<laughs> we got Marlock. How y'all handling Gideon? <laughs> we on this. Schedule your turn. I already buzzed the lip. I think Gideon's dead. It looks like he's not breathing. Yeah, that nigga for sure dead. You see how flat he is? Ooh, y'all stomped the mud hole in that boy. But, uh, you wanna tell him that? I ain't think so. Yeah, there you go, Sketchy! Flat him out! Wolf that trick! Get him, wolf that trick! <laughs> oh, that was nothing. Watch this. Oh, the Stone Cold stun on his ass! Tag me in, tag me in! <laughs> I sketchy! Batter up! <laughs> Talk that boy here, let me hit a home run! <laughs> Ugh! <laughs> you see how far I hit that? He gone! <laughs> he don't got no more legs! <laughs> so how did you all get in my basement? Pardon my French, but what the duty do is going on? So you telling me you don't remember anything that just happened this whole episode? Okay, I'll tell you another time about it, Marlon. Let's go celebrate at the Heavenly Body Strip Club! Yeah. yeah! All right, I love grabbing fish titties. Oh, yeah! I'm about to throw a whole lot of money on that big-ass booty candy. <laughs> this isn't over. Do you hear me? I shall return. I shall be back. You will not underestimate me. Stump your stupid ass up! Stump the y'all with your stupid ass! Oh! <laughs> gamma, ga, fa, fa, gamma, ha! <laughs> All over your face. Back on my happy feet. <laughs> this is really fun. What to do this more often, Sketchy? Hell yeah. We boys now. Don't be afraid to hit me up if you need anything, K more. Man, who is this? Hey, man, if you was my parole officer, I told you I need a day's notice to hide the drugs and go. Oh, it came more as you. <laughs> what up, big dog? What's good? You scared the hell out of me. So remember when you said, if I ever need anything, don't be afraid to hit you up, Sketchy? Yeah, that was yesterday. What's up? I'm moving in. <laughs> Best buzz, right? You said what now? I think you misunderstood what I meant. I said if you needed me. Well, uh, I do, Sketchy. <laughs> I don't got any friends. And I feel like me and you, we could be a good team. Whoa. What about that? Go move in with that nigga. No, not that nigga. That nigga smells funky. <laughs> I like you, Sketch Dog. You smell like cologne and weed. <laughs> yeah, you right. I guess it would be cool. Fuck it. Come on in. Welcome, K-More. Mi casa es su casa. <laughs> oh, so you think you big now and got your own show, huh? Think you better than me? You think y'all don't need me no more? All right, I see how it is. I give it like two seasons. Sketchy, what's going on over there? Hey, I thought we had this talk, old lady. Mind your damn business. Sketchy, see an old lady, you gotta be nice to the elderly. Who are you calling elderly, punk ass? Don't make me walk all over there and stump y'all asses out. What the hell? Come over here and try it. We just stumped out a snail. We'll stump your old ass out too. And ass kicking don't discriminate. Y'all dumb and dumber looking asses ain't worth it. Yeah, that's what I thought. Walk away with your old ass with that big ass back. Welcome to the neighborhood, k -more. I'm glad I finally got somebody in this bitch that's gonna protect me and ride for me. <laughs> What's her issue? Ah, she been real bitching since old man Rivers died. She ain't been getting fended, if you know what I mean. And I ain't finna be the one to do it. <laughs> so should we just move the rest of the boxes inside then? No, don't be stupid now. The animator, he gonna do all that work for us. Now let's go grab some 40s and get some bad shorties. Call it a day. <laughs> let's do it. <laughs> I'm gonna love this house. Hey. Damn, baby, you gotta be tired. Uh, why? Cause you been running through the sketch dog mind all day. From one, that's a lie. You literally just met me. Two, you smell like grease. Yup. Girl, that's the smell of money. You better recognize. <laughs> Sorry, not interested. Wait, 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 wait. I think we started out on the wrong fence. My name's Emmanuel. I'm part owner of this, uh, place. <laughs> you, part owner? Yeah. 
I mean, the only reason I smell like grease is because you know, one of my employees uh, called off and I got to run the business here. So, you know, I had to step up to the plate. I mean, that's what a real boss man would do. Mm. Well, I do like a man to know how to take care of his business. Mm-hmm, baby. And the sketch dog always take care of his business, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> mm, well, okay. I like the sound of that. Well, all right, Mr. Business Owner. Maybe you should take me downtown later on 24th Street for a couple of drinks. Uh, downtown? Like, 2,000 feet away from here, downtown? Uh, yeah, I guess. I mean, is that a problem for you? You're a baller, right? Uh, no. It ain't no problem for me. <coughs> I was just making sure that you was good. You know, the sketch dog, I'm going to be there, baby. Okay. Well, I'd like to hear that. Well, I'll see you later, handsome. Don't be late. Hi, <laughs> right, baby, don't you be late. Sketch dog going to be on time. <laughs> Shit. I got myself in two. Now, ladies, just breathe in. Ha. <sighs> Breathe out. There you go. Kamo! My guy, I need you. Man, what the hell you got going on here? Uh, excuse me for a second, ladies. I'll be right back. <laughs> Man, can't you see I'm running a class right here? What you want? A class? Man, these women look like they about to be ready for their funeral home. Shut up! What do you want? I need a favor from you. I got a date tonight. And yeah, nigga? It's downtown. Downtown? <laughs> you realize you can't leave a thousand feet from this crib, right? <laughs> yeah, and that's why I need help from you. Oh, no, I don't even like where this headed. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Come on, man. All I need is for you to wear my bracelet for at least about three hours. No, then it means I can't do Pilates later with the ladies. <laughs> Come on, man. Look, what do you want me to do for you? Hmm, you know what? Now that you mention it, Man, my rent has been kind of high since I've been living here. You think you can cover for me this month? What? Cover for you? Hey, it's either that or your ass ain't going nowhere. Uh, okay. And also, I want to add that I got Monday through Thursday for me and my ladies up in here for class. Uh, fine. Man, get the hell out of my face. I got to get ready for my date. Now, here. Here's the bracelet. Don't lose it. Of course not, idiot. Do I look like you? <laughs> now get out of here and go have some fun. Thank you, Kate Moore. I appreciate that, man. Ooh -wee. Yeah, I'm gonna go see that bitch. Sorry about that, ladies. That was a homeless guy. Now bring your asses back up. Hmm. Oh. What are y'all farting? Damn. Yeah, baby. I told y'all wasn't gonna be late. Mm. And I love a man that's a man to his word. Well, that's what the sketch dog is, baby. And you smell so good. <laughs> you know, that's a little of that cushion, that cologne. <laughs> How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? What can I get for you tonight? Man, what the? Man, you sound a lot like my roommate. Oh, uh, no, I don't. Anyways, what would you be having on the menu? Today's happy hour. <laughs> this is weird as hell. Uh, okay. Damn! $30 for a bottle of water? Uh, I mean... Is that a problem for you? Yeah, is that a problem for you? Can you get the water? <laughs> Baller. <laughs> no, it ain't a problem for me. Man, this is pissing me off. Yeah, can we get two waters? Man, water usually free. This shit crazy. All right, I'll be right back. Let me know what y'all want later. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Can I get a drink? A drink? This bitch cost me a lot. Yeah, of course you can get a drink. Sir, would you like one? Nah, I'm good. Wait a minute, you don't want to join a drink with me? Yeah, yeah, you don't want to drink with this beautiful young lady? Nigga, you really killing me right now. Yeah, give me a drink too. And yes, I would love to have the most expensive wine on the menu. Mother, Let's keep it together, skid dog, keep it together. She fine, she fine, just keep remembering that. Oh yes, great to us. And that wine will cost $13,000. <laughs> I'll be right back. I love these people. <laughs> Who, uh, by the way, I never got your name, girl. Oh, my name is Tiffany. Tiffany, huh? Mmm, okay. Fine, sexy name. You know what, uh, I'm not even that hungry, though, Tiffany. What about you? Oh, I'm starving. I've been waiting for this all day. Oh, that's crazy. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> well, I guess I gotta feed you then, huh? I mean, you are a baller, right? Of course. And this is an amazing restaurant. I mean, great choice by me, right? Yeah, Great choice. 
stupid bitch. <laughs> la 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 la. Man, I don't know why Sketchy always complaining about staying at the house. I done cleaned up the whole house, made three bowls, an ashtray, fed the pet. Oh, wait a minute, we don't got no pet. <laughs> Silly me. La 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 la. Wait, who's at the door? Hey, sir, how's it going? Ah, uh, is Clarence Butterscotch here? I'm his parole officer. Clarence Butterscotch? Who the? Oh, shit, that's sketchy. Oh, uh, yeah, he's here. He's, uh, right in the back. Let me, uh, go get him. You wait right here. <laughs> oh, damn, what am I gonna do now? I gotta call Sketchy. And my butler wouldn't even do it for me. Can you believe that? I had to make my own damn grilled cheese sandwich. And that's why I had to fire his ass that day. You know, it's really hard to find good help these days. Right? Can you relate? <laughs> yeah, I mean, me and my butler, we stay getting into it. I had to fire his ass last week. Hired two of them motherfuckers the same day. <laughs> Girl, it's crazy out here for a pimp. <laughs> uh, oh, wait, wait, wait a minute. I'm getting a call. One second. Hello? Yo, Sketchy, you gotta bring your ass back here right now. You didn't tell me your parole officer was gonna be here. My parole officer? Oh, damn, today was the day he was coming by. Okay, uh, AK I need you to stall for me for at least about 20 minutes. Man, he wanna see you right now. How can I do that? I don't know. Make up something. You smart. Okay. You better hurry your ass up. Hey, right, I got a plan. I'll call you back. Hey, uh, Baby, how about me and you go catch a movie? You know, I heard Candy Fish was out. Oh my God, I did want to see that movie. Oh, let's go right now. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, cool. Uh, I'll pick up the chick. <laughs> I'll meet you at the car. Damn, they left. Niggas, I knew I couldn't trust this ass. Smell like he was broke. Oh well, guess I'll drink this expensive bad wine myself. Next, get your ass back to work. Damn. Uh, baby, I've really been enjoying my, oh, my stomach. I'll be right back. I gotta go to the restroom. Okay, go handle your business. I mean, I'm enjoying this movie. <laughs> uh, okay, don't you go nowhere with your fine self. Uh, uh, all right. <laughs> oh, yeah, sir. I forgot to tell you, man. Uh, Clarence went out last night. He got food poisoning. He taking a massive ass shit right now, so he on the toilet. Uh, if you give him about like at least five minutes and thirteen seconds, I promise he'll be off the toilet. Uh, well, I guess that's a precise ass time that you got there, but uh, okay, five minutes and twelve seconds is what he got. Okay, sir, that's all he need. A few moments later. Sketchy, what the hell are you? I can't buy you this much time. I'm on my way, nigga. I'm running. Where's he at? He's in the front of the house. So, sir, uh, nice weather we having, huh? Nigga, it's raining. Oh, uh, <laughs> I could do magic tricks. <laughs> da, 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 da. <laughs> that was horrible. Uh, you want to see these pottery bowls I made? <laughs> I colored them blue. <laughs> Where is Clarence? It's been five minutes and ten seconds. If he don't come here in three, two, I I'm right here. How's it going, sir? Thought you'd never take so long. Well, damn. You didn't give me enough time. The man told you I had food poisoning. Okay. Well, I was just coming by to check on you and make sure you were here. Don't you be doing no funny shit on me, Clarence. One fuck up and your ass is right back in the big house. Well, okay. I know that. And that's why I ain't fucking up. Anything else you want? Nah, uh, that'll be all. And you get this motherfucker right here some goddamn magic lessons. He's horrible. Well, damn. Oh, man, I appreciate that, K-Moy. Yeah, yada, yada, yada. I don't want to hear it again. Just make sure you get my rent, and my lady's going to be here Monday through Thursday like I is. It, it, it's, I got you. Hey, man, you know the craziest thing? My waiter sounded just like you. For real? <laughs> I mean, he got amazing ass voice. <laughs> you lucky to hear him. Man, whatever. Anyways, wait. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Oh, shit. Where the hell is this nigga at? This movie over with now? I swear to God. Jeffrey, can you come pick me up? Yes, another broke nigga just finessed me. Oh my dear DeRuchis. 
I still miss your big booty ass. You used to make a nigga feel special. I miss when we used to keep the neighbors up all night cause of how loud and freaky we'll get. You remember that one time we was rubbing fingers in the playground? I'll never forget. I'm not allowed 500 feet within the child. Probably shouldn't have done that in the park near the school. Kind of our fault. But I miss the adrenaline in it to give us. Look, baby, I still got the shorts. I kept it after all these years. Oh, it still smells like you. Barbecue potato chips. Mmm. Oh, okay. Ooh, yeah, baby. Real quick, real quick. Oh, damn. I'm coming. I'm coming. Yo, okay, K-Mo, I'm about to order some pieces. Does eating anchovies make us cannibals? Nigga, what are you doing? Oh, oh shit, sketchy. Hey, what's up? What's up? That's what's up. Why the hell you being your dick in the living room? I thought you was gone. That's my bed. <laughs> I watch TV here. Do that in the bathroom. All right, fine. I'm sorry, sketchy. I just missed my baby girl. Then go visit her. Hmm. You right. I didn't even think about that. <laughs> K-more? Yes, sketchy. Could you put your pants back on? Oh, <laughs> my bad. I didn't even think about that. You a genius, Sketchy. I'm going to see my baby girl right now. <laughs> now I got to throw away this damn couch or get a priest to pray over it or something. And why the hell it smell like barbecue potato chips? Sketchy, you seen my gun? It's on the top of the fridge. Wait, why? Man, what the hell are you doing? I'm about to go see my baby. What the hell you mean see your baby? <sighs> my baby the roots is dead, Sketchy. So I'm about to go home to her. Bye-bye. Man, stop it. I ain't know your damn girl was dead. I would have never told you to go actually see her. Man, what the hell is your problem? I just missed the sketchy. I missed the way we used to have sex. The way she used to climb on top of me and break my bones and my pelvis. I just got used to it too. Look, I'm loose. <laughs> Man, that's just sad. It's crazy. Why not just go out there and meet some new women? I mean, I couldn't do that to the roaches. She's looking at me at all times. See, look, that should go up there. Man, what the hell? Hey, man, we got to get the writer to close the roof. That's scary as fuck. But look, you got to move on, k -more. She's dead now. There's some more fish in the sea. Now that metaphor really worked down here. That's crazy. <laughs> well, I mean, you actually think I could find somebody new? I mean, yeah, if you comb your hair and brush your teeth. Damn, you ugly. I, I, I mean, you got potential. I think you can find somebody new. But how? What's the first step I take? Hmm. I think I got a couple of ideas. Give me a second. Okay. Get you. Where the hell are you taking me? Hey, calm down. We'll be there in just two seconds. One, two. Take off the blindfold. What in the? It's speed dating, k -more. So you got all these ladies right here lined up for you. Sketchy. You shouldn't have. No, really, you shouldn't have. I don't like none of them. Man, what What the? You ain't even looked at all of them. I did. I don't like none of them. Hey, K-more, you got to at least give them a chance. Uh, okay. But I promise you, I don't know if this going to go well. Hey, you want to get over the roots, don't you? Well, I guess so. Then sit your ass down and let's find out who's going to be your next woman. Oh, uh, okay. Damn. Let's go. So, I like long walks in the park. I love fishing. I Next! Get our ass out of here! What? She look good! Big booty? Big boobs? Uh, I don't like the way she look. Next! Next! Oh my gosh, you're so handsome. I just love- Next! I don't like her voice. <laughs> but, this nigga is picky. Boy, I ain't gonna never find love. Oh my gosh! You are gorgeous! She called me gorgeous, Sketch. That's weird as shit. Well, most women call me handsome. <laughs> yeah, you definitely my type. Next! Oh my gosh. Wait a minute, let me go ahead and finish this chicken first. Oh my gosh, I love the way she eat. <laughs> she is gorgeous. But she ain't big enough. Next! She ain't big enough? What the? Then you looking for a sumo wrestler? Hey, I like what I like. Next! Next! Nope. I'm good. 
No. Hell no. Girl, you stinky. Oh, too pretty. Oh, eyelashes too long. Oh, your head shape weird. Oh, no. <laughs> your face look kind of funny. <laughs> Next. Damn. Man, I'll never find this dude no love. Okay, <sighs> boy. Man, that was 22,000 women. I guess we ain't gonna never find you nobody. I'm sorry, man. Huh, it's okay, Sketchy. You tried. Oh my god. What? Sketchy! Look! Look! She can't even fit through the door! Oh my god! Look, she making a ground shake! I think I found the one, Sketch. Who? I can't see nobody bad this big ass fish right here. That's what I'm talking about. Isn't she gorgeous? Them big ass wild hips. Look, she busting out her clothes like a baked biscuit. Oh my God. I think I'm in love. How you doing, Helsa? I'm doing fine, beautiful. What's your name? My name is Biscuits. Oh my God. I knew it. I knew your name would be Biscuits. Did I say something about Biscuits, Sketchy? Okay, more you a weird bastard. Oh my gosh, you are so handsome. So, you like big girls? Like them? I love them. So, baby, you want to get up out of here? This all these other fishes, they just ugly. Man, you, we could be the perfect couple. Oh, yeah, I like the sound of that. But wait a minute. Do you like to feed your women? Feed them. Baby, I'll give you the whole damn seat. Come on, let's get up out of here. <laughs> we ain't going to get married tonight. Hold on, wait a minute. I'll be, I'll be right with you, baby. Oh, sketchy. How can I ever thank you for this? Trust me, you don't got to thank me. Just make sure if you ever bring her home, lock up the damn refrigerator. Damn. <laughs> I'm so lucky. I love you, Sketchy. Wait a minute. I got to have a moment of silence for my baby, Darucci. Daruchis? I'm so sorry. Man, you had so many great moments. And I know you would have never brought biscuits here. If you would have never thought I could never find love again. Thank you, baby. <laughs> but see, bigger. Let's go, Biscuits. This nigga's weird. Well, I'm glad he found love. Shit, only if I could find love. I could have kids, a wife. It'd be a good life. Nah, <laughs> not for the skits, dog. <laughs> what was I thinking? And the writer been I ever write no crap like that. I beat his ass. <laughs> What the man, what the hell was that? If you hit a ride bus, you picked the wrong house. I ain't afraid of whacking. Yeah, that's what I thought. You know, you ain't want none of this. Hi there, boy. -o. What the hell? Man, that's some good weed. He looks so real. That's because me is real, Bucko. What are you supposed to be? Why, well, I'm a leprechaun, lad. A leprechaun? That's a horrible ass accent you got too. What's a leprechaun? Hey, it's three in the damn morning. What the hell is going? Oh shit! What's that? You you can see it too? Yeah, I can see him too. What the hell is that? Apparently he's a leprechaun. What the hell is a leprechaun? I don't know. I was asking him the same thing. I was hoping you would. Oh, you don't know what a leprechaun is? What a leprechaun? We're very lucky. And if you see us, you get to get gold. Yeah. yeah. I'm about to go get my damn gun. This nigga's crazy. Yeah, hey, it, I keep it on the top shelf. Oh, don't worry. I know where that shit at. Oh, no, 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 wait, 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 wait. No, don't kill me. Don't kill me. If you don't kill me, I take you to the pot of gold. Now, how serious are you about this damn gold that you speak of? Yeah, and how we know if it's actually gold? Don't worry. I'll show you right here. Voila. See? This is the gold. And all we have to do is go to the bottom of Bikini Bottom to go get it. Are you serious? Sketchy! We'll be rich forever! Oh my god, I can't believe this! We can leave this hellhole! Man, I'm starting to love the idea of the damn leprechaun. So yes, you see? We get the pot of gold, you get the money, and I survive! And the bitches! The bitches, they come! They come for you! They love you forever! Oh yeah! yeah. I can do that! I'm scared, dog. Let's go get this pot of gold. Hey, I'm with it, my nigga. I love bitches and money, too. Plus, I can have a full supply of weed. Lifetime. 
Let's go. Let me come, you better not be lying. I'll foot you in your little green ass. Yeah! And I'm keeping this pistol just in case. <laughs> Let's go. Man, we been walking for 50 damn minutes. Where the hell is this gold at? Yeah, my feet hurt, Leprechaun. When we gonna get to it? It's at the end of the rainbow, Bucko. At the end of the rainbow. Wait a minute. It ain't no damn end of a rainbow. Everybody know that. Yeah, even I know that shit. And they ain't even finished school. I don't think you have to finish school to know that it's the end of a rainbow, boy. Okay. But the beaches. Don't you see the beaches? Wait. Sketchy, look. Here. 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 The pot of gold. Is she waving at us? I think she waving at me. I mean, me, but not you. Nigga, she waving at both of us. Oh, my God. Princess! I see you! Yes, Bucko. You're getting closer. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, my God. Guess what? We're getting closer. Oh, my God. We on our way, baby. Let's go, K-More. We just got to keep faith. Keep faith, Bucko. You're getting closer. Hey, man, we in a whole different part of Bikini Bottom. How are you sell weed over here? Why we all over here, man? The animator crazy. He trying to take us to the real hood. Man, I don't like this, Sketchy. I mean, I know we getting to the end of the rainbow, but this is getting kind of dangerous. Hey, I don't think these bitches do this gold worth it. If I get shot, what I'm going to do? Man, calm the hell down. Stay focused. Trust the leprechaun. Trust the bitches. Go. Okay? Okay. Ah! Man, what the hell wrong with you? You didn't see that damn crack fish go across from here? Niggas scared the hell out of me. Hey, who the hell you calling the crack fish? I got a heart too, boy. Hey, man, let's just stay focused like you said, Sketch. This shit getting kind of scary. Maybe if I just click my fingers together, I'll go home. There's no place like home. There's no place like home. Ah, I'm still here, boy. Ah, let's keep going, Sketchy. What the hell, leprechaun? Go. I'm over here, boy, yo. Just keep following the gold. Keep following the end of the rainbow. Trust yourself. Keep going. You hear what the damn leprechaun said? We almost there. And you know how the journey is. The more you're on the road, the harder it gets. But the gold is at the end of the destination. Now let's go. Okay. <laughs> I'm scared. <sighs> Man, we in a damn jellyfish field. Wait a minute, Sketch. I thought you couldn't be more than a thousand feet away from the house. Man, shut up. I ain't worried about that. I'm trying to get this damn gold. And too busy worried about getting stoned by these damn jellyfish. Keep going. Man, okay. All right. I'm getting kind of tired. I don't know if I'm going to make it. I can't breathe. Man, you on some more shit. I think that weed's starting to get to you. It's starting to get to me? It been got to me. I think I'm hallucinating, Sketch. I'm starting to see stuff. You ain't seeing the right shit. What you need to be seeing is the damn rainbow. We getting close. Wait. K-more. I think I see the gold. I see the gold. <sighs> Got you. I see it. I'm getting life. Get the hell out of my way. <laughs> yes. I'm rich. I'm rich. <laughs> I see it! Boy, yo, you're getting closer. You're here. You're here. Now just go. Go touch that pot of gold and you'll be rich forever with the bitches. Look at the bitches. They're playing around the gold. They're practically waiting for you. Hey, more. We rich forever, baby. Hey, man, I just want to let you know. Hey, Mina, wipe my ass with your toothbrush. Wait a minute, you doing what? Forget about that. I can buy you a thousand toothbrushes in there. And all the bitches in the world, I don't got to sell weed no more. I mean, I'm still going to smoke it, but I don't got to sell it. <laughs> yeah. And me and my old ladies, we can finally go on that vacation that we always wanted to. Sketch. This is amazing. Sketch. Sketch. Clear. Clear. Ah! Wait! Where's the go? Where's the leprechaun? Where's the bitches? Clear. 
clear. Ah! I'm rich. Get the hell out of my face. Wait, wait, wait what the? Man, what? Where am I? K-more? What happened to the gold? The, the, the leprechaun? The... I don't know about any leprechauns or bitches, but we found you guys playing in the street, hallucinating, talking about exactly that. We found you guys high on carbon monoxide. If we didn't get you enough time, you would have died. You've been passed out for 24 hours. Thank God it was a miracle. Man, what the hell? Damn! So you mean we ain't rich? No leprechaun? Ha ha ha. Rich? No. You're still broke. But I'm pretty sure you're going to owe a lot of money in debt. These medical bills are going to eat your ass alive. <laughs> Look at this. 25000 just to revive you. 10000 just to get the carbon monoxide out of your body. 2000 just to get you inside the ambulance. Man, please don't read anymore. God damn. You guys are lucky to be alive. Anyways, yeah. Damn. Sketchy, I told you to fix that. I did. I put duct tape over it. Duct tape? God damn. Man, and I thought it was the weed. Here I'm thinking the whole time I could have sold this. Crap. Just my luck. La 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 Oh my god, this is such a beautiful day! <laughs> I always gotta pick Sketchy up. Man, I can't wait till he get off parole. Oh, a squirrel! Oh, damn, what the hell was that? It was kind of heavy. Let me get out and see. <laughs> Probably just a rock or something. <laughs> damn, rocks in bikini bottom. Oh my. Oh my god! I killed a man! Oh my snap! S -s Sir? Sir! Let me check his post. Oh damn! It's roadkill! Oh no! What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? Ain't nobody around. I could just leave him here. Oh no, k -more. That's not you. You a good guy. Oh snap, the cops! Oh, I gotta think quick, gotta think quick, gotta think quick! <laughs> Hi, officer! Dumbass! <laughs> I can't believe that actually worked! Okay, now I just gotta pick up Sketchy. Be normal. Be normal, Kaymore. Be normal. <laughs> Alright, boss man! I'll see y'all tomorrow! Fuck you, Eugene! Where the hell came with? Oh, there you go. Hey, my boy. Oh, what up, uh, Sketch? <laughs> Why the hell are you so sweaty? The hell going on with you? Uh, what's your name? <laughs> I'm normal. Now come on, hurry up. Let's get in. All right. Gonna put on a couple tunes, man. <laughs> man, today was so damn long. You know who came by the job today? No, who? Man, Lavetta. Lavetta? You talking about the one that got the one eyeball? Exactly. Ann Connor messing with me, she knowing damn well she can't see. Ah, I can't stand her ass. Then she wasn't talking about, you know you owe me my weed. Bitch, get the fuck away from here. You see me at work talking about weed. Shit, man. Mad because I gave her some Reggie. <laughs> uh, Lavetta Gravy. <laughs> what the hell you got in the trunk? That was heavy. Oh, uh, well, what you talking about? <laughs> that. Man, that sound heavy as hell. What you? What, what was that? Oh, uh, I'm uh, I'm doing laundry. Laundry? Man, you wear the same clothes every day. Oh, uh, uh, I'm doing uh, your laundry. Man, I wear the same clothes every day. You know the cartoon artists don't draw us nothing new. The only time I got something new is when I got a gun on me. Now what the hell is that in the trunk? That sound real heavy. Plus it's slowing us down. Oh, uh, hey. Pull over! No, man, we almost at the house. We got pull over. Okay. Damn. Okay, Sketch. Now before I open this trunk, just know this was not my fault. Man, what the hell are you? Oh my God! Game on! Who the hell is this man? Sketchy! I, I told you it wasn't my fault. This man was in the street and I saw a squirrel. And I mean, they... is he dead? Wait, let me check his post. Oh my God, this man is dead, k I, I don't know what to do. Man, look, whatever you do, your ass is on your own. You in trouble for this. 
I don't got nothing to do with this, man. Uh, come on, Sketch, you gotta help me. No, sir. You on your own. Plus, I'm on parole. Sketch it. You can't leave me. Wait a minute. This is your car. What the hell are you trying to say? I'm trying to say, this is your car. This is a dead body. If your ass don't help me. <laughs> you would. Yes, I would. I wasn't behind the wheel. <laughs> I had nothing to do with this. <laughs> you a sick bastard. Now, come on. Help me. Because if you don't, your ass going to jail too. This your car, dead body, sounds like you in a whirlwind of trouble. And who they going to believe? An innocent face like this or a nigga that's on parole? You fucking bitch. All right, come on. All right, so look, let's think. What are we going to do with the body? Uh, okay. I got a friend that got a morgue downtown. We'll just take him there and he'll dispose of the body. Okay, great. Let's go. Hey, yo, Fred. You here? I need help again. Again? Shut your ass up. It was two years ago. Okay, nigga. Fred. Damn, I don't think he here. Oh, what are we going to do then, Sketchy? Calm the hell down. Damn, man. I mean, why you put me in a situation like this, K-Moore? Why the hell you was even looking at Squirrel? I mean, you should have seen the Squirrel. He was all smiley, jumping around. He was cute, Sketchy. You would have looked back too. <laughs> he even waved at me. Well, look. I think I got one more friend. Damn. Man, I'm sick of this shit. Pull over here. My friend's a meat cleaver. What? What are we going to do with a meat cleaver? I mean... Clearly, K-Moore, he's going to chop the body up in pieces and then, you know, probably serving the people. That's the way we can dispose of the body. What? We going to do what again? Hell no. We can't do this to this man. He probably got a family, Sketchy. A family? You thinking about this man's family right now and you just killed him. Come on, Sketchy. You got to have a heart. Fuck what you talking about, man. Sketchy. No. We cannot do that. Look at him. He looks useless. His name is probably, what do you think his name would be, Sketchy? I don't know. I'm not thinking about this man's damn name. Come on, we got to give him a name if we're going to just kill him and just dump him over the river. His name was probably Jacob the <laughs> Third. Jacob! I forgot he did. Man, I don't give a damn about naming this man. Wait, what'd you just say? <laughs> I'm talking about Jacob. No, before that. We can't just dump him over the river? K-Moore, you a genius. That's exactly what we'll do. What, dump him over the river? Yeah, I mean, it's easy. All we gotta do is drive over there to the river, dump him over. Nobody sees it, we sky free. Oh, I guess so. Come on, let's go. Okay, so all we gotta do is get the rope and get the rock and we're gonna tie it around. What? If we get a rock, k -more, we can weigh him down. That'll make him go all the way down to the bottom of the river. Nobody see it. We good. Oh, great. Sketchy, you're a genius. I know. I'll be right back. Let me go get the rock. Okay. <laughs> la, 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 la. I can't believe we're doing this little man named Jacob. He's probably a good guy. Oh, oh a zombie! <laughs> oh, my God. I've never been attacked by a zombie. That was scary. Man, what the hell are you doing all this records for? Oh, nothing. <laughs> Come on. You get his head, I get his legs. Hold him up. All right. Oh, wait a minute, Sketchy. Can we say some last words to him before he goes over the river? We'll never see this man again. K-Moy, you got to be out of your damn mind. Come on, Sketchy. All right. Couple words. You got 20 seconds. Dear beloved, we got to here today for a man named Jacob III. He was such a good guy. You should have seen the way he was bouncing under the car. He had such a bright future. I'm pretty sure he would have been good at bowling ball, basketball, anything with a ball in it. You'll forever be missed. Amen. K-Moore, you a sick bastard. What do you mean? <laughs> now let's go. Hurry up. Bye, Jacob the Third. Look at him just float down there. Damn, no bubbles. Is it supposed to be bubbles coming up like that? I don't know. Now let's go. Woo! I'm glad that's over. Yeah, me too. Because you almost got me in trouble. Yeah, that was a close one. K 
Can you believe he tried to come back to life and hurt me? Kamo, what you mean he came back to life? I mean, he came back as a zombie and was trying to get me. Kamo, this man that come back as a zombie, you mean to tell me he was alive? Uh, you want to go get the burger? Out of, oh my God. My bad. <laughs> Dio. La 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 la. Ha. <sighs> Isn't it such a beautiful day, Sketchy? To be at the zoo. <laughs> Man, why the hell are you bringing me here for? Ugh, I hate this. Smell like animal piss. Sketchy, you gotta calm down. Just enjoy the nature. Look at the people. The little kids running around. Ain't they just happy? <laughs> I hate kids. I wanna go home. I'm supposed to be watching BET Uncut right now. What? Man, you realize that damn thing was 12 years ago? Yeah, I be recording the reruns. <laughs> You're an idiot. So you rather do that than be here? Man, whatever. Come on, let's go view this animal right here. Uh, excuse me, sir. Sir. Uh, sir, I don't have five dollars. Five dollars? I don't want five dollars. I want. I don't have two dollars either. What do you need, man? I don't need any money, sir. I want to know the name of the damn animal. The, the animal don't have no money either. Excuse me, sir. Damn, please. What the hell was that, Sketchy? And why I said we don't need to freaking be here. You got random ass white fishes around here with hats. This man probably don't even work here. Come on, man, let's go home. Man, calm down. We gonna get to the bottom of all of this. I know there's some other animals we can go over and look at. Look at this one, for instance. Isn't it beautiful? You mean that disgusting pink little turd right there? Yeah, yeah. Look at it, it's just adorable. <laughs> don't you just wanna pet it? Yeah, I, for sure the hell I would not pet it. I won't touch that damn thing, I'm a pimp. Sketchy, that's what I'm saying. Lose the whole damn attitude. Calm down, look at this. Look at the little fella. <laughs> I'm sketchy, I think he's smiling at you. I hope the hell not. I don't wanna look at that little ugly ass thing. Sketchy, I'll give you five dollars if you go over there and pity. Five dollars? Man, how about you go over there and pity? See, I'll pay it for free. <laughs> look out for me. Hey, little guy. <laughs> How's it going? I'm gonna call you Jesus. <laughs> You smell like you got a little bit of blood inside of you. <laughs> what does that even mean? That means you just soft with flesh and just paint. <laughs> Hi, little guy. Tickle, 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 tickle. Hey, Kamo, I think you need to move away from that thing, man. I don't know if it's... Oh, but you be quiet. I love the nature. <laughs> hey, little guy. Man, I wish I could just take you home and feed you. Better than that damn Gary that SpongeBob got <laughs> with his little glass. <laughs> you way cuter. K, K more? What, why is the ground moving up under you? Uh, I don't know. Maybe he's happy to see me. <laughs> Hi, little guy. Look. Tickle, 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 tickle. Oh, oh wait, wait a minute. Get you. Whoa. Oh, K more. Come back over here. Come over here. Oh, oh, no. Oh, oh. oh my God. He's huge. Game on! Oh, I'm, I'm a son. Now look at you. I told you I wanted to go home, and now you inside the belly of a damn beast. But don't worry, this your type. You like him big, right? Man, shut up! Get me out of here! Hey, well, you on your own. Sketchy! No! Help me, please! Oh, wait a minute, came on, find somebody. You! Sir, help me out! I don't have any money! And right here we have the biggest worm in Bikini Bottom. Ain't that right, guys? You see him? Oh! Get me out! Please! Oh my, well, I guess we have a new addition. I didn't know that it could talk. Well, well come on, y'all. <laughs> All right, new addition to the, uh, <laughs> whatever. Man, get your ass up out of here, man. My friend's stuck inside there. Move! I might be fired. Yeah. K more, I'm gonna get you out. Wait right here. Where else can I go, Sketchy? Damn! Oh, snap, he's leaving. What can I do? Think fast, think fast. A cart. Perfect. Move out the way. I'm coming, k I'm going to save you. Plus, you got to pay your rent. And I can't do this shit by myself. Move. Get out the way. Move. My friend's in danger. Hell. Wait, why the hell ain't nobody helping? Why y'all all running? Oh, snap, you eating more people. k if you can hear me, say damn. Oh, I know you in trouble now. Snap. Ah, oh, man. I need a blunt. Crap. Oh. Okay, well, I guess he's sleep. Park 
right here. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Everybody calm down, please. It was not my fault. Please tell the manager that. <laughs> uh, the worm is okay. He looks a little tired. I know this. I, I work here. Okay? <laughs> my, my friend is stuck inside the stomach. Can you help? What's the worm got a stomach? Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, help! It's, it's, it's okay. Calm down, sir. Shit. <sighs> Let me walk up to this. Hey, man. Um, you been <laughs> got everybody kind of frantic. <laughs> you know. Uh, just listen to me. You know, before it was just me and you in the zoo. <laughs> okay, I seen you from a little baby, baby, baby worm. We used to like pet your little. <laughs> You got swallowed too? Yeah, I got swallowed. I got swallowed. It's so dark. Hey, it's not that bad. Look. It is bad. No, it actually isn't. He swallowed a TV, Domino's. He even got some Wi-Fi up in here. <laughs> you want to watch HBO? <laughs> I might. They got a new Insecure episode on there? Right here, look. <laughs> this episode with his ass level. <laughs> oh my god, this is my favorite episode. I know, right? <laughs> you ain't that bad. You ain't neither. <laughs> Man, Man we... what can I do? I need a blunt. <sighs> you know, people got a bad stigma on weed, but it just make me feel so much better. Wait, makes me feel feel better. What if I can give the... Oh, yeah. Hey, little wormy, wormy. Wait, I think it's working. Let me do one more again. Hold on. Starting to open. K more! Can you hear me? Yes, Captain! Walk this way! Follow the light! <laughs> okay! Hey, what up, Sketchy? K more! Come on! Get out of here! Oh, he, he can he got out of there too? Woo! That was claustrophobic, but that was a good episode, wasn't it? I, I really enjoyed it, man. I wish we could have finished it. Man, how'd he get a plug in there? What? What? Man, forget all that! K more! I'm happy to see you! I'm happy to see you too, Sketchy! Wait, look, the weed is working. He's getting small, look. <gasps> it's getting small. Okay, 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 my job, my job, my job, my job. Keep my job, <laughs> keep my job. Baby, 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 little baby worm, little baby worm, little baby worm. Little Wait, worm. before you take off with him, what? I want to say a few words to him. Okay. Hi, little wormy. We had such a great time. Not that close, it's, it's your, your breath is on it. Okay. Remember when I took a do and you got real big? <laughs> it was a good moment, right? Now, you about to go back inside. Just know, I'll always think about you, little guy. Okay, okay. It's your breath is six feet. COVID. All right. Uh, let's um, let's take you back home, my boy. <laughs> All right. Got to see it through. <sighs> yes. Family. Okay. Nigga, you're fired. What? You're fired. Get your shit out of here. It was your fault. Get your ass up out of here now. <laughs> it's what it is. Damn, I feel bad for the guy. Hey, anyways, it's good to see you back, K-More. Well, I was kind of had fun in there. Fun? What you mean? I mean, I had cable up in there. I mean, the little guy was eating everything. <laughs> Hell. I even saw my old ex-girlfriend up in there. You ain't talking about- No, not her. It was the girl you talked to back in fifth grade. <laughs> She's doing good, though. I guess so. You ready to go home? Yeah, I am, Sketchy. <laughs> Damn. Ooh, it's a hot day outside. Pollution. It's the water's temperature rising and whatnot. 
You go pollution? Yeah, something about recycling or something. I don't know. Supposedly we just destroying the world by not taking care of it, you know. So why don't people just recycle and take better care of the world? <laughs> K-more. Poor K-more. Don't be stupid. Once this planet gets ruined, we just gonna fly to another one and live on there. But won't we just destroy that one? Of course we will. But I'll be long dead and gone by the time that happens, so I ain't worried about this shit. <laughs> yeah, you right about that. What was I thinking? You about to ruin the show. Show? What show? 3.51 p.m. Miss Porter passes the street for her evening run. What? There she go right there. Damn! Damn is right. You can say that again. How is she running in slow motion? She ain't. I'm high. You drunk. That's just how we see it. But shut up. I'm trying to focus here. I am. Never mind. Me too. Hey, hey Miss Porter. Porter. Hi, boys. Uh, how you doing, Miss Porter? Oh, I'm doing good. Man, man, man. Give me three and a half minutes. Maybe even four. She be want to marry a fish. <laughs> Boy, please. She want me. Want you? Negro, you ain't her type. What you mean I ain't her type? Look at me. Exactly. She don't want you anyway, boy. Look at me. She was looking all at me when she just ran past here. She don't want you. You broke as hell. I ain't broke. I'm the one that got the weed. Matter of fact, my pager. Man, who is this? You got a pager? <laughs> oh, yeah. I know your ass broke. <laughs> Wait a minute. Why you got a pager in the cell phone? Wait. Why you worry about me having a pager in the cell phone? Are you the feds? Oh... Uh... Next question. Don't worry about that. <laughs> Anyways, I got to make this sale. I'll be right back. Okay. Don't be too long. She may run back through here. <laughs> and then I'm going to have all to myself. Matter of fact, stay gone. <laughs> hey, Miss Porter. I can't wait. And this where he said he'll be at. Damn, it's been three minutes. What's taking so long? Hey, yo. You sketchy? Uh... Yeah, who who wants to know? It, where the hell is Chris? Who are you? I'm Sketchy Yeah. Sketchy? You mean your name is Sketchy Yeah? Oh, hell no. Man, y'all writers are getting so damn lazy up there. They don't make no sense. Man, you crazy. Hey, don't you worry about that. What you need to be worried about is me. This my block now. I'm taking over everything. You only got two options. Give me that or I beat your ass. Well, damn. I mean, can I just be free? No. Matter of fact, boys, come on. Oh, so this is the whole party, huh? All right, you just give me a second. I got some for y'all. Damn. Man, I forgot I washed my ass today. This is what I get. These are wrong pants. Yeah. It's over for you, little man. Uh, shit. Johnny ate a booger and it tastes like sugar. Johnny wanna know who ate that booger. You it? Man, I shit. Wait, man, who the hell are you over here playing hide go see with? Uh, nobody. Let Ross see you later. Ten o'clock. <laughs> Don't be late. <laughs> what the hell happened to you, Sketchy? Man, some dudes freaking jumped me. This new dude, Sketchy, yeah. Sketchy, yeah. Man, that's the same damn thing I said. Yeah, they just getting lazy. That don't make no damn sense. But wait a minute. Why they jump you for? Man, this, the new dude sketchy and taking over the block. He's some big dude. Bald head. Ugly as hell, too. Got a cock eye. I almost beat his ass, but forgot I ain't had my gun. Man, how the hell you be a drug dealer and forget your weapon? That's like being a lawyer and forgetting your briefcase. <laughs> you ain't no damn real drug dealer. Man, shut up. I gotta get my stuff back. Well, damn, how you gonna do that? I, I don't know. I'm gonna go get the gun. Wait a minute. I'll help. You help? Okay, more. I don't think. Hey, man. I said I got you. Once a brother, always a brother. You my roommate, right? Well, yeah. Okay. So let me just go over there and talk to the guys, okay? I'm pretty sure I can have a word with them and they'll hear me out. Man, that's the dumbest damn idea I ever heard. I'm gonna go get my gun. Hey, hey. Trust me, okay? I go first thing in the morning. Until then, let's just go in the house and watch cartoons. Wait, ain't we cartoons? Stop 
thinking so damn much. Catchy? <laughs> okay. Once again, I'll go over there first thing in the morning. Let's go in the house. All right. It's just my pride hurt, man. It, it hurt my feelings. Tomorrow. Okay, I got my AK-1, AK-2, AK-47. Got my Glock 9, my 44, 45. I should be good. Cause ain't no damn way K-more handy than this. I am ready. La 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 la. How you sketchy? K-more? Where you coming from? Uh, I told you I was going over there in the morning. Oh yeah! I forgot to tell you. <laughs> here's the weed, here's the money too. Oh, and here's some of that money. Also, <laughs> we got a new dog. Man, what the fuck? How you do all this? I told you. I was just going to go over there and talk to the guy. And turns out, the sketch of your guy, he's pretty cool. <laughs> he got a collection of a pet rats. <laughs> so you mean to tell me you went over there, talked to them, and they gave you all this? Yeah. And I told you to stop worrying. Everything is good. You got me in your hand. Man, that's crazy. Damn, they even gave you extra money too? I can re-up now. Game more. I love having you as a roommate. You know, you a good guy after all. <laughs> well, what can I say? I mean nothing. This is crazy. I'm about to go re-up, man. This is amazing. I can't believe you actually just went over there and talked to them. Wow. <laughs> yeah, exactly what I did. Meanwhile. Johnny ate a booger and it tastes like sugar. Johnny wanna know who ate that booger. You gonna be the one to die. Bang! Now you, who the hell is sketchy here? And where is he right now? You took too long. Bang! Come on, Larry. Let's go. These niggas thought they could fuck with us. Oh, damn, a dog. <laughs> damn money. <laughs> don't my ass. Sketchy don't even know how to do his job. I gotta do everything for his skin red. Call himself a drug dealer. I got more street cred than this nigga, <laughs> My name is Mr. Alaska. She used to smell like. Hey, Skitty, you wanna play high and go see? Man, what do I look to? I was just asking the question. Man, we ain't doing nothing else. Let's smoke. I mean, we always do this, kid. Hey, wait a minute. Is that somebody moving in next door to us? Yeah, I think so. Wait, let me see who he is. Oh, never mind. He a white fish. I mean, but look at him. He looks kind of cool. Hey, neighbor. Damn, came on. Why the hell are you so friendly? Because. I mean, he looks like a cool person. Neighbor! Hey! How's it going? It's going great. Can't complain. <laughs> what about you? It's going great. I am K-more. Mm. This is sketchy. Sketchy. Sket, is that with a K? Oh, uh, yeah. But that's not his real name. His real name is Clint. The, the game. Man, don't be telling him my goddamn real name, K-more. What's your problem? We almost got him. We almost got him. What's your name? Uh, <laughs> uh, Ray. Ray. Yeah, but, 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 but it's Ray with an A, not with an E. Some people might think it's Ray, but it's Ray. Okay, that was random for him to tell us that, but all right. Well, hey, Ray with the A. <laughs> uh, you want to come over later? We're just chilling and, you know, watching the game and whatnot. Yes, yes. Yes, I would love to. Hey, Kimo, we don't know this damn white fish. When are you going to fight him over to our crib? Hey, Sketchy, calm down. Now, nah, this guy looks really nice. Look at him. <laughs> exactly. When you trust the guy that looks like that. That's what they say, Sketchy, with a K. I don't know, Kimo, I don't like him. Be quiet, give him a chance. Well, look, man, we'll see you later, okay? All right, I'm gonna see y'all. What what uh time exactly do you want me to show up at 435 Fish Drive? Uh, four o'clock. Four o'clock, four o'clock, four o'clock. <laughs> Such a nice guy. You stupid. La 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 la. Clean over here, clean over here. You doing mighty damn cleaning for a white fish. Hey, calm your ass down. This is company. I mean, I like the guy. He's pretty cool. <laughs> oh, that must be him. All right, now don't you mess this up for us. We got a chance to get a new friend and you all reacting all crazy. Shut up and just answer the damn door. Hey, Ray. 
with the A. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> right, remember that with an A, not a it, something else. It, bring your ass in. So, what brings you to the neighborhood? Yeah, what brings you over here all <sighs> randomly? <sighs> that was a nice question, Sketchy. Um, you know, <laughs> great neighborhood, quiet, quiet, very quiet, unless somebody makes some noise. Uh, just a great way to to weed out the weed. With speaking of weed, we never said nothing about weed. Right, I did, cause I'm cool like that. <laughs> Y'all got some weed? Uh, who wants to know? I do. Duh. Look at me. <laughs> Come on, man. My my weed senses. Do Y'all got some weed or not? What's up? Oh yeah, yeah. Sketchy got all the weed up. Game up. Let me talk to you real quick. Hold on, Mr. Ray, with the A. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that. <laughs> Bring the weed and everything else you got to. What on, Sketch? Man, why the hell you talking so much telling him I got all the weed? I mean, the guy says he's pretty cool. One, he loves the neighborhood. <laughs> I do too. I'm always outside playing how I go seek. I wonder if he'll do it with me. <laughs> Three, he likes weed like us. What the hell is your problem, Sketch? My problem is you being too goddamn friendly. Man, we don't know this man, man. You, 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 I don't, I don't trust him. Sketch, calm down. Of course, we got weed. Come on, Sketch. Go and get that bubblegum cush we got back there. So y'all, oh, perfect. Weed at 435 Fish Drive. Okay, okay. So uh, what what type of, uh, what else y'all got? Y'all got some, you know, some cane or the Coke or the, some, you know, some, 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 like, you know, some little, little, little gun, little bullets, you know, like, what y'all got? We don't got no guns and no little bullets, uh, nothing like that, but, I mean, I got a little weed back there. Just stay right here, I'll bring it back out. <laughs> right with the A, she gonna love this. Man, this always put me in my ass, and I always see grasshoppers. Little Man, I'm talking about, I see all type of random shit. One time I had all this little clown jump over here and got on top of our house, and it scared me. <laughs> Watch, you gonna find out. Sketch, get the stuff that got the little blue string in it. Man, be quiet. I bring out what the hell I want. And Sketch, bring that stuff that you can't find nowhere that's rare. You can't find it anywhere, like nowhere in America. You damn near can't find it overseas. <laughs> I'm telling you right with the A, you're going to love this shit. Overseas? Um, stuff like, uh, this is big, guys. This is big. This is big. Man, this is amazing. Yeah, I ain't going to even lie to you. I love smoking this every time. But I can't help but notice. Why you not that high? And why you sweating? It's hot. Y'all ain't turned the the AC sketch. Man, we underwater and it's cool as hell. What are you talking about? <laughs> That's one of the side effects of being hot. Look, you can tell he is hot. Right, just playing. <laughs> right, 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 right. I'm just playing. I'm just, I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. <laughs> like I said. So where y'all get this from exactly? What street did you buy? Oh, can't you, did you tell me you got this from this Colombian guy down there that stay on the fourth over there downtown? Remember? The, shut up! Up uh, no, man. He just joking, man. I found this somewhere from a stranger that was walking on the corner. You know, little stupid stuff like this. Mmm, stranger on the corner. So, <laughs> so you know, you know, I, 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 I just be trying to do my thing. Like, what? What did he look like? I mean. You can get it through me, and I'll let you know. I can get it through you, Sketchy. Maybe. Oh, wait a minute. Sketchy, that's probably one of your customers right now. Customer. Okay, well, this is good. This is good. Hey, Sketchy, what's up, bro? It's been a while. Man, what the hell you doing over here? I came to buy some weed. What else am I going to be here for? You came to buy some <laughs> some toys. No, I think he, I think he said weed, Sketchy. <laughs> Toys? I don't want no damn toys. I'm here for weed, Sketchy. Weed. Here! Get your hands out of here. Go! Go! Alright, thank you, Sketchy. You got the best weed in Bikini Bottom, bro. I swear to Poseidon. I got the best weed grass that I'm growing over there on the side that he's talking about. The little stuff. Uh, it's spinach. <laughs> okay, so you uh, you a head honcho or something, right? I, I hunch a lot of heads. That's what I do. 
I don't know about no head honcho. Ah, oh, for sure, for sure. That confirms it. We got him. I'ma just uh go to the bathroom <laughs> real quick. I see y'all. Oh, no problem. It's right there to the left. Sketch, <laughs> y'all love this guy. I don't know, K-more. I don't know if it's the weed or if you just a dumbass. But either or, I'ma enjoy myself. Thanks, Sketch, dog. <laughs> hey, K-more, get that for me. Of course. <laughs> Who's that? Oh, nobody but the police. Oh, the police! Hey, put everything up! Your niggas are going to jail. I told you, Clarence, if you do anything else, your ass is going to jail. Good job, Ray. Thank you, exactly. We cracked the case. By the way, they got a whole bunch of stuff in Cambodia right in the back, in the left room, and you take a right. I did it, right? I get a raise or something. I can't believe you did this to me, right? I thought we were good friends. We were good friends. But I had an agenda. You gotta go to jail. Man, I told you not to trust that white fish. You wanna be fucking nice and stuff, K more. This all your fault. Now I'm going to jail. Yeah. Jail with an A. Alright, nigga. Now get your goddamn hands on the ground right now. You're going to jail, boy. Wait a minute, just me? He my roommate too? Well damn, skits. No, just you, boy. I told you don't fuck up no more. K more! Help me out! Skits! I'ma save you, bro! He ain't gonna save nobody. <laughs> it's my town, bitch. I ain't never trusting the white bitch again. Stupid. My bad, sketchy dude, I got to win this. I just thought that the right with an A. <laughs> I'm sorry, that still might be laugh. That's hilarious. I just thought he was a good guy. Man, whatever. Told you not to trust him. Now I don't know how long I'm going to be up in here. My parole officer already told me if I got in trouble, I was going to do 5 to 10. And imagine how much weed I got caught with. I mean, don't worry, Sketch. I'm going to figure something out. You won't be in here for long. Hurry up. I saw the dude back there looking at me kind of crazy. <laughs> he liked my hair. <laughs> he told me he going to braid it tonight. And I don't think he talking about braiding my hair, K-Boy. <laughs> oh, damn. That sound like a personal. I, mean, I, I, I got you, Sketch. Keep your ass, I mean, your head up. I love you. Nigga, I don't love you. <laughs> don't worry, Sketch. I'm going to get you out of this. Damn. <laughs> He's going to get his ass fucked. <laughs> That's not funny. Why am I laughing? <laughs> Probably still laughing at that right with an A. That was genius. <laughs> he could have got everybody with that shit. <laughs> I'm not dull. <sighs> Sketchy with a K. Who wants to know? Nobody now, cause you're in jail. <laughs> I can't stand you. Mm. All right, so this is gonna be either the easy way or the hard way. I choose the hard way. Right. <laughs> you tough as a ton of bricks, huh? You damn Skippy. Hmm. What about this brick? Stop <laughs> me! You can't be hitting us. Says who? Ain't nobody in here. <laughs> Man, it ain't fair! This is my world, boy. <laughs> now tell me everything that we need to know! Man, who the hell are you, Denzel from Training Day? I ain't telling you shit! <sighs> you better be glad I like that movie. <sighs> we gonna try this one more time, sketchy with a K. <laughs> you better be sketchy with eight, ten years. Now, who is the plug? Man, I ain't telling you a damn thing! What plug? Only plug I got is the sockets in my house! Sockets in your house, my ass. We burnt down that whole shit. You ain't got nothing to go back to, Sketchy. What you gonna do? Doodle? You gonna change your name to that? It's cool. The animator gonna draw me another house. I'm cool. Fuck your animator. What? Well, fuck you, bro. It's cool. I hope you erase your ass after this episode. I don't see no goddamn erasing. Now, look, tell me what I need to know right now, or you get about. Let me roll the dice about uh, seven years. Man, nobody scared of no damn seven years. Mm, we got some bigger dice. Uh, 20. 20? Man, I ain't seen my daddy in 20 years. That ain't nothing. <laughs> we got your daddy on the second floor for the last 17 years. 30 years. Watch my ass for 30. Mm, somebody else gonna watch your ass for 40 years. Well, you better tell them to watch my ass for 50 years. Because I ain't telling you shit. Get the power drill. Power what? Oh, hold on, man. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! 
This is what I'm talking about, sketchy with a K. How you feel now? And you got to do more than that. Get the bigger power drill. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> What's up now, sketchy? And you trying to kill me. Fuck it. Go for it. Well, that ain't going to do me good, but I'll try. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> All right, that's, that's all good. But you, you think you tough, huh? You think you good, huh? It's fine. Go on, get him up out of here. I don't give a shit. I'm a thug. Come on. <laughs> Let's go. Wait, man. You sound just like my damn roommate. What? I'm a guard. I don't have a room. <laughs> I guard niggas. <laughs> man, this is weird as fuck. All right, come on. I still can't believe I got him in trouble, Larry. Yeah, you're a damn idiot. I know! And it's just, he trusted me. Now I gotta take my rent, his rent. Larry, you think you can help me? Hell nah, I'm a roach. What you expect me to do? I don't know. I mean, maybe you could just stay here and talk to me, Larry. You're the only friend I got left. Sorry, nigga. Gotta go. Larry! Damn! K-more, K-more, K-more. <laughs> How you doing? You doing well? What do you want? You got my friend arrested. No, 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 no. He got himself arrested. Uh, we just need a little more information. Man, I ain't telling you nothing. I trusted you, Ray with an A. How could you do this to me? <laughs> That's comical, Ray with an A. I was actually under witness protection. It's Ray with an E. Ray with an E? You lied about that too? Man, Leave! Leave me alone! Let me mourn in peace! Well, I guess your boy just gonna have to do what he do in a cell for 50 years! How about you? What? 50? I didn't know Sketchy was gonna get 50 years! Wait! I can help! Oh, uh, you... I'm sorry... I'm... You said what? I can help you! I know Sketchy's plug! Sketchy's plug from... Columbia? Yeah! He goes by the name of Scarfin. I know where he stays. I visited him a couple of times when I was on run with Sketchy. Funny looking guy. Talks like this, man. And a lot like that. It's kind of scary if you think about it. Scarfin, that's our top prospect. Just calm down. Just tell me everything you know about Scarfin. And we'll get you something. I want Sketchy to be free or I ain't telling you nothing. 40 years then. Free! 30 years, you pushing it. Free my nigga! 15! Free sketch! Alright, alright, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, we can do that, but you gotta help us catch the plug. What I gotta do? <laughs> you gotta infiltrate the whole system. Oh. Hey, uh, boss, we have k here. A lot of men. Hey, yo, uh, Scarfin! How's it going? Long time no see. <laughs> right, uh, where's Sketchy? Oh, uh, Sketchy, uh, oh, he's back home. You know the boy had the runs. <laughs> Bad case of the shits. He ate some Taco Bell last night. So, he sent me out. Hmm. I don't remember Sketchy eating Taco Bell, but fuck it. What do you want? I want three pounds of that Godzilla Kush. <laughs> three! Pounds! Godzilla! Kush! <laughs> mm, you're very weird, my man. Three pounds, huh? Why are you acting so weird, my man? Oh, uh, no no reason. I mean, this is kind of my first time placing my order, so I'm kind of a little bit nervous. <laughs> but I'm good. It ain't like I got no wire or nothing on me or anything. Hmm, okay. Look at up. We don't do nervous around here, man. We don't do wires either. I'm going to let you say that again before you find your fins on the floor. Oh, did I say nervous or any wires? I mean, man, I'm a gangster. <laughs> I ain't never been nervous. I I do this all the time, Scarfin. Hmm, <laughs> okay. Gangster, okay, 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 okay. So I'm going to need to see something, like something. Prove it. Prove, prove that you're a gangster. Let me, let me see. Let me, let me see something. Uh, what do you want me to do? Hmm. Oh, I forgot about room three. Hey, uh, Gilberto! 
Bring up, bring. There he is, there he is, there he is. I want you to kill him, my man. Oh my God, please, no, please, please, don't, don't kill me. I, I didn't know she was your sister, Scarfin. Shut up. Kill him. I'm sorry. Bye. Oh my God, he really just, he really just killed him. Well, I can take him to jail after this too. Perfect. Oh. Good job. He cleaned my pool every Sunday. I guess not this Sunday. Pam, you really just mean, Scarfin. So, how about the three pounds? Can I get it? You seem like a good man. Get him the three pounds. Give me the three pounds. You don't have to do that. This is my house. This is his house. That's enough, right? You guys can move in, right? You can save me, right? That's enough, what, that's enough weed or is that enough? What are you doing, my man? Hey, uh, Ray, we wasn't recording. You, you wasn't rec- K-more. Get him to say it again. We were not recording somehow. Ow! You wasn't recording. Damn! Scarf, Scarf in my man. Uh, I know I just asked for three pounds. You know how they read out your receipt? You mind, uh, going over with me what I just got from you? Another? Hmm. It's kind of weird, my man, but, um, very adventurous. Very, uh, aggressive. <laughs> we like aggressive around here, as, uh, as you can see. What do you think about being on my team, my man? What do you think about, uh, joining us, huh? I'll join you as soon as you read me back my order. What did I get, Scarfin? I forgot. We'll get to that, my man. We'll get to that. We'll get to that. Um, just prove yourself again. Guys, I can't kill another person. I don't know what to do. Bring them out. You got to guys come save me. What's another thing I can ask you real quick? Uh, K-more, um, you might just have to do it, you know? We, do. we cannot blow our cover, all right? We are there. There's nowhere else to go, especially for you. So I really need you to kill the man. Just promise me I won't go to jail. Of course. <laughs> Duh. Of course, of course. Okay. Uh, reach in my back pocket here. So here's a knife. Cut his ear off and feed it to him. What? I mean, yeah, because I'm a gangster. Uh, where am I? No, no, where? Uh, uh, who are you? Help, somebody. You just the wrong fish here at the wrong time. No! Uh, uh, damn! Okay. Now read it to me, Scarfan. What did I get from you? That's what I like to see. Well, just gave you three pounds of my best, my man. <laughs> Well, basically, we're like family now, you know, my man. We're, 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 we're family. We're, we're cousins, you know. We're, 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 we can go to the cookout together. Now, because you're family, you get some of my best supplies. Best supplies? Okay. So now I got the three pounds of cuss, and now I get your best supplies? What do you mean by supplies, uh, Scarfin? The, 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 the fishy gum. The, the, you know, what gets the fishes going. The bikini bottom coke. The, 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 the best of the best. It's good. We got it. It's enough. Okay, hurry up! Hurry up and save me! What do you mean, save you? Get your ass on the ground! We got you, Scarfin! What? How did they get me? Must have been Ray with the A. Shoot up the whole place! Get him! Scarfin, you're going down! Ah! Get me out of here! One week later. Sketchy! You made it out! Game up! I thought I'd never see the light. Man, ain't no snitch, ain't no rat. You know, I ain't tell nothing. Neither did I. Wait, how the hell I get out then? Oh, I just got Scarfin in the trouble. <laughs> My number one supplier? What the? I, I mean, what else I was going to do, Sketch? He was going to give you 60 years. Keep me in jail, nigga. You could have kept the damn flow going. I mean, it was either that or I'd never see you again, Sketch. I love you. Damn. Now I got to re-up with another Cuban. And Scarfin going to be looking all over for me. Shit. Now we gotta relocate. Come on, man. I'll help you out. Help me with what? I got your back. You got my back. Last time you had my back, I went to jail. Listen, everything is gonna be good. Trust me. Man, shut up. You don't know how much trouble Scarfin can get us in. He can get us killed. I mean, I'm in it together. We in it. Plus, 
We got right with an A on our side. <laughs> I don't trust that white fish. We gonna be good. Now come on, Skits. I'll buy you a burger. <laughs> yeah, I am kind of hungry. And I kind of woke up unconscious. My bottom fin was kind of sore. Oh, damn. Boss man, it's been a minute since we've been out, right? Look, bro, you ain't gotta keep calling me boss man outside of work. It's weird. What? I mean, I never learned your name. We wear name tags at work for a reason. Oh, yeah, that's right, boss man. My bad. <laughs> Whatever, man. Man! I can't wait to get up inside this club. It's gonna be a great night. I'm gonna do some wild things. <laughs> man, we don't want to see whatever you got going on, k -more. Who idea was it to come to this club anyway? Look at it. It look like it's straight. <laughs> and that's my type of crap. Ain't no but trap stars in me here, baby. <laughs> the finest of the finest. Trust me. Skip dog got you. Last time you said trust you, I ended up losing my leg. <laughs> Damn. $20. Damn, $20? Man, last time I heard it was 10 My bad, boss, man. Got to tell you that. Oh, well, it's cool, because I ain't gonna be the one to pay for this. Shit. <sighs> All right, here go, 40. Uh. Oh, uh, Skits Dog. You got me? Hey, I don't got you. Where your money at? I had to get boss, man. Shit, he my boss. Uh. Boss, man. <laughs> Toy, you got me? No. Ever since you put that gun in my face, I decided never to do nothing for you again. Oh, man, why you bringing up old stuff? Damn, then how am I get in? That's a good question. Cause I ain't paying for you. I did it last time. Shit, I ain't paying for him either. I did the time for that. What? No, that man came more. Sound like you need to get a job. Well, boss man, sound like we about to have some fun up here, huh? Yeah, we gonna have a good time. <laughs> All right, nigga. The wait, y'all gonna leave me? You damn, damn right. right. <laughs> No ass for you. Damn! I guess I really gotta get a job. Wait! I got a great idea! <laughs> I'll just walk on now. Can't wait! Oh my god! Is he beating the hell out there, man? Wait, wait a minute. Why are they kissing now? Oh damn! Is he putting his finger in? You know. Oh yeah. I'm gone. <laughs> I'm glad I ain't getting in that damn club. <laughs> they probably see some damn crazy fishes up in there. <laughs> I ready to go home and play with myself. Uh, Damn, boss man. What the hell got you? Uh, Party animal. <laughs> remind me to never go out with you again. W what you mean? You had a good time last night. Man, them three women, they had me taking shots all night. Boss man, there weren't no three women. What you talking about? <laughs> it was just one big ass fish that you was with. That's another reason why I don't want to go back. I can't tell the difference between three women and one. Ah oh, damn. <laughs> it's cool. Maybe you just like Kmo and y'all into big fish. Man, I hope today is an easy day. I'm not in the mood. <laughs> what up, guys? <laughs> oh my. Poseidon. I'm finna go in the back and act like I'm doing some paperwork. Y'all have fun with this shit. Alright, Tut. Can't wait to see you at work today. Kmo! Man, what the hell you doing here? What you mean, Skits? I got a new job now. I work with you. Work with me? Man, when the hell this happened? I called Mr. Eugene earlier this morning. He said, hey, you can come right in. <laughs> Ain't that right, Mr. Eugene? I'm paying the boy three bucks an hour. He's dumber than a box of rockers. Look at him. Damn! I forgot to get the piss off the seat. I'm just kidding, me boy. <laughs> it wasn't a joke. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Eugene. Such a nice guy. Man, you don't even know what you even doing here. It's easy, Sketch. Look like you ain't doing nothing but mopping shit. Tut is just up in the restroom sleep. Yeah, yeah. I'm out now, but no, my cologne is not honey mustard. And you, all you do is cook. Man, I do more than cook. I'm the man around here. Get your stupid ass better than burgers, me lady. Time is money, and I love money and hoes. Money more. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. Ah! Damn! It's the third time I don't waste food. It's okay, son. It's coming out of your paycheck. Go into the bat with Mr. Butter's touch. Yes, sir. <laughs> I've been waiting on this opportunity. That boy right there is pretty stupid. Alright, k more Now I'm gonna show you how to do the best job in the house. My job. <laughs> Cause you know can't anybody else do my job. Uh, I mean it seems pretty simple. Flip a burger, put it on the bun, and give it to a customer. You think it's that simple, huh? Yeah, but me, 
I got my own secret recipe. <laughs> Man, anybody trying to hear your recipe? All right, this is how I go. And I'm only going to show you this once because I'm high. You get the patty, and you flip it like that. You get the lettuce, tomatoes, pickles, sprinkle a little bit of weed up. I mean, uh, a little bit of lettuce on there. <laughs> Cheese. And now get the bun. Now, now your turn. Okay, uh, lettuce, bread, tomatoes. Bone, sausage, uh, stop, nigga! You, ah, that's horrible. I mean, sketch you over my damn neck. It's a lot of pressure. Okay, one more time. Patty, lettuce, tomato, pickle, onions. Uh, stop! Just go work the damn register with Ted or something. Messing up my mojo. I gotta get high again. Damn, my bad, sketch. I mean, I told you, let me do my secret recipe. Man, recipe your ass up there to the front. I got better things to do. Plus, I'm waiting on the customer to come through. But sketchy. The customer's up in the front. <laughs> Man, I ain't talking about them damn customers. I'm talking about my customers. You think flipping burgers giving me all the money I'm getting? Nigga, I'm selling weed. Get your ass away from back here. And don't tell nobody. Well, damn, sketch. I admire your entrepreneurship. This man is selling weed at work. What does America come to? All right, now. I'm going to take my 30. That mean don't none of y'all bother me. You got it. Hold it down. You know how to work cash register. Somebody order something, you give them their change back. Don't do nothing random like giving a nigga some money for free. All right, cool. Bye-bye. Now, why would I do something like that? <laughs> hey, can I borrow $100? Of course, sir. Here you go. <laughs> Have a nice day. Do I smell missing money? La, 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 la. Timor. Yes, sir. You the masses fired me, boy. Huh? What I do? You're giving away me dollars. I have child support to pay. But he asked for money, sir. What was I gonna do with this? Not let him have any money? <laughs> we got plenty here. Did I put some in my pocket from earlier? Hey, SpongeBob. Yes, sir. Hey, this stupid motherfucker outside. Yes, sir, Mr. Krabs. Let's go, stupid motherfucker. Oh wow, this is a nice way to take somebody outside. <laughs> Such a cool guy. I'll miss you, Kmore. Ah! Mm. Well, that nigga gave away some money. Ain't my problem. <laughs> this is some good shit. Damn! Ah! I thought that guy was nice. <laughs> it kind of tickle. Now I need a job. You lost your job, right? Come work for me. Oh, uh, yeah! And I got a secret recipe that Mr. Eugene and them won't let me do. Do it here for the chum bucket. Oh, really? I can have a job? Yes, come right over. Oh, I won't let you down. I'll show them. She got her diploma from the... She know how to roll that mountain. Mm -hmm. I hope it's a good day. <laughs> Damn, hey, what the hell going on over here? This, why the hell a chum bucket got a long line for? Wait, k, k more. Hey, Sketchy. What's going on? Man, you tell me what's going on. Why the hell a chum bucket got a long line? And what you doing here? Oh! I'm part manager at the Tum Bucket now. What? Oh, yeah, I got a new job. Plankton saw me when I got my ass kicked out the window and was like, hey, do you want a job? <laughs> I couldn't turn a damn. Man, what the hell are all these fish in the line for? Oh, because of my secret recipe. Your secret recipe? Yeah, yeah. You know the one I was trying to get y'all to let me do, but y'all was hating? Now look at me. I'm a big success. <laughs> oh, my God, this is amazing. See? <laughs> Man, what the hell? You a traitor! Try these nuts! Let's go, Kmore. Forget about him. Let those failures cry to their mothers. Oh my gosh, this is so amazing. Would you please sleep with me? <laughs> one at a time, baby, one at a time. Man, this is crazy! I know, right? And y'all could've had it. Now get your unsuccessful ass back across the street to the damn grumpy crap. <laughs> Hey, boss, man, you see that line over there at the chump bucket? Came more crazy as and gave me a secret recipe. Now they going crazy over it. Man, that ain't got nothing to do with me. You better fix it, Mr. Goodweezy, or you will not work here anymore. Hey, I always put a nigga job in jeopardy. All right. Come on. Come on, Sketch. All right, boss, man, all we got to do is go up in there and just really talk to K-Boy. I'm pretty sure he'll come out. Let's get in this damn line. 
Excuse me, excuse me. Hey, buddy. What are you doing? Back of the line. Back of the line, my ass, man. Get the hell out the way. Is there a problem here? What the hell you doing over here? Yeah, man, don't you work for us? Not anymore. Ever since Mr. Kmore has become successful, he no longer fucks with you fuckboys anymore. Now, do I have a force shot with this chop or are we good? Actually, I'm good. What about you, boss man? You? Yeah, nah, I'm straight. I'm good on force. Yeah, okay. Okay, we just, we just, you know what? I think we're gonna wait to the back of the line. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're gonna go to the back of the line. I spin the block with a Glock and pop at the ops. Bang, bang on y'all folks. Man, this shit like seven streets over. Dang. It's gonna require a time transition. Yeah, go ahead and do that, narrator. Five hours later. I wonder how much that nigga make. I already make 55,000 episodes. Wait, what? That's that's way more than I make. I'm gonna start a show. I mean, but you are a fish. Yeah, you're right. I am a fish. Oh, okay. Here go the bracket right here, boss man. All right, here go one right here. And damn, they only 199. Mr. Krabs ass be taxing. Yeah, he do be taxing. Hold on. Wait. Man, this is, this is amazing, boss man. Yeah, man, this is actually good. Oh, damn. <laughs> Don't let Mr. Krabs hear that. This was definitely worth the five hour wait. Hell yeah, I'll wait five more hours for this. <laughs> no, I wouldn't. I would. Damn, who we'll put the Mr. Krabs? You know what? I say we go in there, we figure out what he using to make this, and we take it back to the Krusty Krab. We steal his recipe. This smart, boss man. See, that's why you the boss. Mm-hmm. And the man. You lost me, Sketch. Damn. Okay, come on. What the hell are y'all boys doing? Uh, uh, we got lost. We blind. Oh my goodness. Where's my stick at? I'm scared, but man, I can't see nothing. It's dark. Uh, look what they doing. Trying to steal my stick of recipe. Hey! Yes, sir, Mr. K-Moore. Get these bomb ass niggas up out of here. Yes, sir, Mr. K-Moore. Let's go, bum ass niggas. <laughs> <laughs> so this how I feel. <laughs> Pathetic. Let's go. I'm gonna show you how to flip the burgers in a bit. Hey, man, now what we gonna do about our job now? Mr. Krabs gonna fire us. Man, I don't really care about that. I can go back to being a lifeguard. Hot babes and the crabs on that beach, they don't take your money. Man, wait a minute. Did you get fired from that job? You let somebody drown. This man, Michael Jordan, they hit every buzzer beater. Yeah, whatever. You wanna go smoke? I got some good goods. Definitely. That shit you had last time, you turned me into a human. <laughs> well, I got something that's gonna turn your head to a turtle. We're down here at the Chum Bucket where Kmore's secret recipe is increase the sales. Bob? Man, you won't believe this shit! Hey! Go ahead and show me the recipe, man! This shit is amazing! <laughs> so, like I was saying, you get your burgers right here, and then you got your buns right here. Now let me show you what I do. First, I put that thing on the grill. <laughs> you hear it sizzling? <laughs> then you get your lettuce. Then you get your tomatoes. And then you get this little thing right here. Sprinkle it on top. Sprinkle it on top. Now I got the bun. Uh-huh. <laughs> this is the best part right here. And then I slam it down on the ground. And then I stomp it. And then I spit on it. <laughs> and then I say, yeah! Gotcha. And then I squat on it. Because I feel like I need to be smushed down with my ass. And now I just pick it up and I read it a bedtime story. Once upon a time, not long ago. And then after that, I just give it a little kiss. And I give it to a customer. What? You throwing that gonna make me throw up? Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. I can taste what his ass is. <laughs> Man, I'm still sick of what Kmo ass did. Oh my god, I don't think I'm gonna eat another burger in my life. What's up, y'all? No, no, get your ass out of here right now. Man, it's enough that I live with you. You can't be at the job no more. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I just came back to get Mr. Eugene his $100. I forgive you. You were always my favorite, K-More. <laughs> I knew it. Man, where the hell you get money from? Yeah, man, you ain't got no job no more. Well, after everybody found out what my secret recipe was, and I got fired from the chum bucket, I actually went viral. A page on Instagram actually started a We Hate K-More page, and now we collab, and I get $20,000 a month. 
<laughs> I ain't like crazy. Man, what the hell? I know, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Cut, cut your boy in on the deal. I had you on my show, you know. <laughs> we can make merch together or something. <laughs> you you, you get, the, get the money? Man, get the hell out of our way. Didn't you say we was going to lay up two seasons? Yeah. I'll never forget. Yeah, he right. You did say that. This is my roommate. Ain't that right, roommate? Nah, get your ass about for me. You lucky we are roommates and the animator wrote us into this show. Other than that, I'll leave your ass too. <laughs> See you at home, roomie. Damn. Boss, man, we should never been mean to him, huh? I can't move. I think the animator got tired of animating. Oh, yeah. That's right. It's the end of this episode, y'all. <laughs> I budget low. Donate. Donate if y'all want more. It's been slow as hell all day. Man, what could be going on? This ain't like you, Sketchy. It must just be a bad day. That's what I'm going to chunk it up to. It could increase. Hey, wait a minute. I know that guy. He one of my customers. And him. And him. Hey, yo, where you going? Come on, man. You know I got the best in the city. No, I'm good, bro. This woman down the street is selling way much better stuff than you are. So I'm going to just go buy from her. See you later, bro. Woman down the street? What? And let me see what they talking about. Hey, oh, oh my God. Don't get distracted, Sketchy. Don't get distracted. Excuse me, ma'am. Hey, you! You! Ow, another satisfied customer. Uh-uh, you need to get back in line, baby. Take your time. I'll serve you later. Uh-uh, not right now. Step back. Get in line. In line? Man, ain't no damn customer. Man, this is my corner. You need to take your butt on right here. I own all this. Your corner? Man, it took me less than three hours to take over this whole block. Now, that's my customer. You my customer. You finna be my customer next. You brainwashing my customers. Now, I'm gonna need you to get your butt out of here right now. Now, see, look how tense you are. That's why I need to serve you. I put love in my product. That's why I put a little heart on the bag. Look at them. They all lined up for me. You need some of this, too. What you call yourself? Sketchy? Mm. A little bit of love? What? Wait a minute. You you can you try to say you're going to give me a little bit of love? I mean, I could. I even give you a little discount with your fine ass. Well, <laughs> I mean, now that you mention it, I I mean, you know, this, this block was getting kind of lonely anyway. You know, I, we needed a little bit female, uh, you know. <laughs> so, uh. What's your name, baby? My name, Bebe, but I could be the Bonnie to your Clyde. You want to see if our products go well together? You know, like maybe us type of thing. Well, now that you mention it, I could use a little bit of Bunny. Your name, Bebe? You could be my Bebe. Mmm, girl, you looking real good. So, uh, you got any plans tonight, Bebe? <coughs> <laughs> no, nah, not really. I was fixing to take over the next other couple blocks. You want to help me do that? Oh, you aggressive. You my type. Hell yeah, let's do it, baby. Come on. Yeah, I mean, we can get together a little later. I do have to finish working, though. I got to serve the rest of your customers, baby. Work is work. Uh, uh, okay. You lucky you fine with your man. Uh, all right, I'll see you later. <laughs> Now, everyone just breathe in. <sighs> Damn, I just breathed out. <laughs> My bad, people. Start over. Now, everyone just breathe in. <sighs> breathe out. <sighs> and while you're breathing out, make sure you put your money in a hat right in the front. There you go. One at a time. <laughs> okay, back in positions. Kmore! Man, you won't believe what just What the hell going on here? Oh, I'll be right back, you guys. Just keep breathing in and keep breathing out. Hmm. <laughs> Don't What up, Sketch? Kmore! Man, I just met one of the finest women ever. Oh, for real, Sketch? Where at? She was on my corner. Oh, damn. She ain't no uh, <laughs> prostitute, is she? No. She was actually selling on my corner. Once again, was she a prostitute sketch? Look, she is doing the exact same thing that I'm doing on the corner, K-More. She was selling weed. Oh, damn. I mean, <laughs> was she a bodybuilder or something? I mean, usually women who sell weed be kind of big or aggressive. Or she was aggressive, but this one, she, mean, she was beautiful. 
But this one right here, man, I don't know. It's something about her. She's just different. I mean, usually people stand down to me, but her? Mm -mm. She took charge, and I like that. You know, she even reminded me of a bunny and a Clyde. I think that's what I want to be with her, k -more. Well, I mean, <laughs> congratulations, kid. Yeah, me and her got a little date tonight. So, uh, wish your boy good luck. Good luck, nigga. <laughs> All right, back to the class. Breathe in. Breathe. Put the money back right there. I just saw you. Crazy ass monk. He's <laughs> <laughs> just the address. Who the fuck is it? Uh, this, uh, sketch. Is, is Bebe here? Baby, come in. Real slow, though. Okay. Wait, why the hell you got your gun? Nigga, did you bring a water pistol with you? No, nah, this ain't no water gun. This is a real gun. Now you put yours down. Why it's so little, though? <laughs> you put your... Oh, you ain't got to put your gun... No, okay, put your gun down. It's cute, though. <laughs> Stop playing with me. Put your gun down. I mean, I'll put my gun down, but what you want me to do about all of these other guns? Nigga, ain't no need for me to put the gun down. I'm covered. Put your shit down. You in my house now. Yeah, you got a point. Okay. So you ready to go? Oh, Sketch, you was gonna protect me if something happened or something. I mean, hell yeah, I'm gonna protect you, girl. What you think? You rolling with the Sketch dog now. <laughs> she all these guns, you damn nigga protect me. I'm gonna treat you like Neptune. You the king of my sea. You don't have to carry no guns with you here. Put your put your gun in my holster. I got you, king. Girl, man, you gonna get along just fine. Let's go. Yeah, you know what? Uh, this is like uh, my... Favorite restaurant I always come to right here. You know, they know me up in here. <laughs> I'm the man. Oh, this is real nice. I like this. This is cute. Oh, they got, oh, they got tablecloths. I know that's right. <laughs> well, you know anything when you're rolling with the sketch dial, baby. <laughs> How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? Sketchy, it's good to see you in here again, my man. Hey, bro. You sound just like my damn roommate. I'm not crazy. It gotta be the same person talking for the sake. You know what? I'm just gonna ignore it. Yeah, I'm, I'm back in here again, brother. What's good? Back again so soon, huh, Mr. Sketch? Look, what you talking about? Oh, I mean, this is like your fourth time in here this month. <laughs> just can't get enough for you, huh? Fourth time? Mm. Well, this will be the last time you'll see him with anybody other than me. I can guarantee that. Exactly. So mind your damn business, Mr. Waiter. Oh, uh, okay. So what will you guys be having? Our special we have going tonight is some expensive shit. So, would you like that? Uh, no. Okay. Well, here's our menu. I'm going to try this thing I saw on Instagram of food TV or something. Y'all got um snail hips in here. Snail hips? No. Shoulders, but not hips. What about barbecue worm legs? Y'all got them? What the hell? Uh, no, we don't have barbecue <laughs> worm legs, ma'am. Eyes, but not legs. Well, I thought you said this was one of them fancy restaurants. Y'all got sea urchin crumbs, like the ones they put on the bottom of the thing, like at the other place. Like, don't you order crumbs at the thing? Uh, Mr. Sketch, I think you may want to take her to the chum bucket, sir, because none of that stuff is here. Would you like something simple, ma'am? Like a glass of wine, uh, bread, any normal appetizer that we can start you off with? <laughs> I suggest you get that expensive shit that I was mentioning. Well, don't even worry about it. Just start me off with a drink. I need to get lit. Ooh, they got Hennessy in here. Baby, get us some Hennessy sketch. Yeah. It, yeah, give us some of that hen dog. I want some of that too. <laughs> okay. One hen dog coming right up. Anything else? Um, let me have the apple. So you want Hennessy and the apple? God, thank you. Okay. And uh, give me some spaghetti and uh, a box to go. Thank you. Okay. I know why you got the spaghetti. You want to share a noodle with me like on that lady in the tramp thing, ain't it? I'm going to share a noodle with you, Sketch. Girl, you read my mind. Damn. Yeah, this is going to be amazing. Ari Sketch, hold my gun and this purse I took from this lady at the table next to us. I gotta go pay real quick. No problem, baby. Take your time, girl. <laughs> Take your time. She didn't have a purse. Yep, I'm gonna get that. Get some of my damn money back she stole from my customers. I don't play that. I'm loyal to my customers. <laughs> One bathroom break later. 
I'm back. Look at all these soaps they had in the bathroom. Ooh, and the lady in there, she gave me a whole bunch of gum, too. Actually, I kind of stuck her up for the gum. She tried to give it to me, but whatever. And she had a whole lot of money that other people was giving her. I was like, what kind of hustle she got running here? Hold all these coins for me, too. Look, baby. Damn, girl, you hit a lick. But look, I'm going to need you to hold it down for me. Scared the dog got to use the restroom. I'll be right back, baby. All right, baby, you know I got you. You know I got you. And what you got in here? What he got for me? Uh-uh, not condoms, what he thought was finna, oh, they small too, oh, sketch, no worry about that, oh, okay, he got some money, I thought he wasn't getting no money today, where all this money come from, I know that's right. Another bathroom break later. Mm, okay, here he comes, welcome back, dear daddy, you like when I call you daddy, I just thought about that. Whoa! Man, I'm full. Damn, girl, you know you can eat. Thank you for ordering for me. I was just sort of out of my element. I ain't know about ordering in places like this. Thank you. No problem, baby. It's the least I can do. Uh, waiter, can you bring the check? I'm ready to go, man. Bring the check for what? Like, move, I got this. Here you go, sir. Here's your check. Oh, damn! Oh. Yeah, you can run me them checks, but run me some real checks, like with some signatures on the back. Matter of fact, clear all these tables out. We taking all this shit with us. Oh, and you know what? Bring me another one of them little, them lobsters things that you had ordered earlier. Bring me some of them, too. All of that shit. Come on, Sketchy. Back up out of here. Nah, uh uh Hold my back. Hold my back. Grab that off that table right there, too. Thank you for the doggy bags. It's been real, y'all. Damn! I thought you like coming here, Sketch. My bad about that, man. Look, I'm trying to get some ass. Y'all be good. I had a good time with you tonight, girl. You know what, Sketch? Yeah, I had a real good time, too. I like the way you held me down tonight. Like, you really had my back. That was nice. Baby, when you with the Sketch dog, you're going to always be protected. Trust me. <laughs> I mean, but it's been a long time since somebody really, you know... Like, I felt like you could be my partner in crime and whatnot. You know, I was thinking about what we said earlier. Maybe we could, you know, hold the block down together. What you think? That's crazy. I was just thinking the same thing. You know, like, I, I felt you seen what I had going on at first. You know, you saw how I was killing it, you know. And you wanted to come over there on the block. And you start doing your little, your little thing. And, you know what I'm saying, the customer saw you and... and so we we on the same page. We on the same page. I was really thinking more about you taking the further end of the block near where my grandma house is, cause I can't run into her no more. But yeah, what you just said, baby, what you just said. Yeah, 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 exactly. You know what? I think me and you we gonna make a real good team, girl. Yeah, me and you, Sketch. Me and you, mm, your little guns and stuff. Yeah. Stop talking about my gun. Hey, you have a good night. Bye. Good night, Sketchy! Larry, the lady does not walk into the house. I'm telling you. Man, you crazy. I've seen this before. Look! I told you! Look! Oh, damn, Sketchy! Run, Larry, run! K-Mort! Man, I told you about laying that damn roach in the- Oh, no, man, I was about to kill him. He was just- Never mind. What's going on, Sketch? Man, I just had one of the best- Days of my life. Really? Of your life, Sketch? You mean the Sketch dog? The P-I-M-P? -E you sound like you whipped. <laughs> I mean, I ain't gonna say all that, K-More, but damn. She hit me with something. I mean, it's like we just got this connection. You know what I'm saying? That it's different, K-More. I think I'm in love. I'm glad to hear this, Sketch. Maybe we could double date sometimes. Me, you, her, biscuits. Uh... I don't know about that yet. Biscuit ass can't even fit in the car, let alone all four of us. Oh, yeah, you right. Probably got to rent out a U-Haul that day. But it's cool. <laughs> I'm happy for you, Sketch. Yeah, me too. And now, yeah, you know all that money she made on my block earlier? She tried to hustle me. I got her ass back. Wait, she took my money. Huh? She took my money. Oh, man. I love this woman. Woo! This nigga is crazy. Larry, you can come back out now. He gone. <laughs> Let's finish watching the show. 
100. Yeah, I made some decent money today. Streets <sighs> getting kind of cold out here, man. I need me some protection. Oh! Look at this little worm! Oh, man, this little thing is. <laughs> ah! Damn! Man, this thing hurt! Man, this would be the protection I need. Wish I had me a worm. I'm so sorry about that, sir. This right here is Philip. What's your name? Uh, you don't need to know my name, weirdo. I'm sorry. Uh,. Hey man, you know where I can get another one of these worms right here for? Oh yeah, it's right down the block. It's an animal shelter. You can't miss it. They got the most baddest, dangerous worms. Really? Yeah, really. I hate the way you talk. We can end this conversation now. I like talking to you. I'm gone. Okay. Bye. Okay, I'm here at the animal shelter. Oh, look at that little guy in the window. Oh, he looks aggressive. He's perfect. <laughs> Now you just move your foot down here like a little pedal, and then your clay is gonna start moving on its own, ladies. Now, as it moves, I want you to get both of your fins and put it around the clay. Now look at the shape it makes. <laughs> now I know you're thinking what it is, but it's not. Get your brain out of the gutter. <laughs> oh, sketch! Man, what the hell is going on here? Oh, nothing, I'm teaching pottery class. Ladies, say hi to Sketch. Hi. Hello. Y'all smell. Sketch, what the hell is that? Man, it's my new pet worm. <laughs> he aggressive. Excuse me one second, ladies. Sketch, you got a pet? Why didn't you tell me? I would have made you just get another snail. Man, I need protection around me. And only a worm can do that for me. Oh, damn. I mean, is he supposed to be aggressive? Yeah. But, I mean, ever since I got him, he ain't really did nothing. Now, I guess I got the wrong one. Either way, I'll probably just return him tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, I think you got a dud. But other than that, the little guy is cute. Hey, well, I'm about to go upstairs and lay down. You think you can watch him? Wait, wait, wait a minute. Let me get rid of my class real quick. Okay, ladies, we're going to pick this back up on Wednesday. So now that we've made the first shape, we're going to start on the second shape that's more of a hole. And we're going to put them together. <laughs> now get y'all ass up out of here. Okay. Oh, look at this little worm. Sketchy got to know I'm the best caretaker ever. <laughs> hey, look, 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 look. Hey, little guy. Look, 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 look. Ah! Damn! What the hell? Hey, K-more. What the hell going on? Man, your damn thing just bit me. My thing? My thing is a worm. Don't disrespect him. And what you mean he bite you? This man ain't did nothing since we got here. But what, well, I'll be damned. You just bit the hell out of me. Man, you overreacting. You probably failed or something. Man, I'm telling you, it's what he did. I don't believe it. Anyway, I'm gone. Don't blame none of that's on him. Matter of fact, get away from him. You don't got to tell me twice. His ass is staying down here tonight. Man, I remember this episode. This one dude got his ass beat. <laughs> I remember it too. Damn! Larry, it's been a minute since I've seen you. Where the hell you been? Man, you know I have to take care of some business. I got a baby mama and a side chick over there on rock bottom I had to go see. <laughs> you a pimp, Larry. To be a roach, you got a lot of guys. <laughs> hey, what the hell that is? <laughs> oh my god, Larry! <laughs> oh, man, what the fuck? I'm out of here! <laughs> Don't ever invite me over here again! Larry! You damn worm! That was my best friend. See, Sketch, you don't see how crazy you are. But I know. Sketch! Man, what? This damn worm just tried to kill Larry. Who the hell is Larry? Don't you remember? My old roach friend I told you about. He can eat that damn roach. No, he can't. Larry is my friend. Man, I'm going back to bed. Oh, yeah. You got to get up out of here. Hey, old biscuits. <laughs> you gotta stop rubbing on me like that, girl. Oh, oh, wow, my neck. Oh, you know I love when you be fucking on my neck. Ah, damn. Ah, wait, you, you, you kind of nibbling too hard, girl. Oh, damn. Ah, ah, oh my God. 
I'm an upside down. Where am I? What's going on? Sketch! Hey, shut your ass up. Oh my gosh, it's the worm! Yeah, it is the worm. I heard you want to get rid of me, huh? Oh, uh, I, I didn't say such a thing, Mr. M Mr. Worm. Oh no, don't try to take it back now. I heard everything, and I'm going to get rid of you. What? Yeah, and it's just going to be me and Sketch around this place. He doesn't need you. Oh, yes he do! I I'm his bestest, bestest friend. Not anymore. Now I get rid of you. Well, Sketch ain't gonna believe you once he sees what's happening right now. Not if you smoke all his weed. Now how can I smoke his weed if I'm upside down? <laughs> you got me tied up, idiot. <laughs> oh, that can be arranged. You like peanut butter? Yeah, I like peanut butter. Oh, how's <coughs> oh, you making me smoke? Stop! <coughs> man, what the hell going on down here? K-more! Man, why you smoking all my weed? <laughs> Sketch! I swear I didn't do this! It was that worm! How the hell it was the worm came on when he was over there asleep? And your eyes as red as the devil's dick! He tied me up! <coughs> and he put the weed to my mouth and made me smoke it! So you want me to believe that my poor worm that ain't did nothing to nobody tied you up, put weed to your mouth, not only did that, lit it up, and made you smoke? Yes! He did all of that! And his little ass can talk. And he got a smoker's call. Scared the hell out of me. Yeah, I'm going back to bed. <laughs> this is crazy. Come on, little guy. Getting accused of by K-more. Man, get some rest. Keep that damn thing away from me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, all right, man. I'm out of here. Wait, wait, wait. Don't leave yet, sir. Uh, I'm not finished playing chess. Come on, man, this is the hundredth game we've played. Don't you have a home to get to? Oh, I don't want to go home. I'm getting bullied by a damn worm. Oh, wait, you don't mean one of those aggressive worms, do you? Yeah, yeah. You know about them? Know about them. My brother got his ass eat by one of them the other day. Man, those things are getting out of hand. I know, right? And now my room my has one. And I'm scared. I don't know what to do. Well, you know, you could just use one of those teddy bear cameras. <gasps> wait a minute. You a genius! That's perfect! <laughs> Thank you, sir! Thank God, now I can go home. So all I gotta do is get a stuffed teddy bear with a camera and I'll use that to expose the worm. <laughs> K-more, you a genius. La 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 la. I'm not doing anything. I'm just gonna put this nice teddy bear here. <laughs> Dumbass worm. <laughs> so, how's it going, Mr. Worm? You, uh, feeling kind of froggy? <laughs> huh? You want to jump? Uh huh? Oh, you ain't big and bad today, huh? Why are you not moving? Hello? Don't you see me? Messing with you? You weak ass? Huh? Oh, you just not gonna move, huh? Yeah, that's what I thought. You. Punk out here! k more. what the hell you doing to my worm? This worm is not what you think it is, Sketch! Man, you know who I think you are! Punching my damn worm like that! I'd have kicked you in a damn fin! Man, whatever! This damn thing is evil! And I swear you're gonna see one day! Man, get out of here! You crazy! Are you okay, little worm? I'm sorry about that. You know, I'm gonna get you, I'm gonna get you away from this crazy old man right here. Yeah, poor thing. Yeah, yada, yada, yada. Man, matter of fact, you out. Oh, no. You kicking me out, Sketch? Yeah, I'm kicking you out. You crazy. Over here smacking my damn worm. You know what? Fine. You can have it. You and your little damn worm. I'm out of here. Fine. Get out. Crazy ass. Come on, little worm. You okay, little guy? Can't believe k was putting his hands on you. Talking about you can talk. <laughs> that man losing his mind. Probably all that damn weed he was smoking. Smoking up my damn weed. No, he know better than that. Yeah, he was crazy, right? <laughs> yeah, he was, man. You know he had the nerve. Oh, wait a minute. What the hell? Did you just talk? Yeah, I did. Hey, Sketchy, look up. What? Yeah, boss. We got him. Yeah, man, what the hell is going on? Wait, Wormy? I'm not your damn Wormy. I'm a grown-ass worm. I always hated that name. Hey, what the hell going on, Wormy? 
How could you betray me like this? And you can't talk! Oh man, k was right. I feel so bad for doing this. Hey, shut your ass up. Where's your weed stash? My weed what? Your weed stash, buddy. I'm here to get it. Man, you here to rob me? Oh damn! Tell me right now, or I'm gonna stick this damn thing so far up your officers! Arrest that damn worm! Come here, you damn worm. We've been looking all over for you. Game more! I never been so happy to see you! Yeah, yeah. Anyways, get your ass up out of here. Good job, son. <laughs> Thanks, officer. And I got it all on this teddy bear right here. You can keep the footage. <laughs> I got three copies of this shit. I'm gonna steal this on eBay. Game more! Man! You was right! I'm sorry I didn't believe you in the first place. I mean, it just sounded kind of crazy. A little worm talking and, you know, making you smoke. I mean, yeah, it's sketch, but you gotta know, I'll never do anything like that to you. You're my best friend. Yeah, I know. So, uh, you, uh, nigga, you know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> I know, sketch. Of course I'll move back in. Yeah, appreciate that, k more. But, under one condition. What? <laughs> And you just move your foot and make sure you have your fans around the clay. Man, this shit is stupid. Sketch! Put your hands around it so you can make the shape. <laughs> Y'all, he nasty. <laughs> Sorry I let you down, boss. Man, we almost had it. How the hell you ruined that? It was that damn K-more. Gotta take him down too. Yeah, don't even mention him. I got some big plan for that little dude. Who the hell is he? I don't know, but he's good. Sketchy, here's your check. Let me see. $200, man. See, bruh, this is what I'm talking about. Doing all this work and just getting this measly old money. Man, I need me a new job. ASAP. I'm out of here. Go ahead and take my little smoke break. Oh, wait a minute. What they say in the window? $25 an hour? Oh, yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and try to put my name in for an interview. Good, sir. Nice, 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 nice. Well, um, you seem to pass all the requirements. We really like everything that you have to offer. Yes, sir, and I graduated top of my class. <laughs> oh, yeah, it says only 12 students at your school. Yep, and I was number one. Well, that's very good to hear. Well, um, like I said, we like everything that's right here. Um, um, I think the last thing after this will just be um, a drug test, and once you pass that, you're in. <laughs> you can pass that, right? Uh, yeah, I can pass the drug test. Me? Drugs? <laughs> no way. Of course not, sir. <laughs> Well, okay, great. You come back tomorrow and we'll be squared away. Yes, sir. <laughs> Man, finally get a chance to get a good job. Put on this whack old tie. And I still end up getting messed up. Man, I'm going to fail that drug test. I got weed coming out my system when I take a shower. Damn, where I'm going to get some clean pee from? Uh, can't rely on him. Nah, nah. Not Lil John. Nah, not him. Wait! Kamo ain't smoked in 30 days. He should be clean. That's perfect. I ask him. All right. And you just mix this in with the blue. And then you put this red one right here. And then... Uh, oh! Sketch! Sketch, you almost made me blow this whole place up. <laughs> I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. Give me one second. Kamo, I, I need to talk to you real quick. Well, let me get done with my chemistry class first. k is important! Huh. Damn! You always ruining my fun. Uh, all right, guys. We'll pick back up tomorrow where we left off, okay? And everybody stay safe. Don't mix the red and the blue, and if you do, <laughs> that's your ass. Okay, k -more. So, you know, I've been working at the Crystal Crab for a minute, right? Yeah. And, man, I'm sick of that crap. Mr. Mr. Krabs don't pay nothing, so I found this job, and your boy ended up getting it. Oh, damn! That's amazing, Sketch! I always knew you could improve yourself. 
Uh, yeah. But anyways, so I got the job, but there's one thing that I need. Oh, uh, what's that? Man, I gotta take a drug test. Oh, damn. You in a drug test, catch? You got two chances. <laughs> Slim and none. <laughs> That's the only test your ass can pass is a drug test. <laughs> you got all the drugs. Yeah, I know. And I know I'm in a feeling it. So, I was thinking, yeah, that you can let me borrow some of your pee. No. No. No, you, no, no skits. You can't borrow my piss. I need my piss on Sunday. What? I'm, uh, <laughs> ignore it. No, Skits, you cannot have my pee. And I stand by that. Come on, K-More, I do it for you. No, the hell you wouldn't name when you did anything for me, Skits. What, K-More? So you mean to tell me I ain't saved you from that big-ass worm that time? Yeah, you forgot about that already, huh? Flashback. Oh, no! Oh! Oh! K-More! <sighs> well, his mouth starting to open. K-More! Can you hear me? Yes, Gatsy! Walk this way! Follow the light! <laughs> okay! Hey, what up, Sketchy? Game on! Oh, you know what? I did. Ugh! Okay, when do you need it for? You got me? I oh, appreciate that, k -more. So look, if you could just take this cup wrapper and wrap- Wait a minute, Sketch. I said I'd do it. But I didn't say when. <laughs> what you mean? Well, I need you to do a couple things for me before I go ahead and pee in this here cup. <laughs> what you mean? Let's go for a ride. Oh, don't forget my laundry basket. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Damn, man, why you got so many bandanas? Don't you worry about it. You just keep folding. And I like my corners real creepy. There you go. One, two, three. Man, this is crazy. All right. Can I get the piss now? Mm, <laughs> no, I got something else I want you to do. Hey, more man, do I really have to do this? Shut up! You said you wanted my pee and you agreed that you'll do anything that I ask. So, hey, be quiet. Let's go, Larry. Johnny ate a booger and it tastes like sugar. Johnny want to know who ate that booger. I'm sketch, you it. So that means you got to count. <laughs> so turn your ass around and count to 20. <laughs> Let's go, Larry. One, two, she's stupid. Three. K more, man, this gotta be the last one. I promise you, it's the last one, Sketch. Now, you just grab this scrap over here and just put it around my back. Man, this shit is weird as hell. Be quiet. Okay, ladies, now just rub the front of your stomach. Now your baby, just talk to her. Just say, hey, mommy's here. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> now ladies, do y'all hear y'all baby talking back? Shh, shh, just listen. <coughs> oh, mine just kicked me. <laughs> All right, K-Moy, go ahead, go in there and go piss. Hurry up. I can't pee while you watching me, Skates. Turn around. <laughs> I need my privacy. I gotta talk to my friend when I pee. I gotta get him started. Hey, little guy. It's okay. Take your time. There's no rush. How's your day going? <laughs> oh, oh, there he goes. <laughs> yep. My boy. Uh, ah. There you go. You can go back to sleep now. <laughs> Good job. There you go, Sketch. Man, K Moy, you is. Fucking crazy. Give me this piss. You should be good. Good luck. <laughs> See you later. <sighs> yes. I finally got the piss. Now I'm going to be making $30 an hour. <sighs> Sketchy did it again. 24 hours later. Oh, k more they calling me. they calling me. <laughs> I knew I got the job. Go ahead and answer, Sketch. Let's see. Hello. Is this Clarence Butterscotch? Yes, sir. <laughs> so about your drug test? Yes, sir. So you definitely tested negative for marijuana? Of course. <laughs> so when do I start? But you tested positive for cocaine. You tested positive for promethazine. 
You tested positive for heroin, crayons, a plan B, birth control. You even had a mixture of a horse tranquilizer inside of you. But yeah, you didn't get the job. Sorry. Man, what the hell? Damn. That's why I was sleepy that night. <laughs> I knew that damn horse tranquilizer had did something to me. Game on! But Sketch, you asked me did I smoke weed? No. You didn't ask me if I did anything else. <laughs> Man, why the hell you got birth control? So I don't get pregnant. Duh. Stupid. That's for women. Oh. No wonder I've been crying lately. <laughs> oh, I feel like watching a soap opera. Is it really men made? And I'm so sick of this. I'm sick of work. I'm sick of watching over my shoulder. It's like I'm stressed everywhere I turn. Man, only if I could do something to relieve the stress. La 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 la. Huh, such a wonderful day. I love life. I love this. I love you, little plant. I love little Larry. <laughs> oh, Sketch. How's it going? Shut up talking to me. Damn, Sketch. Hello to you, too. What's wrong with you? Man, I'm just tired, bro. Wait a minute. Why are you so relaxed? Let me guess. You high as hell, huh? Uh, not this time, Sketch. I'm just naturally relaxed. <laughs> I got me a great massage today. Wait a minute, you got a massage? Oh yes, and it's one of the best massage parlors around here. Guess what? And it comes with a happy ending, if you know what I mean, Skits. <laughs> a happy ending? Oh, we talking about the same happy ending, right? Hell yeah, we talking about the same happy ending. <laughs> it's amazing. You gotta try it out, Skits. Well, okay, uh, can you take me to it? Hell yeah, I can take you to it. You are gonna love this. You are not gonna regret it. <laughs> My happy customer back again so soon. Oh, yes, I am. But this time it's not for me. It's for my buddy Sketch right here. Oh, hello, friend. How are you today? I'm doing good, sweetheart. How about you? Oh, better now, honey. What you need today? Mm hmm. Okay. Well, my buddy k here tells me, uh, you guys get the best massages in town. <laughs> Oh yeah, honey, we do deep tissue, we do hot stone, anything you like. Mmm, deep, deep tissue, huh? Yeah, I like that one. Okay, and uh, also he told me, uh, you guys do happy endings. Oh yeah, honey, we do happy ending for you, the happier. Oh, uh, okay. Came more boy, you really came through this time. <laughs> Don't worry, Skitch, I got you. Lee Ling, can you show us to the back, please? Oh, honey, many not. Oh, so tense. Yeah, baby, I'm real tense. But I got a lot of tension built up somewhere else, too. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, yeah, honey, we can get there very soon. I can't wait. That's what I came here for. Ha, huh, sketchy, isn't this the life? I mean, yeah, it's cool, but I'm really ready for this happy ending. She said we gonna get to it soon, so uh, I'm gonna just be patient. Trust me, sketch, it's worth the wait. <laughs> ah! Ah! Yes, that's my spot. Good. Ah! Here you go, honey. I make something nice for you to drink. Make you very strong, man. Very strong? Oh! I get it. She want me to be nice and hard when it's time. <laughs> Three steps ahead of you. <laughs> Ew! Damn tea is nasty. k more. And when we gonna get down to the nitty gritty? Sketch! She just gave you the tea. Don't worry. It's about to happen soon. <laughs> hey, you want those cucumbers on your eyelids? What? Do you want the cucumbers? Uh, no, and I don't want to give it to you either. Damn, it's my favorite. Okay. <laughs> oh, so relaxing. Can't wait to the next one, boy. Woo! <laughs> This is one of my favorite ones right here. Walking on a hot coal. Walking on a what? Sketch, don't worry. It's getting you closer to the happy ending. <laughs> How in the hell walking on cold can get me closer to the happy ending, K-More? Because it gets you hot and ready like a little Caesar's pizza. <laughs> Watch this. Ha, 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 ha,
I loved it. Go ahead, Sketch. Your turn. Forget all that. Man, where that little Asian thing get right now? Lin Lin, I want my happy ending right now. Damn, Sketch. Oh, you messed up every damn thing. Oh, Lin Lin, go ahead and give me his happy ending. Okay, honey, you ready? Hell yeah, I'm ready. Okay, you take deep breath in, close your eye, and give me your hand. Ooh, okay, I like where this is going. See, that's just what I'm talking about, k more Yeah, <laughs> finally. All right, what else you need me to do, baby? Go ahead, what else? Oh, give me the other hand, too. Ooh, okay. <sighs> okay, prepare for happy ending. <laughs> oh, stretch. Boy, you about to go crazy. <laughs> Ooh, I can't wait, k more Lay it on me. Okay, I get to you right now. Okay, here you go, big boy. Oh, see, I tell you, very strong, man. Yeah, you know, I don't like to be a show-off, but, uh, <laughs> your boy working down here. Okay, Sketch, open your eyes. What the? Man, what the hell is this? It's a gold fin, you see? Man, where's the happy ending? Oh, the ain't happy ending, honey. You get the fear. Very special fear. Good for you. And good for the soul. Yeah, Sketch. <laughs> don't you love it? Best happy ending ever. I love getting these fins every time I come here. <laughs> I got a collection of them now. Came more out of kick your ass. You know what I was talking about. Man, get me up out of here. It, here, you can keep your fin, Lin Lin. But honey, it's just for you and many gold. It's okay, Lin Lin. He don't understand. One day he will. Can I take it though? Oh, honey, I have something different for you. Come to the back room. Oh, damn. I guess I'm about to get the real happy here. <laughs> Skits to some dumb ass. I now present to you elevator music. Oh, this is the elevator music right here. Damn. Hey, what floor are you going on? <laughs> okay. Grandmaster Funk like skies. So heavy, so I walk with a limp. Got a lot of hoes, I ain't never been a pimp. Eat a lot of fish, I ain't never eat shrimp. Grown ass man, I ain't never been a simp. Talk a lot of shit, so I knew you was a hater. Make a girl with, call a curry activator. Teach you like candy, eat you now, eat you later. Got a lot of guap, had to change my neighbors. Pocket so heavy, so I walk with a limp. Got a lot of hoes, I ain't never been a pimp. Eat a lot of fish, I ain't never eat shrimp. Grown ass man, I ain't never been a simp. Talk a lot of shit, so I knew you was a hater. Make a girl with, call a curry activator. Teach you like candy, eat you now, eat you later. Got a lot of guap, had to change my neighbors. Walk with a limp, walk with a limp. Grown ass man, I ain't never been a simp. Ho try to talk that shit, so I gave her but now nothing. Now she acting like a champ. Got a lot of money, so I bought me a blimp. Dying. Bitch, I'm on fire, you can check my temp. Hop in the pool, so I took me a swim. Dying. Got a lot of flex, I ain't even need a gym. Yup, <laughs> you see me flexing over here, girl. What you want more? I don't think you ready for more, cause that first thing wasn't nothing. Okay, just sit down, I got you. Yeah, yeah. Uh, bitch on the weatherman, bun in my other hand, light as a feather man. I make a weather man, I give a medicine, shine like I'm Edison, fly like a pelican, slim like a skeleton, drink like a Mexican, pop in my melanin, pussy my regimen, her name was Evelyn, kissing her cinnamon, she's a Dominican, I give a dick again, she is from Michigan. Damn. Call me Michael Jackson from the way that I beat it Bitch love me, she don't care that I'm cheap Shit got real so I call me a meter Nigga breath stinks, can you please stop breathing? Ate me an apple out the garden of eating Nigga ask why I don't even need a reason Got a six pack cause it's undressed for you Pocket so heavy so I walk with a limp Got a lot of hoes, I ain't never been a pimp Eat a lot of fish, I ain't never eat shrimp Grown ass man, I ain't never been a simp Talk a lot of shit so I knew you was a hater Make a girl wit, call a curry activator Teach you like candy, eat you now, eat you later Got a lot of guap, had to change my neighbors Pocket so heavy so I walk with a limp Got a lot of hoes, I ain't never been a pimp Eat a lot of fish, I ain't never eat shrimp. Grown ass man, I ain't never been a simp. Talk a lot of shit, so I knew you was a hater. Make a girl wit, call a curry activator. Treat you like candy, eat you now, eat you later. Got a lot of guap, had to tame my night. Tame my night, this nigga. You can get out the elevator now, baby. <laughs> Here's the floor. Nice meeting you. Yo, hey, die, die, die. Season two, baby. We're going all the way to season 200. Elevator music coming out on Christmas on all platforms. Die! <laughs> Man, that was a long day of work. Ready? Hey, K Moore. Man, you won't believe who I saw at work today. This girl. Was oh my god! Oh! Get it! Oh my god, close the day of door. Oh, he's all rude. Don't, don't, Sketchy. I'm sorry, baby. <laughs> My eyes.
I can't believe I just saw Free Willy. <laughs> ah, ooh, so much damn jelly in there. <laughs> oh, biscuits. Girl, I swear you the best I ever had. I know you always crush my bones every time we do this, but I swear every limb is worth it. Hey, I'm still here. Oh, my bad. Hey, biscuits, baby. You mind going in the room real quick while me and Sketch have a little quick conversation? <laughs> no problem. Don't keep me waiting. I want Sugarfoot. <laughs> Isn't she lovely? I call her Sugarfoot because you know she borderline diabetic. Doctor said if she keep on eating the way she is, it's going to be a scary sight. She may lose the foot. But I told her we going to go walking every day. Instead of me giving her regular Gatorade, I give her Gatorade Zero. Now, I know it's still kind of bad, but you got to do one thing at a time. <laughs> Man, I ain't trying to hear none of that. What? Is that my damn rope? Uh, yeah. And hey man, why you didn't tell me it was velvet? <laughs> Boy, you know you got good taste. Hey man, take my shit. You know what? What I just got done seeing, keep that shit. What What you mean, Sketch? That was beautiful, right? <laughs> Did you see her gorgeous body? I mean, you should saw her ass going like, fly her, fly her. I did see it. Look, forget all that. I'm sick of this shit, k -more. Ever since you and her got together, my life has been horrible. You had changed the damn door for her. Now we got a hole in the ceiling. We got to get three refrigerators and all them bitches still be empty. Oh, yeah, that's my bad. I, I, I forgot to mention that, you know, my baby can get hungry at 3 o'clock. What you mean 3 o'clock? 4 o'clock? 5 o'clock? 6 o'clock? That bitch never stop eating. Hey, can't chill. That's my queen. I got to keep her happy. <laughs> we need to keep her happy ass away from here. Won't you go to her house? I can't even sell weed in peace. Every time I'm thinking it's a customer, it's a damn Postmates order from her. I'm sick of this shit. And that's the third soap of this damn month. I mean, look, my baby was going through a couple things. She had gained a little bit of weight. And that's why the couch is broke, Sketchy. It ain't like she just huge. Okay, more. shut the hell up. And can you please close that damn road? I pay the bills around here, too. That's why I give your ass $400 a month. I could be butter-ass naked around here if I chose to. <laughs> Matter of fact, ah, feast your eyes. Oh, damn. It is kind of cold in here. I did this at the wrong time. Oh, this all good. Where my gun at? Oh, scared. Oh, I, <laughs> I was just playing. I was just talking. I was just talking. Yeah, exactly. All I know is you and her need to start going to her damn house and ruin her furniture. You know what? I never thought about that. You mean to tell me you never thought about going to her house? I mean, no. <laughs> I really haven't. And actually, I haven't even seen her house. That's a good idea, Skits. We'll start going to her crib. Yeah, do that. Sick of this shit. Feeling like it's an earthquake every day. Scary as hell. <laughs> it's fun for me. <laughs> I got used to it. <laughs> oh my God, that restaurant looks so amazing. I agree, baby. We definitely got to go there. Oh my goodness, all you could eat? I ain't never seen that before. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm gonna give you anything that you want, beautiful. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Oh, damn! I totally forgot. I told Sketch the wheel start tilling at your house. So, what you want me to do? Oh, you gotta hide. Shit. Um, perfect. Here, get this lamp shiny right here. <laughs> He'll never notice. What up, K Moore? What's good, Sketch? How was work? Man, crazy as hell as usual. I swear, man, I'm gonna kill that Eugene cat. I hate his ass. <laughs> you crazy, Sketch. Why well, I smell bacon and baked biscuits and, and a hint of hot sauce? Oh, boy, your senses is amazing. You should be, <laughs> I used to work for some type of government, Sketch, but I don't know why you smelling anything. I ain't like I had company over or anything or nothing like that. <laughs> yeah, okay. But yeah, man. I want to apologize how I came across, you know, the other night about the whole biscuit situation, man. Oh, I mean, it's cool, Sketch. I mean, then again, you did walk in on us having, you know, amazing. I have Don't give me a damn picture of it anymore. I'm trying to apologize. Wait, where did all my fries go? Oh, my God. Damn. These things wouldn't even save it. Man, what the hell? Oh. I'm sorry. Biscuits! Come on, baby! k more. that's it! You and her need to go to her damn house right now! I'm sick of this! Come on from work, 
Can't eat my food. I'm starving. I hate her. I'm gonna go for a walk. Do what I do best. Sell this pound. When I come back, she needs to be out of here. Damn. I think you really mad, Biscuit. I mean, I guess so. I mean, I really did him a favor. The fries was horrible. I know you did, baby. You got great intentions. I know you was only doing it to help him out, but you know, Sketchy don't understand stuff like that, Biscuit. So, you gotta just work with him. I guess you're right. So, could you do me a favor and go apologize to him? Oh, and walk so far? No, you can take my car, <laughs> even though this is the third one this week. I'll do anything for you, though, Biscuit. And that's why I love you. All right, I'll be right back. Look at her sick ass walk. <laughs> How did I get cursed with a roommate with bad taste? Sick of his girl. I'm sick of his ass too. I'm gonna let him pay all the bills. Eat me out of house and home. Got me on the diet. I ain't never been on the damn diet in my life. I even consider going vegan. You get what I mean? Uh, so can I still get that, uh, gram? Oh, yeah, here, man. Here, go and get your ass up out of here. Thanks. So look who we have here. Sketchy. Man, what the hell you guys want? It ain't what we want. It's what we know is gonna happen. You gonna get up off this block. You already know since Squawfin went to prison, this is Sketchy Yuz turf. Sketchy up my ass, and I still hate the cartoonist for even giving him that damn name. All I know, I run this. No, nah, go ahead and show him, boys. Who's boss? <sighs> Wait a minute. Hold on, what's that? <sighs> Y'all try to hurt Sketchy? Who, who, who the hell are you? Oh my God! Come here. Oh, get out of here, boys! She gonna kill you! Ah! You all okay, sketchy? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm good. How you just run all them guys off like that? Oh, ain't nobody gonna mess with me. They already know what's up. I mean, yeah, yeah, I see what's up. You know, I'm thinking about uh, starting my own security team. I think you'll be dope for it. Me? Yeah, you know, it seems like you got everything right and big enough. I mean, strong enough. I think you'll be perfect. Oh, my God, Skits. Uh, well, thank you. I would love to do it. Yeah, and I can pay you. <laughs> oh, Skits, I don't want so, buddy. I'll do this for the bottom of my heart. And also, if you let me and my baby stay over your house for now, oh, and oh, yeah. I am kind of hungry right now, so if you can give me one of them plates for down the street, uh, that'd be. I really appreciate this, sketchy. But I don't want some money, though. Yeah! Come on! Woo! La da 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 da. Where you going, K Moore? Oh! Me and Bitch is going to an all you can eat buffet. <laughs> I can't wait to see her eat. I love her. Yeah, you know. I kinda didn't like biscuits at first. I'd be honest with you, K-More. I mean, besides putting a hole in the roof, besides just being on the eighth couch, besides barely having no food in the refrigerator, she kinda growing on me. Really? Yeah, you know, me and her, we have somewhat, let's say, a partnership going on right now. Oh, that's dope, Skits. Man, what do you know? My roommate and my girl gets along. <laughs> that's life. Well, look, Skits, I could talk all day. Bitch is gonna be mad at me though. You know she down there be eating the seatbelt up in the car. <laughs> Gotta go! Yeah, that that woman is a miracle. She been making me so much damn money, I took over the whole freaking part of the bikini bottle. You know what? I'm gonna bake her a cake. That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, it's gonna be weed cake too. Six and a half hours later. Mmm, man, that smell good. I still got it. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is that? Is somebody dying? The hell on. <laughs> if anybody's behind this door, I'm shooting it. <laughs> Wait a minute. K, K more? Uh, uh uh. What? <laughs> what the hell wrong with you? Me and my baby biscuits broke up. <laughs> what? Why, K more? Man, what the hell you do? Uh, I didn't do anything. <laughs> I mean, okay. So. We was at the restaurant, right? And you know, I took her to an all-you-can-eat buffet. I'm thinking it's gonna be an amazing idea. And it actually was. But it backfired on me. Sketchy, how many when I tell you when I walked in there? 
It was the most beautiful sight I ever seen in my life. It was over 50 huge ass fishes up in there, Sketchy. I mean, I lost control. So once we walked inside there, I started looking and my baby biscuits, she called me. I couldn't help it, Sketch. My eyes was going crazy. It was like biscuits with times two. And I just went crazy. One of them was so damn big, her head was coming out of the ceiling. I almost lost this sketch. I almost lost it. Damn, man. Man, she was helping me make a lot of money. I mean, she was, man, she was dope. Man, you got to get her back, K-More. Uh, I don't know if I can, sketch. She just blocked me on Fishagram. Damn, that's serious. I know, right? Well, look, we going to find a way. You mean you will help me, sketch? Yeah. It's going to be tough, though. Yeah, yeah. I agree. Was the day before Christmas. Inside this local trap house stayed two best friends. One jolly friend named Kamo and one grinchy one named Sketchy. Everyone loves a Christmas story. Our story begins with Kamo decorating a tree in Christmas spirits. He took another list. He took it in twice. He gonna find out who's not of you at night. Fan the clouds are coming to tie out. Man, the clouds are coming to tie out. Fuck it, sketch. Man, shut the hell up. It's five in the damn morning. You over here decorating a Christmas tree. I got two hours before it's time for me to go to work. Well, damn, sketch. Why you don't got on the Christmas sweater that I got to? You not in the Christmas spirit? <laughs> Man, I don't believe in no damn Christmas. <gasps> sketch, you don't believe in Christmas? You can't say that out loud. Santa Claus won't get you a gift. And I definitely don't believe in that fat bastard. I don't want to hear nothing else about Christmas, K-More. Guess you are crazy. Damn, are you sure you've been getting some ass? Because <laughs> you're so damn aggressive. I don't know what's going on with you. But anyways, I got my list right here for Santa. So I want me a uh, Xbox. I also would love to get back with biscuits for Christmas. That'll be great. Hmm, a new TV, <laughs> a new aerobics class, that'll be awesome. Um, uh, let me see. Damn, I got a lot on my list. I gotta get to work. What about those sketch? What you got on your list? Hmm, what I got on my list? These nuts. Now leave me alone so I can go to sleep so I can get ready for work. Bye. Mr. Clarence Butterscotch really did not like the holidays, for his heart was very small. And I hate Christmas, I hate the smell of snow, I hate everything about this damn day. Oh, snowman, I love it, woo! Damn snowman. Ugh. Why you do that, mister? Fuck your snowman, kid. I hate you! Yeah, I hate you too. <laughs> You'll find out. Santa Claus ain't real and he don't like you either. The only snowman I recognize is the drugs I sell. Come see me in about 10 years, little boy. Yes, yes, you seem correctly. He kicked the children's snowman. What an asshole. Merry Christmas, Ketchy. Happy holidays. Here's the season. SpongeBob, get out of my face. I ain't trying to hear none of that. Turn that frown upside down, Mr. Butterstodge. I love Christmas. Well, it's gonna be a long day of work with all these damn bastards. Hate this time of the year. Next order. You have to make the patties with jolly old love, Sketchy. Man, I ain't making nothing with no jolly love. Get them this damn burger. Although there was hate in Sketchy, there was also hope. And Kevin was scared that he was home alone. It was crazy. And that's the story of Macaulay Calkin, everybody. <laughs> Oh, oh, Skits! How y'all for going? Everybody say hello to Skits. Man, everybody out right now before I kick y'all ass like a football. Get out! My bad, you guys. I'll see y'all later tomorrow. Be good! Skits, why you do my little elf friends like that? They cool. I don't like elves either. Fuck them too. Oh my, Skits. Okay, I'm tired of this. What in the hell happened to you, Skits? What made you not really like Christmas? Come on, buddy, you gotta tell me. Please, did something happen to you as a kid? Cause this is just too much for me. 
You saying fuck elves? Then I heard you had kicked over one of these kids' damn snowman. What's going on with you? <sighs> well, if you must know, man, it was the Christmas of 1998. It was great. Mom had left so many gifts under the tree, but I ain't care about none of that. I only wanted two toys, my mermaid man and my barnacle boy. Mom had been saving up all year to get it for me and told me that Santa Claus was definitely going to surprise me with it. And I was so happy to see Santa, so I stayed up all night, k more waiting for Santa Claus to come. Then all of a sudden, I heard somebody in the chimney. And there you go, Santa Claus coming down. But this Santa Claus looked kind of weird. He was a little bit skinnier than the regular Santa Claus than we used to know. <clears throat> Shit. Hey, little dude, where all the prisons at? Santa, Santa, Santa! The prison's right here! Cool. Anybody else in the house with you, little nigga? Uh, that's my mama. Where she at? She upstairs. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Go upstairs with your mama real quick and make sure she don't come downstairs while I, uh, add more prisons. <laughs> okay, Santa. And next thing you know, I come back downstairs with my milk and cookies to surprise Santa, and everything was gone! I never got my mermaid man and barnacle boy to it. And ever since then, I freaking hated Christmas. And I hate Santa Claus. If I ever see him again, I'ma shoot his ass. Wild skits? That's a sad story. Very sad indeed, k -Ma. You actually helped Santa Claus rob you. <laughs> what a dumbass. <laughs> Boy, that probably wasn't even Santa Claus. That was probably a day of crackhead. <laughs> you said he took all your presents, right? Exactly. Santa would never do something like that. <laughs> Man, whatever. Leave me alone. Forget you and forget that little crackhead Santa Claus. Oh, man. Poor Sketchy. Hmm. I wonder what can I do to get him in a Christmas spirit. Oh! I got just the idea. <laughs> Twist the night before Christmas, and every boy and girl is asleep, all except one boy, who is about to get a special visit. k -more, is that you? Man, he in his room sleep. Let me get my gun. Hey, whoever this is, you about to add ten holes in your ass. Oh, don't shoot, please. Who the hell are you? It's me, Sketchy. I'm Santa Claus. Santa Claus? You mean you? You real? Of course I'm real, son. Santa, I can't believe it's actually you. I never thought you existed. I, mean, I always hated Christmas because of you. Me? What did I do? Man, you stole all my gifts when I was a kid. I wouldn't do such a thing, son. You must have me confused. You ever been to this address? 1544 North 3rd Street. Oh, hell no. I wasn't going to those neighborhoods during that time, son. That was very dangerous territory. Mrs. Claus put that off the map for me. Trust me, that wasn't me. Probably got robbed by some crackhead or something pretending to be me. Damn, k more said the same thing. And I helped that fool too. Anyway, son, I just want you to have a better understanding about things here, okay? You have a lot to be thankful for. Got great friends, good job, good girlfriend. Oh wait, she ain't my girlfriend yet. Hell, she barely even let me get to second base. We taking things slow. Oh, trust me. I put something into her stocking earlier. I'm pretty sure she's going to be giving you a call later today. Damn, Santa, you the man. I really appreciate that. I guess you're right. I do got a lot to be appreciative about. You know what? Thank you, Santa. I now have a better perspective on things. So, did you leave me some weed? Of course not, Sketchy. I left us some weed. Now, let's enjoy this, shall we? Spark it up. Damn, Santa, you cool as hell. Oh, yeah, you my man for now. Woo! And so Sketchy and Santa Claus smoked some strong weed for the rest of the night. Crazy, isn't it? We said it was a Christmas story. We never said it was a family-friendly one. Sketchy! Man, are you good? Man, you all ass down here passed the hell out! What happened to you? k -more. Man, I had one of the best nights ever! You won't believe who I met! I met Santa Claus! <gasps> what? You met Santa? Oh my gosh, what did he say? 
<laughs> Did he talk about how cool I was? <laughs> man, something like that. He said I had good friends in my life. But forget all that. Man, me and my man Santa got high. I loved you. I ain't no Santa could smoke like that. For him to be a big dude, he could damn near carry his weight around. <laughs> man, we sat around, smoked all damn night. She even bought an ounce off of me. That's my nigga. Wow, who would have ever thought? Sketchy and Santa Claus getting along. That is crazy. So, do you believe in Christmas now? Yep, I do. I guess you was right all along, K Moore. I was wrong. I believe in Christmas. I love Christmas. I love everything. I love you, K Moore. Oh, Skip! Don't come too close. I still shoot you. But yeah, man, I'm very happy about this. Here goes your gift. Oh, Sketchy Sunnail. <gasps> Wow! You got me some shoes made out of weed! <laughs> you the man, Skits! That's the least I can do, K-More. I mean, if it wasn't for you, I would've never gotten a Christmas spirit. Well, anyways, I'm about to get some more rest. I'm still kinda high. Wait a minute, Skits! I think Santa left something for you. What could it be? For real? Let me see. Oh my God, K-More! It's, it's Mermaid Man and Brunicle Boy! It's my action figures from what I wanted when I was a kid! Oh my god! This is the best Christmas ever! <laughs> you got that right! Thanks, thank Nick. I knew you would come through. You're welcome, K Moore. Hey, Elf, keep a good eye on these two. Don't worry, boss. I'll definitely do that. And definitely sketchy. Oh, I'm on top of it. They don't even know that I'm an elf. They still think I'm Leprechaun. <laughs> Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas! This concludes the Christmas special. Happy Holidays to all! Man, I gotta find a way to re-up. Damn! Boy, I sure do miss that biscuits. She kept my business up afloat! La da 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 da! <laughs> what up, Skits? k more where, where are you coming from? Smelling all... <laughs> Better. Won't say good, cause your sin is just horrible. I have you know, sir. I just came from a date. A date? Man, what are you doing? What you mean what I'm doing? Ain't you sad over biscuits? I guess. I mean, yeah. I don't know, Skits. Maybe it's just not meant to be. I mean, I really did break a heart. Okay, and you can fix it. What you doing? Come on, man. You can't be moving on that, that fast anyways. That's that's that, that, that's toxic. That's real toxic of you, K more. You ain't even taking time to heal and think about her uh, being the one. You you think I need time to heal? Well, this other fish just got done doing to me, Skits. Man, I can't even describe in a cartoon. <laughs> hey, look, focus on biscuits. We need, to, I mean, you need to get back with biscuits. Don't you miss everything that y'all would do? Yeah, yeah. I mean, but actually, the doctor said it's kind of better for my health for us to be separated. I have no more injuries, Sketchy. I mean, my back used to be broken all the time. My pelvis used to be messed up. Now the doctor told me it's actually straightened out now after three weeks. Whew, thank God. My fingers ain't broken no more. My penis ain't bent anymore. I gotta still develop this, sketch. I mean, but what about mentally what she did for you? I mean, all them damn injuries I had. Shit, that was mentally draining. You got a point there. It kind of affected me and I wasn't even in a relationship. I mean, I mean, look, 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 look. This not important. Don't you love her? I mean, yeah, yeah. I do love her, Skits. I mean, don't you want to fight for her? Uh, not really, Skits. Not really. Um, I'm really enjoying what this new fish is doing to uh <laughs> my balls. So, I think I'm at the pass on biscuits right now. You know? But hey, <laughs> it was good having to talk with you. Ah, I'm still kind of a little bit sore on my side. You know, it's the side the biscuits to sleep on. I can still smell them. But anyways, I feel so much better. Ice kids. <laughs> Damn, I gotta find a way. Hmm. Well, if he don't want to talk to Biscuits, maybe I can get Biscuits to talk to him. Yeah. Oh, uh, hello. Who is it? Hey, Biscuits. It's uh Sketchy. Sketchy. One second. Hi, Sketchy. What you want? Hold on. Damn, you dropping sauce on me. Uh, uh, I'll just come over and see how you doing. I'm doing good. How about you? 
As you can see, I'm eating because I'm kind of sad. And Dr. Sad always eat when I'm sad. You must eat when you happy, sad, angry, when it's raining. You eat it all the time, biscuit. I mean, I know, but I just said I increased it over, you know, what, it, what I was saying. Oh, uh, okay. So, since you said, does that mean you miss K-more too? Yeah, I miss him. I do. I miss cracking his back when I sit on him and he screams. Ah! And, you know, he just sits there and he just enjoys it. I miss the full times we have. He'll take me out. Yeah, you can say I miss him. So, that, that mean you want to get back with him? Oh, no. I'm good on that. See, he'll know how to treat me. Mm -mm, I'm good. Anything else you want? I mean, you don't want to... <sighs> Damn, think fast, think fast, think fast. Uh, got it. Uh, I mean, you know what? You right. Forget K-More. <laughs> he ain't your type anyway. What's up, man? I mean, see, I'm more of a the aggressive type, you know? <laughs> I'm a thug. Oh. I do like dangerous man. Can you take me out to eat? Yeah, I can take you out to eat. I just come pick you up tomorrow night. Okay. I'll be ready. Yeah, I know your big ass will. Yeah, boo. I'll see you then. <laughs> Got my wallet. Cool. Yeah, I'm gonna need to break out the bank for this one. I already know I'm gonna have to spend by at least 500 damn dollars. But it's cool, Sketch. It's gonna be well worth it when your plan execute like how you want it to. Sketchy, where you going, man? Oh, well, I got me a nice date tonight, k -Mor. Oh, for real? <laughs> I got me one, too. That's what's up. So, where you headed? Oh, we going downtown. <gasps> me, too? Oh, man, that's crazy. We should actually just double date then. I think that's a good idea. All right. Okay. <laughs> I'll see you there, buddy, yo, pal. I bet she's a good looker, too. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> All right, see you then. Hey, man, why you doing your best friend like that? Man, what the hell? Who, who the hell are you? Oh, man, my bad. I ain't introduced myself. I just been around your house eating shit. I'm uh Larry the Roach. Larry the Roach? Man, I don't know you. Man, I'm, 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 I'm K-more best friend. Yeah, k more got to move his ass up out of here. Talking to roaches and... Man, what the hell you want? Man, what I asked you. How you gonna do your best friend like that gonna take his girl? For your FYI, I ain't taking this girl. My plan is, take her on a date, get k more to be jealous, and they get back together. And everything can be perfect, and I have more money in my pocket. So shut your ass up before I get the raid. Hey, man, chill. I'm just joking, bruh. <laughs> you good in my book. I don't like anything here. Uh, yeah, me neither. Damn, I don't like to eat nothing like my baby Biscuit did. She maybe ate me out of house and home, but at least she'll eat. I don't like this invisible ass pencil right here. <laughs> yeah, sweetheart. I ain't getting nothing on the menu either. k -more, Sketch! What's good, man? G -g -g Whoa, damn! Man, she look good as hell. Where the hell you find her? I'm a man of many words, Sketch. You know I'll do what I do. <laughs> Man, I don't know nothing about what you do. Never mind that. Where's your date, Sketch? Oh, uh, she coming. Mine looks so good that you know she could barely fit through the door. <laughs> oh, damn. That's what's up. Wait a minute. I know them stuff from anywhere. Oh, snap. Oh, my goodness. It's an earthquake. That's not an earthquake. That's biscuits. Hi, boy. Biscuits. Darling, join us. <laughs> Have a seat, or three. You didn't tell me Cable was gonna be here. It's just you didn't tell me Biscuits was gonna be here. Uh, the waiter. Yes, sir. Oh, wait a minute. Man, I told you y'all sound alike. What are you talking about, sir? You sound like him. K-more speak. Gizzy, you are freaking bugging out right now, bro. See, I'm not, I'm not crazy. I know I ain't the only one to hear that shit. Sir, I'm going to have to ask you to leave if you... Don't stop this <laughs> ignorance right now. I don't know what's going on with him, Mr. Waiter. Could you give me uh the number five right here with the uh, lemonade? Oh, yes. That's one of our best things on the menu. You have a quite good taste, sir. <laughs> Man, this guy is cool. Go ahead, order, Skits. Fucking hate y'all. Man, go ahead, uh, Biscuit. Go and get what you want. Thought you would never ask. So, could I get the number one, the number two, the three, the five, the seven, 
the number two again, the four. Oh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to eat that last four. What's two again? I'm pretty sure I can just get whatever it is that you're getting off of yours. No, this is all for me. So, if you hog, you better get whatever it is that you want. She don't make no sense. Huh. I remember when she used to order all of that with me. I miss her so much. Man, just give me water. <laughs> Coming right up. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Waiter. <laughs> nice guy. So, y'all don't hear the resemblance at all? Nah, I don't hear anything. Oh, you crazy. I'll, I'll, I'll get it. Uh, Biscuits, you uh dropped some jelly on your shirt. <laughs> Let me get that for you, baby. Oh, thank you so much, Sketchy. You so nice. I'll save it for later, but it's cool. Oh, my bad, baby. Oh, you good. Oh, uh, Sketch! What's up, K-Moy? Can I uh, talk to you real quick? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'll be right back, Biscuit. Okay. Hey, man. What the hell are you doing? What you mean what I'm doing? Why the hell you on a date with biscuits? Uh, I mean, you said you didn't care. You ain't want to be with it no more. What, you not jealous, are you? I mean, no, I ain't jealous. I'm just wondering. She, she too good for you. What do you mean she too good for me? I mean, she is. She's smart, beautiful. That's a lot of women you can't handle, Sketch. Yeah, you damn right. I mean, I, I'm good. Just know that me and Biscuit's having a good time tonight. Hey, it's you. Me what? Uh, wrap it up. Yeah, it's what I thought. Oh, my God. I'm still hungry. Oh, well, baby, you want some of my food? Oh, my God, Sketch, you are so nice. I would love some. Here you go, sweetheart. Anything for you. Open up. Choo, 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 choo. That's it. Ah! Oh my gosh, Kaibo, why you just do that to Sketchy? Biscuit, I'm sorry, I had to. This man was trying to steal the love of my life. Kaibo, I'm the love of your life? Yes, Biscuit, and I'm sorry I ever looked at those big fishes. You're the only woman I ever wanted. And starting here today, I gotta be a better man than you. I'm a changed man, and to prove it, here. Oh my gosh, this is not happening. Oh my goodness. Biscuits, will you marry me? Oh my God. Yes, Kaibo, I will marry you. Oh. It look like it smell good, too. Mm. Oh my God. She said yes, everybody. <laughs> We're getting married. Oh, man. Man, I got a headache. That's what your ass get for trying to take my woman. Man, don't nobody want your damn woman. I was trying to make you jealous, fool. Oh my God, Sketchy. You was trying to make me jealous by taking biscuits out on a date? That's genius. <laughs> You're such a great person, Sketch. Now I know exactly who I want to be my best man. Really, k -Moore? I'm your best man? No, not you. Tut. <laughs> of course not you, Sketch. Let's go, Biscuits. Ah, I was just playing with you, Sketch, dog. You know damn well too they gonna be my best man. Besides, he said we weren't gonna be making a season three. And we about to be on season three next month. <laughs> Peace out, best man. Bye. Man, they so damn crazy. Hopefully she don't be eating us out of house and home again. By the fact with this new agreement, I probably need to get a lock on the damn refrigerator. Hey, K more! I got a few arrangements. La da 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 da. <laughs> I love sandwiches. What? What the? Man, who the hell are you? Be quiet. We playing cops and robbers. Cops and robbers? Man, who the hell are you? Be quiet. I'm asking questions right now. Now, where were you at 3:30 p.m. on a Wednesday night? 3:30 p.m. I don't even know where the hell I'm at right now. Am I even at home? Okay. There goes my pictures. Okay, I'm at home. Look here! Who the hell are you? And how you get in my house? Nuh-uh. Wrong answer, Mr. Robber. Ah! Damn! Man, where the hell you get this car battery from? This thing hurt! I got it from your car. Now, tell me what I need to know. Or I'ma press this thing again and shock you like a damn Christmas tree. Help! Somebody help! Ah! John, John, put that back on.
I am so sorry. Oh, my God. Put that. Why are you messing with Mr. K more like that? I'm so sorry. You okay? Did you piss yourself? Baby, you all right? Baby, this okay? He made me piss myself. I'm so embarrassed. I'm sorry. Yeah, that's John John acting crazy, just like his old murderous ass daddy. I'm so sorry. Wait. His daddy a murderer, too? Well, that explains a lot. Got them kids a delinquent. Well, he locked up. I mean, you know, what, what, that, that's besides the point. I am so sorry. You okay? Let me get that. Let me clean that up for you. This little kid is strong as hell. Man got the strength of a grown-ass man. <laughs> John, John, he big for his age, too. Ain't he handsome? No, that's my baby. That's mama's baby. Look at him. He is so cute to me, though. Get me out of this. I'm going to go to my room. It's so embarrassing. I got to change my damn underwear again. I'll see you later, Sketchy. I'm so sorry about that, K-More. We'll see you later, Sketchy. Bye, Mr. K-More. See you later. <laughs> All right, baby. I'll see you later. Bye, little John John. <laughs> I love that kid. Is the little delinquent gone yet? Is the ghost clear? Yeah, everybody's gone. You can come out now. Oh, my God, Sketch. That was the scariest I've ever been in my life. That kid is dangerous. He tied me up, and I woke up in a damn trap house. I ain't know where I was. Man, thought me we were playing cops and robbers. He was talking my ass with a battery. Damn, he did all that? Well, from what I know, John John's a saint. That little boy won't hurt a fly. He's so precious. Cutest thing you ever see. Yeah, if he's the devil's son himself. You heard his own mama say his daddy was a murderer, and it looks like the apple don't fall too far from the damn tree. K-Moy, you overreacting. He'll be good. You know he around that age where he just like to play a lot. He got a wild imagination. And yada, yada, yada. I was a kid once too. And I definitely wasn't beating up grown ass men and tying them up. <sighs> I'ma go lay down. This is just too much for me. I'ma see you later, Skit. Alright. And make sure you get in the shower. You smell like burnt bacon. Oh, baby, we gonna have so much fun together tonight, girl. I promise you. Oh, yeah, I've been hearing about this restaurant everywhere. My homie Latrell went to it. He almost got kicked out. Okay, boo. I'll talk to you later. Can't wait to see you tonight. <laughs> oh, damn. That's dope, Sketch. Y'all going out tonight? That's what's up. But how y'all gonna go out when somebody gotta watch Lil John John? Yeah. About that, K-More. I was wondering if... Nope. I already know what you gonna ask me. And the answer is hell no. I'm not watching Satan. That's y'all problem. Come on, K-More. Just this one time, man, I'd do it for you. Plus, man, Keisha, we really getting to know each other right now. This is a crucial time for me and her. I don't give a damn. You better find somebody else to watch him. Or y'all ass better stay home and get McDonald's and be together as a family. Not me. Not I. Mm -mm. Come on, K-More. Okay, what can I do for you? Please, it has to be something that you want, K-More. Come on. Oh, trust me. I don't want nothing to watch his ass. I am good. I just had to schedule three damn therapy sessions back to back days because of him. I'm still getting shockwaves through my head. Ah! Come on, K more. Oh, hey, right, right, look, 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 look. If you do this for me, I'll, I'll go to your next five classes that you always have randomly in our house. Any class that you have, I'll go to. The next five of them. Skits, you really mean that? You go to all my classes? Deal! <laughs> This is gonna be great. Appreciate that, my guy. I tell Keisha that you're watching him tonight. Whew, man, you're a lifesaver for this. Hell, I'm the one that's gonna need saving. Damn. You sure about this, K-More? He could be a handful. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Look, make sure that he don't have nothing sweet, okay? Only let him have water. Please don't let him drink no sodas. Oh, my Lord. And don't leave nothing sharp around him. Hide your matches. Hide your lighters. You know, stuff like that. You know, anything normal you do with regular kids. Just hide your dangerous shit, if you know what I'm saying. But just thank you and take care of my baby. Thank you so much. John John, do like Mama said, okay? Be good. When you feel like you about to blow it, count to 10. Remember how Mommy told you? Count to 10 and don't touch nothing sharp. Like, I love you. Look at you. You're so handsome. Be good. Yes, ma'am. I'm your bestest, bestest angel. I be on my best behavior, Mama. Love you. <laughs> hey, Mr. K-More. Don't you Mr. Hey, K-More me. 
You heard what your mom said. You can't hear nothing soft, no lighters or matches. And matter of fact, I did all that before your little ass even got here. I threw away everything you think you can get to. So you think you're going to hurt me this time? You got another thing coming. So all you're going to do is sit here and watch cartoons while I go ahead and cook this food in the kitchen. Matter of fact, I got a good show for you. <laughs> it's almost on season three. Now you just watch this and stay right here while I go in this kitchen. Do not move. Yes, sir. I'm going to move a bit. I stay right here. <laughs> Little crazy ass kid. Now let me go ahead and bake these cookies. This is going to make me happy. My therapist told me, do things that make you happy, K-More. Focus on you. Everything will be good. Da, 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 da. Oh, these cookies smell amazing. I guess I can get a little delinquent one of them. Hey, John John, do you want... John John? John John! John! Ah! Oh my God, where did you get that gun from? I just used some of the metal from your car. <laughs> now, we playing cops and robbers again. Stick it up. Don't make any false moves. Oh, yes sir, Mr. John John, sir. Now, give me all your money that's in your pocket. Damn, you robbing me? I was just giving you some cookies, little nigga. Yep, I'm robbing you. Because this time, while we playing cops and robbers, I'm the robber and you the cop. Now come find me. Damn! Ah! I can't see nothing. Ah! John John! Where are you? Wait, is that my car? No! John John! Oh, damn. Sketch gonna kill me. I gotta find this little damn bad kid. Oh, snap, how can I? I'm coming, John John! Little damn delinquent. I'ma kill this kid my damn self. Damn. It's been over an hour and I still can't find this ass or my car. Now, if I was a kid, where would I be? But then again, I can't think like him. He's a jailbird. If I was a jailbird kid, where would I be at? The hood! Oh my God, that's my car! My baby! What the he told to you? No! I played this car since I was 17. What that little bad ass kid is. Wait, I hear something. There he is, right there. Hi, right, everybody, everybody. This last game, last game. I'm gonna break it just like this. Ugh, seven. Give my money, everybody, right now. There he goes, officer. This is the man that stole my car. You mean this little kid stole your car? <laughs> Come on, John. Let's go get some donuts. I don't have time for these cases. But, sir, he's crazy. Ooh, I can't stand your look. Hey, give me my keys. Come on. I can't wait till your mama see this. My mom won't believe you. She won't believe nothing you say. Because I'm her angel. Mm. Uh-huh. See, I knew you was going to say something like that. That's why I got your ass recorded. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Don't like playing your own game, huh? That's what a good cop does. He records everything. I didn't mean to. I, I, I'm sorry, Mr. K K Moore. Oh, now you sorry, huh? Yeah, I bet. I can't wait till your mom see this. She gonna beat your ass. Now let's go back to the house. Got me sweating out here looking for you in the hood. I ain't supposed to be nowhere around here. <laughs> Man, that's funny. I love this show. Hey, Mr. K. Moore. Ah! What you want? I just want to apologize for being so bad. I'm sorry. I didn't mean any harm. I didn't want to hurt you. I just wanted to play cops and robbers. Oh, it's okay, little John John. I understand. I was a kid once. You know, kids can be kind of crazy, but misled. That's all. It ain't your fault your daddy a murderer. You a good little guy. Thank you, Mr. K. Moore. You the best babysitter ever. Can I have a hug? Oh, stop it now. You're making me blush. Come here, little John John. I knew you was a good little boy. <laughs> and Mr. K. Moore. I also baked you some cookies, too. Mmm, it smells real good. What? You baked me cookies, little John John? Oh, I guess I could be a babysitter after all. Let me try these things with your little cooking hands. Oh, it tastes so good. Damn, John John, what you put in it? 
Wama Itty. Oh, Daniel! What the hell is in these cookies, Son John? <laughs> I put Itty powder in them, Mr. K Boy. <laughs> you look Daniel Bastard! I know I should have never trusted you. What my damn tape record is? I'm still finna tell your mom. You mean this tape recording, Mr. K Moore? Uh, 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 yeah. <laughs> <gasps> you tricked me. You little bastard. I know you didn't want no damn hoes. Oh, I kid. Any last words, Mr. Robber? You going down. Ah! Oh, Mommy's Angel, I missed you. How were, were you good for Mr. K. Moore? I know you were. Look at my man. How was he? Oh, baby, did you miss Mommy too? I missed you. Oh, my gosh. Thank God you bet. This little nigga stole my car. K. Moore, how in the hell can he steal your car? He only six. Only if you knew what this little nigga was capable of, Sketch. Trust me, he did it. He been bad as hell. Let's go, John John, baby. Mr. K. Moore didn't hurt you, did he? <laughs> All right, Sketchy, I'll talk to you tomorrow. Did I hurt him? Shit, he hurt me. I ain't never watching this damn kid again. <laughs> See you later, Mr. K. Moore. <laughs> All right, baby. All right, little John John. See y'all later, boo. <sighs> so, K. Moore, how was it? No, 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 no. I don't even want to talk about it. Just have your ass ready tomorrow morning for my class. I got something for you. Hey, a deal's a deal. So what you got for me? And kids, that's why you do not do drugs. You don't want to go on the bad path here. Now, today in cop training, we have a taser. A gun taser to be a thing. Now, given this great demonstration, it's going to be my good friend, Sketch. Come on, Sketch. A taser? Man, no! No, 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 no! Yeah, Sketch! Every last one of these kids gonna take turns shocking you, so they know how it is. Now, come on! First kid, step up! Now, kids, don't take it easy on him. Remember, he's a bad guy. Let him have it! God! I hate you, k I just want them bad boys. Yeah! Got you, k -more. That's the 800th time I lost. <laughs> Forget it, let's do 801. <laughs> you a sucker, let's do it. Oh, oh, damn, you heard that? Yeah, what, what the hell that noise is? It sounds like it's coming from across the street. Damn, somebody getting their ass beat. Yeah, well, anyways, that ain't none of our business. Well, I guess not, but it really does sound like somebody's getting hurt, though. You sure you don't want to go find out, Sketchy? I'm 100% positive. Plus, I'm on house arrest. If I go over there, that's my ass. So let's keep playing the game, and I'm finna keep beating your ass. This is the only domestic violence you need to be worried about. <laughs> you right. I'ma give me one in. Sketchy! Wake up! Man, I heard gunshots over there! Man, K-more! Damn, man, it's 1 a.m. We gotta go over and see what's going on, Sketchy. I'm scared. I think somebody's really getting hurt in their house. And I told you, for the 20th time, that ain't none of our business. Damn, go to sleep. I can't, Sketchy, I'm worried. Please just come with me. Okay, but we go over there and some crazy stuff start happening. I'm leaving. Deal. Let's go. Go ahead. Not gonna do it since you want to come over and ask. I'm scared. Okay. Oh, hey, k and Sketchy. What's going on? Marlin? You live here? Of course, silly. I've lived around the corner for a long time now. You should know that. <laughs> That's weird. Yeah, the animator never told us that. It's crazy. Funny you say that. He drew me right before he, uh, well, we'll talk about that another time. Yeah, how you guys doing? Um, I'm doing good. Sketch, how about you? I'd be doing better if my ass was in bed. Sketch, calm down. Well, Marlon, we, we just want to ask the question of, have you been hearing noise around the neighborhood? <laughs> no, Siri. <laughs> I kind of keep to myself around here. The only noise I hear is the children playing in the street. Oh, they're such good kids. I love them. It's crazy because we don't even have kids around here. Yeah, I know. This nigga crazy. Um, uh, um, uh, Marlon, so me and Sketch have been hearing noise every night for the past couple of days. And I think it's been coming from your house. Uh, you don't know anything about that. Mm, no, not really. I mean, <laughs> 
I do talk to the devil sometimes, so you might be hearing that. But, unfortunately, if you're a Christian, you wouldn't hear anything coming from this house. What, do you, what kind of noises are there happening from this house, K-more? Oh! oh! What, why did you just smack yourself like that for? Oh, 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 uh, oh, that, uh, shut up, now. Uh, oh, that, that, that's nothing. I just, uh, shut the fuck up, tell him what's going on. Uh, um, you know what? I have really bad reflexes. Okay. Y yeah, we gonna get up out of your hair, uh, Marlon. We'll talk to you later. Uh, 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 shut <coughs> oh, okay, we'll talk to you later. I can't wait to come back later. I really can't. Come back later, girl. Yeah. Kish, did you see that shit? This man was trying to bite his own face off. What in the hell? Yeah, I'm about to go to sleep. I'm going to assume all this was a bad dream, and I'm going to just wake up in the morning and smoke a blunt. That's it. I mean, I don't know, Sketch. Maybe Marlon was trying to give us some type of warning. That didn't look safe. I'm pretty sure that that's where the noise is coming from. We just got to figure out what it is. Uh, you got to figure out what it is. I'm taking my ass to sleep. And when I wake up in the morning, I'm smoking a blunt and going to work. Good night. <laughs> that grump old sketch. He'll never learn. Get off me. I'm not even touching you. You get off me. You get the fuck off me. Oh, I kind of like it, though. Get the fuck off me. Get off. You don't want any more of this? I know you do. Get the fuck off me. Me now, nigga. Stop! Get your hand off of me! Mm, if you touch it long enough, it might. Game up! Come on, real quick! Hurry up! Oh my God, Marlin! Hey, Kmore, you want to help me out? What the hell is going on? It's Marlock. Ah, it's Marlock. Get him! Get him off! Can you help me, Kmore? Ah, help me out, Kmore! Help me out, Kmore. Uh, help me out. Hey, Kmore, he's inside. Oh my god, I thought you got rid of Marlock, Marley. How did he come back? Uh, his DNA is in... Uh, his DNA is infused in my mangina. Oh, damn. Man, this is crazy. Hey, what you guys stop, 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 stop. Mo <laughs> Marlock? Uh, I bet you didn't know we're both. Uh, he, she, nigga. Uh, they, uh, nigga. Uh, Okay, okay, okay. Calm down. Marlock, what is it that you wanted? Why are you doing this to Marlon? Ah, I want to pregnant this nigga. Get off. No. It's because I want to reproduce, nigga. Ah, plant my seed. Hey, man, y'all got to calm down. Why about you just get some weed or something? It ain't weed ain't going to work for them. These two need therapy. Clearly, you can see that sketch. Therapy? Ah, Fuck that shit, my nigga. Ah, ah, fuck that. The last time I had a shrink, I got fucking fucked. Wait, now hold on, Marlock. Therapy sounds like a really good idea. Yeah, and I think you two could work a lot of things out. It seems like you guys are really stressed. You know, Marlock, our relationship is on the rocks, and I really don't like feeling it so deep inside my stomach. Oh, God, I don't even know what these two is talking about. I'm... Fucking this nigga! Oh my god, it's horrible! See, this is exactly why y'all need therapy. Now, Marlon, how much of a percentage do you control of Marlock? Well, to be honest, Kmore, I control about 95% because he's about 5 inches deep inside my lungs, which is about 5% of my whole body. Oh my god! Well, okay, look. I think therapy is perfect for you guys. You guys can work something out, and maybe Marlock can go do his own thing. What do you say, Marlon? Ah, fuck it. That sounds like a yes to me. I'm going to take my ass back in the house. Hope y'all work it out, nigga. So, how long has this been going on between you two? Ah, uh, my whole life, nigga. Well, since prison, actually. So, Marlock, which is the other one, was made in prison. Am I hearing that correct? Ah, uh, you bet your ass, my nigga. <laughs> yes, that's correct. He was planted inside of me in prison. I was inside him in prison. How did he get planted inside of you in prison? Try to guess, Doc. Okay, thank you for that. Marlock, how do you feel about being inside of Marlon? Do you have your own thoughts? I feel like not coming out, my nigga. So you don't want to come out. 
How does that make you feel, Marlon, that Marlon doesn't want to leave? Well, he gives me my weekends, and I get every weekday after 6 o'clock. I give him every weekday after 6, but during the week I dominate. I'm the dominator, my nigga! He is the dominator. He's a top. He's a power top. I'm a power bottom. He's a power bottom, my nigga! Well, how about we try a different approach? We're going to try doing 50-50 for a couple of weeks, just to see how things go. How does that sound to you, Marlock and Marlin? I don't give a fuck. I ain't pulling out till Tuesday any fucking way. He doesn't really care. He's not pulling out till Tuesday. Okay. Well, we're going to give this a try. Now, we're going to try this exercise. Every day, you're going to wake up and say, I love you, Marlin. Say it, Marlock. <laughs> I love you, Marlin. That's progress. Oh, okay. Well, there's progress. It is. Now, Marlin, you tell Marlock that you love him. Okay. I love you, Marlock. There we go. The beginning of something new. Fuck this shit. I'm still pulling this dentist's hair out every Tuesday afternoon. All right. Now, I'll bill you guys for my final payment. You guys have a great day, and I'll see you next Tuesday. Everyone get the door for me. All right. Marlin. Marlock. How did therapy go? Oh, it was great. We made a lot of progress. Yeah, that's right, nigga. We're going to make a lot more progress in a week or so. He's going to make a lot more progress in a week or so. I'm going to make a lot more progress in a week or so. He gets deeper and deeper every every time. I swear to God. More progress is more progress. More progress is more progress. So much progress. Well, okay. I'm glad to see that you guys are happy. So is there like anything that the therapist told you guys to work on, like practice, like say to each other? Well, you see, it's been it's been really happy for the both of us. And honestly, I'm really starting to learn where the male G-spot really is. I thought I was gay, but turns out your G-spot is really deep inside of her anus. And Marlock seems to get it every- Oh, well, bye! Y'all have a good day! Game on! Who was at the door? That was Marlon and Marlock. Oh, how did their therapy session go? Uh, I guess it was going good. Sketch, what the hell is the G spot? What? Yeah, yeah, Marlon said something about a G spot, but I don't know what it is. I thought you could tell me. Uh, wait, it's somebody at the door. Thank God, man. You look up what a G spot is on your phone. I don't want to tell you that. I don't feel comfortable. What up? Get them, boys. Hey, man, what y'all doing? What the? Sketchy. Oh no! Good, we got him. I'm about to put an end to all of this. Yeah, sweetheart. Could you make those eggs for me that I love? You know, sprinkle the little bacon on it. And uh, a little toast. And a little strawberry. Mm. Yeah, you know, that's my favorite. I love it. I love you. I, I, I'm sorry, baby. I'm, I'm, I'm getting distracted. I forgot what I came here for. Oh yeah, that's right. I'm here for Clarence. He ain't checked in in two days, and he already know if he don't talk to me, his ass is going to jail. So let me give you a call back, sweetheart. All right. Damn delinquent. He know better. Clarence, this is your PO. Oh my God! Help! Somebody help! Please! I'm claustrophobic. Man, shut the hell up. Damn, you right next to me. Be quiet. I'm scared too. I don't know what we gonna do. Me neither, Skit. Oh my god. All this being claustrophobic got me kinda itchy. Skit, you think you all, since you kinda real close to me and you facing the, the opposite direction, you think you could scratch my ass for me, Skit? It's really itching so bad. Man, hell no, I ain't scratching your ass. Man, that's it. Man, I know I'm gonna die. No, we're not scared. Oh, we gotta figure something out. Let's come up with a plan. Okay. What do you smell, Skit? I smell. Smell like a damn gym sock and cigarettes. Whoever got us, these niggas are definitely broke. Man, ain't no getting out of this. We tied up. But you're right, man. These dudes definitely broke. Wait a minute. I remember this smell. 
I think it, K-Mar think it's sketchy of the got us. Still hate that damn animator for giving him that freaking name. Oh man, we hear some deep shit. Sketchy you? Oh damn, I did hurt his gone. That's why he got me too. Oh man, sketchy. I guess this is the end of us. We almost made it past season three. I just want to say I love you, Sketch. <laughs> I really do. <laughs> Man, be quiet. Ain't no time for crying right now. Be a G. Man, I can't believe this how I'm finna die. I always thought I was gonna die with a blunt in my hand and a girl in my lap. Now I'm dying here next to your little ugly ass. Oh, man, this is horrible. Hey, Clarence. Oh, oh damn, the door was unlocked. This boy is careless. Probably that other boy that showed him down magic tricks. His ass don't even know how to unlock the door now. Clarence, I'm taking your ass to jail, boy. You ain't reported me in two days. Pull on my damn tape recorder. Seems kind of suspicious. The time is 5.45. I'm at Clarence Butterscotch house. There's no one in sight. What is this on the table? The time is 5.46. I found a half-lit blunt. It's kind of fresh. Boy got some good taste. Some real good kush. All right. I guess since I can't find him, whenever he comes back to the house, that's his ass. Where the hell are you, Clarence? Hey, what's up, man? Oh, damn, a roach! Yeah, oh, wait, don't hit me! Who the hell are you? Man, don't hurt me, man, I live here. I'm Larry the Roach. I'm k -Moore's best friend. You can't get rid of me. k -Moore. Must be talking about that dumbass boy that do that damn magic. Yeah, he even slower than I damn thought. Talking to a damn roach, and is his best friend. Anyways, Mr. Roach, what the hell you want? Well, I overheard you saying that you looking for, uh... I don't know who that clearance is, but he's probably talking about Sketch. Yeah, him and K-Mor got snatched up about at least uh, about an hour ago. About an hour ago? Oh man, this is crazy. It's crazy than I thought. Okay, tell me everything you know inside this tape recorder. Yeah, man, there was some crazy goons that came up here and snatched them up. Put bags over their head. Smell like gym socks and cigarettes. Oh, wow. Sounds very familiar. They definitely got snatched up by some broke niggas. <sighs> thank you, thank you. I appreciate you, little Larry. Maybe we could use somebody like you on the force one day. Man, you for real? Of course not, you idiot. You a damn roach. The hell, we gonna do with a damn roach on the force. You just a stupid as that damn K-more person you're talking about. Thank you for the information, though. Take the bags off these clowns. Well, well, well. Look who we got here. Sketchy. You ain't so tough now, huh, that you tied up, right? Man, what the hell you want? Man, untie me, man. Get me out of here. Shut up. You and your boy ain't going nowhere. And all year, I want to appreciate you for taking our scarf in. You made my job a lot easier. <laughs> Sir, uh, if I may add real quick, Mr. Uh, Sketchier, my ass really itch. Can one of y'all please scratch it? Please, I'm dying here. Man, hell no, I ain't scratching your ass. Shut up. Yeah, so you want to know why you here? Man, I've been in the trap game for a long time now. I've been trapping since I was a kid. Hell, when I was in elementary, I used to be trapping candy, giving it to everybody. I was the lead boss of everyone. So, it was only natural for me when I became an adult to keep trapping. And this is my life. But you, you want to get in my way. And now that you took Scarfan out of the way, and now that I got you, I'm going to run this entire city. Everything is mine. <laughs> I've been waiting for this ever since I was a little kid. You know, I was born without a mother. Wait, wait, wait. You was born without a mom? How the hell is that even possible? <laughs> this guy's a fucking mutant. <laughs> How the hell is that even possible? <laughs> you hear that sketch? This guy's a damn alien. <laughs> Shut your ass up. Matter of fact, you gonna be the first to die, Mr. Funny Man. Man, well since you gonna kill us, at least tell me what your real name is. Since the animator gave you my damn thug name, what's your real name? Mm. I guess I could tell you what my real name, since it doesn't matter for you anymore. My name Bob. Bob! <laughs> Man, it's worse than what I thought. Oh my god, his name is Bob, sketch. I at least thought the anime was gonna give him the exact same name as you, Clarence. He called his ass Bob. That was a good one, animator. <laughs> Shut up! Hey, Josh, come get the knife. I'm tired of this one. Ah! I was just talking, Mr. Sketch, you sir, please! Hey, Johnson, give me the file of Sketchier right now. I need it. Thank you, son. Here, I'm trying to have a hand. Here. Ah, I found it. There's a hideout right there. Goddamn boy ain't smart at all. 
always leave this location. Smell like gym socks and fucking old cigarettes. Johnson, call me to come get this goddamn boy Clarence. Yes, sir, Mr. Sir. Um, my ask, is it just the sketchy guy that we're getting? Unfortunately, it's not. It's Clarence and his damn roommate, Kmore, whatever the damn boy name is. k k k k k k more? Oh, no, sir. You're probably going to have to go alone. Oh, I hate that guy. No, I can't go with you, sir. What the hell you mean you can't go? That's an order. Sir, I'm sorry I can't. Here's k Moore's file. You'll see why. Give me the damn file. Oh, damn. Never mind. You stay here. I'll go my damn self. This nigga's crazy. And not that I kill you boys, I'm gonna get somebody to go inside the prison and kill Scarfin. Then I'm gonna own the entire Kenny bottle. Start selling all the drugs. Matter of fact, I've already created my own marijuana stream. It's called Ooey Gooey. <laughs> oh yeah. Time to die, boy. You first, ugly dude. Any last words? <laughs> Time is slowing down. Okay, three K more. Five idiots. Three of them with little small baby guns. Cheap wooden chair. Damn, I ain't do my laundry today. I wonder what Larry doing. I got class tomorrow. Ha! Ah! No! Ah! Hurry up! I found you, niggas. Ah! Ah! Kmore, get the hell out of the way! Ah! I've been shot! Damn! Damn! They shot the P.O. Oh my God! Are you okay? Of course not. I got fucking shot, you idiot! Ha! Ah. Do me a favor, boy. Watch out for Sketchy. He's crazy without authority. He needs it. If he don't, the boy can do some dangerous things. Ah, ah, fuck ya. Always hating your magic tricks. There you are, sketchy. Yeah. You ain't so tough with a bullet wound inside you now, huh? And I want to thank you for telling me your plan. Because I'm about to take all your ideas. I'm going to go inside the jail. I'm going to kill Scarfin. And thank you for your new drug thing that you just came up with, the ooey gooey. Yeah, that's mine now. And your goons about to work for me. Now, like you was telling my boy, you got any last words? <laughs> Psych, I don't want to know him. Hey, goons, y'all see y'all both down here, right? You want to end the same way? Well, put them damn guns down. Y'all work for me now. Uh-huh. Yeah. You the boss. You the boss. Yes, sir. You the boss. Mm-hmm. At the right boys. Yep. Well, this remind me of GTA. <laughs> I love this. Okay, more. come on. Let's get up out of here. Ooh. Thank God this is over. One second, Skits. Oh, yes. I finally scratched my ass. Damn. What it feel better than having sex with biscuits? Damn. Man, bring your ass. Damn. That was crazy. Damn. So now what, we'll Skits? Everybody's dead. Yeah, you right. Everybody is dead. Sketchy is dead. My PO is dead. There's one more person I got to handle. Question. If you gonna ask who voices me, I swear to God I'ma shoot you. I promise you I am. Who voices you? Why does everybody keep asking me that? I mean, it's the same question over and over. <laughs> Man, get out of the street! Don't you see me right here? Talking about I'm on the sidewalk. You crazy. Oh, damn. Here come the ops. Man, what 12 on? I ain't even doing nothing. License and registrations. License and registration? I don't even know what a damn registration is. Man, you not know who I am? You not know the man in these streets? You not know I own this town? Man, look. I got something for you. Have this stack of money right here and go get your ass some donuts. <laughs> All rise, 
Clarence Butterscotch. Damn, man, you the judge too? How many jobs your ass got? Don't worry about how many jobs I got, Clarence. You seem like you in a lot of trouble, son. Now we are charging you with DUI, killing a damn animator. How could you do that? Bribing a police officer? Oh yeah, <laughs> that's at least 25 years for your ass. Any last words before your ass go in the back of here this cell? One second. Yeah. Oh damn, that's a lot of money. Oh, okay. Well, how about this, Clarence? Since uh, I'm feeling kind of extra friendly and rich, you just gotta do boating school. If you pass, you get your license. If you don't, your ass is going to jail. Case dismissed. Boating school? Man, it's some bull crap. Okay, everybody. So this is how you make a computer. All you need is this wire to go right here, and this wire to go in the back, and kablam! Oh, damn, I ain't mean for it to blow up on nobody. Oh, uh, sketch! Oh, uh, uh, class dismissed. Can somebody get the remainings of that guy? Damn, I'm glad these niggas didn't sign no form. <laughs> that would've been my ass. Sketch, what the hell were you? You had me worried. Not seeing you for that long, I was scared. You could have called me at least, Sketch. Damn, man, you sound like a neglected wife. Keisha don't even be up on me like that. Damn. But anyways, man, I got arrested. Police hating on me. Talking about I was drunk driving and stuff. Man, you can't believe that they took me to court this morning. Now I got to go to damn boating school. Sketch, you was driving drunk? Oh, yeah, you really are a dumbass. <laughs> I thought that was me. Say it. Can't be two dumb asses in the house, can't you know that? I guess I'm the small one. <laughs> Anyways, what time you gotta go to school? Man, I gotta be there at damn 8.30. I don't even wake up till 10 o'clock. Well, seems like if you don't go, your ass going to jail. <laughs> we can't let that happen to you, Sketch. So I'll wake you up at 7 a.m. and take you there. See you tomorrow, school boy. <laughs> you said I gotta go to school. <laughs> Stupid ass. Slow down, K-Moy. It's over here in the corner. Right here. Appreciate it. Skit, before you go, I just want to say, have a good day, okay? I'll be back later to come pick you up. I love you, and I'm always thinking about you, all right? K-Moy, I'm going to smack the hell out of you if you keep talking to me like you my mama. Man, get your ass up out of here. Be here later to pick me up. <laughs> Peace out, Skit. Go and get this over with. Man, I hope this teacher don't be whack. Uh, k -more. Man, what the? Man, how the hell you do that? You were just in the car. You do I mean, sketch. I can't teach all our classes inside the house. I got to go somewhere sometimes. And I picked this job up to make some extra money. So, if you don't mind, sir, have a seat, Clarence. <laughs> man, k -more, stop playing. But hey, I'm glad you the teacher. So, since you the teacher, you can just go ahead and get my license right now. I appreciate that, my boy. Oh, uh, I'm afraid I can't do that for you, Clarence. You need to have a seat because you're actually in school. Now, I can't go against the system. That's your ass. So you just got to sit here and learn. So why don't you go have a seat next to Mr. SpongeBob back there? <laughs> Bye. Class about to start in 30 seconds. Man, you got to be fucking kidding me, k -more. Ooh, I was... You'll do what? You lay one finger on me, I'll fail your ass and you'll take your ass to jail. <laughs> Now go sit your head down so I can go ahead and get started. My bad, Clarence Butterscotch. <laughs> Boy, I know you hate your parents. I wouldn't want to be in school either with a name like that. <laughs> Imagine me calling Roll. Clarence Butterscotch, are you here? <laughs> I'm going to have a blast with this. Anyway, now get out of my face. Damn, SpongeBob, you still here? Man, I know you've been in this class about 15 years. You still ain't passed? Couldn't be me. If it was me, I would have been quit. You know what? You're right. Fuck this class and fuck you, k -more. I'm gonna go holler at Mrs. Puff. I know she want me. Oh, damn. I ain't think you were gonna... I guess it ain't for everybody. <laughs> About time. I got driving skills. Yeah. I got driving skills. I'm ready. Crazy driving skills. Crazy. Crazy driving two skills. Is a. I got driving skills. Yeah. Yeah. Mr. Butterscotch, uh, what the hell are you doing? Bring me your phone. Man, k you ain't taking my phone. Shut up. Give me that damn phone. 
No phones are allowed in class, Mr. Butterscotch. Ugh! Now stop cheating, you damn delinquent. La da 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 da. You ready, Clarence? Man, what the hell? K more! You don't even got your bandana on! Man, I never knew you had hair under there! This is crazy! What the hell you thought I had? An invisible skull? <laughs> you crazy, Clarence. Now let's go! Take this corner right here. Drive to the left. Now make a right right here. Okay! Stop right here at this bank. Now I'll be right back. Don't you go anywhere, Mr. Butterscotch. <laughs> Come on, Larry. What the hell he finna do with Larry? When the hell did Larry get in this damn car? Ooh, I can't take this. Boy, if I pass, I swear to God I'm moving out. This nigga's crazy. Oh, damn! What the hell going on? Oh, my God, Sketchy! Drive! Drive! Man, they shot my boy Larry. Larry, don't look into the light. Don't look into the light, Larry. I mean, it got me, K-more. <laughs> yeah, he shot off one of my legs. Uh. Man, what the hell was y'all doing up in there? Robbing a bank, duh. You think I was coming out here to get a damn deposit? Now take Larry to the hospital. Come on, he going to die. His little body can't handle it. He's getting cold, Sketchy. You idiot, we can't take his ass to the hospital. He got a gun wound in him. If we do that, they gonna file a police report. Oh, damn, you right. So what we gonna do? Larry, don't look up, Larry. Don't look into the light. k is getting cold. I'm getting real cold. <coughs> I'm losing bug juice. Man, he gonna be all right. I'm gonna get one of my goons to take care of him. He went to school for this type of stuff. All right, k -more. Now my goon told me he think he can make a full recovery for Larry. Oh my gosh, really, Sketch? That's amazing. Thank God. You hear that, Larry? You gonna live. But under one condition. You gotta pass me in boating school. What? Man, you heard what I said. You either pass me in boating school or this little damn roach friend of yours gonna die. But Sketchy, you wouldn't. It's Larry. Oh my God. Well, hey, that's the rules of the game. I do something for you. You do something for me. Ain't that right, Goon? <laughs> I can't believe this. Okay, I'll pass you. But only because I want to see my boy Larry walk again. You damn bastard. You heard him, Goon. Go on, save the little damn roast life. Thank you, K-More. I knew you could do it. I came more I see you at the crib. I got to make a trip to Mexico. Me and my boy right here, we got to go ahead and make a real delivery. Drop off these pounds. Man, I can't believe that fool's finna let me die. Man, that's crazy. That's all you did for him. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I can't believe Sketch would do something like that. I mean, it's not like him. I mean, I know he don't like you that much, but damn. I mean, but just to say, either pass me in boating school or Larry dies, that's just cold. I never known Sketch to be that damn cold. Something happening to him. I don't like it. Yeah, me neither, K-More. I'm telling you, as a friend, you gotta watch him. I don't like that dude. No, I don't think it's that serious, Larry. Huh, but you're right. Something is happening with him. Hey, you wanna get some ice cream? No, actually, never mind. It probably leaked through your body right now. You still got a hole inside you. I'll just take you home. Come on. All right, class. So this is how you deliver a baby. So first, you gotta have your hands right here propped so you can guide the head when it's coming out. Oh, look at the little fishy. Oh, it's so... Wait one second. Somebody's at the door. Sketch! Why didn't you just use your key? <laughs> and why are you dressed like that? Where's your white beater? You actually look sophisticated right now. <laughs> you don't look like a damn delinquent. Um, hi. Um, I, I don't know who y you are, but I'm not, um, uh, sketchy. I'm his brother, Lawrence. <laughs> Sketchy, you funny as hell. Stop, man. You crazy. Even though you are dressing kind of weird right now, this is not like you. You usually smell like damn cigarettes and weed. <laughs> Come on in, Sketch. Stop playing. I, I, I'm, I'm sorry. And your name is? <sighs> I'll play this game with you, Sketch. I'm Kmore. You're Sketchy. <laughs> no, uh, 
I think you still have me con confused with my brother. I'm Larence. My brother name is Clarence. We are twins. Wait a minute. I think you're actually serious. <gasps> oh my God! Sketchy has a brother? This is crazy! Come on in! Me Casa a Sue Casa. <laughs> Why yes, thank you. Thank you very much. Um, Kmore, is it? Um, have you seen my brother, Clarence? Um, have you seen him around? Oh, Sketchy? Uh, he's probably off, you know, doing what he does, stealing drugs and whatnot. He should be home after a while. But here, make yourself comfortable. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. So, um, how long have you guys lived here? Oh, well, me and Sketchy became friends uh, two seasons ago. <laughs> Get it? Because we on season three. But yeah, we became friends a little while ago, and you know, I asked him if I could move, and he told me I can, and there you go. There, that's the show, pretty much. Would you like anything to drink, Larence? <laughs> that's hilarious. Man, you look just like Skit. Why, thank you. I would love something to drink. Very parsh. Okay, I'll be right back. Oh, and who is this little fellow? Hello, little guy. Hey, man, chill out. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. Come on. Chill. No, 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 no. I don't want to kill you. I, I don't mean any harm, buddy. Please let me live, Sketch. I promise you I won't smoke none of your weed. No more, man. I won't smoke none of your weed. I'm sorry. Larry! I see you've met Sketchy's brother, Larence. <laughs> Such a cool guy. Wait a minute, k -Mo. You mean to tell me that this right here ain't Sketchy? Whew. Man, thank God. I thought you was going to get me. But man, y'all look just alike. I know, right? They're twins. <laughs> Isn't it crazy? He's like literally the total opposite of Sketch. Oh, yes. Quite in, in indeed. My brother, he's kind of on the outside. I'm really... Chill and lay back. <laughs> well, nice to meet you, Larence. You way cooler than the sketch already. He would have tried to stunt me by now. Well, hey, I guess since we all just waiting on sketch, we could watch some cartoons or something if you want, Larence. Cartoons? Oh, I would love that. Yes, let's let's watch cartoons. <laughs> hey, right, cool. Let me go get the popcorn out of the kitchen. I'll see y'all on the couch. Appreciate that, Larry. Hey, bring me a Coca Cola out the fridge. <laughs> let's go, Larence. Ooh, man, that was a long day. Boy, anybody said the trap life was easy. They sure did lie. Hey, k -more, did you forget the... Yo! Bro, what, what, what's sketchy? You're here. Look, it's your brother, Larence. Why you ain't tell me you had a brother, sketch? Why, hello, brother. How's it been? I've missed you. Uh, man, don't touch me. Don't get all mushy with me. Move. What you want? What you doing here? And k -more, why the hell is that damn roach on the couch? Where, where the hell my gun at? See, Larry, I told you this way I ain't like him. He always trying to kill me. I'm gone. Peace out. Damn, Skitch. You not happy to see your brother? Why didn't you tell me you had a brother all this alone, Skitch? I thought I was the only brother. But it's dope to see you have an actual one. And he looks just like you. And he doesn't smell like weed and cigarettes. <laughs> oh, no. I've never smoked a day in my life. <laughs> and that's the reason why I ain't tell you I had a brother. He's such a square. He don't like doing nothing I like doing. That's why I moved away from him. Oh, Clarence, you haven't changed a bit. You know, Mom always said if you kept smoking, you'll get that voice that you have now. That's why it's all kind of scratchy. Yeah, and that's why I left her too. I'm my own man. But forget all that. Like I asked the first time, what are you doing here? Well, if you must know, Clarence... So I recently went to the doctor because I collapsed. And the doctor said that I could lose a kidney. And the doctor said if I don't find a donor, I could die. <laughs> oh no, Lawrence! That's crazy. We don't want you to die. Isn't that wild? You don't smoke or drink or do anything. But yet you sitting here about to lose a kidney. Damn. That is sad. Yes, it's... It's because I'm always around the computer tech and everything and the machines at work and it's just all the fumes that just got inside my body and my kidneys took a hit. Okay, that still don't explain why you're here. Why are you telling me for? Well, Clarence, seeing that you are my twin brother, I was hoping you can be my donor. <laughs> Damn, Larry, you ain't changed a bit. Hell no. Sketchy! 
You don't want to give your brother a kidney to save his life? Did, 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 did I stutter? No, I ain't giving him my kidney. Plus, if I give him one of my kidneys, I can't drink like I like to drink anymore. Wow, Sketchy. Now, this is even lower than you. I could never imagine you would do something like this. It's all right, K-more. Well, it was good seeing all you guys and you too, Clarence. I guess I'll be seeing my way out. Bye. But Lawrence, where will you go? I guess I'll just g go back to the lab and finish working on computers and hacking stuff. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, Lawrence. You said you know how to hack stuff? Yeah, Clarence, that's what I do. I'm a hacker. So let's say if somebody's in, just hypothetically speaking, jail, you know how to hack inside the bars and stuff like that? Well, hypothetically. Aesthetically speaking, as you said, yeah, that's easy. <laughs> hmm. Okay. You got a deal. If you can hack some for me, Lawrence, I give you my kidney. Oh, oh yes, Clarence, of course I can hack something for you. <laughs> Put it there. Yeah. Don't do that. So sketchy, what's the plan? What are we doing here at the jail? If I can get Lawrence to hook us inside the jail, I can finally finish off Scarfin once and for all. Then that way, I can become the real kingpin of this city. I own everything. <laughs> <gasps> sketchy! You're gonna use your brother to break you inside the jail so you can kill Scarfin? Nigga, you're a genius. I'm down. Let's do it. <laughs> Lawrence, can you hear us? Loud and clear, brother. I can hear you. Copy that. There is one problem. There are security cameras everywhere. I can only hack the system for, um, let's say about a minute and three seconds. So that's the time that you guys have. So if one of you guys can be the distraction while I guess Sketchy, you go do what you need to do. Kate Moore, you can be the distraction, right? Be the distraction? What the hell you want me to do? Kate Moore, don't hate me for this, but uh. La da 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 da. Look at me. I'm washing my body. Yep. Oh, man. This soap is re really slippery. I hope I don't drop it. Oh, I dropped the soap. <laughs> sketchy, you need to hurry up. These guys look serious. All right, Sketchy. Go ahead and go. Go inside right now. Got it. I see Scarfin right there. Scarfin, we meet again, huh? Sketchy. What you want, man? I'm done with you. You're the reason why I'm in here in the first place. When I get out of here, I'm gonna kill you and I'm gonna take back over a bikini bottom. See, uh, that's why I think you're wrong. See, I already took out your boy Sketchy. Now, it's time for me to get you. You ain't making it up out of here. What you talking about, man? Matter of fact, how did you get up in here? Gorge! Come get this guy! Say goodnight! <clears throat> I don't know how, how I can ever repay you, brother. Thank you for giving me one of your kidneys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want to hear. And if you tell anybody I did this for you, I'll kill you myself. Come on, Doc. Yeah, so about your kidneys, Clarence. Seems like we can't even use your kidney. Uh, you've been drinking way too much. And besides, you only have one yourself. Yeah, I don't know what to tell you guys. But... I'll come back and let you guys figure that out. Damn, I forgot that. I do only have one kidney. Oh, well. Oh, no. That means I'm going to to die. Oh, if only there was someone out there with a type A kidney for me. Huh. Hey, Lawrence, did you say a uh, type A kidney? Why, why, yes. Yes, I did. I did say type A kidney. Oh, well, that's the same type of kidneys I have. I guess they make us triplet. Well, why you ain't say that in the first place? Duh, idiot. Cause you didn't ask me. I'll be more than welcome to give you one of my kidneys, Larry. Let's do the operation. Besides, my ass kinda hurt. Duh! Oh, thank you, K-More. I really appreciate that. So, have you guys figured it out? Yeah, Doc. I'm gonna give my guy Larry right here one of my kidneys. But I got one request. Please knock my ass out. Cause the way I'm feeling right now, I'm in so much pain. Yeah, what in the hell happened to you anyways? Why are you, you know, I actually don't want to know. Doctors, get this man on anesthesia to knock his ass out right now. Appreciate that, K-More. Everything works just like I planned. 
and I'm the kingpin of this city. Hey, uh, Lawrence, I just want to say I really appreciate, man, for everything you did, dog. You ain't had to do that for me, but I guess that's what brothers do, huh? Of course, Clarence, I'll do anything for you. We should actually start to hang out a lot more. Well, let's not go too far. Maybe sometime. Yada, yada, yada. Doctor, knock me out. My ass hurt. You move that over there, put that across over there. Yeah, that's gonna look real good right there. <laughs> My own statue. Wow! I can't believe we got this place to ourselves, Sketch! Oh man, see, I can already imagine it. My class gonna be right here, then I'ma also have my class over here, and then- Let me stop you right there, K-More. You ain't having no classes here at this house. Mm-mm, I'm not having it. This is a place of business. You ain't finna have no damn class going on here. Having women coming in and all about it here and random people. You crazy. You gonna blow my cover. Damn, Sketchy. I just wanted a few aerobics classes going on. I guarantee my ladies that I'll still make it happen for them. Huh, okay. I guess I'll just still do it back at the old house then since we still got it. Damn. Matter of fact, let me call Larry over. I know he'll love this place. And he most definitely ain't finna be in my new house. You got me messed up. That roach ain't finna see no part of this floor. And if I catch him here, he's mine. I'm telling you, K-More, I don't want to see Larry here at all. He don't even need to be at the other house either. Sketchy Larry can't come here? Oh, man. I don't know. What am I going to do? It's going to be so damn boring here. Oh. Oh, God, man. I guess I'll go see what my new room is. Because I can't do nothing in there either. Oh, asshole. Yeah, he mad right now. But he gonna thank me one day. Shoot, this is an amazing come up. I'm the boss. <sighs> Sketch, pat yourself on the back. You did good. <laughs> Look at this big ass room. Full of nothing. Man, I wish Larry was here. He'll understand me. Oh, damn. I need to go back to the house and get a few things. La 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 la. Go ahead and get this. Bring this. Oh, I'm definitely gonna need this. Oh, Larry, what's good? What's up, K-More? Man, it's been kind of lonely since y'all left here. Well, I'm glad that Sketchy gone, but man, you? Gosh, bro. I missed you, man. I missed you too, Larry. And I won't even lie. Man, I hate that new place. It's just huge and I don't got nothing to do. Can you believe Sketchy said I can't even have classes there? <gasps> For real? Man, you can't have your classes? But you do that all the time, King Moore. That's crazy. I know, right? And then he gonna say that Larry can't come here either. That's when I was like, man, you done lost your damn mind, Sketch. So, I'm sorry, Larry. I guess you just gotta be here. But I'll still come here sometime. I figured he'll say something like that with his hating ass. It's cool. I guess I'll just be here all by myself. You know, with nothing to do and nobody to talk to until you come by. Maybe once in a while. Oh, come on, Larry. Don't be sad. Don't, don't make me cry. You know what? Forget Skit. You can come with me, Larry. But we'll just have to, you know, hide you for a little second. You know, maybe until he possibly warm up to you or something like that. It can't be all bad, right? Plus... You can just stay in my room. That way you never have to come out. Hell, the room's so damn big. It's just like this house right here. <laughs> we'll make it work. For real, K-More? Oh, man, that's what's up. Let me go ahead and get my thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just make sure that shipment is out by noon. And I do not want to be late. If my shipment late and I lose out on money, that's your damn ass. Bye. I like being the boss. I can get used to this. Man, I got cameras everywhere. Johnny ate a booger and it tastes like sugar. Johnny want to know who ate that booger. Oh, Larry, you got to count. <laughs> it's my turn to hide. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Cool, 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 cool. One, two, three. Damn, I got a camera to every room. Let me check on K-more crazy ass and see what he up to. <laughs> Probably trying to see how he can have a class inside his room or something. Wait a minute. I know that ain't. Oh, hell no. Goon, 
Tell K more to come here. Oh, Larry, you found me. <laughs> Damn, you getting better at this. Oh, snap, somebody's at the door. Hi, Larry. Hi. Hey, uh, K more. The boss wants to see you right now in his room. Come up ASAP. Okay, Goon. I'll be there in just a second. All right, Larry. Make sure you stay hidden. We don't need Sketchy to see you, okay? I'll be right back. <laughs> All right, it's cool. I'll be right over here. Oh, what's up, Sketch? You enjoying your new office? It's real cute. I remember the last time I was up here, man, we had did a crazy deal. That's how we ended up getting you out of prison. Well, a lot of things have changed since then. <laughs> what you up to? Oh, nothing. Just taking care of a few deals. Speaking of deals, what you doing up in your room, man? You just, uh, chilling? Oh, yeah. You know, I ain't doing nothing, nothing that's out of the ordinary. I'm just, uh, <laughs> collecting stamps. That's pretty much it. So you wouldn't happen to be playing hide and go see with anybody, would you? Uh... No, Sketch, I wasn't playing hide and go see. I was just, you know, in my room just chilling, you know, like just trying to get used to everything. And that's pretty much it. So you wasn't playing hide and go see with Larry, was you? <gasps> Sketch, I'm surprised at you. You really think that I would bring Larry here after you told me that he can't come here? Now, why would I do something like Because I got your ass red-handed. Uh, that's not Larry. Hell, you both got some new roaches in your house, Skit. That ain't Larry at all. Oh, that's not Larry, huh? You got some jokes. Okay. Goon, bring him in. Man, get your hands off me, bro. Move. Put me down. Put me down. Larry, let him go right now. Put him down, Skit. Be quiet. I told you that damn roach don't need to be here in my house. And you literally disobeyed me, k -more. He gotta go. Okay, okay, I apologize. Let him go. Just put him outside or some sketch. Come on. Put him down. The little guy don't deserve this. It's my fault. I told him he can come here. He didn't want to come. Goon. You know what to do. Throw him out the window. Wait, 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 wait. Hey! Larry! No! I got the little buddy. Sketch. Fine. If Larry can't stay here, I ain't staying here either. I'm going back to the old house. Let's go, Larry. That's cool with me. But just know if you ever come back, that roach can't come up in here ever again. Man, can you believe that, goon? People just so damn unappreciative. Hey, thanks for saving me, came out that window. Man, I was going to be a goner. It's cool, Larry. I'd rather go back at the old house where everything was good anyway. Plus, I can start back my class. Matter of fact, you could be my sidekick. <laughs> Larry and k -more. New classes. It's going to be fun. Way better than being here with this asshole sketch. Man, that guy's just losing his mind. He is crazy. Oh, well. Let's go get something to eat, Larry. I'm hungry after all that damn superhero stuff I just got done doing. Hurt my ass. <laughs> Okay, class, so today we're going to show you how to remove a bullet. And to demonstrate, I got my boy Larry right here. He got shot last week and survived it. Go on, tell him, Larry. They went my first time getting shot. They are like my third. So all y'all got to do, when you got the bullet wound, just remove the... Hold one second, everybody. Somebody's at the door. Give me one minute. Da 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 Oh my goodness, it's so good to see you, Kaibor. I miss you. The roaches! Oh my god! Oh, oh my god, it's so good. Oh, it's so good. Oh, what happened? The, oh my god, the roaches! It, it wasn't a dream, you actually are here. What the hell are we? Well, silly. Well, you passed out for seeing me. I just picked you up and I took us to our favorite restaurant. But the roaches, I thought you was, you was dead. I mean, I went to your funeral and everything. I mean, we buried you. How are you here right now? See, that's the thing. When I was in the sea drowning, I was actually choking on a chicken wing, Kaibor. So what ended up happening is they didn't come give me enough time. 
So I end up going into a coma and I end up waking up in some casket and I'm like, what the hell is going on? And it's been a whole year since then and I've been looking for you. And here we are right now. You mean to tell me, DeRoaches, you never died? That you was just in a coma this entire time? Oh my God, that is crazy. I know, right? Like, it's insane. But ever since then, I've been looking for you, K-Boy. You don't know how much I have missed you. You was like my little sugar plum, my cinnamon apple. Speaking of cinnamon apple, you gonna eat that? No, it's okay, you got it. Damn, I mean, I don't even know what to think right now, the Roaches. This is insane. It's okay. You don't have to do that buzz thinking. All man, you got to do is just get back together and our life will be back great. And it seems like you got a house. So, man, you, we could just move in, start our little old family and everything, Kaimor. We can go back to being normal. Oh, damn. What about biscuits? Oh, uh, the roaches? Look, this is a lot, you know, to take in with you being back alive and I thought you was dead. I'm going to need some time to think about this. Whew, this does too much for my brain right now. Uh, okay, I understand, K-Boy. Take your time, but I'll take two more time, okay? I miss you, baby. Mm, I can't wait for me and you to get back to how we was. Remember when I used to crush your bones? Oh, yeah, don't remind me. I'm still getting surgery on it. But, yeah, DeRuchis, I need to take some time on this one. Uh... I guess I'll give you a call later or something. No problem. Here's my number right here. Reach out. Oh my God. Man, I can't believe she's still alive. That's crazy. But what about Biscuit? I'm in love with her now. I mean, this whole year from me thinking DeRuchas was dead, I didn't fell in love with somebody else. Man, this gonna be tough. Hey, boy. Man, it's good to see you back. Whew, man, class is crazy. Everybody said I did real good without you, though. You ready for class tomorrow? I don't know right now, Larry. I got a lot on my mind. Man, can you believe my ex showed up at the door? She was supposed to be dead. Wait, 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 wait. You mean the ex you was talking about from a year ago? Damn. Yeah, you got a lot on your brain. It's cool. I'll take over the class tomorrow and just tell everybody what's going on, man. I'll be right back. I just met me a girl from the class. We about to get ready and go out. <laughs> All right, Larry. I'll see you later. Damn. Maybe Sketch will know what to do about this situation. Let me call him. Mr. Sketchy, please. I'll never do it again. I didn't mean to steal from you. Exactly. I know you'll never do it again because I'll never give you the chance. Goons, feed it to the worms. Who this calling? Okay, more. Yo, what up, boy? What's up, Sketch? Man, you won't believe what's been going on. Bro, do you know how I told you about my ex, Daruchi? Of course, how can I forget? You always talk about her ass. I mean, that's until Biscuits came along. Now you got another big ass fit. Yes, exactly. Sketch. She is still alive. Whoa, 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 what? How? How is that even possible? Exactly what I said. So apparently she was just in a coma. She was choking on a chicken bone when she was drowning. Man, what are the odds? And then she came up at the door and she took me out to lunch and saying that she want to be with me again, Sketch. What do I do? Oh, damn. Man, that is a tough one. And then you got Biscuits. Come on, man. You got a tough decision to make. You can't let go of Biscuits. But then again, this girl right here was before Biscuits. And I know how much she mean to you, too. Yeah, I know, Sketch. Man, this is a bad situation. And I told Biscuits to come by here to do... Oh, snap, she at the door right now. Let me call you back. Good luck, nigga. Damn, I hate to be in this situation. Oh, well. <laughs> money, money, money. Baby, it's so good to see you. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I missed you so much, boo. Mm -hmm. Come on, let's watch our favorite show. So, baby, how was your day? Oh my goodness, my day was so good. But then again, this person might be bad because he got my order wrong. Instead of giving me 20 hot dogs, he gave me 19. Can you believe that, baby? Oh, I just hate bad customer service. He did what? 
Yeah, that's just horrible customer service. I can't believe he did that. I'm gonna give you 19 instead of 20. He know 20 your damn, you know, that ain't even your appetizer. You know what I'm saying? That's just the, the warm up. That's crazy. Are you gonna get the door? Kyboy, are you gonna get the door? Somebody docking at it. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna. Oh my god, why you acting all crazy? I got it. Just sit down. Why the roaches? I gotta know. Uh, can I help you? Uh, can I help you? Uh, I'm looking for Kaymore. Who is you? First of all, I'm his girlfriend. You got no reason to be looking for my man. No. I'm his girlfriend. You got no reason being in my man's house. First of all, this man his spot. Oh, ladies, how's it going? How about we sit down and let's watch this TV show? <laughs> it's a really good one that's going on right now. Yeah, no. That's the TV show right here. It's gonna be a sumo fight. Bitch, you got about five seconds to get by my bad house. I'm finna go crazy on you. I don't mind the scared of you. One, two, three, four, five. Let's go. Ah! No! Stop! Stop! Oh. Oh, my head hurts. My whole body hurts. Ah! The roaches! Biscuits! What's going on? Well, when you had gotten all crossfire and got your ass knocked out, me and the Roaches had a talk. She told me everything, Kaybor. Why didn't you let me know that you had a girlfriend that died? Uh, yeah, yeah, why didn't you tell me you had a girlfriend, Kaybor? Uh, I mean, to be honest, I didn't know what to say. Biscuits? I didn't know that the Roaches was still alive. I thought she was dead. And the Roaches, I mean... Damn, you just saw up at my doorstep and you was alive and I thought you was dead. I was just confused. Well, we've come to a conclusion. You gonna either choose me, Kaybor, or you gonna choose this thing right here. Oh, uh, first of all, I ain't no thing. We can go a second round if you want. I got enough energy. Wait, 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 wait. Please don't fight again. I mean, this is kind of tough. I mean, the Roaches, girl... I, I I loved you. I mean, we had went through so much together. And we had some of the best times. And I think about you every day. I'll be honest. Not a day goes by that you're not on my mind and everything that we went through. But I must admit, I'm in love with my baby biscuits. <laughs> the way she makes me feel. The things she do to me. I mean, she do crush my bones too. But she's about to be my wife. And... I know what me and you had was special to Roaches, but me and Biscuits, we got something even more special. I'm sorry, the Roaches. I don't know how to, you know, make this situation better for you. It's okay. I mean, I guess I get it. You did think I was dead, and I mean, like I said, it took a year for me to find you. I had to have a little fun myself, you know. Oh. <sighs> I guess no little ugly ass win. Oh, Kaybor. I love you so much too, baby. No hard feelings, girl. No hard feelings. Girl, you got you a good man in your hands. Take care of him, because you lucky to have him. Trust me, I would know. Whew, girl, I, trust me, I do know he is a good man. Whew, all this fighting and stuff got me hungry. You want to go down to the hall you can eat buffet with me, girl? I was just on my way down there. Yes, I love to go, girl. I'm starving. Bye, Kaymore. I'll be back to check on you, baby. I'm about to go get my grub off. <laughs> Let's go, girl. I heard we can take all the food from them. Yeah, girl. Last time I was there, they kicked me out. Talk about they ain't had no more food left. I'm like, well, why you call your place all you can eat this? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, that was a close one. That damn near killed me. Oh, but I'm happy that I got my baby biscuits. And I really hope the Roots have a good future. But enough of that. Ugh! Three on my back! I don't know which one of them sat on me. Ah! Oh. One million and one. One million and two. Boy, I just got so much money. <laughs> hey, yo, uh, boss, uh, sorry to interrupt you, but, uh, 
I think you may want to see this. Man, see what? You see me counting money? It's the mayor, boss. He's talking about something crazy. Hello, townspeople of Bikini Bottom. I'm glad that you all are gathered here because I want to protect our city. So starting here, I'm implementing new laws for us so we can all be safe. Starting today, the gun law. New gun laws are going to be placed where Bikini Bottom has no weapons. If you have a weapon, you have to have it licensed. And if you don't, you will get a minimum 25 years in jail. Second law, no drugs. I repeat, no drugs. If you have anything from either a 2.5 of a gram, you're going to jail for a minimum of 10 years. And last but not least, there's been a lot of drug trafficking going through our city, people. So we're going to put a high security team right at the border so no one is coming in and coming out. And I hope these rules will have an effect on the city and everyone will be safe. Love you. Thank you, guys. Shit! Man, the mayor tripping. Man, this is going to be bad for my business. I got to do something about this. Hey, yo, goon! Get me a meeting with the mayor right now. <laughs> Mr. Mayor, my guy, how's it going? I ain't seen you since the last time you had came to the Crescent Crab and got that burger and threw up. Please don't remind me. I'm still getting over that. Ugh. Now, can we make this meeting fast? I have another meeting at 5.30. Yes, sir. Of course, of course, of course. So, uh, about what you said today. You know when you were speaking about uh, people coming in out of the border and stuff like that? Yes. Well, Mr. Mayor, my line of work, that kind of will affect my business. You know what I'm saying? No, I'm not following you. What are you saying? I'm saying, Mr. Mayor, if you can scratch my back, I'll scratch your back. You get what I mean? Uh, I think I'll pass on that. I have my missus to scratch my back. <laughs> uh, Mr. Mayor, you got you got jokes. What I'm trying to say to you is, you can look out for me how I look out for you. Now, I know you ain't never seen this much money right here. Ain't no way you getting paid this much money on the mayor's salary. I can get you paid, mayor. You get what I'm saying now? Oh, okay, I get it, I get it. You're going to pay me so I can keep the border open for you, right? Exactly. I scratch your back, you scratch mine. Now, what do you say about that, Mr. Mayor? You ready to get paid? Yeah. I'll pass on that. Sorry, sir. I am the mayor of Bikini Bottom. I don't do business with criminals. Now, if you excuse me, I have an appointment at 5.30. I have to meet some young lady. You know, it's really hard to be mayor when every woman wants you. Gosh, glad I can be a faithful man, you know? Security, get this guy out of here. <laughs> I need a plan. He won't take money. And what the hell will he take? Wait a minute. I got just the idea. Um, now you're very relaxed, class. Don't let anyone interrupt your flow. Hmm. Damn! Somebody always calling me doing class. Hold up, everybody. Hello? k -more, my boy, what's good? Sketchy, what the hell do you want? I have class going on right now. You interrupted me in the wrong time. We was meditating. My bad, k -more. Uh, So, you remember when I helped you get uh, biscuits back, right? Right. And that girl that you was on a date with. Uh, You wouldn't happen to still have a contact, do you? Oh, you talking about Sherry. Oh, yeah. I still got her contact. I had met her ass on MySpace. Can you believe people still go on there? <laughs> Idiots. Yeah, you need it? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yes. Thank you, K-More. Give me her number right now. Here. 555-6755. Five, 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 five. Now, leave me alone. All right, class. Let's finish meditating so we go ahead and crack an egg off a bomb head. <laughs> hey, Goon. Find out where the mayor going to be at later today. Already on top it, boss. The mayor's gonna be golfing at 6.30. Cool. This would be perfect. 
four. Damn it. Missed that one too. Man, my golf swing is getting rusty. Had a long night. <laughs> what? Is, is that you, Mr. Mayor? Man, how's it going? It's crazy to run into you here. What do you want? How the hell did you even get in here? This is a members only club. Oh, I know it is. I just so happen to be a member. So if you excuse me, let me go ahead and take my swing. Yeah. Ah! Damn, I'm good. Wow, you have one pretty good swing there. Why don't you show me that again? Easy money. Yeah. <laughs> that boy cold. Hey, you should be my golf partner. I love to have you around. Anytime, Mr. Mayor, just say the word. Hey, buddy, who is the hot chick right there? Oh my gosh, she's gorgeous. Oh, you, you talking about her? Oh, that's my caddy, Mr. Mayor. Yeah, she look good, right? Hey, I think she told me she got a crush on you. Oh, 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 really? She does? You uh think you could hook your boy up? <laughs> oh, anything for you, Mr. Mayor. Hey, Sherry, my boy Mr. Mayor want to see you. Well, hello, Mr. Mayor. How are you doing, handsome? Oh, stop it. I'm doing great. How about yourself, beautiful? Oh, I'm doing even better now that I'm here with you. <laughs> so, do you really love to golf? I would love for you to teach me how to swing. Oh, y y y yeah, I, I love to golf. I can definitely teach you how to swing. Um, how about you give me your number so I can get you a few lessons? Oh, anytime. Here you go. <laughs> Call me. Wow. Thank you. Uh, what was your name again? Uh, Sketchy. <laughs> Sketchy. Thank you a lot, Sketchy. Hey, let's say we keep this between us. You know, we won't want the public to know that the mayor is cheating on his wife, right? <laughs> you get me? <laughs> of course not, Mr. Mayor. And ruin your reputation? I would never do such a thing. Me and you were boys. <laughs> So, Sherry, what's the word? What's going on? Can you believe this fool took me to a cheap-ass hotel? I mean, it has to be the worst one in Bikini Bottom. And talking about he's the mayor. Hmm. Well, I guess that does make sense. Nobody expected the mayor be in the hood. Look, all I need you to do is place the cameras right where I told you. And, you know, flirt with him a little. You know, do everything with him. You can do that. Oh, that's easy. This fool can't keep his hands off me. I'll let you know when everything is happening. Cool. So, baby, how about me and you, uh, have a little fun on the bed here? Oh, I thought you were never ask. How about we put on a little music? Gotcha, coming right up. Ah, this is my favorite song. This new girl really has no taste. Oh, yeah, this is a good one. You want a massage? Oh, I thought you will never ask. Ugh, you know, being a mirror is really hard. So tense. Glad I can get away from my wife. God, that woman stresses me out. But you, I really like you. You may be the one. Oh, don't worry about your wife. I'm going to take all your troubles away. <laughs> How about we uh turn off these lights? And cut! Got your ass, Mr. Mayor. What the hell is going on here, Sketchy? What are you doing here? Nah, the question is, what are you doing here, Mr. Mayor? Got you on camera. Now go ahead and tell everybody what it is you're doing here. Are you cheating on your wife? Hey, hey, hey! Put that damn camera away. Come on, please. The only way I put this camera down if you agree to my deal, like I said before. I'll do anything. Please, please, please don't let this get out. My wife will kill me. I probably won't even be mayor of the city anymore. Uh-huh. You sure won't. Here you go, Goon. Go make copies of this in my office right now. Good job, Sherry. I'll pay you tomorrow. Pay me tomorrow? I want my money right now. Damn, why you gotta be so... Here. Now get your ass out of here. One, two. Cool. Nice doing business with you, Sketchy. Hit me up anytime. Bye, Mr. Mayor. I can't believe you set me up. Damn it. I really like that girl. I don't want to hear none of that. This is my city. You was about to stop my whole drug game. And I can't let that happen. I gotta keep running this. So, Mr. Mayor... Moving forward, you're going to take away your high security team across the border so I can keep my drugs from coming in. Got it? Got it. Is there anything else? Hmm. Now that you mention it, I do got one more thing up my sleeve. <laughs> hey, yo, boss, the man's on TV again. 
townspeople of Bikini Bottom, I have new laws that I want to change. So, as I mentioned before, that I was closing off and putting high security team by the border, I'm no longer doing that. I feel like that's not an important thing of our city. And second, I'm assigning a new commissioner of the whole entire police department of Bikini Bottom to Clarence Butterscotch. That's all the news that I have. Do you know what this means, boss? You're commissioner of the police department of Bikini Bottom. I know exactly what it means, goon. Checkmate. <laughs> I'm the captain now. Now go get me some chips with extra dip. It was originally rolling for Long Beach Griffin, but he canceled. So I filled in. And here you go. The rest is history. <laughs> hey, why did you still touch clothes? You know that wasn't written in the script, right? Hey, yeah, baby, welcome to my home. I know you like it, right? Oh, baby, this is real nice. Look how you came up. Oh, baby, you want me to wipe my fans off before we come in here? Matter of fact, let me cover my fans up because I don't want to mess nothing up. It's so nice in here. Oh, you good, baby. Me, Casa, and Sue, Casa. You know what I mean? <laughs> Hey, John John, don't be doing too much, all right? What you say in Spanish? Mi casa es su casa. I know that's right. Hold on, so that means you're going to give me a key maid. I'm so proud of you. Look at you sharing your wealth with me. I ain't got to break in or nothing. But, baby, I miss you. I feel like I ain't seen you in forever. Where have you been? Like, we're keeping you away from me like that. Well, you know, baby, I am like the CEO of what I do now, you know, but... I missed you too. I'm glad to see you and Lil John John here. We're like one big happy family. <laughs> oh baby, we do make a cute little family. Look at us. <gasps> Let's go to the mall. I saw some stuff I wanted anyway. Ooh, and while we there, I'm gonna schedule to take us a little picture in there. You know, like at JC Penney's. We gonna be so cute. Oh, uh, go to the mall? Damn, today kinda busy for me. Uh, yeah. First, uh, I think we gotta get somebody to watch Lil John John. Uh, get somebody to watch him for what? John John damn near grown. He'll be all right. He can play in that little sand pit you got over there. You'll be all right, won't you, baby? Yes, ma'am. I'm a big boy. Then again, you didn't put all these cameras up in your house, which he would steal something. You right? Uh, let's get somebody to watch him. Okay, cool. Uh, let me try to call K more real quick. <laughs> All right, ladies, so this is how you do jail extensions, ladies. All you gotta do is put your hand out right here, and then, who the hell is calling me? Hold on, y'all. Hello? Yo, uh, k Ward. what you doing, man? Nigga, I'm having class. I'm trying to teach these ladies how to put on jail nails. What do you want? So, uh, we best friends, right? Right. And you'll do anything for me, right? Of course, Sketchy, you my guy. Now, what's up? Uh, I need you to babysit, uh, somebody for me. Babysit who? I need you to babysit John John for me. Come on, K-Moy. You got me, right? Oh, hell no. I told you. I ain't babysitting Satan no more. That's your damn problem. Bye. <laughs> now, what were we, ladies? Oh, damn. Don't hurt her. Damn. Uh, Goon, you think you can watch him while we, uh, Go to the mall real quick. Oh, I'm real good with kids, boss. No problem. Of course I got you. You sure, Scotchy? This nigga been staring at that wall for like the last 10 minutes just talking to himself. Uh, yeah, I'm sure. He my best goon. He got it. All right, John John, you know the drill. Be mommy's angel. No matches, no sharp shit. Don't kill nothing. No animals. Stay away from the small stuff, okay? Yes, ma'am. I'm gonna be on my best behavior. Hey, Mr. Goon, you ever play cops and robbers? <laughs> oh, thank you, baby. I've been dying to get to the mall. I saw all this nice stuff that I wanted. Oh, they got a Christian Fior in here. Look, 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 baby. Oh, you missed it. Okay, don't worry about it. Let's go. Ooh, ooh, they could give me a Shashel bag. Yes, baby, a Shashel. Sketchy, you hear me? Oh, you keep walking past up. <gasps> oh, baby, we gotta go in here. They got some C. Jordans. 
You're not. I could get you to see Jordan ones, but you two, you not. <sighs> Baby, stop. I'm for real going in here. They got sandals really made of sand. Sketchy. You're not listening to me. Uh, my bad, baby. Uh, uh, yeah, see Jordan, see Jordan, see Jordan. Uh, man, let me call you right back. Uh, Sketchy, what was the purpose of you even asking me to come out here? Like, why would we come to the mall if all you're going to do is be on the phone, talking to your goons, doing business? What about me? We ain't spend no time together. I don't even know what you look like no more half the time. You make me sick. My bad, boo. You know what? You right. I'm gonna put my phone down. This is all about you. Oh, hold on, wait a minute. Let me take this call real quick. Hello? I said I had a shipment done later. My bad, boo. Yeah, but like I was saying, it's all about you. It's all about you. Whatever you want to get, let's just go ahead and get. See? That's all I wanted you to do is something special for me. A mermaid dress. It's made out of real mermaid scales and everything. I'm gonna look so good in it, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, whatever. You're gonna look real good. We're up. Real good, real good, real good. Man, we better get this shit made. Sketchy, I really hope you get it together before tonight. Because, you know, I got this dress and your favorite color and everything. It's supposed to be special. Uh, tonight? Y yeah, yeah, baby. Tonight gonna be real special. I, you know I can't wait. You sound like you don't know what I'm talking. You got the reservations, didn't you? Didn't you? Girl, come on. For you, of course I got the reservation. You know how I never forget that we... Doing something tonight? <laughs> yeah. Okay, baby, because I'm so excited. K more doing my nails and everything. I'm going to leave you now because I got to go home and get dressed. But, ooh, I can't wait to see you later tonight. I know you're going to smell so good. <laughs> uh, of course, baby. You already know I'm going to smell good. Smell just like that cushion cologne you like. <laughs> Well, I'll right, see you later. Go ahead and get your hair done. Here goes some spending money for you. <laughs> Ooh, my baby rich, y'all. Thank you, baby. I'm so excited. I'll see you later. Damn. I wonder what could she be having planned tonight. I forgot. I've been so damn busy. Wait, she said she was going over Kmore house. Maybe I can ask him real quick. And there we go. How about this color, baby? Is it good? <laughs> Go ahead and tell your boy how he did. Oh my goodness. How did you learn how to do gel extensions so good, K more? These are nice. Oh, it's gonna make tonight so special. I can't wait. You know it's our first anniversary. Me and Sketchy. I mean, it's been rough lately, but he gonna make up for all of that tonight. I know he is. Oh, it's our anniversary. Well, ain't that dope? Me and Biscuits, you know, we've been together for about a year too. That's why me and her getting married. I can't wait. Hey, maybe you could be Biscuit's bridesmaid. Hell yeah, I'll stand up for her. I mean, if I can fit in there with y'all, because if it's a capacity, maybe it's just you and Biscuit, but I'll be outside when y'all get done. Heck yeah. Oh, we got plenty of enough room, trust me. I already know. Plus, Biscuit's got her family coming, and they just as big as her. But don't worry, the church is huge. <laughs> oh, damn, wait a minute. How long getting a call? Hello? Hey, k -more. Is baby over there with you right now? Oh, uh, yeah. How's it going, person who is not sketchy? Oh, uh, how's it going, sir? Okay, cool. Uh, man, she said we're supposed to be doing something tonight, and I have no clue what the hell going on. You know, I've been so busy with work. Did she uh happen to mention that we was doing something tonight? Oh, uh, yes, sir. The toilet seems to be working fine, and if I could guess. What's going to be happening to the toilet tonight, sir, is that it's going to be an anniversary uh, toilet. Because this is the, the one year anniversary for the toilet for you to come fix it. <laughs> toilet? What the hell you? Ah, okay. I see what you're talking about. So it's our anniversary. Damn. Okay. I appreciate that, K-More. No problem, sir. You have a great day. I'll be seeing you later to come fix the anniversary toilet. Thank you. Ooh, girl, you know them damn uh, plumbers. <laughs> They stay messing up. That's cute that you call it a toilet anniversary. I just call it a warranty. I think that's what it's supposed to be, but okay. <laughs> hey, baby. You look so good in your mermaid dress. I can't believe you, Sketchy. You were 30 minutes late for our dinner. Uh, yeah, I, I, I got caught in traffic. Man, can you believe that? Whew, yeah, it was crazy. But yeah, uh, so, 
You know, I know it's our anniversary, and uh, yeah, tonight gonna be real special. <laughs> I can't believe it's been a whole year that's gone by. Man, time flies. It feels like I just took your corner like two episodes ago. Yeah, it does seem kind of fast, huh? Man, the animated show be working. Uh, but yeah. Well, baby, even though I've been working my ass off just like you have, I made time to get you this really expensive necklace. I want to announce that I paid a lot of money by myself for this necklace, and I don't mean to be hood, but I did put a lot of time and money into this for you. Baby! Wow, girl, you uh, you shouldn't have. Man, this necklace is 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 amazing. Man, it's, it's, so, it's so dope. And it's, it's sparkly, like you paid a lot of money for it. Whew, girl. <laughs> yeah, baby. And I'm going to need you to put it back in the box and unbox it and record it again so I can post it to my Instagram so everybody can know how much I love you. Now, where's my present? I'm so excited. I can't wait to see what you got me. Uh, yeah, your present. Uh, of course I got you some, baby. Uh, close your eyes. Oh, okay. Wait, 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 baby. Hold on, hold on. Let me call her. Wait her. Come here, come here, come here real quick. I need you to record my baby giving me my gift real quick. Hold on, come quick. All right, baby. No problem, ma'am. Oh, damn. That's a nice-ass necklace. Uh, okay. One, two, three. You go for your eyes, baby. Um, sketchy. What, what the fuck is this? Oh, yeah. You in trouble now. <laughs> uh, Baby, it's, it's one of the newest guns that just came out. Uh, you like it, right? <laughs> newest gun? Nigga, this ain't even your gun. It's John John gun. And I could tell because he scraped the serial number off right there and he missed one digit. And his daddy gave it to him before he went to jail the last time. Damn. Uh, Baby, I I promise I got your gift. Uh, Sketchy, I can't believe you. Did you forget our anniversary? So, uh, ma'am... Did you still want me to keep recording? Because this is good. <laughs> this is better than TV. Man, give me my phone. Sketchy, take me home right now. Damn. Man, it's all your fault. What the hell I do? Everybody always blame this stuff on me. I didn't want to record this little weak-ass anniversary anyway. I should have never did out the last time y'all robbed me. Oh, wait a minute, lady. Come back. Baby. I can explain. See, I was doing it. Nah, Sketchy, I don't even want to hear it. Man, I work just as hard as you do. I keep up my corners just as well as you do, but I don't forget you. I make time for you, man. This don't make sense. That's the thing, baby. I don't got a just a corner no more. I'm the boss. I damn near own Bikini Bottom. I mean, my time has just been all over the place, baby. Come on, you, you got to understand. Nah, I know exactly what happened, Sketchy. You let this money change you. Look, we started off as Bonnie and Clyde, and now you over here like Scarfin. You got to make a choice. It's either me and you, or you can do this by yourself. Baby, you know I can't leave the business. I'm in this for life. Come on, I'm just now getting up on my feet. I own the city. Come on, girl. For life, huh? What's the life when you got to do this by yourself? Have fun running the city. John John, get your things. and Get a few of his things, too, because we out of here. Peace out, Mr. Sketchy. And I thought you was gonna be my new daddy, too. Oh, well. Bye, Sketchy. Baby, John John. Damn. Man, you know what? Forget them. They don't want to stick around to be here with me. I don't need nobody. I can do this by myself. It's cool, boss. You still got me. Man, get your ass out of my face. Go get me some cereal or something. Damn. So, yeah, it's it. I've been really thinking about making my OnlyFans account. So I'll upload pictures of my feet, upload pictures of my fins, then I'll have pictures of my elbows and stuff like that. Yeah, I think I'll make a lot of money. So what you think type of stuff you'll upload if you had an OnlyFans account, it? You know what? I think that you don't even be thinking. Is it like a hamster running in a wheel inside of your brain? I'm not finna make no OnlyFans account. You know what? I could. I could sell the recipe to the Krabby Patty. Charge a whole lot of money, you smart. What's up, y'all? What y'all got going on, man? Man, oh, hey, hey, wait a minute. What's the occasion? You going to a funeral or something? You flipping burgers, man. You not leveling up in life? You got a corporate job interview? You leaving the Krusty Krab? Well, well, okay. Uh, wow. Well, guess this will happen when a nigga get his own show, huh? For your FYI, I ain't here to flip no damn burgers. Tech. 
I'm here to talk business with Mr. Crab. I'm thinking about owning half of this place. Mr. Buttercotch, why are you not flipping my fucking burgers? Heh. <laughs> yeah, you funny, Eugene. Here you go. Now shut your ass up. This the money I want to give you every other month to keep doing business here. Now I know you ain't gonna turn down this money. No, I do not accept this money. No illegal activity would be happening at the Krusty Krab. Ah, right, you don't want to do illegal activities, huh? Go on. Go on, show him what's up. Davy Jones's locker. That is a lot of green. Yeah, change of heart now, huh? There we go. Now go on ahead, give me the deed so I can sign it. It's my place. Yes, sir, Mr. Buttershot. So now, I'm your new boss, Tut. Now, matter of fact, I think you should go back there and flip some burgers. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. I got a phone call. I'm gonna step outside real quick. You know, take care of business. Something you ain't never did before. <laughs> hey, Mo, what's going on? Why he big money sketch now? I'm like, look. Mackerel or something right now. I feel like a sardine. He treat me like a sardine. Well, damn, Tut. I guess you have missed a few episodes. Well, Sketchy, he's the big boss now. You know, he the man of the city. He's got ridden every, uh, really opponent <laughs> that could take him out. He took out Scarfin. in. He don't got a parole officer no more. That's a lot. Man, this guy's been going crazy. But with the thing about it, he been letting all the power go to his damn head. I hate his ass right now. Yeah, and it's like I'm losing my best friend. You know, Sketchy was never like this. He was always thoughtful, and you know, we'll always do stuff together. And we don't even hey, hate. man, I ain't gonna lie. I stopped listening the second that your sentence was longer than mine. So, uh huh. But, you see that new uh, Spider Fish No Way Home? Man, man, that had the green shark on there. That was crazy. Mm mm. But, spoiler alert. All the spider fish is in there. Yep. <gasps> oh my God, are you serious? Oh man, I won't be able to sleep for a week. Hey, Tut, get your ass off your phone. We got a shipment outside. I want you to go ahead and go unload. Man, I ain't finna unload nothing. My job working to register. I'm gonna need you to register that in your brain. Now if you look at some more TikToks. I think you must forget. I'm the boss now here. Not you, I'm boss man. You ain't boss man no more. So if you don't get your ass out there and unload that shipment, your ass is getting fired. Uh, oh, okay, boss. I can't say it. Boss. Mm. Mm. Ah. Okay, boss man. Ah. All right, I guess I'll just get to the... Oh, my. Oh, my Poseidon. What is this? It's the shipment, Chuck Weezy. Get to work. We got cocaine, weed, pills. What? We got everything. No. No, no, no. I ain't going back to jail, all right? I'm tired of making first day out songs. I can't do this, SpongeBob. I can't go back to jail. I can't... Shut up. Ow! Stop being such a pussy. You have no other choice. Help me out here or you got no job. You ain't getting in the way of SpongeBob's bread. <sighs> okay. All right. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. I ain't got no other choice. I got to pay these bills. <laughs> Thank you, Sponge. You're a real one. So... We got a few changes around here regards to uniform. Tut, for now on, you're gonna wear this bulletproof vest and you're gonna have this Glock right here with you at all times. Every time you're on the shift, wear this bulletproof vest. Wait, 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 what I need that for? Is a zombie apocalypse coming or something? No, this is just in case you get shot. And I ain't trying to have you down on my watch. And also, we adding something to the menu. It's gonna be the secret menu, a 444. That'll be a 44 Magnum, four ounces of weed, and four bulletproof vests. What? So, Tut, I watched this spider fish no way home. I can't believe it. It was crazy. I was crying throughout the whole movie. Can you believe this damn aunt did that dumb ass shit? She almost got everybody killed. Hey, man, get your ass out of here. The store been closed. I mean, I just wanted to chill out for a second. Damn. Plus. I don't got nowhere to go right now. Hey, break all this up. Hey, k more. get up out of here. I got to talk to Tut real quick. Yeah, yeah, get your ass out of here, man. Like I said. Damn, I'm all right. See you later, Tut. Oh, this cool, though. I'm finna get off work, go home, smoke me a blizzard. Nah, you ain't finna get off work just yet, Tut. I need you to do one more thing for me. I need you to drop a shipping off to Kenya. Man, you need me to do what? Where's the job description? There is no paperwork that showed me exactly what I have to do. You got a bunch of random illegal tasks for me. I can't do it. Hey, man, chill. The job is paying you 40K. But remember, 
You gotta wear your bulletproof vest and keep your Glock on you. There's gonna be a lot of people probably trying to chase you once you get across the border. But you'll be alright though. Wait a minute, 40k? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait. Nah, my baby mama just gonna take half of that. No deal. I gotta wear what? Do what? Who am I, the transporter? No, man. What? You? Then fine. Get your ass out of here. I can always replace you. You ain't nobody. Who are you? I feel like I don't know you anymore. You wearing suits and stuff now? Probably doing cocaine? Selling drugs? I mean, you been selling drugs, but you selling harder drugs. You used to just sell a nigga a little dime sack or something. The money to change you, man. I'm out. And by out, I mean I'm out of this friendship. I'm out of your life. Dramatic walk away. Cue the music. People always hate when you become the boss. That's fine. I run all this. Damn bastard. Eugene, bring your ass out here to come do this shit with me. I'm paying you 40K. Yeah, it's all good, goon. Go ahead and stay home. It's the fourth goon shot this week. I can't afford to keep losing more people. Man, I need somebody who could protect me. I'm protecting their ass. Wait, didn't Biscuit say she'll come work for me if I need her again? Yeah, I'm gonna give her a call. Biscuit, wasn't that such a romantic movie? I mean, all the candle lights, everything that was going on, he fighting for her, she wanting him. I love these type of romantic movies. Oh, 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 I bet the movie was good, but it had me pissed off the entire time. Can you believe when they was at that restaurant, they didn't even touch their food? Oh my gosh, this is not real. I mean, but other than that, the movie was cool. I liked it. Oh, hold on, I'll get a call. Uh, hello? Biscuits! How's it going? It's your boy Sketchy. How you doing? I bet I'm doing good. Just spending some time with my baby. What's going on, Sketchy? What you want? So, uh, you remember when I got you and K-More back together, right? You told me that if I ever needed you again, you can come work for me. Oh, yeah. I do remember that. Oh, of course, Sketchy. What you need? Well, uh, I need somebody to be my full-time protection. You know, like security. You think you got me? Oh, full time. I don't know, Sketchy. I was thinking about part time or something like that. You know, I got a lot going on, you know, with the wedding and just my job. And I be having these time to eat and stuff. I got three refrigerators and I take you to a five star restaurant every night. God damn it, you got a deal. I'll be on my way. Sorry, baby, that was sketchy. He just had me at his full time security. Full time security? You sure about that, Biscuits? I mean, I thought it was gonna be cool, you know? And besides, it could be some extra money that I could keep on the side for the wedding. Okay, I'm just worried about your safety, Biscuits. You know, you are my woman, and I don't want anything to happen to you. You're my world. Okay, boy. Don't worry, you know I ain't gonna let nothing happen to me. Can't nobody hurt me. See, they gotta worry about me hurting them. <laughs> You're definitely right about that. <laughs> Damn. All right, Biscuits. So I'm going to need you to stay out here and guard the door for me. I'm about to go up in here and talk to a few guys, okay? Make sure nothing happens. If you hear me go, hula hula hula, I need you to come in there, okay? Shit just went left. Okay, hula hula hula, I got you. I'm going to be right here. I ain't going nowhere, Sketchy. Go take care of y'all business. I got you. All right, cool. Be back in 10 minutes. 20 minutes later. Ugh. All this security stuff got me so bored and a hungry. Wait a minute. Is that a KFC across the street? <laughs> oh, I see that commercial where they got that new special. Oh, yeah, I gotta go get me one. Uh huh. Uh, uh, hula hoo! Hula hoo! Biscuits! They, they trying to hurt me! Hurry up! We got the money, let's go! Oh my god! Now where you think you go on with that? Give me this. Get your ass out of here. Oh my god, let's go you guys! She's gonna kill us! Yeah, that's right. Y'all better run. You are gonna be floating above the ocean when I'm done with you. Biscuits, what the hell happened to you? I got hit in the damn eye. 
See what had happened was sketchy was I was out here and then I smelled some chicken and I was like it gotta be something around her that just smelled like chicken and I just went and got some food but I came right back though sketchy see I got you your money back here you go I'm sorry damn it biscuits I don't care about no damn chicken appreciate it give my money let's go Biscuits, can you get the door? I'm over here counting money. Oh, okay, no problem, Sketchy. Kaibo! Hey, my baby Biscuits, how you doing? I'm doing even better now that you here, baby. I miss you. I miss you, too. So I just thought about to give you this lunch right here. I know you'll probably be hungry. Oh, my God, you know me so well. I ain't ate in 40 minutes. I'm starving. Thank you, baby. Anything for my queen. Now, where that damn sketchy at? I need to have a word with him. Oh, he just over there, Castle, buddy. You can go talk to him. Well, well, well. Look who's here. K-more. Thought you would never come back to the crib. Oh, and I still don't want to be in this damn hell hole. The only reason I'm here is because of my baby biscuits. I came to drop off some food. Why well, aren't you fiance of the year? Yada, 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 yada. I don't want to hear none of that. I just came to let you know that you better not get my biscuits in no damn trouble. That's all I got to tell you. You better keep her safe, Sketchy. Because if anything happens to her, I'm coming for you. Man, ain't nothing going to happen to Biscuits. Shit, people need protection from Biscuits. Let alone, you need to be worried about me. I'm the one that's getting hurt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just remember what I said. Don't let nothing happen to my baby Biscuits. All right, Biscuits. I'll see you later. Me and Larry, we got a class that we got to handle later. Okay, baby, I'll be at the house soon. I love you. Hello? Yeah, you said four o'clock? Okay, I'll be there. And you better have my money ready. All right, Biscuits, we got another meetup. Four o'clock, be ready. These some real crazy goons right here. Okay, Biscuits, now at this time, you're gonna stay right by my side the entire time. I don't trust these guys. We're gonna do this deal, and we're gonna get up out of here, okay? Yeah, let's hurry up, because my show about to be on it. I need some food every time I watch my show. So, yeah, let's get this over with. Let's do it. So, uh, you got my money? You, uh, got my drugs? Yeah, we got your drugs right here, man. Go ahead. Show them the suitcase, man. Woo! Now, this is what I'm talking about right here. Pure cocaine. You know, I like doing business with you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Give me my money, my friend. Give me my money. There we go. Hey, Freddy, count all this right now. What you trying to count it for? I mean, all of us there. You good. Come on, bitch. Let's go ahead and get up out of here real quick. Wait a minute, my friend. Hold up. Wait. Man, this ain't nothing but Twinkies up in here. Kill him right now. Take cover, biscuits. Take cover. Oh, my goodness. A wide open it away. Give me that gun. Uh, 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 shot him down. Uh. Oh, no. Jose. You killed my brother, you piece of shit. And I'm gonna do the same to you. Any last words? Your mother ain't shit, I know. Woo! Biscuits, that was crazy. Biscuits? Oh my God, Biscuits! Keep breathing, I'm about to get you to the hospital, Biscuits. Oh my God. Baby! Oh my God. Doctor, is she gonna make it? <coughs> I can't lose my queen. Oh, um, biscuits? Oh, yeah, she'll be fine. Apparently, a bullet hit a chicken thigh that she had inside her bra. Yeah, she's gonna be okay. She's just getting some well-needed sleep right now. I think she's in a food coma. Oh, my God, thank you so much, Doc. Baby, if you can hear me, get as much rest as you need. Everything's gonna be okay. I love you. I'm so glad you're all right. Now I'm about to go deal with that damn sketchy. Who is it? Your worst nightmare, you asshole. Oh! Hey, more man, get off me. Get off me. Didn't I tell you not to let anything happen to my biscuits? Man, I lost control of the situation. Everything just started going crazy, man. The dude did a bad deal and just started shooting everywhere. What the hell was I supposed to do? Not have my baby in a bad situation. Know what you was supposed to do. I trusted you, Sketchy. You almost got my damn fiance killed. 
she'll never work for you again. And as far as this friendship, it is over. So just like that, huh, it's over. Man, forget you. And forget her too. I don't need none of y'all. Yeah, bro, you let the money change you. You a complete asshole. But it's all good. You don't got to worry about me no more. Me or my baby. I'm out of here. Damn. What am I going to do now? I don't got no friends. No goons. Just got money in this big ass house. And I lost a girl of my dreams. I really fucked up this time, sketchy. Wow, this seems like a beautiful location, Biscuits. This church is huge. They got all the bells and whistles we could ever want. I can imagine us having our own service and everything. Speaking of service, what kind of food did you think we'll have to serve the people? Oh my goodness, I thought you would never ask, baby. So, I think we could have some knuckleback tissue. Uh, I think we could have uh, some uh, baby back ribs on a, uh, on a salad tray. Uh, and my favorite, we get us some chitlins with some uh, garlic sauce on it. Oh, I'm just going crazy just thinking about it, baby. Ha, ah, baby. I just love the way you think. You so creative. They gonna love that food menu. Ain't that right, Larry? Uh, just remind me to eat before we get to the wedding. <laughs> oh, somebody's at the door. Give me one second. I'll be right back, baby. Uh... Hey, how's it going? How can I help you, sir? Hello, my friend. I am Romero. I am looking for someone in particular. Oh, damn. Uh, well, my name is Kaymore. You must be like a secret agent, model, or James Bond type of guy or something. Because, I mean, not to sound crazy enough, but you're kind of handsome, sir. Uh, but who are you looking for? Thank you, my friend. I get that a lot. But I am looking for Princess Biscuits. Do you happen to know where she is? Uh, depends on who's asking. Uh, what, the, what, what do you want with Biscuits? Or my friend, I promise you I mean no harm. I am a old friend of hers, and I haven't seen that in so long, and I want to do surprise her. Oh, why didn't you say that at first? <laughs> Go ahead and come in. Hey, Biscuits, you got a handsome friend here looking for you. Oh, my God. I know the biscuits. It's been quite a long time. Ramiro, what in the hell are you doing here? My precious biscuits. I demand that I win you back. I still love you, baby. Whoa, how the hell on? This is your ex, biscuits? Oh my gosh, yes. I left him so long ago. He just won't get it. Oh, hell no. R Romero, Romeo must die, whatever your damn name is. You gotta get the hell about my house. Yeah, you hear what my boy said? Get the hell out before we throw you out. I'm not going nowhere without the love of my life, Biscuits. Shut up, you peasant. Glove to face. Yeah. What in the hell? Did this man just smack me with a damn glove? <gasps> oh my god. Oh no. Kyborg. In Romeo's country, where they smack you with a glove, that means they challenge you to a duel. A duel? I mean, what the hell do you want to do? Pokemon cards? <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh? Beyblade games or some shit? <laughs> we don't do that here. No, you stupid idiot. A gun duel. I challenge you to a gun duel for the love of my life, Biscuit. The winner gets to keep her. The loser, what do you know? Dead. A gun duel? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love to shoot niggas. Yawn. Very well then. I'll see you at dawn tomorrow. I'll see you tomorrow, Romeo. My name is Romero. And y'all, 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 get your ass out of here. Oh my gosh, baby. You cannot do this. He is crazy. I don't want you to go do this. I'm not going to have a risk of chance of losing you, sweetheart. I'm sorry, Biscuit. I got to do this. A man comes to my door and challenges me for the love of my life. I got to take him out. Besides, you said yourself. This guy is not going to leave you alone. This is the only way, baby. I got to fight for the love of my life. And I'll be willing to do it for you. Oh, my God. You are so romantic. I feel like I'm in a movie or something, like a western. Oh, it turned to be all. Oh, what about fries, did? Uh, came up. About this damn duo that you about to get ready to do. Man, that's some real white shit. I said 
say we just run up on this nigga and shoot his ass? That'd be the end of the episode. Your ass wanna act like it's a damn movie or something. No, nah, Larry. We can't do it like that. A duel is a duel. And I must win bitch the right way. Plus, I know I can beat this guy ass. I ain't worried. <laughs> he don't know about me. I'm crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If your ass ain't to be in shot, I promise you, I'm gonna shank his ass. <laughs> Thanks, Larry. I can always count on you, buddy. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it's actually done. I'm so nervous, baby. Please be careful. I love you so much. You sure you don't want to bag out? No, sweetheart. A man's got to do what a man's got to do. Now stay right here. I'll be right back. All the while, you actually showed up. I am in the press. So, these are the rules. We're going to be back to back, take 10 steps, turn it around, and then we shoot. Agree? Deal. Let's do it. I mean, damn, do you have to spit? Last day is best. I love you, baby. I love you so much. Hey, k -Bot, if you die, can I get the house? Hell no. Now shut up. I gotta concentrate. Animator, cue the Western music. Done the whatever, biscuits. Me and you will be together soon. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> Damn idiot! What the? How could you shoot me like that? You have no honor. That's not how we play in my country. We fight like the real men and we shoot. You cheated. Exactly. Your damn country. Boy, your ass is bikini bottom. You thought I was crazy? <laughs> Nigga, I ain't finna count the team with your ass. Plus, you over the love of my life. You got me messed up. In your last words, psych, I ain't trying to hear nothing else. Bye! <laughs> Come here, baby. I love you so much. You thought I was really gonna let this guy kill me? Hell no. Plus he was handsome anyway. He was already a damn three. Kaibo, I'm so happy. Oh my God. I knew you was gonna do something like just heroic and crazy. Oh, that's so romantic, baby. Oh my gosh. I'm so happy. Oh, my night is shot at all. But Keep my boy Kaibo. I knew you wasn't gonna die. Man, I thought you was on some crazy white shit at first. I'm like, why the hell would he just shoot this dude when he talking about doing a duel? Man, you crazy. I knew you was smart. And you knew damn well I went from the head no duel. I just had to make the story look good for the episode. Whoever actually believed that me and this guy was gonna have a duel, <laughs> they ass is crazy. Thank you, animator. You knew damn well I wasn't gonna do that shit either. Draw four, reverse back to me, uno out, yeah, win again, <laughs> you suck, goon. Yeah, boss, I just can't seem to beat you. Yeah, I guess I'm gonna call it a night. My shift is over with. C -c call it a night? I mean, we, we just getting started, my boy. I mean, uh, look, I was just about to call some strippers, you know, get this thing popping over here. <laughs> Come on, stay, man. Sorry, boss. I got a wife and kids. You know how that is, boss. You know they need me. I'll see you tomorrow, boss. You have a good night. All right, goon. Damn. All alone in this lonely-ass mansion. Just too quiet for me. I gotta get out. Do something. I guess I'll go to a bar. Have me a drink. Hey, bartender. Give me another Jack and Coke. Coming right up. Damn, bro. How many jobs do you have? Like, do you ever sleep? Come on, now. I'm a cartoon. <laughs> of course I don't sleep, you idiot. Here's a Jack and Coke. Enjoy! I ain't even gonna say who you sound like. I'm just tired of that conversation. <sighs> you know, bartender, you ever feel like, man, you just be searching for some of your whole life and you finally get it. And when you get it, you know it's not exactly what you thought it was. Oh yeah, all the time. I remember one time when I was in high school and I wanted to talk to this girl. She was so damn sexy. Just to find out, her breath was fucking stinky. I still smash that ass, though. <laughs> I'll never forget, Broderick. Uh, yeah. Give me another Jack and Coke. Damn, man, watch where you going. Man, this suit cost $30,000. You almost made me get damn lick on it. My bad, man. I ain't mean no harm. Here goes the Jack and Coke and your check. No problem. Go ahead and give you this money right now.
Wait, man, where the hell my wallet go? That little son of a bitch. Hold on. Hey, bring your ass here. Ugh. Get your ass on the ground. You were messed with the wrong dude today. Whoo! I ain't seen everything but Christ mine. You can go ahead and pull that trigger. I ain't scared of nothing. Come on, man, I ain't what you waiting for. Pull that. Damn, I can look in your eyes and really see you not scared. I like that. Reminds me a lot of myself when I was younger. Hey, man, what's your name? Where you from? My name Barry, man, and I'm from these streets. I'm a professional pickpocket. Barry, huh? Yeah, you definitely is a professional. You got me good. <laughs> I must admit. Shit, man, uh, you want to be friends? Damn, man, I ain't never had no friend. Yeah, cool. Damn, my boy clean. Oh yeah, that's a ten thousand dollar suit right there. That was one of my very first ones. For real, man, you think this look cool on me? Nah, oh, man, this is the best clothes I've had in my life, man. I really appreciate that. You got a nice crib here, man. I ain't never been in no place of luxury like this, you know. Somebody really showed me I'm special. I really appreciate that, man. Ain't no problem, little Barry. Hey, but look, I got a meeting to go to. Uh, why don't you come with me? You know, show you the ropes. Yes, sir. I'm definitely down to go. How's it going, everybody? Sorry I'm late. Ha! Huh? He's a rookie. Welcome to the BT, Scotchy, or whatever your name is. We just here talking about territory. I'm going to take over this block. He's going to get this one. And whatever one you want, I don't care. <laughs> man, wait a minute. What, what kind of shit is this? That's the one that I wanted. Man, hell no. I want that one and I want this one. Ha ha ha. Someone do you hear this cloud? <laughs> get in the chopper. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's get out of here. This guy's crazy. <laughs> I don't think y'all heard what my boy said. He said he want this block and he want that block right there. I think y'all need to listen to what he got to say. Go ahead, sketch now. Yeah! Like I was saying, I'm new in charge. And I don't give a damn about y'all old dudes. I run this now. This my city. And if you got a problem with it, my boy Barry gonna put a hole right in your ass. That's understood? Ha <laughs> ha ha! I was just joking, Mr. Scotchy. <laughs> I'm friends with you. You can have this block. Give me whatever. I don't care. <laughs> Anything else you need, boss? Nah, I'm good, baby. Let's get up out of here. Animated, drop me a helicopter. Man, what you did out there today, Barry, was legendary. Man, you should have saw they damn faces. One guy was like, ah, them folks really scared. <laughs> man, you a goon for that. Man, you know I does what I does, boss, man. Ah, <laughs> uh, you know, I like to say I put in a little work myself. Man, with this type of partnership, we can take over everything. Man, I ain't gonna even lie. Boy, you damn near like my best friend now. <laughs> Toast up. Friendship. Wow, you really think we could run the entire thing, man? Like, we could run everything together? Do I think? Man, I know. With your skill set, and plus me being the boss? Oh yeah, man, this game over. <laughs> we got this. I appreciate you believing in me, man. And you know how much that mean to me. Yo, what time you need it there? Uh, noon, huh? Okay, cool. I sent some of my finest people. Hey, yo, Barry! Goon! Come here! What's up, boss, man? What you need? So, uh, I just got a call about a drop-off, you know? And I figured you would be the perfect person to go ahead and do this job, you know? Since you kind of like my partner and everything. You know, I think this would be a good experience for you to go ahead and go out there. Oh, man. I really appreciate this, man. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, come on, Goon. Let's get up out of here. I'm pretty sure he the perfect man for this job. Now I can just sit back and relax. Whew. I don't got to go out there. Probably go ahead and play a little Madden or something. <laughs> One successful drop deal later. Hey, yo. How did it go? How was, it, how, how was your first run, Barry? Oh, it went just like I expected, Mike. Everything was smooth. Yeah, everything was real smooth, boss. The kids are natural. You did a good job choosing this one. I told you, Goon, that he was cold. Yo, Barry, got something for you, man. What's that there, boss, man? 
What's that that you got, man? Hey, you know, I got you a little roly roly, you know? Figure, you know, since you help me out, I'll go ahead and make you look good. You feel what I'm saying? <laughs> you done got me a Rolex, man? Oh, man, I ain't never... Oh, man, oh my gosh, man, I can't believe this, man. So what's up? You rocking with it? You like it? Like it? I love it, man. I really appreciate this sketch, dog. Like, we, we, we really is best friends. I can't believe this, man. You like the brother I never had. Man, I can agree. You definitely like the brother I never had. Toast to us again. Brothers. For life, man. You never got to worry about me, man. Now, let me hurry up and go and get up out of here. And just when I almost was about to trust you, I knew damn well I had to remind myself, get yeah, dog, you can't trust nobody. When you first met this dude, he stole your wallet. You know, I always been keeping an eye on you. Nine days, you gotta watch everybody, including your brother. <laughs> so you finally caught on to me, huh, man? It's all good. I've been playing you this entire time. The hell you think you was really my brother? I'm from the streets. Ain't nobody cool with me, man. You thought just because you was the boss that that was going to change something about me, man? No, I'm at the bottom. I want to be at the top. And you know what? You ain't going to be at the top for long. Best believe that. You damn near gave me your whole empire in three days, man. Heh, <laughs> wrecking mistake. In the famous words of my boy K-Moore, yada, yada, yada. Say what's up to my boy Scarfin for me. <sighs> man, one thing he was right about, I'm slipping. Can't let nobody get this damn close to me. I knew damn well I ain't had no brother. At least not no more. Gonna pull up a little whiskey shot. This trash can stinky. Woo! I gotta stop eating eggs at night. <laughs> oh, Clarence! Why, hello, K Moore. It's really good to see you. It's good to see you too, my guy, Clarence. Man, it's been a minute. So, what brings you to the neighborhood? Oh, why, yes, it has been quite some time. But I was looking for Clarence. Have you seen him? Oh, sketchy? Yeah, he actually moved away a few months ago. He didn't tell you? Um, no, I haven't talked to Clarence in quite some time, actually. I was wondering if we can hang out, but he hasn't returned my phone calls. Yeah, sketchy has been a little asshole lately. I'm sorry, Clarence, but, you know... I don't know what to say about him. Well, it's quite all right. I guess I'll be making my way home now. <laughs> nice seeing you, K-Moore. Have a good day. Hey, Larry, what are you doing today? Me and Larry, we were just going to go down to the beach. We'll love if you join us. Joining you at the beach? Oh, wow, that sounds amazing. I I'd love to. Cool. Let me go get my suntan lotion. <laughs> Wait for your wedding, bruh. Ooh, the bachelor party gonna be so lit. I mean, ain't gonna be so many big booty fishes and everything around there. You know what I'm saying? I can't wait. I'm gonna have me about like three of them on my side. And Larry, I guess you can have whatever you want. Wow, a bachelor party? I've, I've never been to a bachelor party. Ooh. Well, it ain't gonna be no bachelor party. Sketchy was supposed to plan that out for me. And he's no longer my best man. You are, Larry. Well, shit. If I'm your best man... It's gonna be a bachelor party. <laughs> Trust me, I got you, K-Moore. I'm gonna have all the roaches up in there. They're gonna be shaking that thing, man. I know so many roach strippers, so many beetle strippers. Roach strippers? I don't know about that, uh, Larry. <laughs> you hilarious. Man, you don't know what you're missing out on. Hey, guys, how's it going? Mm, what's up with you, K-Moore? You so fine. I just, oof, just make, oof. Hey, Miss Porter. Whoa, calm down now. <laughs> I'm a taken man. I'm an engaged man. I'm having my wedding soon. She must be one lucky lady, cause mm, mm. Damn. So, what's up with your friend over there then? You kinda cute too. Oh, that's my guy Larry. Go ahead and talk to her, Larry. Why, hello, Mrs. Putter. <laughs> How's it going? <laughs> hey, Larry, I like that little shake in your voice. Wonder if you can make my legs do that. You kinda cute. I guess I'll see you boys later. Damn! Did you hear that, Larry? She wants you to make her legs shake like your damn voice. <laughs> oh, man. Hell yeah. She, I wish she was talking to me. Hoo-hoo-wee. Miss Porter can get it. I give her every three inches of this roast dick. Why, she is quite hot, isn't she? Um, 
I don't know if I can get a girl like that. What about you, Kimor? Yeah, I mean, she cute and all, but she ain't my type. She a little bit under the weight. She gotta be at least over 300 pounds for me. <laughs> Man, you act crazy, Kimor. I never understand you. Well, she's perfect to me. I mean, I wouldn't even know what to do with all that. What you mean you wouldn't know what to do with that? Same thing you did with any other fish. <laughs> Larynx, you crazy. <laughs> yeah, with any uh, other fish. <laughs> what do I do with any other fish? <laughs> Wait a minute. You have been with a woman before, right, Larynx? Um, if um, being around my mother counts, then yeah, I, I have been, been with a woman. <laughs> oh my God, this nigga a bird. <laughs> I'm a roach and got some pussy before you. Oh, man, this is sad. Be quiet, Larry. <laughs> I mean, it is kind of funny. But listen, it's okay. We're going to change that for you. Ain't that right, Larry? Oh, no. If he ain't got it all this time, I don't know if it's nothing to me. You can do it by the cable. <laughs> Shut up, Larry. Don't worry, Larry. I got the perfect idea for you. We're going to get you some. Trust me. <laughs> I'm the man. Yeah, I mean, the other one time I actually even gotten close to a woman was... Prom night. I mean, I tried to pull out a um, condom and I made a mistake and swallowed it and she left out the room. How the hell do you swallow a con- Ooh, Larry, we got a lot of work on our hands. Pray for us. Hey, yo, Larry. Hey, boy, I got you a date. Now, look, you guaranteed to smash on the first night with her. She going like that. I'm telling you. You- Actually found me a date. Oh, wow. Thank you, Larry. Uh, I'm so appreciative. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just meet her, man. It's going to be a blind date. Go make it happen right now. <laughs> Tell her your boy Larry sent you. I'll get dressed right away. Damn, Larry. That was quick. I mean, what can I say? I know people. Hello? Are you Larry? Why, yes. Yes, I am. How can I help you? Larry told me to meet up with you on a blind date. Y you're the woman that Larry suggested for me? I guess so. Oh, wow. I never guess I'll talk to a roach, but um, why not give it a try? Well, I'm Larence, and um, what I do for a living is computers. Already bored. Uh, thank you, but no thank you. You're cute, but mm -mm, you're not worth it. Oh, nice m m meeting you. Gosh. Man, how the hell you screw that up, damn? It was a roach. You couldn't have sex with a roach. Whew. Man, this gonna be hard, k -more. Be quiet, Larry. This is why we here. I know the perfect idea to get Larry laid. We outside Miss Porter's house right now. Larry, all you gotta do is go knock on Miss Porter's door. When she opens the door, tell her that you are a plumber and you're here to fix her pipes. And then bam! Just like that, she gonna let you in and then you fuck. <laughs> Cable is genius, bruh. I know, trust me. <laughs> oh, well, um, uh, how do you know exactly that it's, 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 it's gonna work? Um, oh, trust me, it's porn one on one. I'm always watching scenes where some people be playing the pizza guy. He comes in and say, Hey, did you order some pizza? And the woman is like, No. Well, he was like, Hey, I got a special delivery here for you. And he got his damn cock inside the pizza box. <laughs> but yeah, you're not gonna do that. You're just gonna go up there and say, You a plumber and give us some pipe. Go get him, tiger. Um, all right. Um, here, here goes nothing. Um, he hello, Mrs. P Porter. Oh, you came with a friend from the beach. I remember you. So cute glasses still. Can I help you? Um, yes. Um, I think I'm here to, um, help you. See, I'm, um, I'm a plumber. And I was coming here to, um, fix your pipes. Oh, I didn't even know what my pipes need fixing. But maybe once you finish in enough time, you could help me pipe some else. Oh, um, yeah, I can, I can do that. Um. Three hours later. Damn, it's been by like three hours. What the hell taking Larry so long? He did say that was his first time. Your first time with a woman like that? She, she probably killed that man. Hey, guys, how's it going? <laughs> Whew. Larry, you're back. So, how did it go, boy? I want all the details. <laughs> Why, y y yes, it was...
quite extravagant. Um, so the um first time um we did something, she pulled me in the room and um I put on my pants and um I only lasted um two pumps. Mm-hmm. Then she was quite disappointed, but the next time she gave me a full bottle of um Viagra and that's what took me so long. I was having sex for three hours. It was amazing. Woo. Damn, my poor beast! <laughs> three hours, man, that was crazy. Wow! I'm so proud of you, Larry. Congratulations. Man, we should celebrate this. I wish your brother Sketchy could have been a witness. He would have been real proud of your ass. <laughs> Come on, y'all, let's go get a beer or something. Drinks on me. Thank you, you guys. I couldn't have done it without you. Hey, question. Is it normal to have a really bad itch after sex? My crotch really kind kind of burns. Oh, uh, Larry, remind me when we get done drinking this beer to stop by the clinic. Damn. to get these guys, okay? They're bad business, and I need my revenge, all right? So that's all I need you guys to do for me. No problem, no problem, no problem. But um, if you don't mind me asking, why do you hate these guys so much? What what did they do to you? They killed me, okay? They killed me. I mean, well, clearly you see me here, but they dealt my body. I got hit in the head with a rock. I got put in the trunk of a car, and they dumped me over a river. So I want these guys dead, but I ain't gonna kill them. So I'm paying you guys double to bring them here alive. Now go do your job. No problem, boss, no problem. Got you. Oh, sandwich here. Uh, this layer here. Uh, biscuits! How many layers on your sandwich do you want? Oh, uh, I need about five layers, baby. By the fact, I need seven. Seven layers on my sandwich, please. Damn, I'm gonna need some more meat. Oh, okay. Uh, one, two, three. Oh, snap. Hey, came up, bro. Turn around. Oh, uh, get away from me. Oh, uh, damn. Put the hell my gun. Oh, snap. Oh, uh, get your ass on the ground. Who are you and who the hell you work for? Stop! Got him. Hey, boss. One down, one more to go. Dang. Man, all I need is my Henny bottle. Ooh. Ooh. Ah, yeah, this the good stuff right here. <laughs> hey, uh, boss. Um, I did all my rounds. Saw nothing. The perimeter's clean. No intruders. Everything is good, boss. I'm gonna go ahead and go home, all right? My shift's over. You have a good night. All right, goon. You be good. <sighs> and I miss my baby Keisha. Man, that drink got me feeling it. Let me call her, see what she doing. Hey, hey Keisha. This the hundred time me calling you. I love you. Just checking on you and John John. I miss y'all. Damn. And I gotta get my girl back. Oh, typical ninjas. Here to kill me. Hey! If you're here to kill me, I'm unarmed. Just come up and come get me. Just if you're here to kill me, just get it over with fast. Damn, that was easy. Boss, we got him. Help! Help! Oh my gosh! I'm about to die! No, help me! Somebody! K-more! It's you! K-more! Anybody help! Get me out! I'm scared! Came on, man, calm down, man. I got a damn headache. Where the hell are we? The hell if I know! I'm scared, sketch! Calm down, calm down. What's the last thing that you remember? Oh, uh, okay. I was making biscuits or sandwich, and Larry told me to turn around, and all of a sudden I seen two damn ninjas coming at me. Hey, you two shut up. Be quiet. I'm glad I got you here right now. I've been waiting a long time for this. A long time? Who the hell are you? Why are you doing this to us? What do we do to you? You don't remember me? Huh? You don't remember my face? Uh, Sketch, have you ever seen this guy before? Hell no. I was just going to ask you the same thing. I ain't never seen this ugly ass dude before. <laughs> he is ugly. He got a damn eye patch. <laughs> They used to call you Fetty Wap. <laughs> Good one, K-Moore, Fetty Wap. 
<laughs> Get it because he got one eye. It's probably not funny to you, sir. Shut up right now. You guys don't remember me? You're the reason why I have this eye patch. You knocked me out and ran me over, and you put me in the trunk. Oh, my. No. Sir. Sir. Oh, my God. Game on. Who the hell is this man? Skinny. I, I told you it wasn't my fault. My Jacob the third. Look at him just float down there. Game on. This man didn't come back as a zombie. You mean to tell me he was alive? Uh. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. Starting to come back, huh? Oh, snap. Sketchy. It's the guy that we put in the damn river and drowned. Oh, now I remember him. Wait a minute. I thought you was dead. Yeah, I do remember this guy. How the hell are you still alive right now? We put cement blocks on your feet and drowned your ass. You two have to be the dumbest idiots that I know. A fish cannot drown. It's impossible. We live underwater. I've been underwater for a damn year. I can never go back to my old life again because I was pronounced dead. I had to start a whole new life. But you two, you two, I had to get rid of before I get back to doing anything that I want to do. I hate you two from the bottom of my freaking soul. Now, you see this gun? The only way you two are going to be set free, one of you have to kill each other. <laughs> I know, right? Such a great option. Good luck. Oh my god! I can't believe we're in this situation. Skit! What do we do? You heard what he said. One of us gotta kill each other. And you need to pull a trigger and kill me, k -more. What? What are you talking about, Skit? I'm not gonna shoot you. You should. I got nothing else to live for. I don't got no life. Everything sucks. And you got so much looking forward to you. You got biscuits, y'all about to get married, start a family, you wanna have kids. Me on the other hand, I'm hopeless. I got no friends, nobody who loves me anymore. Sketchy, don't say that. I mean, I know man, you ain't been on the best of terms, but I still love you, Sketch. You still like a brother to me, and I don't know if I can shoot you. As bad as I want to, but I just can't do it. K-more, be quiet and just shoot me. You got everything to live for. Get it over with. Then go be with your baby. <sighs> okay. I'm sorry, Skitch. What the fuck? Well, that was quicker than I expected. Wow. I mean, I thought you guys were going to be kind of sad about it and have a discussion or something, but that was very fast. Yada, yada, yada. <laughs> you can't shoot me. Only put one bullet in a gun, you dumbass. Yeah, that's right. You did only put one bullet in the gun. But I always keep one bullet in my pocket. And this time, stay dead. What? k -more. Man, what the, what the hell's going on? How am I still alive right now? Oh, calm down, Skitch. I wasn't going to kill you. I made sure I shot you where there was no major arteries at. Come on now. I couldn't do that to you, buddy. Man, fuck that. Why you ain't just pretend to shoot me? I could have played dead. Because you got my baby biscuit shot. You like I ain't kill your ass for real. I wanted you to suffer just like my baby biscuit suffered up in the hospital. Even though she didn't get that hurt and the bullet just bounced off of her, still, that hurt her feelings. Yeah, I was kind of an asshole for that. Sorry about that, k -more. Man, I really missed you. Well, I can't lie, I missed you too, Sketch. You no, know, it's been real different since you ain't been around no more. You know? Hell, the whole show is about k more and Sketchy. And since we ain't been together no more, it's like not been a show. <laughs> you get it? Yeah, you are right, man. Things have been kind of weird. Man, but forget all that, bro. I really miss you. You want to go get some drinks, go get a beer or something? Hang out just like old time. Look, just because I miss you, this doesn't change anything, Sketch. You still an asshole. Bye. <sighs> Now, what are we going to do about you? All right, guys, listen up. Quiet. All right, so we have a foul on Clarence Butterscotch, a.k.a. Sketchy. He's the prime target. He's the head honcho. <laughs> honcho. And word on the street, he's killed Scarfin, Sketchier, and his own PO officer, Mr. McAllister. Now, this guy is a tough case, but I feel like I got the best guy for it. 
He's brought Sketchy in one time. Right. And I think he could do it again. Right. So without further ado, what? Everyone, welcome Ray with an E. That's me. What's up? What's up? What's going on, man? What's going on? We already know the deal. Every time I walk outside, what about Sketchy? What's going on with Sketchy? You looking at me wrong. It's Sketchy. I'm tired of it. Tired of him. But guess what? I know a weakness. <laughs> Secrets. It's his boy. <laughs> Marsh, I said, right? Everything. Th thank you. Thank you. Sketchy has a secret, everybody. K more. K more. La 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 la. Just watching my ass. La 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 la. Damn! Every time I get some started, somebody always interrupt me. Man, who the hell could this be? Oh, hell no. I know. Right? You can get your ass up out of here. Uh-uh. Not today. I know. Not today. Look, Leave me look, alone. Look, just, just listen, all right? Look, I was just in town. I just wanted to catch up with you. I still got stuff I need to say, but I just wanted to catch up with you, see how you was doing. Yada, yada, yada. Bring your ass in here. Have a seat. I got to get dressed. Larry, keep an eye on this nigga for me, okay? Keep an eye on Ray. That's right with an E. <laughs> this video kind of make me laugh. <laughs> Watch him. Oh, wait a minute. That's the snitchy nigga you told me about. Shit, I ain't know he was white. Oh, so uh, a talking roach. <laughs> okay, how you doing, roachy? So, you a talking sneak? Man, ain't nobody do nothing. Ain't nobody did nothing. You man, don't you even fucking beast. know me, man. You, beast. you don't know me, you don't know me. I know everything I need to man, know about shut you. Shut up, shut, shut up, ain't nobody here. Shut up. You a hoe. All right, bet, Yeah, bet, 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 bet what, nigga? Bet, bet what, bet. nigga? Bet. On my mama, I kill your ass. Aye, 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 chill out. Now, Ray, what the hell are you doing here? And whatever you want, you need to make it fast, because I got to get fitted for my tux for my wedding. You got two minutes. Okay, uh, look, first of all, congratulations on your wedding, man. For real. Like, I really want to be there and support you, just like I told you before, man. I've been thinking about you, man. Can I come, you know? Yeah, as long yeah. as you don't start no shit. I appreciate it, man. Thank you. I, I can't, you know, I think you actually starting to see me for who I really am. Oh, don't worry. You still a snitch in my book. Now, what's the real reason of why you here? What do you want? You know, I just want to see what's going on. Like, where, where, where's Sketchy, you know? Why you want to know? I, I, we friends. You know what I'm saying? I'm friends with him, too. I want to check up on my friends. I'm a friend, man. I'm a friend, friendly guy, you know? I just uh got a cookout. Want to invite him? Where's Sketchy? A cookout? White people don't have cookout. Stop lying to me. Now, what's the real reason you want Sketchy? First of all, I'm tired of them goddamn white jokes. Next, Sketchy is a top dog now. He knows he's responsible for the deaths of Sketchier, Scarfin, and his P.O. They have a whole department dedicating their time in Sketchy, man. Come on. Like, just, we friends, you know? Ah, uh, you know, I don't know nothing. I don't know nothing you talking about right now. Now, if you don't mind, I got to go get fitted for my tux. So you can leave, right? Look, look, man, look. I can probably help Sketchy, man. Maybe I can give him a deal before the feds come. Just listen to what I'm saying. Let me help him. Where's Sketchy? Man, I, no, I ain't telling you nothing, right? You lied to me before and you will lie to me again. I ain't never telling you what Sketchy is. Look, Sketchy can do life. <laughs> life. You seen the movie? But if he, if he just like cooperates with, I ain't even saying everybody else. I'm saying me, Ray, with an E, me, with an E. I can give him less time. Okay, okay. I'll tell Sketchy to reach out. Damn. Thank you. Thank you. Whew. All right, now you heard my boy. He said he got to go get fitted for his tux. Ain't nobody now was talking to you, man. Get out of here. Bro, I knew you was a rat soon as you knock on the door. Nigga, you a roach. Like cheese from a mile away. Nigga, all you eat is cheese, grease, and all. Look, Kate Moore, just talk to him. All right, y'all. Hello? We'll have Sketchy's location soon. Damn, yeah, Kate Moore. So what you going to do? The only thing I can do. Shit, I gotta go tell Sketchy. I don't like his days, but I still don't want him to do life in prison. Damn, man. He's on the move. Hey, yo, uh, boss. K Moore's here. He said he got some news. Some real big news. Sketchy, right is back. He just left my damn house telling me that they got a whole department working to get you behind bars. But if you cooperate with him, maybe you can get less time or you can get out of jail. What is going on? 
What's happening? I had no idea. Man, what the fuck, K Moore? Why you bringing this snitch over here in my house? G Goons, come on, squad up. Yeah, y'all thought I wasn't ready for this, huh? I'm ready to die. What's up? Look, I can help you, man. I can help you. Look, just, just listen to. Oh, okay. You a little different from your boy Scarfin. Uh. Man, I'm way better than Scarfin. I was prepared for this. I knew y'all was coming. I got people on the inside working for me. Ray, you better tell your niggas to drop their guns, or we gonna light their ass up like a Christmas tree. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, all right, everybody, you know, just put the guns down, put the guns down. Everything good, all right, everything straight. Hey, Goon, take Ray ass to the car, and for the rest of these officers, give them a bribe deal. Pretend they was never here, and they don't know where Ray ass went. Whoever fails to agree, shoot they ass dead. Okay, more, you can go home too. Sketchy, what you gonna do with Ray? You know exactly what I'm finna do to him. Now go ahead, leave now. You were never here either. Sketchy, 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 sketchy. Bro, look, I, I was just playing, bro. You know what I mean? At, at least about some of it, but most of it was, I was trying, I was trying to give you a deal. You ain't gotta do this. You ain't gotta do this, man. You do not have to do this right now. This is my new fucking fans, bro. I, 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 all right, bro. Look, just, just listen, listen to me. Listen, just listen to me, man. All right, listen, I got a deal. It's a deal. Man, shut your ass up. Nobody wanna hear that. You know what, matter of fact, since you really care about your life, here go a spoon. Dig your way up, bitch. Good job. That's what I like to see. The Bikini Bottom Fakers lose again? Man, this team suck. Is it like how you expected after you killed me? You got everything you want, huh? Mmm, no. It's actually better. Life is great. <laughs> so you say, I can tell how the way you look reading the newspaper. You don't want this life. You wish you would have never killed me. Now you're miserable. See, that's where you're wrong. I don't wish it, because I actually killed you. And you know what? It was the best thing that ever happened to me. Now, if you don't mind, I'm about to get up out of here. Have a good day, Sketchy. I'll be seeing you around. Now I'm at home, I can just relax. <laughs> that shape is very comfortable, huh, man? Oh, it's real comfortable. I want to appreciate you keeping it warm for me. You know, ever since you died, <laughs> you've been farting in this damn seat, too. I had to get it clean. That seat right there cost me $50,000, man. That's a lot of money. And guess how much it cost me? Free. <laughs> you stupid. Ho <laughs> ho, it's not me that's a stupid one, man. You need to lay off the drugs. You're talking to dead people. Damn, can I just be alone? Shit. Well, his coffee ain't gonna keep bothering me. Hate this man voice. Oh, I don't know how to leave, man. And even if I did, why would I leave for you? You deserve anything that's coming to you. You know what, Scarfie? You got it. I'm gonna go for a walk. Ah, the Krusty Krab. I ain't smell one of these in a minute. Reminds me of my old fry cook days. Good time. Simple time. What you doing here, man? What I'm doing here? Shit, this is where it all started. I was selling dime backs in the back on break. <laughs> Boy, it was easy getting folks doing that time. Mr. Eugene never knew nothing about it. Man, that's some inspiring shit right there, man. You always been a hustler sketch. You know, maybe one day I can come up, man. Oh, yeah, that's right. You killed me. Guess I'd never get my chance to grow up on sketch. Barry, you gave me no other option. I took you in, tried to feed you, help you out to get you back on your feet, and you tried to fuck me over. That's the game, man. You know that. You got too much heart to be a boss. If anybody should know that, it should be you. Man, I ain't trying to have this conversation. I'm out of here. Back at the old crib. Man, I ain't seen this place in so long. I almost forgot how it looked. I wonder if Cable was inside. You lost your roots, boy. Not so damn humble anymore. Forgot where you came from. Why in the hell am I seeing ghosts? What's going on? Keep it together, Sketch. Keep it together. You're not crazy. Boy, your ass ain't seeing ghosts. This a figment of your imagination. Your ass going crazy. Probably you gonna see a doctor or something. Dumbass. Look, P.O., man. I'm sorry I got you killed. Man, it was not my intention. You wasn't even supposed to be there. Ah, don't worry about it, Sketchy. It ain't your damn fault. It's that dumbass K-more. 
Boy's dumb as a damn box of rocks. Talking about he a damn magician. Hate that kid. Now that's something we both can agree on. <laughs> Thank you for seeing me last minute, Doc. I really need your help. Tell me, Clarence. What's going on with you? What's on your mind? It's just, lately I've been seeing so much dead people, man. It's crazy. I don't know what's going on with me. Hmm. And what are they saying to you? To be honest, Doc, I think they hunt me because I killed them. It just won't get out of my head. I hate it. On top of that, I'm losing my friends. Lost my girl. It's like, can't nothing just go right, Doc. You know, I thought me having this life, everything was gonna be good, you know? I become the top drug dealer of the city. Sketchy wins. But why I feel like I'm just constantly taking L's? I hate this. Well, you know, Clarence, what I think? Hey, hey, it's sketchy. I don't pay you to call me Clarence. Oh, sorry about that, sketchy. Well, you know what I think? I think you feel responsible for so much suffering, it's beginning to take a toll on your psychological mind. You must repent your sins to free your soul. Repent my sin and free my soul? Nah, I'm gonna just go to the titty bar. Thanks a lot, Doc. You have a good day. Um, hey, can I come with you? <sighs> sketchy. Yeah, sketchy, 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 sketchy. I'm gonna take this man down! If it's the last thing I do, I swear to God, <laughs> I swear to God, bro. I swear to God, yeah, sketchy, 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 sketchy. Oh my gosh, you guys. I'm so nervous. I can't believe I'm about to get married to the love of my life. Okay, Moore, don't be nervous. You look quite handsome, and I'm very happy for you. I'm glad that you're getting married. Can't wait till it's my turn. Oh, thank you, Larry's buddy. Hey, how's that STD that Miss Porter gave you? How you feeling? Oh, um, it's doing a lot better. I'm still itchy, but at least it doesn't burn for me to pee now, so that's a positive. <laughs> you idiot. <laughs> that's gonna forever be funny to me. Hey, I would have did it too. That woman too fine. <sighs> man, on my wedding day, man, only if my best friend Sketchy was here, but he's an asshole. Damn. Don't even feel right. Well, don't worry about it. You got your real best friend here. I'm here from the beginning to the end, K-Moore. I got you. We gonna get you down that aisle. Thanks, Larry. I can always count on you, buddy. Thank you, Priest, for making it. I'm so glad you can marry us. Hell, I'm surprised you even got a damn license to do this. <laughs> no problem. Of course I'd love to marry you. Man, you look good. Don't worry. I got you. I'm gonna make sure you and your baby biscuits walk down this aisle. My baby biscuits look so beautiful. I can't believe I'm about to marry an angel. Oh my God, bitch, damn. I mean, damn, you look beautiful. Tsunami, I'm just playing, girl. You look beautiful. All right, everyone. It gives me great honor to bring these two lovely people under the eye proceeding in his church. Hey, Moore, do you have your vows for your lady? Of course I do, Pastor. Biscuits, baby, you the best thing that ever happened to me. I knew as soon as I saw you walk through them crappy patty doors, you was gonna be mine. The way you was making the ground shake, every damn thing. I knew that she was the woman I wanted for the rest of my life. Oh, and I just love when I feed you. You crack my bones. You dislocated me a couple of times. But I'll do anything for you, baby. I'll go through hell and back. You the love of my life. <laughs> and I always want to be with you. <gasps> oh my God, baby. <gasps> you got me so choked up. <sighs> okay, baby. Okay, boy. I knew when I first saw you that you was going to be mine. I mean, I love you just as much as I love strawberry, vanilla, whipped cream, blue cheese, cake. Oh, I want some cake right now. I mean, I can't wait until I get that cake in my head. I'm just, oh, I, I'm sorry. I get distracted. But yes, baby, I'm in love with you. You are the man of my life. And I don't want nobody else but you, baby. I love you so much. Oh, ain't y'all sweet. So, okay, K-more, do you take biscuits to be your wife? 
Do you promise to be faithful to her in good times and bad, in sickness and health, to love her to honor all of her days in your life? Of course I do. All right, okay, 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 okay. I like where this is headed. Biscuits. Do you take K-more to be your husband? Do you promise to be faithful to him in good times and bad, in sickness and health, to love him and to honor him all the days of his life? Yes, I do, pal. Well, what's the way you know? Y'all marry your woman, boy. Kiss your bride. Hurry up so I can eat. <laughs> yes, sir. Mm -hmm. ah! <laughs> hey, man, where the hell have you been? Clarence Butterscotch is going down tonight. And I know exactly where he's going to be. Get y'all shit and let's go. What you thinking about, man? Huh? You like you got something on your mind? Hey, Scorpion, was it scary when you died? Nah, man. It was scary to be alive. Even more scary to be alive. You know, when you're being a head honcho and everything, it can get pretty overwhelming, you know? I figured you would say something like that. I think after all this time, I know exactly what it is I gotta do. Hey, uh, boss. Um, Ray is back. I don't know how, but he's back and he's planning to arrest you at K Moore's wedding. I mean, but uh, you chief of police. I mean, you shouldn't have nothing to worry about, boss. <sighs> it's okay, Goon. I already know. But thanks for the warning. Look, man, I just want to appreciate you for being so loyal. You know, being one of the loyal ones I ever knew. I'm glad you got my back. But this is the end of Sketchy. Goon, I'm retiring. This empire, I don't want it anymore. But I want to give you the throne. I think you deserve it. Boss, you... You stepping away from the game, boss? I can't believe this. Yeah, Goon, I mean, I thought being at the top would make me happy, but I realize friends and family make me happier, Goon. And that's something I don't have being up here. You know, I, I, I let the money and everything get to me, and it just don't feel the same no more, you know what I mean? But look, since you're gonna be the new boss, some good advice I tell you, okay? Don't let the money get in your head and keep your loved ones close. And last but not least, Goon, don't serve the children, or I'm gonna be back to come kick your ass. No problem, boss. <laughs> you got my word. I love you, Sketch. I, I, I mean, <laughs> hey, stop all that damn crying. You the boss now, okay? You boss. All right, there you go. Thanks a lot, Sketchy. No problem, Goon. Take care of yourself. What's on your mind, boy? What you thinking? I mean, I'm here to make amends with my best friend, my brother. See that over there? They waiting for your ass. Soon as you go up in there, you're going to jail. I know, P.O., but I got to make things right with K-More. And whatever consequences that come with it is whatever. I mean, but this is the right way. I got to do it. You've grown to be a fine young man, Clarence. Wish I could have been around to see it. But, oh, I got shot. I'm just messing with you. Good job, son. Thank you for always trying to keep me out of trouble, P.O. I really mean that. It was my job. You a damn pain in the ass, boy. <laughs> Yeah, I know. <laughs> All right, P.O., I'm gonna go ahead and go up in here. Hey, uh, everyone, c c can I have your attention? <gasps> Sketchy? What, what the hell is he doing? I got a few things I want to say. Arrest that man! Is that right? You working for the feds, you son of a fish. This ain't over. I'm gonna get you back. The fans been wanting it. Okay, more. we've been friends for a while now. Since the day we stumped out that damn snail together, and you randomly knocking on my door and moving yourself in unexpectedly. And at first I thought to myself, this nigga is crazy. And I still think that today. But over the time of us being roommates, our friendship became more than a friendship. You turned into a brother I never had. From the first day you met Biscuits, I got to witness my brother fall in love with his, with his now wife. And it was a beautiful thing. For this past season, I came up on fulfilling my dream. But because of it, it cost me my friends, my brother, and the love of my life, Bebe. I'm here now to apologize to all of them. Bebe, I do love and miss you and Jun Jun. I'm sorry I let that shit get to my head. Tut, boss man, I'm sorry for treating you like shit. It's because of you and your show why I'm here in the first place. And K more, I'm sorry for breaking your bond. Forgive me or not, you always be my brother from another mother. That is all. Now can y'all arrest this man? Shit! It's gotta be the most dramatic arrest ever! Damn. If I try to get married and stuff, you know. 
I've been waiting a long time for this sketchy sketch. <laughs> You are under arrest for illegal drug activities, bribing the mayor, who does that, bribing multiple police officers, my own people, attempted murder on me, me, and for the murder of Sketchy or Scott Finn and to Officer McAllister, I ain't really like him like that, but it's, it's all good. Get this man out of here. Damn, I'm glad my show ain't this dramatic. Nothing but laughs and a good time. I get one more season. I love you too, Sketchy. Oh my God. I'm gonna get you out, baby. Don't worry about it. We gonna get you a lawyer. We gonna get you a real good lawyer. I'm gonna hold you down. I promise. Uh, Sketchy. If you wanna get out, maybe we can gather up a spoon for you. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> oh, I'm getting promoted for sure. I swear to God. <laughs> Good afternoon, Mr. Butterscotch. Today we're serving water beans and chicken flakes. You said water beans? What is water beans? To be honest, I have no idea. It looks nasty though. I'm sure glad I ate before coming here cause damn, this food like it's contracted with herpes or something. <laughs> Good luck. Man, whatever. Y'all got some pudding or something? We sure do got some pudding. Here you go, Mr. Butterscotch. Enjoy. <laughs> How you doing, Sketchy? Can you do me a favor? Uh, what you want, Twitch? I ain't got time for this, man. Could you go grab me some coffee? The, the guards don't want to give me anymore. They said I'm at my limit today, bastards. I mean, well, maybe they could be right. Uh, how many have you had today? Come on, I've, I've had seven cups, man. It's no big deal. No big deal? Twitch, it's two in the afternoon and you've had seven cups of coffee. You just one crappy eruption waiting to happen. Nah, no, 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 no. Look, it's, it's not even like that. Look, if you give me that cup of coffee, it can aid me in my escape from this prison. And when I escape, I can finally go back to building that time machine I was talking about, right? And if I do that, I can go back in time and save John F. Kennedy from being assassinated. Yeah, yeah. So, so you see, if you give me this cup of coffee, now you're helping save America. Right, right. Are you sure you belong in here? Like, why didn't you try plead insane during your trial? You could have been sentenced to a psyche award and got the help you need. Cause, cause I ain't crazy, Sketch Man. Do I got a few loose bolts in my head? Maybe, but that don't make me crazy. Nah, nah. You gonna eat that pudding? Yeah, I am. You smell. When's the last time you took a damn shower? Now class, our next lesson we're going to be talking about is the difference of first degree murder and second degree murder. The difference is intent, I-N-T-E-N-T. -E if you plan and your intentions are to purposely kill somebody, that's first degree murder. Punishment by life in prison since Bikini Bottom Outlaw. Execution last year. Now let's say if you kill somebody by accidentally running them over with your boat. That's second degree murder. Your ass just can't drive. Punishment by some years in the big house and life on probation. <laughs> That's if you get caught though. I forgot how many niggas I done killed. First degree killed. There's always an easy way to get away with murder. I can't tell you here now, but I can teach that class tomorrow. All right, y'all, that concludes today's classes. Get y'all asses out of here before I demonstrate first degree murder and make it look like a suicide. Damn. <laughs> Gamer, you teach a law class? Duh, Larry. I attended seven years of law school. Got my attorney license and all that. You a lawyer, Gamer? Since when? Since forever, Larry. I don't know. Who you think got OJ Simpson off? They wanted to give his ass 10 life sentences before I took the case. <laughs> so you a good lawyer. A good lawyer? I'm the best goddamn lawyer in Bikini Bottom, Larry. Quit playing with me. Put some respect on my name, boy. <laughs> well, okay, Mr. Great Lawyer. If you're such a good lawyer, why don't you represent Sketchy then? You help that nigga out. Hmm. His trial ain't until five months from now. They got a good case on Sketchy. The shit. They damn near found OJ with a knife and blood on his hands. If I could save him, I could definitely save Sketchy. You right, Larry. I'm gonna go see right now. Hey, more, my brother. What you doing up here, man? Sketchy, when did you grow a beard? <laughs> you look like Gandalf. Anyways, 
So Larry gave me this great idea. I could represent you for your trial. Get you off this hook just like I did OJ. I got him off the hook too. Nigga, did you just say OJ? The OJ Simpson? Look, you been charged for a lot of shit. Illegal drug trade, racketeering, bribery, extortion, murder. Enough to keep you in here for life. I could probably help you walk out here a free man after trial. I appreciate where you coming from, k -more. There ain't no way you're going to be able to get me off the hook. Ray got all types of evidence on me. They might as well throw the key away, man. And yada, yada, yada. Evidence ain't the key factor, Sketch. All we got to do is win over the jury and you'll be straight. Work for OJ. <laughs> he was true definition of guilty. <laughs> His ass was done. Man, enough about OJ. Enough about this trial, man. I ain't trying to talk about that right now. How you been, K-Moy? I ain't seen you in a few weeks. Yeah, I'm sorry about this, Sketchy. I've just been very busy lately with all the classes. Man, Biscuits ain't even went on our honeymoon yet. And she been pushing about having a baby. Oh, damn. A baby? K-Moy, that's great. That's I don't want no damn baby, Sketchy. After babysitting John John, that boy scared the life out of me. I'm scared of kids now. I can't do it. They crazy. Right. <laughs> if you say so. So look, man, I know I apologize for a lot of things, but I haven't apologized you yet for not giving you your bachelor party. Ah, uh, bachelor party, smarty. Don't worry about that, buddy. Once we get you out of here, we can hit up any titty bar in the city. <laughs> With Biscuit's permission the first, of course. k -more, I ain't getting out of here, man. You living in a fantasy world right now. Dude, didn't I just tell you I got OJ Simpson now? I'm going to get you out of here, Sketchy. If it's the last thing I do, I'll do it. <sighs> I did a lot of bad things, k -more. It took me a long time to realize it, but I realized and I have to accept it. And I'm okay with paying for the wrongs that I did in here. I need you to accept that too. Yeah, I guess you're right, Sketchy. I'll drop it. Thank you. All right, Mr. Butterscott, time is up. Time to get your ass back to your sale. <laughs> All right, I'm coming. All right, it's time for me to go, K-More. Tell Biscuits I said hi. And give baby my love too. I miss my baby. Of course, Sketchy, I got you, buddy. Hey, guard, here's some cash. Don't beat his ass too hard, all right? Damn, $20? I'll put the padding back on my beating stick for him. <laughs> Good looking out. Kaibo, is that you? What you doing up, baby? It's two in the morning. <sighs> I couldn't sleep. I went to visit Sketchy today and pitched him the idea of representing him in this trial to help him out. And oh, like you did OJ Simpson. Like how you got him off. Yes, baby. Exactly how I got OJ Simpson off. But he turned it down. It felt like he just giving it all up, baby. I don't know what to do. I mean, he's my brother. I can't just leave him in there. What you doing up? Oh, uh, I came down here for my late night snack. I was going to heat up some leftover turkey with some corn, some bad potato, maybe a little bit of gravy and some cake. Anyways, baby, I still think you should represent Sketchy. Help him out as best as you can. But Sketchy doesn't want me to do it, Biscuits. Well, you can either give him what he wants or give him what he needs, sweetheart. Biscuits, baby. That gotta be the most inspirational shit that's ever come out of your mouth this whole show. And you're right. Fuck what Sketchy said. I'ma be his lawyer. <laughs> You want to have sex, Biscuit? Uh, yeah, sure, baby. But let me go eat real quick. I'm starving. Sketchy. Sketchy, wake up, man. Twitch! Man, what the hell you want? What time is it? It's time to get up out of here, brother. Pack your things. Let's go. My things? I only have a damn toothbrush. And even the jail gave that to me. Well, pack that then. And hurry up before the guards spin around back. How you plan on getting us out of here? This is a maximum security prison, Twitch. There ain't no way. Ain't you ever seen that movie Shawshank Redemption? That Stephen King movie with Tim Robbins and Morgan Freeman? Yeah, it's a classic. Very good movie. Did you chisel a hole in the wall with a rock? And hit it behind his Tupac poster? No. But that was a signed Tupac poster by Tupac himself. It was replaceable. Now it's ripped in half. I dug a hole over here in the ground with a spoon. I spent eight hours every night for the past five years digging it. Then why did you ask if I saw Shawshank Redemption? Because it's a good movie and I was just curious if you'd watched it. Okay, damn, man. You know what? I'm out of here. You coming or not, Sketchy? Hell yeah. Let's get out of... You know what, Twitch? Nah. I don't think I'm gonna go with you on this. Uh, uh, come again? Say what? 
You'd rather stay here? Yeah, Twitch. If I go with you, that means I gotta live on the run for the rest of my life. Change my identity and all that. And I ain't trying to deal with that, man. Like, I don't wanna have to change my name to some shit like John Smith or Darius Tutwiler. I'd rather stay Clarence Butterscotch and carry out the full extent of my punishment. Keep it G, you know? Wait, 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 wait. Your name's Clarence? <laughs> this guy's a gangster. His real name's Clarence. <laughs> that's, that, that's funny, man. The rise of this show got a good sense of humor. Whatever, man. Get your ass out of here before I yell for the guards. We good. We good. All right, Sketchy. <laughs> it's been real. You've been an interesting cellmate for the past three months. Uh, oh, before I go... I wanted to let you know, I fondled you in your sleep. You fondled me in my sleep? Yeah, 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 a couple times. Nothing sexual at all. It was more of a spiritual fondle. I don't know how I'm supposed to feel about that, Twitch. Well, you'll have a long time to think about it. Bye, Sketchy. I'll write you. Please don't. I gotta make me a shank, man. I can't have my next roommate fondling me in my sleep. Shit's weird. <laughs>
So, what did you say you were gonna do with your tongue again to the mayor? Ooh, baby. <laughs> um, Mr. Mayor, you had two visitors here to see you. Uh, uh, tell them I'm busy. Tell them to go away. They said they had something to do with Claire's butterscotch. <clears throat> Let them in. Well, hello, fine young gentleman. Uh, how's it going? Can I get you anything? Uh, lemonade, water, bagel, head? Uh, a water will be fine, sir. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Wait. Did you say head? Man, I want the head, mayor. Give me the head. Where's she at? <laughs> <laughs> it's not for free. She's imported. All right, assistant. Give us some private time. So, what can I do for you? So, Mr. Mayor, you know Clarence is doing a lot of time in prison. And actually, he has some charges against you, you know, for bribing you and everything. And we were wondering if you could drop those, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely not. Clarence Butterscotch made my life a living hell for these past few months. My wife almost left me because of the situation. A divorced man can never be elected mayor. The people want a family mayor, not a sloozy one. Well, hey, we could bring that footage back to the public eye if your ass don't comply. <laughs> Is that a threat? Are you threatening me? You threatening me? I had all the footage burned and buried the second they raided Sketchy's mansion. An animal like Sketchy needs confinement. He's a liability. Puts everyone around him in danger. Oh, come on, Mr. Mayor. It gotta be something we can do to get these charges dropped. I'll do anything. What can we do? Hmm. There is one thing. Election time is coming up and the polls are neck to neck right now with me and my candidate, Bob Fisherman. People love that he has the word fish in his name. It's ridiculous. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Mayor, but what does that have to do with sketchy? Uh, thank you. Thank you. <sighs> Have him whacked. I want him dead. <laughs> <laughs> that's crazy. Woo, that's a good one, Mr. Mayor. You almost got me there. Damn. I wasn't joking. I want you to kill him. Anyway, your choice. Just as long as it doesn't get back to me. And if you do that, I'll pull some strings. Give Sketchy a full pardon. He'll be back home next month a free man. Damn. I knew I should have been recording this damn conversation. I could have just blackmailed you with this. Well, yeah, you didn't. Now, can you two get up out of here? I am trying to have sex with my secretary. God. <laughs> 103, 104, 105. Clarence Butterscotch, get up. Face the wall. Open the doors, guard. Yes, sir, warden. Clarence, meet your new cellmate, Tyrone. Tyrone? This is Clarence. What's up? What's cracking, cuz? Hey, God, how things go, you know, taking that piece to my girl? I ain't never doing that shit for your ass again. She robbed me. Again. I had to walk 10 miles back to the house. And I pissed myself. I'm sorry about that, man. It's baby. You know, she kind of crazy, too. I buy you a new pair of pants, though. I got you. Uh, so, uh, Tyrone, you know, what you in here for? Oh, cuz, I'm in here for robbery, murder, and kidnapping. Ah, oh, shit, that's crazy. Now, I'm here for basically being Tony Montana. <laughs> <laughs> Tony Montana, you funny, cuz. Hey, Moore, are you really gonna assassinate this fisherman, dude? Hell yeah, why wouldn't I? I mean, cuz, he ain't really do nothing, okay, Moore? I mean, ain't your number one rule is only kill if the other person deserves it? He's a politician, Larry. Every politician got some type of corrupt system behind him. I mean, but I'll do some digging first. When I find something, I'll let you know, okay? Then we can go kill him. Will that make you happy? I mean, yeah. At least I feel better about whacking the dude. I'ma see you later. I got a damn booty call. Damn, Roach. When the hell he gets so conscious? And all of a sudden, he want to be all spiritual. Have a heart. Look, baby, I love you and all, but before you come home, you're going to have to shave this shit off or at least comb the motherfucker because I'm trying to tell you, the last time I told you to comb, you talking about you tender-headed. How the fuck is you tender-headed in your beard, nigga? I looked it up. It's not a thing. <laughs> <laughs> baby, you crazy, girl. Whew. Man, you know I missed you. How's John John been? 
Has he been good? John John has been really, really good. He only got suspended the one time. But check it. He got suspended for setting fire outside on the playground. But now they gonna study this little motherfucker. Because they like, how he starting fires underwater outside. So it turns out it was good. It was okay. And then, you know, he been talking to everybody about how domestic you been. With all the classes you been taking. You know, he been talking about you a lot. Because he miss you. He's so proud of you. Talking about all your cooking classes one of his friends said maybe you had got turned out but he said you gonna handle that when you get out because he said you not no bitch you tell him daddy you ain't no bitch yeah i got a new silly and everything real cool guy show me how to make toilet wine and shit name is tyrone or something like that wait run that back tyrone tyrone what yeah i don't know he never told me his last name but he a little taller than me got a fade blue color Got a crawl tattoo on his arm. Sketchy, that's my baby daddy. Nigga, that's John John's father. Oh, shit. Oh, damn. I read a quote from this book once. It said, I hope there's another world. We would not be judged too harshly for the things that we did wrong here. That we would at least be forgiven for the mistakes we made out of love. I don't know what that shit means, but damn, it touched my heart. Lord, forgive me, not for what I've done, but for what I'm about to do. Okay class, to clean your guns, you first have to make sure it's empty and safe. Then you disable it like this. Get your cleaning spray and spray that shit. Grab your old toothbrush and start scrubbing. Scribble dub dub. <laughs> now to clean the barrel, each caliber is different. So to make sure that the brush is the correct size for the full clean. Now real simple and bam, you ready to shoot niggas again. <laughs> I have the package you ordered, see? Uh, okay. Would you follow me over here real quick, sir? Let's talk turkey. No problem, Shay. No problem. Your man's clean as a whistle, see? The man's an ordinary Ned Flanders. Church on Sundays, volunteer work every afternoon, lovely wife, three kids, not even a parking ticket, see? Are you sure? Not one accusation? Bob Fisherman is an angel sent from heaven, see? He just built a hospital for the poor with his own fan, see? Damn! Now, can I have my money? Nice doing business with you. See you later, see? Who is that, K-Moore? Oh, Larry, that was just an private attempt that I hired to dig up some dirt on Bob Fisherman. Uh, so what did he find? Uh, Larry? Yeah, he's a sick bastard. Done some unspeakable shit. You won't believe it. Kick old people in the ass. Fart in the little kid's face. I heard he shot a goddamn grandbaby. That's crazy. Who the hell shoot grandkids? Right out of his own grandmama hand. Yeah, that guy's gotta die. But damn, if that Bob Fisherman dude did all that, his ass gotta die. I love to help you with this. <laughs> What you see? Take a picture of the last long. Man, I ain't doing nothing but just looking at my replacement, cuz. Don't know what baby seeing you. Man, look, we grown men. I think we need to be mature about this. You know, for Jun Jun's sake. I bet baby be thinking of me when you piping her, cuz. Alright, now I'ma fuck you up. Uh, ah, get your ass on me! Hey, 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 hey. Y'all niggas fighting booty butt ass naked. <laughs> Stop! Got your ass, dude. Separate! Clarence Butterscotch, you go to this door. Tyrone, you take your egghead ass to this door. Now, since this is y'all first strike and all and getting in trouble, y'all only gonna be in here one day. I'll see y'all ass in the morning time. Oh, damn! I'm already late for my next gig. And I gotta go home and grab my damn G-string. Shit. See y'all boys later. K-more. Man, Bob Fisherman is an outstanding guy. He don't deserve to die. I'm sorry, Larry, but I gotta do what I gotta do to stay sketchy. I can't let you do this, k -more. This is just some cold bloody shit, man. Larry, you my best friend and all, and I love you, but if you try to stop me, I'll stump your little ass, okay? k -more. man, I can't believe you're gonna threaten me like that. Well, look, do what you gotta do, but you gotta do that shit without me. Man, whatever. My damn pistol's still lit. I'm out of here. Right or wrong, good or evil. It don't matter. Not when it comes to your buddy. <laughs> Damn. This shit is some dramatic shit. Be quiet. 
you can make one fucking sound, she gets it too. Walk with me. Oh, please don't kill me. Please. I have all my life savings up in the safe if you need it. Please, I have a family. Look, man, I don't want none of that. This isn't personal. It's just business. Hey, look, Tyrone. I spend a lot of my life always looking over my shoulders. And I'm tired of that. Man, this ain't over, cuz. I got life in prison. And I heard from the grapevine, so do you. Means we got to be spending a lot of time with each other. I'ma slit your damn throat as soon as I get a chance, cuz. Hey. Well, if this ass gotta be, then this ass gonna be. Everybody who go against me is already six feet deep, so I want your ass to know that right now. I'ma just have to add your little fat head ass to the list. Bet, cuz. I'm looking forward to it. If it means anything to you, I don't wanna have to do this. Oh my god. Father, please help me, please, please. I love you, God. Take care of my kids. Take care of my wife. Take care of the church that I just built with my own hands. Everything. Man! Damn, I hate moments in shows like this. They always get to a nigga. I can't believe I did this shit. I really ain't shit. Get your ass up. I'm gonna go home and eat some peanut butter and jelly. <laughs> Oh, how'd it go? I didn't do it, man. That man didn't deserve to die. We just gonna have to get sketchy out the right way and legal way, Larry. Hey, that's my boy. I knew you would come around. I'm down for that. Let's go grab a drink. It's on me. April 12th, 2022. 9 p.m. Day 29. I found myself in Bikini Body and I'm getting closer, see? I can feel it in my loins. My brother killer will face the Grim Reaper when I'm done with him, you see? I'm coming for you, K-more. Ah, see? Thirty-one! Thirty-two! Thirty-three! Yeah! That's all you can live, cuz? Man, that ain't nothing. Watch this. Mark, I'm about to pick up a whole 200 pounds on this food. One, two, three, cuz. Four, cuz. <laughs> man, that's cute. If you 18, we grown men. I got hair on my face now. Watch this. Yeah, going for the big guns. One, two, three. Man, calm down, calm down, calm down. That ain't nothing. Watch this. What? You struggling? No, give me two seconds, cuz. Man, this nigga can't lift that shit. Put some money on it, cuz. Bet you I can lift it. All right, do it. Bet I'm stronger than you. I bet you not, cuz. Put your money where your mouth is. I put my cigarettes where my mouth is. Let's do it. Box of cigarettes. You can't lift this shit. Say no more. Hey, what the hell going on over here? Man, we got some wages going on. If he lift this shit, he get a box of cigarettes and some money. A box of cigarettes and some money? Y'all niggas pathetic. Y'all know this is illegal to do this in the jail, right? Fuck all that, scoot over, I got $10 on this ad. <laughs> so if I approach it this angle, Sketchy probably got a good chance. But if I'm going this way and talking about all the drugs his dad was selling, <laughs> both of our ads done. Damn, I gotta remember that scheme I did for OJ. I should have had a tape somewhere here. Oh my God, baby. I said dinner was ready 30 seconds ago. I'm starving. Uh, one second, bitch, because I'm almost done with this case. I know it. Baby, you better hurt three goddamn dice. All that your ass had was some chicken and some coleslaw. I ate 20 goddamn meals since then, baby. You need to take a break. I understand you want to get Sketchy out, but you can't do it on an empty stomach. I don't know, bitch. Get sketchy damn trial next episode. Yeah. This dumbass, let me tell you what this ass did. This dumbass is caught on tape, going in the jail, killing Scarfin, flicking his head and looking at the camera and screaming, Hey, my name is Sketchy, a.k.a. Clarence Butterscott, but I just killed Scarfin. Fuck all you hoes. Ain't that a goddamn idiot? But then again, OJ did leave a goddamn bloody glove on the thing with his DNA. <laughs> so if he can get away with that, Sketchy can get away with this shit. But I'm still nervous, Biscuit. Oh my God, why would he do that dumb shit? I mean, one time I was caught on camera stealing a cupcake, but at least I ate that motherfucker made it disappear, baby. I have no clue why his dumb ass would do that. 
clearly makes no sense. But the jury might give his ass a break on killing Scarfin. I mean, he was a bad guy. Hell, they even might give his ass a break on killing Sketchier. He's also a bad guy. <laughs> In that ugly cock out ass guy. <laughs> he was a bad dude too. But the problem is, they pinned a sketchy probation officer death on him too. Oh my god. Did he actually do it, K Boy? No. Sketchy was tied up. His PO died saving my life. It was some sad shit. A whole season later, and the people still come in, they miss him. He's dead, guys. And besides, he ain't like my magic trick. So really, fuck his ass. <laughs> I'm the best ever. I mean, but can't you just get the actual shooter to confess? I mean, it's one of Sketchy your old goons. Then he worked for Sketchy. And now his ass working for whoever Sketchy left it to. Uh, I mean, you could just go find out. Then you could clear up Sketchy. You right. I'm just going to visit Sketchy today and see who he left in charge. Thank you, baby. I'm ready to eat. <laughs> oh, my God. It's about damn time. Come on. Damn, y'all. Hurry up. I'm starving. See? Even Larry looks small and hungry. The biggest ain't good video. Mine ain't nothing to it but to do it, cuz. Get out the way. My turn. Oh, he can't do it. Wait a minute. Uh, I, damn, cuz. Shit. She whore. Yay! Yeah. Y'all niggas run me my money. Don't give me my stuff before I beat y'all ass and y'all say him. <laughs> give me my damn money. I knew my boy Ketchy was gonna win in this. Y'all some idiots going over this dude Tyrone. Nigga got one eye. <laughs> Damn, this job come with perks. I can make niggas fight niggas and get money off of it. <laughs> hey, but now y'all going back to y'all sale. Vegetation now is about to start soon. Let's go. Chop, chop. Good job, Sketchy. <laughs> Let me know if you need some extra time out. <laughs> I messed with you now, boy. I left a carton of cigarettes under your bed. <laughs> Good job. Good looking now. Hey, this ain't done, cuz. I ain't finished with you. Just wait till I catch you slipping. Mark. Hey, boy, man, it's good to see you. Good to see you too, Sketchy. How you doing? Man just got done whooping his weak ass doing the weightlifting contest. I'm strong as hell now. Yeah, you look like it with this damn Ben Laden beard. <laughs> like you can knock out six niggas up in here. Well, I actually can. I believe it. But what's up? What brings you down here? I just want to see what's new. You got a prison wife yet? <laughs> I know you've been smacking that ass in here. <laughs> Man, hell no, stop playing with me. But look, on some dramatic shit, Baby's baby daddy is my new cellmate. You lying! Damn! That is some dramatic shit. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> like the scary shit come on. You know the little other sound effect you gotta look up on YouTube and you kinda find it, but they still got copyright claims on it. I hate this shit. Yeah, me too. But anyways, yeah, it's crazy. Then I tried to get cool with his ass, but he pretty much threatened to kill me. Oh, damn, Sketchy. I mean, don't you got goons up here or something? You should tell somebody so you can have some type of protection. Man, hell no, I ain't no wreck. I ain't worried about that dude. Besides, I made me a shank as soon as my old cellmate was talking about he was funneling me in my sleep. I'll never forget Twitch for that shit. Can't wait till I see his ass again. I feel violated. Oh, whoa, oh, wait a minute. He fondled you? Like with his fans or with his dick? Oh, I, I still don't know, K Moore. He said he talking about it was spiritual or something. I don't know if he was talking about he digging or not, but I'm gonna kill his head. He never elaborated that for me. Damn. Well, don't think about it. Your head gonna go crazy. But, anyways, I'm here because I need to know who you left in charge after you quit the drug game, Sketch. Oh, man, I left my old goon Charles in charge. He's like my right hand man. I can trust him with my life. Thank you, Sketch. All right, I gotta get up out of here. I got things to do. Don't get folded in your sleep again. <laughs> he got to do with his dick, most definitely. <laughs> Shut your ass up! He said it was a spiritual one! Yeah, yeah! Bye! <laughs> Hello? Oh, damn! They got a shark tank? A pool table? Damn, y'all niggas turn it up up in here. Sketchy never had this place fun. I want to stay here again. <laughs> What's up? Hey, yo, what up, k -more? It's been a while, man. What's going on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, Charles, I need your help. So, when we was at the warehouse, one of these dudes, not seeing you, shot the P.O. I need to know who the hell shot the P.O., which one of these goons did. And if I do that, I can have a sketchy name clear. You get what I'm saying? Oh, oh yeah. I know exactly who you're talking about. He's orange, three feet tall, wears a white beater. His name is Blake Puff, Miss Puff, old husband. Yo, that man dead. What? 
How? When? He got busted slanging coke. Got into a hot pursuit with the feds. Shooting and shit. Yo, he rather die than go to jail. Rest in peace. Oh, damn. Get your love souls up. Oh, and the no. And yeah, that's my favorite one right there. That boy goaded. Should call him up and get him one of these episodes. Hey, who knows? May happen one day. What the hell going on down there? Oh, damn. Yeah, they kicking his ass. Should I help? Should I not? This nigga want to kill me. I can't watch nobody get jumped. It is Jun Jun Pops. Damn, I got to do the right thing. Hey, 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 break this shit up. Break this shit up. I'll murk all y'all ass. Now, what the hell going on? Hey, yo, 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 yo. Yo. Hey, yo, ain't that the guy that was the lieutenant of the fish game killers? Got shot up, left for dead, went to jail, came back and killed a lot of our own people, went to work at a fry cook job, and then became Bikini Bottom's drug lord, and gave it up just because he missed his friends? Shit stupid, man. Y'all old news. You ain't even a kingpin of Bikini Bottom no more. Good job, good job. You know that is true. Story so real sounds like I can sell it for a movie. Well, hell, even a book. But I still got mob ties out there, boy. Can have you, your family, your friends, even your fucking mailman killed. You know me, you should know how I handle my business, one way or other. Man, alright. I feel you, big dog. Respect, respect, respect. Tyrone, your ass got lucky. Next time you won't be, pussy. Man, fuck you, Mark. Man, I had the situation handled. I ain't need your damn help, cuz. Man, they ain't trying to hear that. They would've killed you if I ain't intervened. Look, bruh, I don't like you. You don't like me. But we don't have to like each other. I'm piping your baby mama and chilling with your son. And that shit sucks. But I respect baby. I respect Jun Jun. Hell, I even love the little kid. That's what you should be cool with, the fact that I respect your child and make sure he always straight. Man, fuck. Man, I guess you right, cuz. You right, I don't even want to admit it, but I but you right. I mean, Lil Jun Jun was a little troubling kid out there because my ass was locked up. But, she, you stepped up, and I appreciate that. And somebody need to get Bay Bay straight, so I appreciate that too. And you all right, little dog. You cool with me. Oh, well, she, you don't feel like slitting my throat tonight, do you then? Oh, ain't nothing changed. Hell yeah, I still want to slit your throat, cuz. But my son wouldn't like that, so you good. Oh, well, cool. You trying to smoke a pack of these cigarettes with me? That damn guard left it up under my bed. Oh, hell yeah. Shit, I ain't had no cigarette in a minute. Let's do it. Man, that was some sweet shit. <laughs> like, a, like a hood soap opera or something. Man, that was great. Hey, wait a minute. Y'all niggas got contraband. <laughs> I'm lying. They just the cigarettes I gave your broke ass. <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs> I got to go to my next dog. Sorry I couldn't be any help, K-More. Man, it's a tragic scene sketchy locked up. I hate it. It's all good, Charles. Man, I don't know what I'm gonna do. His case start real soon. His damn case harder than OJ. <laughs> I thought I'd never say that. Uh, you know what? Don't worry, K-More, I got a plan. Come here. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh. Yeah. Ooh, okay. Oh, oh, wait a minute, nigga. You look at me in my ear. Stop. <laughs> that just might work. Another day. Time to get this guap. <laughs> Alright, Roger. You have a good day. Job number one. Let's get it done. <laughs> Next stop, Main Street. Remember, don't talk to the bus driver. Hi, Mrs. K. Moore. How you doing on this lovely day? I'm doing fine. Um, does this bus stop at the all-you-can-eat buffet? It sure does, Mrs. K. Moore. Don't worry, we gonna get your ass there. Everybody, they're clear. <laughs> oh, 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 hurry up. I wanna get there before all the good food is gone. I gotta be first, I gotta be first. La, 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 la. Making my way downtown, walking fast, fight. Oh! Hey, my brother, you think you can spare me some change? Man, hell no! Get your ass on! You better get 20 jobs like my ass got. <laughs> I'll stay on the grind, boy. What you know about it? Broke ass. <laughs> Job number two, what it do? Your honor, 
I like to start out by saying my client is a dumbass. You ask him two plus two, he gonna say tartar sauce. The boy obviously ain't intentionally do it. Did you SpongeBob? No, I did not. Yeah, no, that motherfucker guilty. Next case. Well, Sponge, I'll try my best. Oh, I gotta do my next job. Job number three, let's get this cheese. Next case, the people of Bikini Bottom versus Darius Tutwiler. Looks like you in the world of winning trouble. <laughs> I love sending you to jail. I don't even want to see the evidence. Send this nigga to Guantanamo Bay. I ain't even gotta show that. Where you going, baby? Please. Let Job number four, let's make some more. Next. Yeah, I like to withdraw $35 million, please. Damn! $35 million? Boy, you must have three hundred jobs. <laughs> Let me get that for you. Hey, can somebody open the damn vault? This rich ass nigga wants the paper. Job number five is do a down time. <laughs> Hello? Uh, anybody here? I got y'all crispy chicken. Oh, I see what's going on here. You desperate and didn't want to give me my damn tip. I see how it is. I'm going to just eat this food right here in front of you. Mmm, so damn good. Love me some Chick-fil-A. <laughs> and you, you had the nugget. Mmm, good old lemonade. A few minutes later. All right, now. Y'all enjoy y'all day. <laughs> okay, what's next? I got to get to the jail? Damn. Job number six. I'm feeling rich. Hey, <laughs> CO, what did I miss? What's been going on with these ugly ass niggas? Oh, man, no, we doing surprise inspections. Actually, you got to check Clarence and Tyrone over there. I got it. Move. Y'all niggas get out the way. Let me see what we got here. Oh, some cigarettes. Weed. A shank. Porn magazines. Toilet wine. A mouth to sell this workshop. What the hell y'all niggas doing? Oh, man. It's all good. Hey, Sketchy, how you feeling? Your trial start next episode. <laughs> What's supposed to be this one, but the creator just said fuck it, and he wants to do something me because the fans like me. <laughs> Man, I don't know. I'm kind of nervous. But here, whatever they find, I handle it. I'm a G. Hey, uh, well, all right. But do me this favor. Rehide your country band. I ain't Steve shit. <laughs> you can call me Stevie Wonder. <laughs> Job number seven. I'm finessing. <laughs> La -da -da. Oh, damn. This big guy came to his house. Hey, yo, man, what's up, bruh? Thank you. This gotta be the pocket rocket I ordered. That's too much information, sir. I don't need to know what your little ass be doing. <laughs> little stinky, dropping roach bottoms and shit. Roaches in bikini bottom. How does that even work? Job number eight, I'm never late. <laughs> damn, I'm late. Damn, hey, man, this fucking shit. I gotta deliver this damn prosthetic leg. Why do y'all need all these prosthetic legs for? Just a word of advice. Don't eat the Krabby Patties. Damn. Learning new shit every day. <laughs> you got it, Mr. Krabs. With your broke ass. Job number nine. Gotta go pay my fine. Breaking news. The trial of Clarence Butterscotch starts next episode. If Clarence is found guilty, he will spend the rest of his life behind bars. Are you keeping up with the case? In other news, SpongeBob is found guilty for public exposure. His nasty ass was showing his dick. <laughs> That'll be all today. Job number 35, some some. I'm fucking tired of rhyming. <laughs> hey yo, let me get a drink right away. Hey man, why the hell do you work so much? Because I got 12 kids, man. When well, my bitch got pregnant, cause I was expecting only one. But I just fucked me over and got 12 of them little bells. And all of them want iPhones, door to 2K. One of them want to go to beauty school. On great ass kids. They need to get a job. Damn, that's crazy. <laughs> Let's toast. Gotta sketch dog. Hey, you looking sharp, cuz. You gonna win the jury for sure. I don't know, Tyrone. I think they're gonna throw the whole book on my ass. I'ma face life. You'll be fine, cuz. Don't even worry about it. Hey, but if you ask me, cuz, I think you got a better chance if you shave. You think so? Man, hell yeah. You gonna go up in there looking like a summer bin Laden. They gonna send your bin Laden ass back right up in here. <laughs> you right. Let me go ahead and cut this shit off. La 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 la. Making my way downtown. Walking fast. <laughs> All right, Sketchy, you ready? Yeah. All right, bring your ass. <laughs> you know your head doing life. I am going to miss you if you get found innocent, Clarence. 
I've been having fun with your dumb ass. <laughs> you entertaining. Man, this is it. This is what everybody been waiting on. Don't mess up, k -more. Don't mess up. k -more. what's good? Sketchy, you shy. Oh, yeah, you definitely gonna win over the jury. Man, that's what everybody's seeing. Didn't nobody like the beard? I'm gonna be honest with you. Hell no. Nah. When I saw baby roaches growing in that damn thing, I knew damn well you was over with. Man, whatever. It took me three months to grow this damn thing. And I'm glad it took you five seconds to cut it off. <laughs> How you feeling? Man, I'm just ready to get this over with. Well, don't worry, Sketch. You're gonna be coming home soon. Everybody, all rise for Judge Matthews. This nigga stink. <laughs> Um, the people of Bikini Bottom versus Clarence Butterscotch, aka Sketchy. How do you please? Innocent, your honor. Your honor. My client here may in fact have done a lot of legal things, but is it wrong to act out of self-defense? I'm listening. Your honor. Can I call you Matthew? Um, hell no you can't. Continue. Alright, your honor. So, in the case of Clarence Butterscotch killing Sketchy here, he did not. There's an actual police report file saying that him and I got kidnapped. And when him and I got kidnapped, that's when Sketchy got killed. By one of his own goons, not us. That's also on a police report. Well, I mean, you can say that, but he's on clear footage killing Scarfin. And not only that, he looked in the camera and said, fuck all you hoes, right? Right? Well, all right, uh, attorney. Where's your evidence to prove that he said all these things? Thought you never asked, judge. I have it right here on this video. Here you go. Man, fuck all you- uh, What the hell's going on here? What is this? And right here. Ooh, I did it. Oh, damn, Sketch, I think there's Larry on the screen. <laughs> My boy. Ooh, I thought I'd never love that roach until now. This is a goddamn roach dancing. This is not the video of Clarence Butterscotch. But, Your Honor, it was right here. I swear to God, it was right here. What, what the hell is this? Who the hell roach is this? Well, seems like to me, you don't have any evidence on Clarence Butterscotch. So it seems that there's no evidence on him killing Sketchy Error, and then you don't have any evidence on the boy killing Scarfin. I don't know about this one. Well, um, he did commit a lot of drugs and crimes throughout Bikini Bottom. This nigga's such a hater. Okay, so if he did all that, where's the evidence? Yeah, what the evidence that, nigga? Judge, look at these photos right here. This is clear evidence of him giving kids weed. Can you believe this, Judge? And this is also clear evidence of him holding a gun and hitting someone in the head with it. I mean, this guy is dangerous, clearly. Well, now this right here is some hard-hitting evidence. Woo! Not looking so good. Now we got us a show. Damn, Sketchy. Told your ass stop selling drills to kids. I did stop. Later. Fucking idiot. You stupid and SpongeBob. Oh, now I got to put on my goddamn thinking cap. And last but not least, we have the death of Clarence Butterscotch's own parole officer, Officer McAllister. Man, I would've never killed my P.O. like that. You got me fucked up. Order, not, not, not order. I have both of you sent your ass back there. Sketchy, shut your ass up. I got this. Your Honor, my client did not do this. The parole officer saw me and Sketchy tied up and tried to help us. Then that's when one of Sketchy your goons shot the P.O. Now, do you have any evidence of this? Uh... I would, honor, but his eye is dead. Well, seems like nobody knows who kills who. Exactly, your honor. If he is the man that actually killed the parole officer and he's dead, then what now? I think he's bluffing. Yada, 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 yada. Ain't nobody bluffing. Damn. Sketchy, this ain't looking good for us. Just keep your fingers crossed and your ass tight. Woo. Well, we have a good quite of a lot of evidence on Clarence Butterscotch, but we have to hear from the jury. But before then, both of you attorneys will have your closing statements. Attorney number one, go ahead and go. Thank you, Judge Matthew. Jury, do you really, really want a man like Clarence Butterscotch, AKA Sketchy, to really be on the streets? This guy's a damn menace. Smokes weed every day, no one likes him. Stinks, sells drugs to children. And obviously, he's a murderer. Jury, I think we'll all be doing ourselves a favor. 
if we get this man off of the streets and back behind bars. Thank you, Judge Matthew. That's all the time I need. All right, Attorney K. Moore, step up to the jury. Thank you, Matthew. I mean, does Matthew? Jury. Look, I know Clarence Butterscotch don't look that smart, never really smell good, and he does smoke weed. Hey, man. Hey, shut your ass up. I'm going somewhere with this. But he's a great guy. He goes to work on time, even though he'll be high, he still gets there. When I needed a place to stay, he let me come stay with him. No questions asked. And if I need to stay, I've been thriving ever since. <laughs> I have classes, I'm married. Matter of fact, when me and my girl was going through some problems, Sketchy even got us to hook back up. He was the one that made me marry my biscuit. And I never regret that. Thank you, Sketchy. Even when I made a mistake and killed somebody, Sketchy helped me hide the body. Uh, disregard that. Uh, but like I was saying, Jerry, this guy's an amazing person. He's not this criminal like this asshole over here is trying to make him out to be. Sketchy has a lot of lovely people in his life. And Sketchy has done a lot of great things, even for kids. You know, to be honest, when he was giving those kids weed, he was actually making them kids feel better because they had got their ass beat earlier from a bully. So Sketchy told them if they smoked, the injuries would kind of reduce. And it did. So I'm here to tell y'all, this is not the man that this guy is trying to paint a picture of. Sketchy is the awesome guy. And Jury, I think if you believe in second chances, you believe in Clarence Butterscotch. I love this guy. Judge, you should love this guy. And he's an example of the American story. Now ask yourself, what would Morgan Freeman do? Thank you, Jerry. Oh yeah, this case is mine. This guy's definitely gonna fucking lose. Can we get this over with? I'm ready to eat. Now, 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 everyone settle down. Jerry, have you made your decision? Sketchy, I tried my best. Ah, <sighs> K-Moore, you a fucking idiot. But I love you. Thank you anyway, brother. I love you too, Sketchy. Let's keep our fingers crossed. We don't got fucking fingers. Why do you keep saying that? I don't know. It's in the damn script. Shut up. All right, Jerry. What do you find here, Clarence Butterscotch? We, the jury, find Clarence Butterscotch. Guilty on all counts. I'm going to jail. I'm sorry, Scratch. Psych. I'm lying. We find him innocent. What? What? Wait, wait a minute. Wait. Nah, 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 nah. Shut your ass up. Be quiet in my court. Clarence Butterscotch, you're free to go. Innocent. Scotchy! We did it! We did it, Scotchy! Oh my god, I can't believe it! I love you, Scotchy. I love you too, baby girl. I love you, John John. Hey boy, I can't believe you actually got me off. Man, how the hell you do that? Oh, Sketchy, come on. Everybody has a heart, even for your dumb ass. And you got $10 million for the damn jury. I'm pretty sure you can get away with anything. I told the shark to pay him off. You did what? Oh, shut your ass up. It was for your own good. How the hell you think OJ got off? <laughs> because we liked him? Hell no. He paid up that damn guap. <laughs> now come on. Let's go to the house. Okay, boy, I love you, man. Let's go. Bitch. Huh, I'm sure gonna miss beating his ass. Oh well, Tyrone ball head ass still up in there. <laughs> That's his ass. Man, Kamal, why the hell are you making so much food for? It's only three of us. Well, four, I guess if you count Larry ass. Because Biscuit says she wants 15 burgers and some hot dogs. So, could you let me finish, please? Damn. Oh, came on, man. You sure know you know how to grill, boy. This so good. Appreciate that, Larry. Oh, look at the two brothers sitting next to each other. Oh, damn. You know, I really never noticed the differences between these two until now. Look at it, Larry. I mean, yeah, you are right. That's crazy. Hey, how can y'all be twins but be so different? Lawrence is an outstanding normal civilian, while Sketchy is a whole menace of society. What made y'all so different? Did y'all parents uh, divorce or separate or something? Um, no. We were both raised by our mothers. Our fathers was gone before we were born. And our mother provided for us the best way she could. Um, sends us to prestigious schools. So, why did Sketchy end up like... Well, sketchy. What you trying to say? No disrespect, sketchy. But I'll trust my 401k with Larry. 
I wouldn't trust you with a pencil. <laughs> well, if you must know, my life changed at a young age. At Rock Bottom Preschool. Rock Bottom Preschool? I went to that preschool. Hmm. Must be a coincidence. When we were younger, me and Lawrence were close. Inseparable. We was exactly the same. Till one day, Mr. Jacob's classroom. Oh, wow. Clarence, you have an amazing talent. One day, you're going to grow up and be a famous artist when you grow up. Thank you, Mr. Jacobs. I want to be like Picasso. <laughs> and then... A fire got started in the classroom. It burned down the whole school. No one got hurt though, but the school was beyond repair. They blamed it on me. And before I completed it wasn't me, they already listed me as a delinquent. And ever since then, I was now the bad guy. They sent me to juvie for two years, and by the time I got out, I was the man you see before you today. Damn, that's sad, Sketchy. Who knows what you could have did with your life if you wasn't framed? Yeah, it was a travesty. To this day, we never knew who really did it. Uh, guys, I may know who started the fire. You do, k -more? How? What you talking about? Well, okay. So you see, I also went to Rock Bottom Preschool. And I also was in Mr. Jacob's class. And I always wanted to be a firefighter when I grew up. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Do you got a hall pass? A hall pass? No! Then... That right there is a violation. I'm the hall monitor. I didn't get this slash just because of my good looks. <laughs> but you know what? They ain't paying me. So go on. on. <laughs> Hi there, k -more. What are you painting there, little buddy? I'm painting a firefighter because I want to be a firefighter. I'm sorry, son, but you can't be a firefighter. We live underwater. Fires are really hard to start down here. We only have two firemen in the whole city because of how unlikely that happened. Why don't you try to be a teacher when you grow up? I don't want to be no damn teacher. Mr. Jacobs, you crazy. I know. I saw Mr. Jacobs I could be a fireman by putting out a fire in the classroom. <laughs> K-more, you a genius. That wasn't the hardest set on a fire. I don't know what Mr. Jacobs was talking about. We really need more firefighters in this town. We only have two. All right, firefighter K-more here for the rescue. Ah! Oh, damn! I thought that would have been enough to put it out. I should go drink some more water so I can go again. Who did this? Who did this? Who started this fire? How could this happen? Uh, uh, it was that kid right there. I saw him with my own eyes. What? Yeah, it was him, all right. Put him in handcuffs. Put tape over his mouth, too, so he won't deny it. <laughs> That'll work. k -more, you started that fire? Man, you ruined my life. I was labeled as a criminal before I could even spell the word criminal. I'm sorry, Sketchy. I didn't know I was a kid. I mean, you are maroon, so. What you trying to say, k -more? Uh, I'm sorry. You know what, k -more? It's all right. I mean, yeah, I went to Jude for two years. Yeah, it completely changed the course of my life. Who knows what I could have probably been? A doctor? But it could be worse. I could have ended up like learns here. <laughs> so, hey, you did me a favor, k -more. <laughs> I'm glad you forgive me, Sketchy. Can't believe we met in preschool. What are the odds? That's crazy. You tried to put out the fire with your piss, k -more? Do 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 Oh, hi there. You scared the bejesus out of me. My name's Smalley, Associate Production Coordinating Directorial Associate Managing Department of Division Office Supervisor of the International Network Distributor Corporation Management Organization Associate of Men Who Love Boobies. And I am here to proudly share a fantastic story of my two favorite idiots, Sketchy and Kmore, and their adventure on meeting Bigfoot. How is Bigfoot underwater, you ask? I don't know, it's a cartoon. But I guarantee you're gonna ask us in the comments anyways. So sit back, grab your weed, and read along with me. <laughs> Once upon a time. Come on, Sketchy, I don't wanna be late. I ain't trying to get bit in my ass by the mosquitoes. All right, I'm coming. Gotta make sure I bring some weed with me on this trip. Freaking hate camping. We gotta go to the exact spot in the woods where I planted weed at 10 years ago. Wait, how in the hell do you even still remember somewhere you planted weed 10 years ago? You were served by the 100 people, Sketchy. I got good memory when it comes to drugs, trust me. And 
Of course, I spent five hundred dollars a month on security cameras to make sure it's still there. K more, go get the snacks. I'm gonna fill up the gas tank. All right. You boys plan on going up in the woods, huh? People who go up there never come back out. <laughs> There's this thing called Bigfoot. You ever heard of it? Hell no, I ain't never heard nothing called Bigfoot. Well, he walks around seven foot, big as hell, with a big ass foot. You boys better watch out. Oh, oh my God. Oh, Skinty, Skinty, Skinty. Is Bigfoot real? Man, get the hell off me. Grown ass man, talking about his Bigfoot real. Boy, your ass worse than Lawrence. Here's my weed right here. Good. All right, we gonna set up camp. Cool. What should I put the key? I don't know. Somewhere you'll remember. Hmm. Okay. Perfect spot. Two days later. Please don't tell me your dumb ass left the keys, k -more. In the initial, the entire two days we've been out. <laughs> okay, I won't tell you that I left the keys in the initial the entire two days we've been out. <laughs> k -more, you a fucking idiot. My fucking phone dead. Oh, damn, mine's on 1%. I gotta make a phone call. Hey, Larry. Is my favorite TV show recording? Oh, yeah, man. I did that before you left. I got you. Appreciate that, my guy. I couldn't imagine not seeing the love and the wrestling. Man, what the hell? You wasted one phone call to fucking call Larry about your TV show? Catch it. That shit important. You don't know what's going on in this season. It's crazy. I could have missed that. I'd rather die. I could tell. Try to call somebody else before your phone die. Okay. <laughs> uh, Skitty is dead. Game more, I hate you. Now we stuck out here for the rest of the night because of you. Don't worry, well, we gonna get home. We just gotta stick together. Somehow that sounds like a bad idea when it come to you. It's all right, we just get some sleep, and then we'll go home in the morning. Sketchy! Sketchy! Man, what? I'm scared. Man, get the hell away from me. <sighs> I'm thinking about Bigfoot, Sketchy. I wonder if his feet really are 20 foot inch. Oh, damn. I wish Biscuits was here. She don't know what to do about Bigfoot. Hey, she will probably eat his ass. Oh, Biscuits, baby. If you could hear me, I need you. Game will go to sleep. Uh, okay. Man, I am starving. Hey, me too. Whew. Hey, what you think we can eat around here? Think they got like some berries on a bush or? Maybe some fish or something like that by the little lake that we can go by. Oh, uh, hell, maybe we should do cannibalism. <laughs> you crazy. Yeah, you think I'm joking. Go ahead and turn around and start looking good. I may eat your ass. Okay, more. make sure you walk alongside of me and not behind me no more. <laughs> okay, sketchy. What's I say? Spaghetti? <laughs> I'm just joking. I want to eat you, boy. Your ass ain't like shit. <laughs> or will I? <laughs> I got you scared. Man, shut up and let's go. Damn, that's a huge ass footprint. Oh, sketchy. I think it's Bigfoot. Man, shut up. Ain't no damn Bigfoot out here. Let's go. What? Ah! Ah! Oh, my. Man, I ain't scared of you. Let's throw these damn hands, nigga. Uh, 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 uh. I'm finna eat you. Uh, I, uh, please don't eat my friend. Big, 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 Bigfoot. Do you like, uh, cannabis? <laughs> weed? Uh, Man, you better not give him my damn weed. Uh, I like weed. I don't give a damn. You ain't getting my weed. Skinty, is it a we give him the weed or we die? Yeah, it's what he said. If you don't give me weed, I crush you with my big foot. Damn. Man, here. Thank you. This gonna be good for me and my lady. Ha ha, ha ha. Ha ha. See, Sketchy, you was right. Weed is a good thing. He saved our life many a time. Woo, that was a close one. I gotta tell people I met Bigfoot. I gotta tell people I just lost fucking $30,000 a week. Shit. It's all right, you'll make it back. Come on, let's go ahead and go. I'm pretty sure them footprints lead to a way out of here. <laughs> well, off to see the wizard, the one of the wizard of all. Because, 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 because. Wait, you still smell like spaghetti, Sketchy. <laughs> Game one more fucking shoot you. Oh, I 
on B. We got any Gatorade sketchy? I need some electric lights or something. Big women are not for the week. Trust me. <laughs> I'll take your word for it. I thought we were having an earthquake or something. Wait, do earthquakes happen underwater? I think we call them tsunamis. I don't know. LaCrocs? We don't got Gatorade, but we got LaCrocs? Who in this house drink LaCrocs? Hey, you better leave my LaCrocs alone. Catchy, you drink LaCrocs? <laughs> That's so weird. So out of character. I always picture you as the Henny on the Rocks for breakfast type of ratchet. <laughs> Not LaCrocs. This guy's a white guy. <laughs> nah, man. I quit drinking. Every time I drink, I always get a new story to tell and a new tattoo. I woke up last week with a goldfish cracker logo on my ankle. Oh, yeah, I remember that night. You wanted to get your mom's initials on your butt, and I talked you out of it. Told you to get the goldfish logo on you. <laughs> Looks good, right? I know. I got good taste. <laughs> right, right, right. Uh, hey, have you heard from Tut? He been gone for like a month. Starting to wonder if he's still even alive. Oh, yeah. He preparing his last season. Man, kind of sad this is his last but hey, at least we'll never end. <laughs> you right about that. Our writers never run out of ideas. Who knows what'll happen next? Hey y'all, guess what? I was on offer up just now and I found this dude selling an enlargement ray. An enlargement ray? What's that? I mean, it's self-explanatory, k -more. It's a ray gun that can enlarge things. Make them bigger. Oh, that's crazy. We can end world hunger. Grow food to maximum size and feed the world. We'll be heroes. Uh, actually, I wanted to buy to make my dick bigger. Why would I care about feeding the world? I'm a roach. Everything y'all eat is already big for me. <laughs> I don't care about none of that. You want to end world hunger? You crazy. Now that right there is a sketchy and Camo episode. Some of that dumb shit. Let's go. Might make my biceps larger if this works. It's the Camo and Sketchy show. My name come first. Don't play with me. Five bucks say it's a crackhead that opened this door. Oh yeah? I'll raise you 15 bucks say it's a mad scientist preparing for world domination. You guys hear about the stupid ray gun? Uh, why yes? Yes we are. Alright, that's gonna be a thousand bucks. Okay, cool. K-more, pay the man why won't you? I left my wallet at home. Man, yada yada yada, you always leaving your wallet at the crib. Don't wonder if your ass even got a wallet. Here's the case. Give me the ray gun. Alright y'all, I'm ready. Give me a 15 inch. <laughs> I can't wait to pull up to my ex house and show her what she been missing out on. Come on, K-more! Hold on! Shouldn't we read the instructions first? This seems all kind of dangerous. Reading, schmeeding. Who reads nowadays? <laughs> Let's talk more action. Ah! Oh my god! Larry! He broke my ceiling! Do you know how expensive ceilings are to fix? It's your fault, K-more! Oh, snap! Sketchy! Sketchy! Are you okay? No, I'm not okay. He threw me through a damn wall. I think he cracked one of my ribs. Hmm. I wonder if there's anything in the instructions on how we can reverse Larry's enlargement. Let me go check. Are you really leaving me here? I clearly need medical attention, K-More. Our top story tonight. A very large roach is terrorizing and destroying the city. Where did the beast come from? What does it want? I've been informed to announce that all Bikini Bottom residents stay inside their homes and pray for the best. This is crazy. All Larry wanted was a bigger dick. That's how all villain arc stories start. <laughs> well, I don't know about you, K-More, but I'm getting the hell up out of here. Bikini Bottom is a hell no for me. I'm taking my ass to Atlantis. Heard the water's warm over there. What? We can't just leave, Sketchy. We did this. We turned poor little old Larry into this big destructive monster. We didn't do anything. You turned him into that. I told your dumb ass to read the goddamn instructions. I don't even like the little bastard. Why should I help him? I already got my flight tickets for me, John John and Bebe to get up out of here. Breaking news. The big roach has stepped and destroyed Bikini Bottom National Airport. Anyone who has purchased any recent plane tickets are screwed. Well... I guess that goes my plan. All right, so I was thinking we can go back to the kid and see if he knows the way to reverse the enlargement. Let's go. Sorry, all sales are final. No refunds. We ain't here for no refund. We're here because the big roast destroying the city. Oh yeah, that was a little friend, right? You didn't read the instructions? Exactly. No, they didn't read the instructions. Sick. You guys are cool. We should hang out soon. Uh, anyways, 
Is there a way to reverse the effect on Larry? No. Oh, wait. Yeah, there is. This right here. I knew he was a crackhead. Nah, it's an antidote. Stab him with it and he'll shrink. Easy as pie. Sell it to you for a thousand bucks. A thousand bucks? I just gave you a stack this morning. Why are you pressing for another one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Money talks, bullshit walks. I know I'm 15, but I'm not an idiot. You buying it or not? You heard the kid. He 15, but he wasn't born yesterday. <laughs> Pay him his money. Fucking hate kid. Damn. I gotta go back to teaching classes more. Okay, he's over there. All we gotta do is get his attention and shank his ass with this. Let me stab. I always wanted to stab that big ass bastard. Okay, here you go. I'm gonna grab his attention. Hey, Larry, bring your disgusting stuck ass over here. You ain't got no holes in your wiener small. <laughs> that ought to get his attention. Did he? Did he grow more from last time we saw him? It appears that way, Sketchy. It appears that way. Sketchy! Oh no! Larry, spit him out! Spit him out, Larry! Bad Larry! <laughs> I'm back, baby! <laughs> you can't kill a real G. Sketchy! You're a liar! How did you do that? I stabbed him with the antidote from the inside. Ain't nothing to it. Denzel Washington ain't got shit on me. Thank God! I thought you were done for. I can't carry this show on my own. What's Batman without his Robin? <laughs> I'm not no fucking Robin. k sketchy. You know you gotta save me. I know you two could do it. It's good to have you back, Larry. You like our Alfred. <laughs> Alfred? The hell this nigga talking about, Sketchy? I don't know. Let's go before the cops come. I can go for a slice of pizza and lacrosse. You drink lacrosse, Sketchy? Man, this nigga crazy. <laughs> Didn't shoot him, officer. He ran into my bullet. It was self-defense. You can't prove nothing. You crazy. Oh, let me get a triple deluxe combo with baked biscuits. So I order hash brown smothered in gravy. Yeah. Let me go ahead and get a, I guess, a zero sugar cola. My doctor said I gotta cut out the sugar or I'ma lose my foot. Yeah, baby. You know they call me Big Larry. <laughs> I may be short in size, but I make up for it somewhere else. <laughs> oh, oh damn! Somebody breaking into the crib. I got the right tool for that. Come on, busy. There's trouble lurking. Kmore, Kmore, wake up! Oh, Sketchy, man, what time is it? I got class to teach in the morning. Hey, you ain't gonna have no class to teach in the morning. Somebody robbing the house downstairs. Come on, grab some. We gotta show this fool he robbing the wrong house. Oh, okay. Let's go. Show him. k more. why the hell did you bring a pillow? You told me to grab something, Sketchy. Is this not something? <laughs> How you planning on fighting somebody with a pillow? Oh, you looking at the 10 time pillow chimp here. I took a class master in the fine also pillow taekwondo. I got my black belt and everything. Trust me, Skits. Man, whatever. Let's go. Hey, whoever you are, y'all came to the wrong house. I got my nine and I ain't afraid to shoot it. Yeah, and I got a pillow. Don't think this shit's sweet. This pillow would knock your two front teeth out. Give your ass a high dental bill. Your dentist gonna thank me. Uh, Sketchy? I don't see nobody. No, no, no. I heard something. Someone's in here. I knew it. Well, do you see anybody? Because I sure don't. Hiya, boy. -o. Sketchy! I think you killed him. Nah, nah. It was a gun. The gun did it. Guns don't kill people, Sketchy. People kill people. Walk into the light, little buddy. It's okay. Oh, boy. -o. I think this is the end for the old me. I sure I'm going to miss a lot of you. Okay, more the brain size of a walnut. And Sketchy, the angry one who looks like Kodak Black. I love you too, so, so much. <laughs> Damn, those were some interesting last words. Asshole. Yeah, why do you have to say some bad characteristics about us? I do not look like Kodak Black. He wish he looked like me. Yeah, yeah. And my brain isn't the size of a walnut. Size of a strawberry, at least. <laughs> ah! What the? 
How did you do that? I thought Sketchy killed you. Yeah, I shot you dead in your chest. You shouldn't be breathing right now. I'm a leprechaun, boyo. I'm magic. Oh, uh, Sketchy? Wasn't the last time we saw him we was hallucinating from carbon monoxide? We almost died that time, right? I thought you fixed it. And I did fix it. Cost my ass two stacks. I got a carbon monoxide detector and everything. I don't know why the hell we can see him again. Because I'm a leprechaun, boyos. Not a hallucination. The carbon monoxide was just a coincidence. The chance was just unbelievable. Oh, damn. That's ironic. Hmm. Well, if that's the case, I think we got some unfinished business to take care of. Make with the loot, leprechaun, or y'all ain't gonna get shot again. <laughs> Kmo, what are you doing? He promised us riches and bitches, Sketchy. And I wanna collect. You better start making the gold, or your ass gonna walk with a limp like a pimp. No, Kmo. I mean, what are you doing? I already shot him. He can't die. You just wasted my bullets. Now give me my gun back. It's okay, boyos. That's why I'm here. It's about the gold. Are you gonna give us the gold? Because, I mean, I could use that guap. <laughs> yes, the guap you refer to. I can get us the guap, boyos. We can split it three ways. And then we can get the beaches. So many beaches. We're both taking man. Lepra. We kinda don't need the beaches anymore. Taken? What has this happened? Well, I got married season three, episode 16. Sketchy star dating Bebe in season two, episode three. Wow. I never would have thought the two of you could pull girls without money. More bitches for me. Yeah? Man, it works for me. As long as we get that gold, we can go in the morning. No, um, we can only go at night. This night, to be more specific. Why night, Leprechaun? I got class tomorrow. I can't just go out for an adventure right now. I don't even got a shirt on. My nipples are cold. No problem at all. What up? Oh my god! I feel violated. Why well, I feel like you just touched me in some specific places. Oh, I did. I was curious about your girth. Sketchy, boyo, would you like me to dress you? Man, hell no. I'm gonna go upstairs and change my damn self. Turn down this street. This spot is at the end of the block. Here we are, the boyos. The gold is inside. Man, this is a trap house. Why the hell of a pot of a gold will be here? Trust the process, boyos. It's in there. All you have to do is go inside and get it. Nope. Man, we're getting out of here. Let's go, K-more. Wait, Sketchy. Let's hit this out real quick. It is out? This is a trap house, k -more. They will kill us if we go in there. Trust me, Sketch. Just follow my lead. We can do this. All right. But if the situation gets sticky, I'm leaving you here. Deal. <laughs> now let's go. Hey, yo. What you want? Uh, um, hi. My name is k -more. This is my friend, Sketchy. Okay. Hi, k -more and Sketchy. What you want? Uh, we're here to, uh, um, we're here to buy drugs. What? Yes. Well, we are here to buy your finest drugs. <laughs> I'm a friend, and I need them drugs. All right, come in. Follow me to meet the king, Finn. Hey, man, what the hell are you doing? I just got out of jail. I can't go back here buying drugs. Are you stupid? Relax, Sketchy. We're not going to buy any drugs. We're going to walk up in there. The leprechaun going to snoop around, find the gold, and we'll get out of here. This don't sound like a good idea. If we get caught, I'll take the blame, all right? All right, fine. <laughs> Let's go. Sketchy? What? Who's the King Fiend? I never heard of him. Oh, the King Fiend is some low time drug lord. Nothing compared to what me or Squar Fiend were. But he is ranking up fast. I heard he's ruthless. I'm glad I got out of the game when I did. Hate to have him on my bad side. Well, well, well. If it isn't Scotchy, you make waves around, my friend. It's an honor to meet you. What do I owe the pleasure? Uh, Mr. King Fiend, sir. We heard about drugs from you. <laughs> Oh, is that right? You back in the game, Sketchy? No, absolutely not. My friend here is feeling experimental, so I brought him here. I heard you got the good stuff. Experimental, huh? I like that. We just got a new shipment of today with these new drugs. They're called Halo. Halo? Like the Xbox game? <laughs> What's Halo? Thought you'd never ask. It's a hallucination drug. Gives the heart an extra 50 beats. Dilates your pupils. That sounds crazy. I guess we came to the right place to buy it. Right, Sketchy? Uh. Sure, yeah. We'll just buy some Halo, King Finn. Some Halo. Okay, okay. Let me go get that for you boys real quick. Be right back. You can't buy this stuff, K-more. Far as I know, the feds why you not sad. What's taking a leprechaun so long? Hell, yeah, I don't know. Let me try calling him. Hold on. Leprechaun, where you at? We're running out of time down here. I found it, boyo. I found the gold. It's so shiny. 
We're rich, boyos. We're rich. He has this, Kenzie. He got to go. Yes. We're rich, K more. Meet me outside. I'll be outside by the car with the gun. Okay. Let's get out of here, Sketch. We're clear. All right. Let's go before the King fan get back. Oh, so soon. What's the rush? Uh, we were just coming to find you, uh, cause, uh, cause we, uh, we realized, King Finn, that we forgot our money at home. So we can't buy any Halo right now. <laughs> Maybe another time. Yeah, uh, uh, another time. Don't be ridiculous, boys. These are on the house. Sketchy right here is an icon of the drug game. It'll be an honor to give him and his friend here a free taste. Oh, uh, well, that's very nice, King Finn. Thank you. Anytime. Take them. Right now. Oh, uh, what? We'll take them right now, King Finn, but uh, we gotta drive home. And I like to take the drugs at home, and you know, in my room with some candles lit, listening to Barry White. I like listening to Lady Gaga. <laughs> take them now, so I know that you guys aren't feds. Me? A fed? Come on, King Finn. I'm the sketch dog. It's all love sketchy, but it's a little suspicious you just got out of prison and came around here looking for experimental drugs. Ain't no way you'll come in here. You have to be a moron. So, Take these drugs, or I have you shot. You hear that, K-Moore? A real moron. Fine, we'll take them. Sketchy, I'm scared. I don't want to do this right now. Shut up and just do it. You got us in this mess? Either you get high or you get shot. And I don't know about you, but I don't want to get shot. Pleasure doing business with you, boys. I hope to be hearing from you soon. Sketchy, I don't, I don't feel, feel so good. good. Me neither. I feel, I feel weird. weird. Man, where's this leprechaun? I don't, I don't see, him. see him. Me neither. Let me, Let me try calling call him. him. Look, Look Sketch. I got, I got a marshmallow. Hmm. <laughs> tasty. No way. I want a marshmallow. Man, how we get home? home? Where are we? Whoa, Whoa Sketch. You seeing all this? This is scary. Yeah. yeah. Feel like, like I'm traveling through, through time and space. <laughs> I wish this would never end. Sketch. Sketch. I'm flying. I'm flying! Me too! I'm flying! Man, how do I get down? I don't know! But I don't wanna get down! <laughs> Sketchy, Kaibo, what happened to y'all? Why y'all down here? Did you eat my snacks? Uh, my head! Came up! And what happened last night? I don't know. I think I gotta, I think I gotta throw up. Man, watch you throw up gonna make me throw up. Oh God. Man, how do we get home? Was the leprechaun real? Did we hallucinate again? Biscuits, do we have a carbon monoxide leak? How do you feel? No, we don't have no carbon monoxide leak. The detective would have went off. What happened to you two? And how do I feel? I feel pretty damn pissed off the two of you ate my snacks. I just bought that box of ho-hos just today. Now what am I gonna eat between my breakfast and brunch? Ugh. Wait, if there wasn't no leak, then that means the leprechaun was real. It means we got to go. Call him up, K-Moore. All right, <laughs> I can't wait. Wait a minute, I can't find my phone. Biscuit, baby, can you call me? Oh, that's right, I ate it. <laughs> damn. That drug is crazy. So how do we get in touch with him about to go? Biscuits, did you happen to see a leprechaun here at all? I don't know what the hell a leprechaun is, Sketchy. Is that something you put on fries? Oh, but there is a door here. It was taped, from, it was taped on the front door. Here. Dead boy, yo. What happened last night was 100% real. We found the gold. I bet you're wondering, where am I and where have I taken it? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, but I didn't need to use the money, money to pay back long shots. They're going, They're going to cut off my thumbs. thumbs. I, knew I knew you would help me out, out. so that's why I come to you. I hope there is no hard feelings. But at least you two learned something. Don't trust complete strangers. Bye-bye. Sincerely, Frank. That lying little... Damn it! What is the no say, Sketchy? Man here! Oh, man, what the... Closer to the left. Man, what you talking about, man? I put it exactly where you told me to. No, your ass didn't. Because if you did, it would have been closer to the left. Damn. Boy, this ice cream good as hell. Hey, where the hell you get some ice cream from? From the ice cream truck. Duh. Hey, I want some ice cream. 
Damn! Hey, Sketchy. Huh? You mind if I have a bottle of your ice cream? Man, hell no. Get your own ice cream. Oh, that's right. The ice cream truck gone. <laughs> Come on, Sketchy, please. Just one bite. One bite. Please, Sketchy. I'll be your best, 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 best friend. Nah, I'm all right. All right, how about this? I will give you $5 right now for a bite of ice cream. Mmm, nah, I'm good. This ice cream too good to trade it for money. How about, uh, damn, what about my pinball machine? Nope. Uh, my comic book collection? Nope. What about my half-eaten birthday cake that's still left in the fridge? Ah, damn, here, here you go. Sick of your ass. <laughs> Thank you, Skits. Mmm. Oh, man, this ice cream is so good. Oh. Oh, oh. Ah! Ah! Damn! My toast! Ah! Man, what the hell wrong with you? And you dropped my ice cream in the sand. Oh, my tooth hurt. Every time I eat something or drink that's cold, this shit just aggravates. Well, damn. You might have a cavity. Hell yeah, man. You need to get that checked out. When's the last time you went to the dentist, K-Moore? Mmm. <laughs> the, the, the dentist? Uh, I'm actually scared of the dentist, uh, Skitty. You a grown-ass man, K-Moore. Ain't no way you should be scared of going to the damn dentist. Well, that's easy for you to say. I believe the dentist will track your tooth so they can bury it and grow a clone version of you. Then make an army of clones just to rule the world. And one day the dentists will be announced the kings of the planet. See, I'm on to that ass. You are crazy, k -Moore. Ain't no damn way the dentists plotting on all of that. Get in the car. I'm taking you to the dentist my damn self. No! Woo! Woo! k -Moore, bring your ass back here! No! You're not getting me alive! <laughs> Man, he sure don't like the dentist, does he? <laughs> well, I guess I eat this ice cream all by myself. Stupid fishies. K-more, you acting like a baby. Just hop in the car so I can go get your tooth fixed. No, Sketchy. I never go to the dentist. Not over my dead body. No. Damn, this bastard the fastest shit. How the hell y'all run a boat? Little scary ass. Where's my Gatorade? A Red Bull, a monster, anything. Some Adderall rope too. Damn, I'm tired of hell. All right, K-Moore, I'm done playing cat and mouse with your ass. Get your ass in the car. No, I'll never be cloned by evil Dennis. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Where am I? What's going on? Why am I tied up? Thirsty. You at the dentist, and they're gonna get their tooth checked out. Please, Sketchy, let me go. Please. Sketchy, I'll give you so much money. And matter of fact, I'll even kick Larry out the house if you want me to. Just as long as you let me go, please. No, now shut up. If you be good, I'll take you for ice cream. Uh, oh, ice cream. <laughs> okay, you got a deal. I love me some damn ice cream. <clears throat> uh, K-more? Sketchy? Man, wait a minute. Don't I know you from somewhere? Hmm? Oh, no. Nah, this is the first time we ever met. Come on in. All right, Camor, uh, when was the last time you've been to the dentist? Never! I know your plan. You want to take out my tooth to make some clones of me so you can have an arm and take over the world. Oh. All right. I'm sorry I asked. Anyways, Camor, it looks like you have a cavity. See? I told you. It's just a cavity, k -more. Yeah, it's just a cavity, k -more. So all I have to do is just fill in the cavity so the two of you can leave my office and, you know, just never come back. Cool. I'm going to wait in the waiting room. Uh, Doc, can you untie me? Uh, no. Sketchy said you might stab me if I do. So, uh, I'm going to leave that rope on you for now. Oh, that's Sketchy. <laughs> Always two steps ahead of me. Doc, what is that? Relax, relax, Camor. It's just anesthetic. It's just to calm the nerves. Uh, oh, sounds great. Shoot me up, Doc. I guess what? I didn't say it was for you. Pop some molly before y'all came in here. I gotta calm my nerves down real quick. So, Doc, how did it go? It went very well. Come on, Camor. Let's go get some more ice cream. You've been a good boy today. Oh, man. Can I have a double scoop? We'll see about that, buddy. We'll see. <laughs> One tooth down, a few more to go. 
Mm-hmm. I'll be seeing you around, Kmor. They're gonna make me them clones. <laughs> you do me a favor there bruv i need you to find out everything you know about charles the shock i want to be the top dog now for kitty bomb i'll do you this favor king fan you see but when a time comes i'm gonna need a favor see that boy kmore see oh that bloody kmore that's the wonka sketchy pal in it what a show what bidders you have with him eh <laughs> Yep, yep, yep! Man, so glad to be off work. I wonder what's in this refrigerator. Still don't got nothing. Came on, when the last time we went grocery shopping? Came on! La da 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 da! Came on, what you over here doing? What you writing? Oh, sketch! <laughs> I'm just writing in my book. You? Writing a book? Oh, uh, yeah! <laughs> I always write books. Since when? Uh, since forever. I got four books already. Oh, you got four books? Mm, you probably ain't even that good. Let me see that one. <laughs> All right, Sketch. But just know, I'm an artist and I'm sensitive about my work. Man, be quiet. Man, wait a minute. This is actually good, k <laughs> You really think so, Sketch? Man, yeah. This is amazing. Wow. K-more, you ever thought about going publish? Uh, no. <laughs> I mean, I just like writing this for myself. K-more, no. This is good. Like, I never really give you compliments, but this is really good. I mean, I think you can make some good money off of this stuff right here. You think so, Sketch? I know so. Better yet, I can be your manager. <laughs> what? You could be my manager, Sketch? Of course. Now, first things first. Let's go ahead and make this public. I know the perfect guy. I'm going to go ahead and give him a call. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm about to have my own book published. Damn. Hey, Kmore. Good talking to you, too. <laughs> Sketchy, who was that? Oh, that was my plug about your book. Turns out you really is about to be a published author, Kmore. <laughs> and I'm going to have a lot of money. Sketchy, how do you even know this guy? I mean, I met him through a plug of a plug. Pretty much me selling weed to a customer and it happens to just be his cousin. <laughs> I love selling drugs. So many relationships you can have. Sketch! Sketch! You gotta be seeing this! My book is number one on Amazon! Oh my god! Man, I'm so proud of you! Boy, you've been making me a lot of money. I mean, you've been making us a lot of money, boy! Man, this is crazy. Yeah, I know, right, Sketch? Number one on Amazon, Kindle, Audible. Oh my god, this is amazing! It's like a dream. Yeah, wait a minute, hold on, I'm getting a call. Uh-huh, uh-huh, what? Okay, 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 cool, 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 cool. See you then. k you won't believe who that was. Who? Fish Lee. Fish Lee? The biggest director in the world? Uh-huh. What could he possibly want with us? I don't know, but we about to find out. Let's go. Look, man, I want to let you know right now, the book is great. Everything about it, I love it, it's a hit, it's a hit maker. So, I come from here to present to you guys, I want to make a movie about your book. Simple and plain. Wait a minute! Oh my gosh! You want to make a movie out of my book? Yeah, I think it's hot, it's good, it's everything that we need, baby. Well, that man talking fast as hell. Uh, yeah, I, I think that's great. <clears throat> uh, who are you? I'm sketchy, I'm his, uh, I'm his manager. Oh, okay, cool. Look, man. We love this guy. We need him to be the co-producer on this movie right here. How about that? Is that cool with you? Your book, your movie, and your co-producer. Oh my God, Sketch! I'm loving this! k more. let me talk to you real quick. Man, I like it. There ain't no benefits for me. What do you want? Tell him. Gotcha. Excuse me, Fish Lee. I love all of that under one condition. If my guy right here could star in the movie. Uh, okay, that's cool. Love it. You got it, baby. It's a movie. It's happening. Let's go. Let's do it. Oh my gosh, my book is really being turned into a movie. Amazing. And I'm going to be the star. Man, first day on set. I can't believe I'm actually in a movie. This is amazing. 
gonna be some type of big star. Girls already all over me, so <laughs> they won't be no different. Sketchy, you ready? Oh yeah, K Moy. <laughs> Where's my trailer? Right up in there. Break a leg, buddy. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Do they only say that in plays? Do they say it in movies too? I don't know. <laughs> oh well, break two legs. <laughs> break a fin. Damn. Now I'm confused. Break a leg, break a, break a fin? Never mind. Man, look at this trailer. This thing is dope. Got his own candy up in here. Bathroom. Let me see. There we go. Needed a little bit of weed up in here. Wait a minute. Where are all my clothes at? We're shooting about five minutes. Hey man, glad you're here. None of my clothes are here. Do you know what I'm supposed to wear? Uh, what you're wearing right now looks fine to me. What you mean, this tank top? Yeah. What about my hair? I don't got no makeup artist, no nothing. You look just like the character. Were you not there for the meeting? Uh, yeah, I guess. All right, now get your ass ready for shooting. Let's go. Okay. Mm. Oh, I get it. I mean, I guess they want me, you know, to be very authentic and everybody else gonna be in makeup and everything like that. <laughs> Right, I understand. Sir, why are you still here? Let's go, time is money. Shut up, I was having an inner thought with myself. Everybody quiet on set, I'm ready to work. All right, K. Moore, you the producer, call it. Sketch, everybody on set, let's go. <laughs> Magic is about to happen. Thank you, K. Moore. All right, baby, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. Man, wait a minute, this looks just like my, my plug house. Where there goes a hole in the roof, the gunshots, Actor, walk in now! Wait a minute, is that, is that Scarfin? In action! Sketch, say the line! What's up, big drug dealer? You, how long, hey, k more cut! Hey man, you don't yell cut, I yell cut. Cut! Cut! What's up, Sketch? Hey man, why is this so close to my life? Oh, uh, because it is. <laughs> Why the hell you write about my life, K-Moore? I did it for inspiration, Sketch. You know, since I moved in with you, I've just been wanting to write about our life and just everything that we've been doing and everything that you've been telling me and sharing with me. What else did you write in that book? Oh, all kinds of stuff. You know, the big drug deal you did when you had- Shut, 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 shut up! Man, what the hell you do that for? I mean, I said you was an inspiration to me, Sketch. <laughs> Look. You funny as hell. I can't wait till we get this story when you had made the other drug deal and then you had lost all that money and then you had hid it and got it away. <laughs> shut, shut your ass up, K-Moore. We can't do this. You gonna make me go to jail. No, you are not. These are characters playing. What's the worst that could happen? Now, I do have this other scene that maybe we can do. Okay, and you sure it's safe? Yeah, it's good. It's not like you are gonna be selling drugs or anything. Okay, I can do that. Cool. All right, get ready. All right, everybody back. Back in your places, back in your places, back in your places. Man, wait a minute. This look like the house. All right, act is in place. K-more, call it. Action, walk up to the door. <laughs> Action. Hey, yo, is there a shady here? Sketch, go walk up to the door. Uh, who is it? Hey, man, is there a shady here? Sketch, open the door. And then when you do that, reach in your pocket. Yo, man, what up, Shady? I know you got what I need. Uh, yeah, I got what you need. Man, I appreciate that. That's that good one. Cut! Hey, man, how many times I gotta tell you? You don't yell cut, I yell cut. Cut! What up, Skits? Man, K-More, bro, we gotta change this or I ain't gonna do this movie. You not liking the direction that we going? I thought it was true to the streets, you know? Like you. Man, I'm just trying to get up out the hood. I ain't no really street dude. Plus, you're trying to make me go to jail again, and I told you I ain't never going back there again. Still kind of sore from what happened. Oh, get please. Too much information. Man, I ain't talking about that. I'm talking about how I used to have to stay up all night. Hurt my head one day. Yeah, okay. <laughs> but okay, Sketch. I consider what it is that you're saying. So how do you think we should change the mood? Uh, okay. I got the perfect idea. Sketch, you are a genius. This thing went number one. Oh my God. That was a good idea to make you a rap star, Sketch. Yeah, I know, man. You know, I just didn't want all my business being out there like that, k -more. But this lifestyle right here, this the real me. You know, I'm a real rapper, you know? Really? You should have really went for it, Sketch. I think you could have been a huge star. It's all good, because <laughs> I got all this money now. <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you, man. Them kids up in that hospital are going to be real happy about this. <laughs> Would you 
What you talking about, kids in the hospital? Oh, yeah. I donated all five million dollars to the kids that we got off the move. You did what? I thought they would've had a seaweed deluxe here. I forget I ain't at the Krusty Krab. Uh, is it a reason why you looking at me all so angry for, baby? Yeah, you been out of jail three weeks, six days, seven hours, and 26 seconds, and it's the first place you taking me? I mean, sketchy, I was holding it down while you was gone. What's up? I mean, baby, I ain't mean to put our relationship on hold. I mean, I just got busy. You acting like I neglected my wife or something. Damn. How am I acting like a neglected wife when I ain't even a wife? Hey, how's it going? Are you guys ready to order? The special today is fried seaweed soup. Okay. Uh, I see y'all plate is already full. <laughs> I'm going to come back later. Damn. Baby, you, you want to get married or something? I mean, where's all this coming from? I mean, I don't know, but I do need some stability, Sketchy. And you ain't been showing me that lately. Woo, there they go that word again, stability. <laughs> I ain't never had that. And I don't know if I'm ready for it. I mean, where you see yourself at in the next 10 years? Do you even see me in your future? 10 years? Damn. Uh, I mean, I guess doing the same thing I'm doing now. Chilling at the crib, chilling with K-More, smoking a blunt or two. You know, same old, same old. And I mean, as far as you being in my future, hell, I'd love for you to be in my future. I mean, but marriage, I don't know, baby. That's, that's just, that's a whole different level. <laughs> I want more than this life, Sketchy. And if you can't handle that, <laughs> just give me back my mama house key. Damn, baby, I just got your mama house. Baby! Damn! Uh, Alright, my manager said y'all gotta order some or y'all gotta get to all ass out. This is the place of business. Oh, damn. What a long face, Sketchy. <laughs> Did she break up with your ass or something? Oh, you must need a few more minutes. Let me go tell my manager mind his own damn business. <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> oh damn sketchy you smell like ass and fish <laughs> and you are fish would you like some coffee uh yes please thank you with an extra shot of espresso so um have you talked to baby recently you know, uh, since the argument that y'all had? Man, I tried, but every time I do, she send me straight to voicemail. And she ain't even been responding to my text messages. Look! Oh, damn! This is bad. Straight blue messages. <laughs> Boy, y'all had been going crazy. <laughs> so, what you gonna do? Man, I don't know. She just real mad at me. Hey, k -more, what you and Biscuits do when y'all have an argument? Oh, <laughs> that's easy. Whenever I make my queen mad, I always ride down to the Krusty Krab and get her one of everything on the menu. Turns her frown upside down. Then we have sex, eat some more. Next thing you know, things are back to how they are. <laughs> but I don't think Baby would like one of everything on the menu from Krusty Krab. So I don't know, Sketchy. Have you given a thought to just marrying the damn girl? Ugh, man. Hearing that word make my flesh crawl. I don't know. My pops never married my mom. Shit, he left. Marriage ain't that bad, Sketchy. You go to sleep with your woman, wake up with your woman, eat all the meals of the day with your woman, go to Target runs with your woman. You get the privilege of always having a partner with you that you love and respect. <laughs> like Batman and Superman. What? Batman hated Superman, k -Mo. What are you talking about? He always kept kryptonite in order to kill Superman because he fully believed Superman would have turned bad. Hmm. Yeah, that's true. Okay, we're like Batman and Wonder Woman. They work together, but had a chemistry where you know when given the chance, they fucking. <laughs> Man, I don't know, k -Moore. Wouldn't it be a lot of people in the same house? I mean, me, you, Bebe, Jun Jun, Biscuits, Larry, Ugly Ass. It would get kind of crowded. Biscuits been living here practically three seasons already. And we only see her big ass when she's part of a story or when it's funny. <laughs> And it's a cartoon. The animator can make another room out of nowhere and the audience is just gonna go with it. Eh, you're right. We could be like a ghetto Brady Bunch. <laughs> Doesn't sound so bad now. There you go, boy. Now finish that coffee. Go shave. And for God's sake, take a shower. Your ass stink. How the hell you gonna smell like a fish and you is a fish? <laughs> Man, you're right, K-More. Let me go do that real quick. K-More, where you see yourself in 10 years? In 10 years? Yeah. Baby asked me the same question. And I'm just curious to what you think. Hmm. Well, in 10 years, I see myself building a school. 
having some babies with biscuits, maturing as I do so every day. <laughs> so you don't plan on being here with me? No, Sketchy. <laughs> you crazy? Look, don't get me wrong. I love this place, and I love you like a brother I never had. But as time goes on, we'll both have different lives. We'll both be pursuing our lives. But it doesn't mean we can't continue our brothership. We'll always be brothers, Sketchy, to the day you die. <laughs> I say you because I strongly believe your ass is going to die before me. You may be right about that. I love you, K-Moore. You ain't as annoying as you were in the first episode. You're surprisingly very wise today. Huh, that's because I took that Addis last night. Spent a whole night reading on Aristotle. I'm teaching a class about his philosophies next week. Who is Aristotle? A philosopher who specializes in love. Philia, to be more specific. Oh, right. You're stupid. Philia means brotherly love. He specializes in brotherly love, Sketchy. He strongly believes you cannot attain such love or friendship without first achieving self-love. Love yourself, Sketchy. Love yourself, you. Love yourself, Kmore. Yes. Love. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna go take a shower. This was, this was something, Kmore. All right, Sketchy. Go wash your ass. Then we can figure out a plan on how to win your woman back. <laughs> Damn that boy stunk. Hey, man, Kmo, what are you doing here? We're here to buy something nice and romantic for your woman, jackass. That's the first step to making up. <laughs> You're such an idiot. Uh, okay. So what's step two? You don't know when you get there, Sketchy. First, let's get past step one. Welcome back, boy. My two favorite fish in the sea. <laughs> what can I do for you two? Oh, um, we're looking for a gift here for my friend's lady. You know, he kind of fucked up. <laughs> oh, yeah. His ass got dumped at my other job. We do sell a bouquet of roses here for $30. $30? That's outrageous. Stop being cheap, Sketchy. We'll take it, Mr. Cashier. What else you got? Hmm. Okay. We also got this big hearted shape of toxic like the chill for 50 Yep, add that to the cart. What else? Okay, I see y'all rich niggas trying to clean house. We do have this diamond ring here. Only 10 k 10 k Oh, hell no. Nah. You smoking milk in here. Ain't no way I'm getting the ring for fucking 10 k No. Add it to the cart. You need it, Sketchy. I don't need no goddamn ring at 10K, k more. Are you insane? Relax, Sketchy. I'll buy it for you. Think of it as a, a wedding gift for me. <laughs> well, where you get all that money from? I got it from selling Bitcoin. I sold it before the value dropped by the thousands. <laughs> Morons. Get the ring, Sketchy. All right. We we'll added the ring, too. Damn. All right. There's one diamond ring added to the cart. We also selling this gold Rolex in case all niggas want to ride out with your day in style. Hmm. All right, K-Moore. Let's do this. All right, let's do it, buddy. <laughs> Good luck. What you want, Sketchy? Shh. I'm here because I had a lot to think about doing our breakup. You have been a huge part of my life, and I do see you being in it forever. One day I want to have kids and grandkids grow old together to the day I die. I say I because k has made me believe I'm going to die before everybody I know. So, anyways... Would you do me the honor in giving me your hand and- Hold up. What the hell you think you doing, Sketchy? I'm proposing to you. Just like you wanted me to. I didn't want to be proposed to now, Sketchy. Especially not after I break up with you. Realizing you don't want me in your little funky ass future. Then what do you want? I'm trying to fix what we- Hold on. K-Moy, you can turn off the boombox. This conversation ain't going how we planned. Oh, damn. <laughs> Sorry. Anyways. I'm just trying to fix what we had. Look, all I wanted to do was see if whenever you thought of your future, if I was in it. I want to know I have stability. Or if I'm just wasting my time with another thug, how I wasted my time with Tyrone. I gave up 10 years of my life hoping that man would change for nothing. Oh, now I see. See, now that you explain it that way, it makes a lot more sense. <laughs> I just want to know you'll always be my baby. And I'ma always be your baby. Hi. Yeah. <laughs> Always, girl. We always gonna be together. We like uh, Batman and Wonder Woman. Batman and Wonder Woman? They barely had chemistry. And when they did, it was just mostly Batman being afraid to lay a pipe to him. Now, we boy like Batman and Catwoman. Or maybe Batman and Talia. His baby mama Talia or whatever her name is. But you know what I'm saying. <laughs> we got chemistry, baby. <laughs> Damn, there's a lot of shit I don't know about Batman. So what about getting married then? We gonna get married one day for sure. I'm tying that ass down. But not until we both ready. And plus, Biscuits told me k sometimes sleepwalk naked in the house. So I'm not in a rush to move in right now, honey. 
I don't want to see nobody balls dangling. Well, damn, all right. I guess everything is cool now, huh? No, not yet. I mean, the best thing about making up is having sex. Get your sexy ass in here. Oh, all right. <laughs> Came on, I'm going to see your ass later. <laughs> Peace out. Come on, baby. I missed you. Wait, you have the car keys. <sighs> oh, well. Guess I'll just walk home at night in the ghetto. <laughs> I hope nobody robs me. Shit. I'm scared. <laughs> All right, boys. Today is the day we come out of the shadows and take what's rightfully ours. Thanks to Jim and his walk, we now know the secret entrance to Scarfin's mansion. Today is the day we storm and take out Charles the Shark. Shh, be quiet, Sketchy. The election on. Oh yeah, question. What do you guys do about the gas prices in Bikini Bottom? Oh, well, if I'm elected, I'll bring them down and make transportation most affordable. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's not that simple. Because of the decrease of the gas, the price must remain the same, if not go up even further. Bro, it's like all these dudes sound exactly the same. <laughs> the voice act ain't even trying no damn more. Man, be quiet. It's only one dude that's talking for me and you and everybody on this show. He doing the best he can. Uh Water fair. Those are not true. There's never been any proof. I would never cheat on my beautiful wife. But according to eyewitnesses, you were said to have been in the pocket of Clarence Butterscotch, right? He blackmailed you into working for him. Isn't that true? Hell yeah, that's true. He better say it is too. I don't know what you're talking about. Clarence Butterscotch is a menace to society. He shouldn't have been let out of jail. And the rumors of me working for him are just rumors started from the media. Yeah, question for Bob Fisherman. If you were elected, what would you do about the jails being overstocked with prisoners? Oh, I would build another prison with my own two fans if I had to, so they can continue to get bad people off the streets. And what money would you use to fund this? The taxpayers? We gotta do something about the mayor. I don't like his ass. Man, just let it go. I just got a jail. I'm not trying to get back into any more dilemmas anytime soon. Your baby baby, I promise you. Daddy will be home real soon, okay? I just gotta handle some business real quick and I'll be home in ASAP. All right. Hey, yo, what? Yo, what are you doing here? Get out of my chair. Calm your tits, bloody mate. Don't be scared. Relax. I'm a friend. Oh, you a mess with the wrong shark. Security. Boys? <laughs> your security is dead. We wipe those boys out like flies. Boys? Now drop your gun. <laughs> What an outrage. We almost lost that damn debate. Me being tied with Clarence Butterscotch is a huge problem. I'm aware if the reporters get Clarence's side of the story, the truth will indeed come out and I'll lose this election. Hmm, I have an idea. I must have Clarence assassinated before his part of the story comes out. But wouldn't it be easier to assassinate Bob Fisherman? No, I've tried having him whacked before. Didn't work. Now Bob has security surrounding his house at all times. Clarence has got to die. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, damn, it's harder than being tied up in Biscuit's ass out here. Shit. Yeah, I don't know about being in Biscuit's ass, but it's definitely hot. It got a lot to do with the pollution. I feel like we had this conversation before, Sketch. Yeah, we have. Pollution can never end if people continue to litter and shit. So did you like the Morbius move or the Batman move? Man, Batman was trash. <gasps> Oh my god, I think so too, Sketchy! But I don't know why everybody clowning Morbius. I love that damn movie. People just dick riders. <laughs> it's just three hours of boringness. I hated it. But I did love that cat woman with her fine ass. Ooh, boy, you ain't lying about that. <laughs> Lock to the dog. Got a package delivery for Kaymore. So, y'all still don't see how y'all sound alike. Come on, Sketchy. That joke getting old. We don't sound none alike at all. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you a dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll see y'all boys later. I gotta go to my temp job where well, they be beating my ass. <laughs> don't even ask. Hey, what's in the package? See, I don't know. It's too small to be a jacuzzi I order. Go ahead and open it. Oh, okay. Guilty? What the? What the hell does this mean? And what am I guilty of? What did I do? This is giving a whole lot of I know what you did last summer vibes. I don't like that. I'm just glad it's you and not me. Oh, man, we gotta figure out where this came from, Sketchy. Come on, I need your help. I got your ass out of prison. Ah, shut up. Okay. 
Wait, it's the address. All right, we're gonna go to this place right here. Let's do it. Wait, man, I know this place. This is the same location that Sketchy you kidnapped us at. <gasps> you right, Sketchy, it is. <laughs> and it still smells like cigarettes and ass in here. Damn, you don't think they'll clean the place up. Damn, never thought we'll be back here. Yeah, me neither. And I never thought it'll still be smelling like ass. But hey, I guess we both wrong. This one I saw all them niggas on cocaine. Yeah! Uh, damn! I'm really focused right now, bitch! Kick his ass, k -more. Oh my god, this man's going crazy! Got a new cocaine to make him do that. k -more, how is your cocaine addition anyway? I don't know, I've been attending NA. It's a slow process, but it's working. <laughs> Whoa! Sketch, it's a picture of you! And it says it ended and began here. Uh-oh! I'm worried about what that could mean. Man, fuck this. Who the hell is this guy? The real little some shit? Yo, yo, please. Spare me my life, man. I got a kid, wife. Come on, man. I got a family. <laughs> Very amusing. I know everything about you, Bloody Mike. I know you got a wife, a kid. I know you originally moved to Bikini Bottom and wanted to be a dancer in the stars, but ended up working for Scarfett. Then working for Sketchy, and now you're doing your own thing. That's what's up. You had to glow up, I see. But now it's my turn, Charles the Shark. I'm on the come up. This is my city. I'm okay with that. You can have the throne, bro. In the business. Just don't kill me. I just want to go home and see my family. Hmm. You're surrendering. All right. Since you're not making it hard on yourself, I'll let you go. Besides, I don't want to leave your children fatherless. Get out of here. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, King Finn. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, it's just a, a reflex. Boys, send his wife flowers. <laughs> oh, I don't know why he ever trusts me. Dump the body somewhere. Oh, yeah. This feels just right. King of the city. My boy Charles, dog. I live in a business. <coughs> I didn't think this could happen to him. I should have been looking out for you, my guy. Now I'm thinking about your wife, your kids, and they're gonna miss their pops. I don't know how somehow I feel like this is all my fault. Sketchy, don't do that to yourself. Charles was a good guy. And he knew what would come with this business. Plus, you got out of drug game, Sketch. You shouldn't be so hard on yourself about this. I know K more, but I still run these streets. People know not to play with me. If I was there, this would have never happened to Sharp. It's all right, Sketch. All we gotta do is find out who did this to him. <laughs> Whoever did this to him, they gonna pay. What we gonna do, Sketch? Strap in, K more. Cause next season. It's gonna be our craziest season so far. Oh, you already know I'm ready. I love to hear that. They ain't fuck with the wrong sort. Strap up. It's time, my nigga. I just said strap. Shut up and strap up and let's go. I ain't ready for what's about to come. <laughs> uh, oh boy, y'all done woke up the wrong demon. Nigga, put that book down. You know your ass can't read. <laughs> you got a visitor. Every time nigga get in prison, they want to go ahead and convert to Islam. <laughs> no damn well, they don't want no shit about religion. But I like the boy. He trying his best. <laughs> Old ball head ass. Hello. What up, cuz? What you doing here? Ain't you the mayor? Yes, I am the mayor, cuz. But I have a proposition for you. I. I'm willing to make a deal for your freedom. If you're interested. I'm listening. Kill Sketchy. And his friend K Moore. She likes us with kind of car. You finna get the one that got two seats. You yeah, that's it. She likes us with kind of house. You finna get the one that got two jacuzzis. You yeah, that's it. <laughs> man, oh man, I love listening to Stokes in the morning. <laughs> <clears throat> Attention passengers, we are now approaching our final destination, Bikini Bottle, home of the Krabby Patty. 
also holds the Guinness World Records of convicts. So make sure you keep your wallets real close. <laughs> Hey, by any chance you know where I can find 435 Fish Drive? 435 Fish Drive? Yeah, that's my buddy Sketchy and Kmore's house. <laughs> you gonna go down this road, make a left on Hickory Street, go three blocks down till you reach the White Castle, then make a right, walk past the one and now entering the ghetto sign. <laughs> It'll be the second house to your right. Anything you can tell me about the guys living there? Oh, them boys are funny. <laughs> Sketchy is a repeated felon. That boy been in jail longer than Wesley Snipes. <laughs> And Kaymore, woo, something is wrong with that one. I think he doing some Stockholm Syndrome stuff to talking to a roach or something. Thanks. Here's a few bucks for your trouble. A few bucks? This is going straight to my Black Air Force Ones fund. <laughs> Thank you, little creepy stranger. Man, this is some trash. Pass the ball. No, no, come on. I don't even know why I play this stupid game. Go away! I said go away! I don't want what you selling. I don't want any Girl Scout cookies. I don't want someone trying to convert me into a high power. And I especially don't want to be served by any lawsuits. Ugh! Fine! Coming! What do you want? I'm looking for my pops. Pops? Uh oh. Look, if you one of my kids, I gotta let you know. Straight off the bat, I'm sorry for not being there for you for your whole life, but I'm gonna need to see the blood test first. Don't trip. I'm definitely not your kid. I'm K-More. K-More Jr. K-More Jr.? What the? Oh! K-More Jr.? You telling me you K-More, son? That's what I said, ain't it? I know I ain't stutter, so you gotta be either deaf or stupid. Whoa, 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 whoa. Listen, kid. I don't know who you think you talking to, but you gonna put some respect on me. Man, whatever. Can you get out of the way so I can come in? No, 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 no. You can wait out here a while. I'll call your pop so we can get all this figured out. That's if he really is your dad. <laughs> so where is he? He is out with his wife at an all-you-can-eat buffet. Man, you punch hard. My throat still hurts. Are you going to call him or are you just going to stand there and look stupid? Look, baby, personally, I love it when you eat. You know I love my woman nice and big, but I'm starting to worry about you. You're starting to sweat buckets in your sleep, and I don't know if that's something I should be concerned about. Baby, my doctor said as long as I can lay on my side, I should be good. And as long as I drink one cup of water a day, I won't dehydrate. So I'll be drinking my cup of water a day, baby. As long as I add five spoons of sugar, uh, some cinnamon in it, I'm good. If you say so, baby. Oh, it's sketchy. He must change his mind about bringing him some food. <laughs> I can't promise I won't eat his food on the way home, but I can promise I'll try not to. Hey, sketchy. What's up? Oh, nothing, k -more. Just wanted to call you and see how you were doing. Well, that's really nice of you, buddy. Honestly, today has been a stressful day. I had to teach a class about belly dancing, and at this age, sketchy, it ain't that easy. My body don't wobble like it used to. <laughs> how was your day? Mm. Well, it's been good. Got to watch the game. Then Baby came over and we got a little freaky. <laughs> then got to play some 2K. And oh yeah, let me think. I got punched in the throat by your younger freaking kid. My kid? What you talking about, Sketchy? Yeah, man. This kid came to the crib knocking on the door talking about he's K-Moore Jr. And he's looking for his pops. I told him to wait outside while I gave you a call. But he punched me in my throat. Just walked up here and now he's eating my Pop-Tarts. Are you messing with me, Sketchy? Who put you up this? Is it as the country doing punk again? <laughs> Man, I used to love that show. Hold on, K-More. Hey, kid, how old are you? 15. Where you from? Mississippi River. What's your mom's name? Debbie Macy. Okay, K-More. Based on the information I just learned, did you happen to hook up with a chick named Debbie Macy from Mississippi River about 15 years ago? Uh, uh hmm. Well, actually, now that you mention it, uh, uh-oh. Uh well, Sounds like you the pappy. I still recommend you get a blood test, K-More. Because let me tell you, child support is not cheap. How can we be sure it's your son? Well, actually, when a man and a woman has intimacy without protection, it can result in an unwanted pregnancy. Are you dumb? Hey! You ain't gonna talk to my wife like that. I'm sorry. 
Sorry that you were dropped on your head as a baby and don't understand how sex works. Oh boy, this got my attention now, Larry. I knew, right? What a way to start season five. Cable with a kid, any disrespecting biscuits. Oh yeah, this gonna be a good one. Where your mama at, Junior? I'm taking you back. I can't deal with this. This too much. She's dead. Oh, d dang. Kmore, you sound like a jerk now. <laughs> a big jerk. Come on, man. His mom's is dead. I'm gonna need everybody out the room. I need my moment with my son. Ugh, this sounds weird. Okay, Junior. This is the thing. I'm not dad material you here. Yeah, I know. You're kind of a moron. I'm gonna pretend like I ain't hear that. Look, I'm sorry about the mom. And even though I ain't ready to be a dad, it's only right that I let you stay here with us. Since I kind of missed out on your life. All right, cool. Give me 20 bucks. How do you ask? Give me 20 bucks now. Junior, you've got to say please. Please give me 20 bucks. Give me 20 bucks right now, please. You see? Now we're getting somewhere. <laughs> here you go, son. Bet. I'm out of here. I'll be back later. All right. Make sure you get back here before nine. Your ass got a curfew and we got to register you in school tomorrow. <laughs> Everything good in here, K-Moore? I got worried when I stopped hearing you yelling. Started thinking he knocked your ass out too. It's all good, Skitch. I think everything's gonna be just fine. We set some boundaries. Talked about it. We all good. Thank God for that. You sent him to a foster home or something? No, Skitchy. <laughs> I said he can stay with us. You said what? Yeah, I said he can stay with us, Skitchy. <laughs> Sounds fun, right? K-more, I don't want no damn delinquent anywhere near me. He's a menace to society. <laughs> the irony of you saying that is so funny. It's the same thing people say about you. <laughs> anyway, come on, Skitchy. Please, let him stay here with us. I didn't even know I had a son till today. I missed out on him growing up. I missed his first steps, his first pimple. Probably miss his damn virginity the way he looked. How about this? I'll pay more than the rent if he stays. Mm, I mean, I can't argue with that. <laughs> All right, K-More, you got yourself a deal. Good old Junior you can stay. Great, I appreciate you, buddy. You're the best. I know, and now I'm going to sleep. Good night, Sketchy. Don't let the bed bugs bite. <laughs> Only bug in here is Larry, so hopefully he don't bite your ass. Three hours later. Young man, do you have any idea what time it is? I don't know. Do I look like a clock? It is three in the morning, Junior. I told you to be back here before nine. I was worried and sick about you. Why didn't you call me to let me know you okay? Dude, relax. It ain't even that deep. We never exchanged numbers either, so I mean, I don't know how you expect me to call you. I'm sorry, Junior, but... You grounded. Give me your phone. What? Are you serious? You grounding me? I'm dead serious. Give me that phone, boy, and go straight to your room. Fine. Whatever. Here. Ooh, Kmore. You got a lot of work cut out for you, boy. Morning, buddy. How did you sleep? Morning, Pops. I slept great. Look, I wanted to say I'm sorry about last night. It's okay, Junior. I get it. I was a teenager once upon a time. <laughs> oh, dear God. Guess what happened to you? I can ask you the same thing, K-More. <laughs> you like you've been trying to be a SoundCloud rapper. Oh, real mature, Junior. You drew on my face with a Sharpie? Trust me, it's not a Sharpie. You might want to start saving up for some laser hair removal. Yeah. They're tattoos? I don't have a single tattoo on my body and you put a tattoo on my face? Yeah, you're surprisingly a very heavy sleeper. You didn't wake up for any of it. <laughs> and you wanted the sun, K-Boy, now you got it. You think it's funny, Sketchy? Look at yourself. What the? I'ma kill him. Where my gun at? Which one is this one? Junior? You smoke? Come on, K-Boy. You got to admit, that's pretty cool. And how you just do that? Give me the cigarette. These are bad for you. They can kill you, Junior. God, why are you been annoying, bro? Because I'm your father, and you will respect me. Now, go cut the lawn or something. You crazy. Woo, y'all like y'all doing a circus. <laughs> Larry, if there were ever a bad time to push my buttons, it's right now. Get out of here before I pull all the bug juice up out of you and spray your ass. You got it, Sketch. You ain't got to tell me twice. Look, K-More, 
ain't gonna tell you how to raise your kid. Mainly because I got five of them myself that I don't even see. But you gotta lay some discipline here before he gets more out of hand. I crowned him for his phone, Sketchy. What else do I do? I mean, is it too late to spank him? Hell, you're never too old for a whooping. Hmm. I don't know if I can hit him, but I think I have the alternate for it. Let's go. How y'all boys doing? What can I do for y'all on this fine evening? <laughs> How much do you charge for beating someone up? Kmo, you're going to hire somebody else to beat up your kid? You're absolutely right. I am, Sketch. What better person than my cousin? <laughs> your cousin? Y'all related? Yeah. Yeah, he's my cousin. <laughs> and we'll just find out about this five seasons later. Well, no one ever asked. Duh. <laughs> yeah. I saw some fans had this theory I was his father or something. That would have been a good twist. But no, nah, <laughs> he my damn cousin. For kids, I just charge a little extra. Only because they're minors. It's more illegal. You got yourself a deal. <laughs> All right. Consider it done. <laughs> nice doing business with y'all. I'll see you at the cookout next week. I'm out of here. You want a burger, boy? Nah, I'm Gucci. Okay. He's on the move, Ken. Get him good. Will do. I'm going to fuck his ass up. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Here you come. Are you sure this is a good idea, K Moore? I know I'm the one who suggested spanking the boy, but I kind of had an idea you would be the one hitting him. Not a hit from a higher guy. Don't give it too much thought, Sketch. It'll be fine. You want a burger? Uh, of course I do. You gonna watch the fight tonight? Which one? Fish Paul versus a retired golf player. Oh yeah, of course I am. <laughs> I love seeing this man beat on non-professional fighters and calling himself the greatest fighter ever. <laughs> Genius marketing though. Yeah, yeah. My crotch itches. Okay, so now once the rice is properly mixed up, you want to just put the heat at a low heat and let it sit for 15 to 18 minutes then cover it up. Don't open it during your duration. You don't want to let the flavor escape from the pot now. <laughs> While we wait for that, let's go back and focus on this skirt steak. Okay, you want to flip these over and some lime in it with some Goya seasoning. Inhale in it, y'all. <sighs> Yum! Get y'all excited, right? <laughs> My bitch loves some Hispanic food. Don't forget to pour a little bit on the Corona on there. Remember, that's Corona beer, not Corona flu. <laughs> Does a little dad joke there. Damn, I'm a diet. That's crazy. Hold that thought, class. Let that meat simmer for a while. I gotta take this call. Excuse me. Ken, what happened? Did you beat him up? Uh huh. Okay. Oh, wow. All right. I'll be there in a bit. What's up, K-Moore? Ken's in the hospital. Come on, Sketch. I just warmed up this Roman. Bring it with. All right. I love me some Roman. You got any hot sauce in the car? Oh, Daniel. What happened to you? Well, <laughs> as you can see, the patient suffers from a mild concussion, a few broken ribs, and an internal bruising. Yada, yada, yada. Why are you talking like that? Where's the doctor at? I'm the doctor. I couldn't get someone to cover my shift, so I had to treat myself. I'm going to need one of y'all to help me out of this bed soon. I got to go check on another patient. What happened to Junior? Is he all right? Junior, the one who did this to me. That boy is evil. Y'all need to hire a priest for that one. Have you with an exorcist or something? Don't even hire me again. He'll test sparks plus to my nipples and gave me some electric shock therapy. It's safe to say my nipples are going to have nerve damage for the rest of my life. Yikes. I'm glad that ain't my son. <laughs> no, but he is staying in the same house as you, so he's just as much of your problem as he is mine. Damn it. You might be right about that. You ever consider boarding school? Boarding school? Yeah, you know. They take a man, discipline him, teach him, house him, feed him. He may come back as a law-abiding citizen. You may be on to something, Sketchy. Let's go. Hey, wait, wait, wait. What's going on here? Why is he in the handcuffs? We've got a noise complaining about a party. When we got here, this kid was distributing alcohol and marijuana to other underage kids. It wasn't my marijuana, was it? Officer, can you lay him off with a warning or something? I'm sure there must be something we could work out. Okay, more. Come here real quick. I say, why not let him take him in the juvie? That way he's out of your hands for a whole while. I don't know, Sketchy. I can't do that to my boy. I want to help him out. Not let him go down in the dog path and end up like, no offense, Sketchy, but you. I don't want him to end up like us. I want more for him. Damn. As messed up as that was that you said about me, that's some real stuff, K-More. All right, man. Go get your son. 
Daddy of the year over here. Excuse me, officer. Would this uh Benjamin Franklin change your mind about releasing my boy? I do like Benjamin Franklin. You got his siblings? I think six or seven Benjamin Franklins might change my mind. Damn, that's a lot of siblings. Fine, here. All right, son, you're free to go. You're lucky ever this guy is your dad. I would've just let you go to jail. What you do that for? Because I ain't finna let you end up like sketchy or something. You're better than that pathetic loser low-life piece of garbage. Dude, I'm literally standing right here. Sorry, sketchy. But anyways, I want you to do something with your life. Be better. I'm sending you to boarding school, where they'll teach you to straighten up and fly right. Take a good look at Sketchy Joint. You don't want to end up like him. A convicted fella with no job, always strapped for cash, smelling like B.O. and Tuna. I'm going inside, man. You hear me, my boy? Am I going to get through to you? Yeah, Dad. You actually are. That's great, buddy. Now go pack your bed. We're going to drive you there. All right, Pops. <laughs> Take real good care of yourself there, Tonya. I'm going to come visit you every chance I get. Will do. I love you, Dad. I love you too, son. <laughs> I guess happy endings do happen, huh, K-Moore? They sure do, Sketchy. They sure do. Daddy, is that you? Oh, damn. Let's go, K-Moore. Time to go home. Oh, uh, Sketchy, I think that kid is talking to you. Kid? Uh, what kid? I don't see no kid. You can call me Stevie Wonder. Let's go. Hey, Sketchy. You sure that ain't your kid? His ass looks just like you. Hell, he even sound like you too. <laughs> Man, k on not know what the hell you talking about. So be quiet. The only thing that's on my mind is getting a job. Man, I ain't had no check in the long ass time. Since I stopped selling drugs, my ass been broke. I, I hate this life. Ooh, who you telling? Because I'm tired of supporting your broke ass since you got out of jail. Matter of fact, are you gonna ask Mr. Krabs for your old job back? Yeah, more than likely. But shit, I really hate to work, but it's an easy ass check. Plus, I get to eat free food and I get to smoke on the job. Shit, it's a stoner's domain. <laughs> oh, maybe I can apply for it too. Get to work with two and tell again so we could be like old pals. <laughs> uh, no. I don't know about that. We already did that season two, and we know how that worked out. Eugene! I, I mean, Mr. Krabs, how's it been, man? Long time no see. Well, 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 Mr. Butterscotch, what the fuck are you doing here? Okay, I'll I get straight to the point. Uh, I know we had our differences. I beat you up, you try to fire me, I steal from you, you steal my tips. I throw money at you and send you to Africa with pounds of angel dust that I end up going to jail for, you know, etc., etc. But together, we make a great team in the fast food business. I'm the best fried cooking this place ever had. And I think it's about time I come back. My boy, business has been just fine since you left. SpongeBob has been working the grill, and he's doing it for half the hourly pay I used to pay you. It's a steal. He's never late to work. He don't smell like weed and B.O., and he's cheaper. So what the hell no for me, Mr. Buttertouch. Fine work somewhere else. Damn. All right, then. <laughs> All right, class, the main thing you need to remember is top of the top of the top of the top is all in your heel. What well, helps me imagine I'm dancing on my father's grave. <laughs> Look at my feet go. Come on, y'all. Get your happy feet on. <laughs> Man, move out of the way. You blocking the TV. All right, class, let's take a break. We'll meet back here in 10 minutes to rehydrate and smoke a cigarette if you have to. <laughs> Sketchy, you know I got the living room between 8 a.m. to 11 a.m. every Monday, Thursday and Sunday for the tap dancing class. Yeah, and you also need it for your strip teasing class, 6 p.m. to 10.30 p.m. every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Saturdays. Your fishing class is from 1 a.m. to 7 a.m. every Monday, Wednesday, and Fridays. And your how to be a pimp class is 3 p.m. to 11 p.m. every Thursday. Your how to teach a class class, 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. every Monday, Tuesday, and Saturday. All you do is teach classes. How do you have time for anything else? I work from home, Sketchy. I can't help that I'm multi-talented. <laughs> I feel like I need to give back to the community with these classes and share my talent, you know? It's just too much for me, man. I never get peace and quiet in my own house. Well, why don't you just watch TV in your room then? Because my TV ain't as big as this one. This TV got some 8K quality. I can see the Rock's muscles having a conversation with each other. Hey, man, this guy stank. 
Who, who are you telling? Hey, man, are you bigger than me? I thought this man, like, portionalized his weights to keep it even. But you look really bigger than me. No, yeah, it's because The Rock chronically masturbates every five, ten minutes. And he's right-handed, so, you know, obviously I'm I'm bigger than you and I got a deeper voice. So, yeah. You know we're going to be in another Kevin Hart movie, right? It's like the fourth one together. <sighs> uh, how you feel about The Rock playing Black Adam? Man, I don't know. It looks like The Rock is just playing The Rock while wearing some cosplay. It's like Kevin Hart playing himself in every movie. It gets repetitive. I'm going to go watch it. Hopefully he proves me wrong, but we'll see. Yeah, Mark Wahlberg does that too. But anyway, back to our main topic. What happened to your job, honey? You been on this couch so goddamn long, I think you're morphing into the fabric. Yeah, I was trying to find a job from Fendi, but with my resume and being a convicted felon, it's kind of hard to find some work for me during this time. The only jobs on there was a party clown. Magicians for kids, parties, teachers. It's weird, it's like, it's like they want criminals to be surrounded by kids. I got an idea. Why don't you ask Ken if he can help you with a job? He got like 20 of them. Maybe he can hook you up. You know what? That ain't a bad idea. I'ma do that. Damn, he stink. I need to put some Lysol on this ASAP. I think we gonna need a new couch. This thing's been through a lot. So you're broke and unemployed. Came here to get it with the big dog, huh? Hmm, maybe I can help you out. Maybe I can't. We'll send it for Ken. We're boys, man. Help me out. I help you out, boy. When have you ever helped me out? Every time I help you out, your girl always robs me. Hey man, can you put the onions away real quick? My eyes are burning. Yeah, you are right. I can cut this up later. Fuck them customers that want onions on their food. Oh, stinky breath asses. All right, look, either you can help me out, or I can go back to the jail and tell them the warden how you grab inmates and make them fight each other for money. Oh, damn, you snitching now? Well, I like to call it extortion. <laughs> you got a deal, Mr. Butterscotch. Look at you using big words. It's Thorson. Boy, I'm proud of you. I'll tell you what. I just opened a convenience store with all the money I've been saving up for working these jobs. You can work the register. I need an overnight guy. Shit, I ate him down. Great. 10 o'clock, Sketchy. Don't be late. <laughs> My eye itches. Damn. Wait, wait, wait. You touched Ah, oh, damn. My fucking eyes. Son of a bitch. This shit hurts like a motherfucker. God damn. Son of a whore, bitch, fuck, bitch, shit, nigga. Okay, Sketchy, simple stuff. If anyone tries to buy any liquor or cigarettes, make sure you ID them. They gotta be 14 years old, all right? Or is it 16? Let's just say 12, just to be safe. <laughs> if anyone tries to buy illegal fireworks, make sure they ain't an undercover cop. They have been trying to crack down on me. Uh, I think that's about it. You have a good night, Sketchy. <laughs> that boy gonna get shot for sure. Man, it's dull around here. I got a solution to that. <sighs> yeah, there we go. More like me and my blizzy. Shift gonna be smooth now. <laughs> One long shift mixed with good weed later. All that weed made my ass hungry. Mm, what can I eat? Sketchy, I bought you a lunch just in case you was hungry. Wow, boy, your timing is amazing. You read my mind. I was just finished and I said I was hungry. Yeah, I figured you smoked that strain that kills John Wayne. <laughs> you usually get mad munches when you smoke that. K-Boy, you know me so well. That's why you my dog. Yeah, I know. <laughs> there you go. Uh, K-Boy, there's only vegetables in this bag. What? Oh, man. Biscuits ain't as much got in it. She ate everything except the vegetables. That's definitely some hush shit. I gotta blend her goddamn carrots with extra chocolate milkshake just so I can get her to eat it. Sorry about this, Sketchy. Hey, but at least you know my intentions were there. Yeah, it's fine. I'm sure Ken won't mind me taking a bag of potato chips. I'm proud of you, Sketchy. You finally got a job. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go and head home. I gotta be up early. I'm teaching a class about dangers and repercussions of drugs. You mind if I use your mug shot? <laughs> uh, sure, go ahead. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. I'll see you at home. Bye. Hey, yo, empty the register. <laughs> Boy, y'all picked the wrong cashier. I got this blicker, and it's gonna pop pop. Now, y'all gonna get about this store. Go on back home and cry to your mama, because y'all ain't getting a damn thing out this register. Hey, y'all beat his ass. Ah! The shit! Ah!
la 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 Ah, oh, new day, same shit. <laughs> oh, damn! What happened here? Where's the money? Uh, man, I got jumped and robbed last night. They took all that shit. Look back at the security cameras. All right, I got the footage automatically on my phone using this app. Isn't that crazy? What a time to be alive. It's unbelievable. Just from access to your fingertips. Oh, damn, they beat yo. I is sketchy. <laughs> they stumbled the hell out of you. Boy, I was out there to see that shit live. <laughs> That's a good ass paper. Uh, I'm sorry. Sketch what happened? I thought you was this tough guy. Man, I'm not no John Wick or Jason Bourne. It was six of them, man. And one of me. I got a good few hits in if you just, you know, look at the footage and see. Well, unfortunately, Sketchy, that just means I gotta let you go. I'm sorry it didn't work out, buddy. Man, what? Because I got jumped and robbed, you firing me? What was I supposed to do? That's not fair. Yeah, I know it's not. They robbed all the money and I had invested in this place. Without that, I can't even be able to play my employee. I'm gonna have to work all this shit myself till I make some good entries. Besides, I really just hired your ass cause you was scary looking. I thought no one would even try to rob this place with your ass in it, but I guess I was wrong. <sighs> I'll give you a call when I can rehire you, buddy. I'm sorry. <laughs> Got his ass beat. Damn, did one of them take the shit on the floor? Clean up on AL2? <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. I guess I gotta clean this shit up. Man, I only had a job for a night and I already lost it. This ain't looking too good for the sketch, dog. I need to find some soon. Hi there, sir. Are you interested in purchasing a new boat today? We have a large variety of selections from Dodge Hellcat fishes to soccer mom vans. You look like you'd be perfect in a new 2045 model fish Tesla. And I'll tell you what, I'll even throw in the blacked out non-poppable tires with hydraulic systems. Uh, no, man. I don't need no boat, I'm good. Are you totally sure? I just got a shipment of those fuzzy dice people like to hang over their rear view mirrors. Nah, I don't got that much money, man. And by the way things are going, I don't see myself buying a new boat anytime soon. Well, we also have the broke niggas lot. The best rundown cars all over Bikini Bottom. What's with the tow truck? Oh, the tow truck. <laughs> It's a fascinating machine. Just needs a little bit of work and a little bit of love, you know? But I really think it needs the right owner. And that owner is you. It's yours for the right price. Yeah. All I got is 500 bucks. It's all I got in my name. You know what? With an 85% APR and a 35% interest rate, you got yourself a deal, buddy. Let's step into my office. Sign the paperwork. Bet. <laughs> now we're getting somewhere. <laughs> He's out! Bye-bye! Bye! Haha, <laughs> what a sucker. That tow truck was reported stolen! And it's in such bad shape, I'm surprised it drove off the lot! <laughs> money for me, money for me. Yeah, now we in biz. Sketchy the tow truck driver. Let's make this money, boy. Oh, damn. Come on! Let's go, baby. Don't fail me now. All right, Larry, it's my turn to go hide. <laughs> man, wait a minute. It's my turn to go hide. What you mean? You just got done hiding, Larry. It's my damn go. No, man, it ain't fair. I ain't get a fair chance, man. It's my turn to go hide. You ain't playing fair, K-Moore. Hey, I don't give a damn what your ass talking about. It's my damn turn. You better start counting right now while I go hide. Me, whatever, bro. Yeah, damn. <laughs> Man, that truck's smoking. Hell yeah, god damn. <coughs> Sketchy, why the hell you got this ugly ass pickup truck for? <coughs> you talking about my baby right here? Shoot, I got it on a good deal. Couldn't turn it down. This is why I can make money towing stuff, you know, boats and everything. Sketchy, the engine is on fire. Oh, damn. Wait a minute. Oh yeah, you got the crappiest hunk of junk I ever seen out the lot. <laughs> yeah, I don't get this damn tow truck a week. Man, whatever. My tow truck just needs some love and some work. Soon it'll pay for itself. Man, it thing got more rust on it than Sarah Jessica Parker's Panani. <laughs> well, I sketchy. Me, Biscuits, and Larry going to a carnival later. You want to go with us? Nah, I think I'm just going to fix the carburetor on the truck. And I also think the air filter is clogged. And I need to order and install some exhaust pipe. This truck is definitely gonna need some work. So lately I've been writing an autobiography because my life been crazy. And I think someday somebody might find it entertaining. You know, like things when I helped save Bikini Bottom from the snails. How I helped the FBI take down Scarfin. How I was eaten by a 50 ton worm. 
Yada, yada, yada. You know, a lot of things that happen throughout all these seasons. We need one competitor. One competitor to compete. What is going on? Oh, there's a hot dog eating contest going on over there. Whoever eats the most hot dogs in one minute wins. Oh my God. Is this a dream? There's a competition involved eating food? I hold my cotton candy and don't drop it. Oh, oh damn. All these damn cotton candy. Cotton candy weigh more than me. We will give you a glass of milk and you cannot remove the dog from the bun. Condiments are at your disposal. At the count of three, one, two, three. Oh, oh God. Damn, she eating like a machine. <laughs> hey, yeah, yeah, I ain't it sexy? I get in the mood when I see her eat. She can put it away, boy. Just like she do my. <laughs> Never mind. I'm done. Can I have some more? Uh, um, you finished 20 hot dogs in 35 seconds. You qualify as the winner. Uh, move out the way. I'm hungry. <laughs> Business, baby. The competition is over. You can stop eating now. Baby, I know, but once I get started, I just can't stop. I got to eat but keep eating. I was mighty impressed with your woman eating all these hot dogs here. Thank you. Business live to eat and eat to live. I've managed professional eating competitors and I've never seen anyone eat like her. I love to manage her and enter her some competitions. You hear that biscuit? You can get paid to eat. Get paid to eat? Oh my God, that's like a dream come true. Where do I sign up? Here you go. You're making the right choice. We can make big money. Hmm, let me just twist right there. Maybe hit it right there with a mallet. Attach this right there. Ah! Damn, I almost had it there this time. She just needs a little bit more love, that's all. How's the tow truck doing? It's coming along just fine. I replaced the battery, changed the spark plugs, found out that the serpentine belt broke off, and then the coolant was leaking, and the brake pads was molded. <laughs> Damn, all oh, that sounds expensive. Hell yeah, it was. Had to sell my Kyrie Low Fives. But it'll be worth it once this baby is up to date. How was the carnival? It was fun. Biscuit into a hot dog eating contest and set a new record. We even made a deal with a manager to help Biscuit go go pro. Damn, that's really something out there for everyone. But that sounds like some Biscuit will be good at. Yeah, they're about to go trying and get Biscuit ready. She has a competition tomorrow. So we're going to test out how much she can eat without stopping. Trust me, K-More. I had no doubt in my mind Biscuit could eat this whole house if it was edible. <laughs> yeah, you right. I'm going to go inside and start feeding Biscuit. We got a lot of training to do. Good luck on fixing your ugly ass truck. <laughs> I'm just realizing my truck missing back rims. How did I drive this thing without dying? Ooh. Ooh. How long was that? 23 seconds. Damn, Biscuit. That's your personal best. I'm still hungry. Let's set up for another go. Biscuit, baby, we can't. That was all the food we had in the crib. We even out of condiments. You drank all the ketchup and soy sauce, including mustard. Hey, we have a gig, a donut eating contest. Oh, Biscuit do love donuts. Her favorite is raspberry filled with strawberry frosted extra extra sprinkles. Did you say raspberry filled with frosted extra extra sprinkles? You got one of them, K-Boy? No, not on me right now, Biscuit. K-Boy, don't you ever mention raspberry filled with strawberry frosted extra extra sprinkles unless you have a raspberry filled with strawberry frosted extra extra sprinkles. Here, my Lamborghini here. Way to go, Sketch Dog. You outdid yourself. Damn, Sketchy. Where did you learn how to fix cars? Oh, I just learned the basics from one of my mom's boyfriends. Then learned the advanced shit in juvie from the guy named Toolbox. I'll never forget Toolbox. He was like a father figure to me. Then he got stabbed 75 times in the shower. Heh, <laughs> good times. Uh, okay. So what are you planning on doing with the tow truck? To tow? Duh, what else am I gonna do with it? Oh, have you ever towed before? No. Well, you got a lot to learn. Maybe I can help you. Larry, what do you know about towing? Oh, me? I towed for Big Fish Tow Company for 47 years. I seen some real shit and dealt with some real shit. I was one of the best in the towing industry. Damn, 47 years? How old are you, Larry? I'm 65 years old. I'm retired now and live off pension. I did not know you was that old. Man, you look amazing for being that old. What's your secret on looking so young? Well, I baby coconut milk three times a day. Keep the skin fresh and young looking. So, do you need help towing? Hmm, fuck it. It couldn't hurt. Oh, 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 oh. 
Biscuits is the winner. Here's a $5,000 check. Congratulations, Biscuits. I'm so proud of you. Thank you, baby. What are we gonna eat for lunch? I got two turkeys in the oven right now with some mashed potatoes and corn on the cob. Oh my God, come on, let's go home. Wait a minute, Biscuits. Let's go cash the check first. Congratulations, Biscuits. But, um, <laughs> remind you that I'm entitled to 20% of your earnings. And also, I got Biscuits a new gig tomorrow at a hot wing eating competition. Oh, damn. I won't be able to make it. I have a voice acting class to teach tomorrow. Well, baby, I could just skip the competition if you want me to. No, baby, you can't postpone just because of me. I'll be cheering you on from home. Don't worry. I'll be there with Biscuits. Can't help but to support a big beauty like Biscuits. <laughs> she is the beauty. Come on, baby. Let's go home. Right there, Sketchy. Park up in front of him. All right. All right, now go ahead and lower the hook. Lay it on the ground. All right, then. Attach the hook underneath the front of the frame, not the bumper. If you attach it in front of the bumper, you're going to rip that motherfucker clean off. Then you got to pay to fix it. The frame is strong enough to hold it together and pull the vehicle. Shit, I probably would have just attached to the bumper. Yeah, most people think that's how you do it, but no. Nah, that's why you ride with a pro. I'm going to show you all the ins and outs. Now raise the boat. Now we bring it up to the police tow lot. Then they will pay us as a group. Easy 500 for the day. Now you're going to always get people who try to bargain you about releasing their shit. Now whether you do it is up to you. What most of us do is have them pay us cash personally. That way we just don't waste gas pulling and just move on to the next one. I have only 30 bucks on me. Now you see, they right there is some bullshit. Take this dude boat. Yeah, you got me messed up. You can pick up this piece of shit vehicle at the police lot tomorrow, broke ass boy. Well done, Sketchy. Now class, it is important to make sure you practice on a daily basis. What most voice actors do to start off is impersonate people you know in real life. Whether it be a friend, a family member, or even your first grade teacher who got fired for having sex with a janitor in the teacher's lounge. Let me give you an example. Here's the impersonation of my best friend Sketchy. Hi, my name's Sketchy and I'm a grumpy drug dealer. Now here's one of my pal Larry. I'm Larry the Roach. I used to be a black dot and now I'm a reoccurring character. Here's one of my baby biscuits. I'm biscuits. And I love my sweet K-Boy. See? It is as easy as that. <laughs> All right, K-Boy. Me and Larry leaving for the day. Uh, Sketchy, can I talk to you real quick? Yeah, of course. I'll be right back, class. Don't go anywhere. So what do you think about business being a pro eater? I think it's cool. It makes her happy. Makes her money. What more can you ask for? Well, I think her manager has a crush on her. He gets really friendly with her and, and I don't like it. Oh, you over exaggerating. Biscuits love you, and she wouldn't ruin that for anyone. Huh, I guess you right, Sketchy. Maybe I'm just tripping. Hell yeah, you tripping. Just finish your class and go take the bubble bath with some white wine. That'll always cheer you up. Congratulations, Biscuits. Are you hungry? Yes, all the time. I have five pounds of rotisserie chicken at my apartment if you'd like to join me. Sure, I never turn down free food. Let me just call K-Boy first and let him know. Mm, no, 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 no. You don't want to disturb his class, right? He's a busy man. Hmm. You may be right about that. I can just call him where the class is. Larry, this is the sweet life. Easy money. Hell yeah, it is. Come to think about it, this is probably the only time me and you ever got along. You ain't as bad as I thought you was. I used to think you were just some rodent who lived in my house and ate up my food. But you're actually a good friend. You're a good friend too, Sketch. Maybe this is the beginning of something new. Cheers. It's a strange, strange feeling. One I'm sure you know. Oh. 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 Oh my God. You look so very sexy chowing down all that food. Uh, no, uh, don't do that. I'm a bad real woman. You're too beautiful to be tied down to one man. A woman like you deserves it all. Mr. Manager, I have all I need, and that's my baby K-Boy. Now believe her and go hold the hill. I almost forgot this. Can't let this food go to waste. What else you got over here? I see you got a four-piece nugget and some mashed potatoes and some corn. Okay, okay. Now, good day to you. It's a certain La, 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 la. How was your day, baby? Kai boy, 
You won't believe the manager tried to make a move on me. It pissed me off. What did you do? I got out of there faster than I could eat a plate of ribs. I'm a happily married woman. I don't want no side piece unless them side pieces are food. <laughs> Baby, I must admit, I have some insecurity. But I'm glad to know my woman is faithful. Are you hungry, baby? Now you know damn well I'm hungry, baby. Let's eat. You getting so big, buddy. I can't wait to smoke you. Good morning, Sketchy. Good morning, K-Moore. How was your night? Turns out that manager was trying to flirt with biscuits. Damn. So what's up? Are we going to run it up and beat his ass? No, it's okay, Sketchy. Biscuits turned him down. It's all good. You want to walk to the comic book store with me? Fuck it. I need issue 91 of Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. So sketchy. Who is your favorite Green Lantern? I thought you had never asked me. I'm telling you, Sketchy. Hal Jordan was the best Green Lantern. And I'm telling you, K Moore. John Stewart was the best Green Lantern. That man used his military architectural knowledge to construct his arsenal. He did more with the ring than Hal Jordan ever could. Are you forgetting Hal Jordan constructed his own Green Lantern ring out of the pure wheel? Pure wheel, Sketchy. That man's willpower was strong enough to make a Green Lantern ring. Are you also forgetting how Jordan was strong enough to wipe out the Green Lantern corpse and recreate Coast City after he got destroyed? Come on now, put some respect on his name. Exactly. He failed to save his own town. That's like Batman being unable to save Gotham City. That's like Superman being unable to save Metropolis. John Stewart could never. I'm sorry. You ain't changed my mind about this, K-Moore. We'll see you about that. We need to bring an expert here in this conversation. Hello, good sir. Can you settle a debate for me and my pal here? Twitch! Is that you? S sketchy. Buddy, wow. What a pleasant surprise. I barely recognize you without the Bin Laden beard. I haven't seen you since I punched out of that jump of a jail. But am I right? How you been? I've been great, man. Oh, K-More, this is Twitch. He was my cellmate before Tyrone. He's the one I told you about who broke out of jail, remember? Oh, yeah. He was the one that fondled you, right? Yeah, but it was a spiritual one, remember? Not physical. Right, Twitch? Right. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, right. Now, n not physical at all, but I did use my fans in uh, massage oil. Twitch, can you settle a debate for us? Me and Sketch have been arguing about who's the better Green Lantern. I say Hal Jordan, but Sketchy says John Stewart. Hmm. My honest expert opinion here. I gotta say Kyle Rayner. Kyle Rayner was definitely the best Green Lantern. Kyle Rayner? They're forgetful. Re Come on, Twitch. Now, now, now. Hold on. Let me explain. You see, Hal Jordan usually used his pilot history to make aircrafts, fighter pilots, you know, whatever. Jon Stewart used his ring with his military history, making machine guns, tanks, whatever. But Kyle Rayner? Kyle Rayner was a comic book creator. He used his imagination with his ring, creating dragons, pirate ships, lightsabers. His creativity was his limit. Man, yada, yada, yada. I still think Hal Jordan watches both Jon Stewart and Kyle Rayner. Where's the new comics at? Uh, it's a comic book shop, not a sex shop. That's next door. Next door? That's all you had to say. Come on, Sketch. All right. Later, Twitch. I'm going to holler at you later. k more. did you finish the milk? I told you I was saving the rest of it for cereal. I know, Sketch, but I had some cookies early. I can't eat my cookies without milk. You know that. Why don't you just put some water in it? It tastes about the same. Why didn't he use water with the cookies then? It tastes just the same. Water with cookies? That just sounds like an abomination. Don't you ever think before saying stuff? And eh, whatever. Go buy some more milk, K-More. I want to add some cereal. I can't right now, Sketchy. I'm watching Mama June's Road to Redemption. This show just gets crazy and crazy every time. Like, why can't Mama June just be good mother to these girls? Makes me sad. Okay, that's how it's going to be. I got you, K-More. You think this is a game, huh? La 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 la. Wash my balls once a day to keep the germs away. <laughs> I love myself. Oh, oh my god, my hair! What happened to my hair? It's gone! I look like a black Mr. Clean! <laughs> Funny, right? I put an air in your shampoo this morning. What? Why would you do this, Sketchy? This is crossing the line. You know I love my hair. My hair is my trademark. It's my image. I'm nothing without my hair. K-More, you wear a bandana every day. Sometimes I be forgetting you even have damn hair. And that's what you get for using all my milk yesterday. I had to eat my cereal dry. You better sleep with your eyes open, Sketchy. 
Cause I'ma cut the dreads off as soon as I catch your ass slacking. I kill you before you touch my hair, K more. I promise you that. Hopefully now you'll leave my milk alone. Cause if not, next time I'ma have a doctor give your ass a vasectomy in your sleep. I wish you would try sketchy. Can y'all two suck up? Oh my god. I'm trying to eat in peace out here. Y'all argue more than a married couple. You two need some counseling or something. Hell. Bitches, he switched my shampoo in there. I'm bald. Don't look at me, I'm hideous. I'm going to be honest, Kai boy. I didn't even know your bandana came off. I ain't never see you without it. Anyways, I'm going to go back in the hallway and eat. Can you keep it down, please? Damn. Man, forget this. I'm going out. Where you going, Sketchy? I don't know yet. But whatever is better than here. Bye, Bruce Willis. <laughs> I'm on that ass. On that ass. Watch this. Uh, dunked on your ass. Uh, you know I got claws, right? I can't even properly hold the controls right. Excuses? I ain't trying to hear all that. You just suck. Plain and simple. It, it's cool. Came to visit me, Sketchy. But it's 10 at night. Shouldn't you be taking your ass home or something? Man, hell no. Nah. Came up and getting on my last nerves lately. Can't stand this ass. Hmm. Seems like the two of you need to switch brains. Get a different perspective on one another. Uh. What you talking about, Twitch? Okay, okay, okay. Check it out. Do you remember when I said I was building a time machine to save JFK? Why am I asking? Of course you do. Anyways, I shaved the idea for now. So, I started my next best experiment. Brain switching. Yeah, you see. I opened up your scab there, scoop up in your brain, and put it inside K-more. Vice versa, so that way you two can literally walk in each other's shoes. We don't wear shoes. The analogy still works, Sketchy. If you two can see how knowing you are in each other's eyes, maybe it'll give you a different respect for another. You see? I'm like Jerry Springer mixed with some MacGyver. I don't know, Twitch. You ever done something like this? I switched my brain with a shrimp one time, but it wasn't appealing. You know what? I'm going to have to say hell no. The last thing I need is K-more stupid brain in my body. I'm clearly talking to the wrong one. Uh, have you ever done an operation like this before? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Plenty of times. Just last week, I put my brain in the shrimp. It was awesome. <laughs> Damn. Let's do it, Twitch. How are you going to make sure he doesn't wake up doing the surgery? Easy. Watch this. <laughs> well, damn. You got any sleeping pills for me? Uh, uh, of course. Hmm. Let's see. Let's see. Do I got everything? Scalpel? Check. Stitches? Check. Ah, man. I forgot to scoop at home. Oh well, I can just use their ice cream scoop or something. <laughs> oh my God, she's gonna eat me. I always knew this day would come. K-Boy, what's wrong with you? k -more? what? It's sketchy. Why you in my bed? Wait, why am I in k -more's room? Oh no. Oh no! I'm in k -more's body! Twitch! Morning. Hey, I'm cooking up some fire-ass fluffy pancakes. You want some? Man, why am I in k -more's body? You making blueberry by, by any chance? Uh, I, I mean, why am I in k -more's body? I told you not to do it. I told him to do it. I like the pancakes, Twitch. Thank you. <laughs> this is like the movie Freaky Friday or something. Why the hell you do this, k -more? Because Twitch made some good points. We argue too much, Sketchy. Maybe if we got to be in each other's bodies for a while, we can have a different perspective on each other. It can save our relationship. Yeah, no. Twitch, I need you to reverse this shit right now. I'm busy right now, Sketchy. Tell you what, why don't you give it a day, give it one day, and I'll switch y'all back. Please, Sketchy, just give it a chance. All right, fine. How hard can it be being K-more? All I gotta do is teach a class and bum out a couch with a roach. Easy. If I'm being sketchy, all I got to do is start being a grumpy grinch. Grr, I hate everyone. You two are going to have a very fun day. I can tell already. All right. Well, I got to go. I'm supposed to be running a marathon. Hey, do you guys know anyone with Adderall? I'm feeling a little sleepy here. No? All right. Guess I'll just stop by Starbucks for some coffee or something. Might spoil myself and get a cake pop too. Wait for sale. I got that Lyle. I got this train that killed John Wayne. <laughs> Three for four. Everything for low. Everything must go. <laughs> Man, this is easy. Hey, yo, sketchy. 
Let me get a dub. I need something for my cataracts. Say no more, fine customer. I got exactly what you need right here. Here you go. That's the dub, bubble gum rainbow. Guaranteed to knock you off your ass. <laughs> Bet. Thanks, Catcher Dog. I'm going to fuck with you. All right, I'm going to fuck with you too. <laughs> this is easy. I don't know why Sketchy complains all day. I need to drop more business though. Hmm. How can I get everyone's attention? I got the perfect idea. K more your jeans. <laughs> Come and get some weed. Some cream stuff here. I got it all. <laughs> for the next edition of album, I'll run to my nigga deal. Get you an extra ounce for a price of one. Y'all can't beat that. Evening officers, how could I help you with some weed? I got the best in town. <laughs> Sir, are you aware that selling weed is illegal? No, it's not. Officer, you crazy. <laughs> yes, it is, son. No, it's not. Boy, yes, it is. I'll arrest your ass right now. But officer, I thought it was legalized. Now in the town of Bikini Bottom, now in my goddamn watch, it'll be a cold day in hell before I let my city get overruled by the luscious plant of marijuana. Put your hands up. Whoa, wait a minute, officer. Uh, there's gotta be something I could do for you. Just let me go. I can't go to jail. I'm too pretty to go to jail. Well, not in this body. In my other body, I'm very pretty. Well, I guess there is something that you could do that can change my mind. I mean, I don't usually find other men attractive. I don't usually roll that way. Not that there's anything wrong with it, but I guess a fish gotta do what a fish gotta do not to get sent to jail. Come on. Boy, get your mind out of the gutter. I want a bribe. Some money. Oh, a bribe. <laughs> well, why didn't you say so? Thank God. How much we talking here? 10, 20? <laughs> Throw me a number. I think $500 should do it. $500? Are you high? I mean, uh, $500, officer? That's kind of sound like a lot. It's either you give me that money, I'm hauling your ass to jail, where they'll steal your pudding. N not my pudding? Hold you down while they take turns stripping you from your manhood. My manhood? And the only way out of that hell is suicide. Oh, uh, do you accept checks? <laughs> Okay, let's get started. Um, let me think here. <clears throat> um, um, well, uh, why don't we start off? You all telling me what's wrong with y'all marriage first? Yeah, that's a good start. How about you? Well, you see, I work my ass off in numerous jobs to support my family. Hell, I even had to miss my ship at the grocery store just to be here. My wife complains. I work too much and never have time for her. But she don't be complaining when them checks come in, though, don't you? To ugly ass. Well, in that case, you gotta put your bitch in line. Let her know you the man and you chasing the bag. If she don't want you to work so much, tell her ass to get a job. All right, who's next? I have a problem cheating on my wife. Sure, I find her attractive, but doing something I'm not supposed to be doing just excites me. It's giving me a rush. <sighs> I've cheated on my wife with her sister, her mother, her boss, our neighbor, our kid's teacher, the male lady. I just paid for a hooker 10 minutes before this class. You ain't shit. Next. My husband doesn't support my line of work. Okay, this sounds like a good topic. What do you do? I'm on OnlyFans. <laughs> and I'm an escort. But he doesn't know about the escort part. Ain't nothing wrong with the OnlyFans thing. Female be making bank off OnlyFans. But you a hoe for the escort part. So, uh, you're an escort, huh? What service does that come with? For the price, I'm charging. Anything you want, big boy. Hey, enough of that. Nasty asses. Wait a minute. I ain't even married. Why am I here? Shut up. This teaching thing is easy. Maybe I should have been a teacher. Let me take a hit of this real quick. I think I deserve this. What part of this has to do with a happy marriage? Well, you see, to the untrained eye, I'm just smoking this blunt right here. But to the eye that has the brains, I'm making a point about marriage. For you see, Marriage is a lot like a blunt. First, you have the blunt. Then on the inside, you have the sweet collard greens that turns everything fun. I don't understand. If I wanted to see a man smoke a blunt, I would have taken the blunt smoking class. Well, that's all we got time for today. Get y'all asses out of here. You don't gotta go home, but you can't stay here. <laughs> and no refunds. Damn. I had a stressful ass day. I had to write a check of $500 for this car. And he made me ride to the bank with him to make sure the check didn't bounce. After that, I got ran up on by two ugly ass niggas. Did you have your strap? Oh yeah, best believe I was strapped up. Shot them both dead. <laughs> then I had to drive out of the middle of nowhere to bury these bodies. 
But even then, this dude on the dog saw me do it. So I had to chase him down and silence him. I'm tired. How was your day? I taught a class on marriage. And I think I did pretty well. But after that, I had another class to teach about how to give your horse surgery. Then after that, a class of CPR. It was hard trying to teach something I know nothing about. Did you use the teacher manual? The what now? The teacher manual, sketchy. Ain't no way no damn teacher just automatically knows stuff. We got these manuals we read out that have answers. That would have been very helpful. Oh well, at least this day almost over. Twitch comes tomorrow and Twitch is back. Yup. <laughs> Thank God. I miss my body. You are uncircumcised. It's weird to pay with. Kaibo, come on. Let's go to bed. I'm coming, biscuits. <laughs> All right. Good night, sketchy. Remember. If the bed's rocking, don't come knocking. <laughs> Wait, K-Moore, are you gonna have sex with biscuits in my body? Uh, yeah, with marriage sketch, we have sex, duh. You can't wait till tomorrow when you're back in your own body? No, me and my woman got knees, Sketchy. <laughs> you crazy. I'd be lying if I said that was weird. We definitely had weird on this show happen before. Oh, well. <laughs>
always wanted to direct porn. It's like a work of art. I want to put so much passion in this scene that you forget that you actually watch porn. Come on, let me show you to the set. And this is the set. That is the matches on the floor. Two porn stars in their robes. Make art, baby. All right, you two. Take them robes off. Let me see what you're working with here. Oh, God. You need a trim. <laughs> Come over here. Let me give you a lineup. Get your ass a fade. Come in. I can't get the door right now. Clarence, I'm Clarence, what do you want? I don't have the patience to be dealing with annoying things right now. My back is in a lot of pain. What happened, brother? Well, I know it's gonna sound crazy, but my friend made me and Kmo switch bodies. And long story short, Kmo still wanted to have sex with his wife, and you know she weighed by 700 tons. And yeah, you can imagine what happened. I got crushed. No amount of weed can help this pain go away. Oh gosh, I'm so sorry to hear that, brother. Is there anything that I can do to make you feel better? You know what? There is actually something you could do. I'm supposed to go meet my parole officer later today for a drop, a drug test. My back's definitely in too much pain. I'm definitely not going to pass that drug test. So we are twins. You could go in as me and pass it. Yeah, that'll work. Sketchy, you a genius. Um, I, I don't know about that. Clarence, that would be lying and breaking the law. You know I'm not the type to lie or break the law. Come on, man. After everything I do for you, you can't just do to me this favor. Do you remember that one time Bill Thompson was bullying you and stole your milk? I kicked his ass for you. Remember that? Oh, well, yes. Yes, you did. But then also you drank the milk instead of giving it back to me. It doesn't matter who what happened to the milk. The point is, I helped you when you needed me. Fine, Clarence. If it would make you happy, I'll do it. But this makes us even. Oh, man. Thank you, Lawrence. Why don't you go upstairs and grab some of my clothes? You got to dress the part. <sighs> okay. Cut! Stop! Pull out of her real quick, Stephanie. Let me talk to you. Stephanie, you're fucking her like she's a cheap slut. You're supposed to bring the passion. Passion! She's not just a piece of meat. You have to caress her, stroke her hair, gently smack her ass. Take your time, boy. This ain't no race. <laughs> Go drink some Gatorade and get your ass back in there. <laughs> Baby, how's your first day going? Oh, biscuits. It's real stressful. These people don't treat porn like an art. They just treat it like a job. Hit it and done. Porn needs to have more passion in it. Well, if not passion, it would just be two random people having sex. But who wanna watch that? <laughs> I don't know about that, sweetheart. You might be stretching yourself out too much. Try not to go overboard. I'll try, baby. Did you bring me food? I did actually bring you lunch. But I got whole girl to drive here, so I ate your lunch. So I'll stop at Wheaties to get you a faux faux faux, but I ate that all the way here, so. Yeah, no, nah, baby, I ain't got no food for y'all, sorry. It's okay, baby. I think they got a venom machine here somewhere. Damn, this can actually fool anyone. Except for the glasses. Get rid of them and fix your hair. The sketch doll don't have no damn nerd haircut. I can't. I need my glasses to see, Clarence. I have very poor vision. Yada, yada, yada. Either you diss them, or you're gonna get busted and sent to jail. And trust me, Lawrence, you wouldn't last five minutes in jail. They turn your ass out faster than the belly buttons on Thanksgiving. <laughs> get it? Cause you eat a lot. Belly get big. Yeah. All right, fine. Here, hold on to them for me. Don't lose them, Clarence. They're my only pair. Don't worry, I got them, damn. Now go, go, to, go, go do my damn drug test. Bye. Cut! 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 You're doing it all wrong again, Stephen. You gotta perk your leg up on the tear and move with the hips. It's all in the hips. And make sure you tilt your body so the camera can get a better view of her ass. Anybody wanna look at a nigga's ass? Think with your brain! Damn! Everybody take five! Get more. You're doing such a great job. You have to guide these actors sometimes. It doesn't hurt to hit them once in a while. Oof, this is stressful. It's easier directing a full feature film than directing a 20 minute pornography. Do whatever you want, my friend. As long as you make a billion film, bring me perfection. What you do? Stephen, get over here. Porn actors, I never got your name, I'm sorry. Get over here too. We're gonna make the damn best porn this world has ever seen. Start from the top.
Empty your pockets and take this cup. I'm okay. Where's the bathroom at? There is no bathroom. You have to urinate in front of me so I know you don't spike it. Um, oh, um, okay. Um, I, I'm a little bit sh shy. I can't pee in front of people. Maybe if you turned around, I, I could go. You can either pee in the cup, I can take your ass back to jail, Clarence Butterscotch. Oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. Um, well, when you put it that way, um, okay, think about something. I'll sing to my wiener. It's party time. Time to get down low. It's party time. Just go with the flow. It's party time. You can do it, I know. Ah, that's it, little buddy. Here you go. That's all right. I can go home now. Yes, just one more thing. Your cavity check. What? Yeah, your cavity check. It's a part of the check. You know that. Now drop them pants and turn around and bend over. Oh, oh, oh um, uh, uh, okay. Oh my god. I hope you like it, Louise. <laughs> Spent the whole day on this. I put my heart and soul into it. Yes, I'm very excited. Start the film. Someone order a big sausage pizza? I did, but I don't have any money. A few inches later. Damn! I didn't think it was gonna be that long. So, how did you like it? <laughs> I just spent seven hours watching a porno. With no fucking sex. There was no sex in the film. How can this be called a porno? I knew I forgot some. <laughs> Whoops. Oh yeah, basically I made the most beautiful pornos ever made. Just forgot to add the sex part. <laughs> well, you live and you learn. Damn, that's crazy. I just spent my day rewatching Friday movies. You know what I just noticed about it, K-More? What? You know the whole conflict of this movie is that Smokey old big worm money for weed he smoked. Which became also Craig's problem too. Oh uh, yeah, that was the whole movie. Didn't Craig get paid that day? Remember in the beginning when he said he went to work and they fired him, gave him his last check? Craig had the money to pay Big Worm. He could have just went to the bank to withdraw it. Damn. I ain't never pay attention to this, sketch. Yeah, and I watched the movie religiously and I barely noticed it. It's crazy. Clarence, how did it go? Did I pass? Um, yes. Yes, you passed, Clarence. This is the last time I'm ever doing a favor for you. Can I have my glasses back, please? Uh, damn. I don't know if I got them. My bad, Clarence. I must misplace them. I could have sworn I had them in my pocket. <sighs> Dang, Nappet Clarence, I told you not to lose them. I'm just going home. I don't know why I trusted you. Hey, pretty boy, you need a lift? Oh, God, how nice of you. Yes, I would. All right, get your little sweet behind in this little van here. I don't mind the stickiness. That's just soda. You got pretty mouth there, boy. Uh, K-more, wasn't it the bang bus? Yeah. <laughs> Man, your brother got to be the nicest guy I ever met. But I must admit. It is hilarious seeing him get the short end of the stick all the damn time. <laughs> but I sketchy. Before I left the buying fish headquarters, I stole this big ass bottle of Don Julio. You want to get litty? <laughs> Hell yeah, my boy. Let's do it. Uh, my head room is spinning. K more. K more, where you at? Ugh, man, what happened last night? K-More! What the? What am I wearing? K-More, wake up! Man, where are we? It's a, damn! Man, you're being awfully loud. Oh, damn! Where are we? Why are you dressed like that, Sketchy? <laughs> oh, snap! We twinning! <laughs> man, I can't find my phone. Where are we? I can't remember anything from yesterday. I don't remember getting lit off that damn dumb Julio. <laughs> Oh, it hurts the layer. <laughs> but it also hurts not the layer. I don't know what we got into last night, but let's get out of here and go home. The best cure to hangovers is a strong bag of weed. And looking for us, I got some Zaza waiting on us at the house. Let's go. Right behind you, buddy. Oh, 
get you? You okay, more? I don't think we in Bikini Bottom anymore. Uh, hey, doll face. You wouldn't happen to have the time on you, would you? Attention! Are you maggots barely waking up? Oh, ma'am, do you mind not yelling so much? My head is killing me, and I gotta say, your tone isn't very nice. <laughs> are you delusional, maggot? Drop and give me 50 now! Oh, uh, I usually don't carry cash on me, but I do got a $15 gift card from Chick-fil-A. I was saving it for Bixby's birthday present. But I think she gonna need more than $15. Push-ups, you idiot! I want you to get on your belly and give me 50 push-ups now! Hey, you ain't gotta be in my guy face like that. Thank you, Skitch. Shut the hell up, k -more. Look, uh, I don't know where we are or even how we got here. Me and my guy k -more had a little too much to drink last night and we woke up here. Now, if you could just point us in the exit, we'll be happy to get out of your hair. You boys have enlisted in the army. Officially government property. No exit! So now, drop and give me a hundred. The, the army? We join the army? Aw, oh, shit. Oh, damn. That Don Julio is dangerous. <laughs> If that sergeant gained another 300 pounds, it should look pretty good, don't you think? <laughs> Nuh-uh. Shut up, k -more. I'm just saying. She got pretty eyes, but without belly rolls. She just ain't my type. I need a woman I can cook for. I can't believe you. Shut up. Damn. This is all your fault. My fault? How? It's because of you and that damn Don Julio bottle. Ain't nobody forced you to drink, Sketchy. Did I point a gun in your head and say drink? Man, whatever. Just shut up. You shut up. k -more and Sketchy, we're ready for you. k -more. I'ma really need you to keep your mouth closed. Let me do all the talking, and I can weasel us out of this. Ah, shit, not you again. Yes, it's me again. It's Clarence Butterscotch, I'm assuming. Whew, your parents must have hated you since birth. And you, what's your birth name? All you wrote was k -more. Well, that's the name on my birth certificate. <laughs> what can I do for you two idiots? Well, um, like I was telling you earlier, me and k -more got a little wasted last night and must have walked in, into the enlisting office on accident. We'd like to resign or whatever it's called. We want to go home. We don't belong here. Besides, I'm a convicted felon. I thought y'all don't accept felons. You're right to an extent. You definitely don't meet our moral character standards. However, if our unit agrees to waive the enlistment standards, we can recruit all the felons we want, as long as you meet the mental and physical requirements. <laughs> Damn! If that don't put the fear in God in you, I don't know what will. By the way, how much does it pay? It pays shit. You'll lay down on the front line for your country, but you'll go bankrupt by your early 30s. So pretty much what you're telling us is that we screwed. Yeah, basically. Mr. Butterscotch, if you will, grab the 9mm in front of you and shoot the target. Look, shorty, I already know how to shoot. I was born with a Glock in my hand. I can shoot a nigga from a distance so far over two miles driving at 40 miles per hour right through his windshield and between his eyes. You heard of that nigga dead shot from DC Comics? I make his ass look like no shot. Quit playing with me. Will you shut the hell up and shoot? Bloody hell! Nothing but headshots. Excellent work. Wish you'd shut up and follow orders more. Came on, your turn. Pick up the weapon. Oh, uh, can I hold it sideways? It looks badass. That's not the proper way to hold a firearm. But go ahead. Let's see what you've got. <laughs> okay. Fire! Fire! Boom! Boom! Take that still, Dad! <laughs> Whenever you're firing at an enemy, you're meant to execute or immobilize. Well, some shots to his dick is definitely going to immobilize the hell out of him. <laughs> Good point. I'm not finding any legal way that we can weasel out of here, Sketchy. We can go AWOL, but they'll just open up an investigation to come get us. They ain't sent us to jail. Why should we leave? They feed us, clothe us, give us kick-ass guns, and our own person in the gym? And they pay us for this shit? Come on, K-More. You gotta admit, this ain't all too bad. Plus, the sergeant got a little crush on me. I can tell by the way she be looking at me. <laughs> we can't stay here, Sketchy. We belong in Bikini Bottom. Swerving and curving. Relax, k -more. I don't see why we can't just stick around for a while. It ain't too bad. Come in. War was declared. Pack your belongings. You both ship up tomorrow, maggots. Uh...
What other ways did you find that can help us lead? Well, I did find this one trick. I don't know if it'll work, but it's worth a try. Let's do it. So I like to say, Sarge, me and Sketch are gay. What? Yes, we are both gay. And as you know, in 1982, the military enacted a policy of splitting banning gay men and lesbians from serving. I'm sorry, but I can't control my urges. I was born who I was. <laughs> Kamal, it's 2022. The military has left their prejudice in the past. And as a matter of fact, that ban was lifted in 2011. Oh, damn! Fucking idiot! It was a nice try, boys, but you're not gonna weasel out of this. What are you doing? I'm getting the hell out of here. If that means being a wanted man, so be it. There is one more thing that we can do to get us this toy. What's that? We'll just have to take a bullet. Take a bullet? What you mean by that? If we can get shot in active duty, they will send us home. We'll just be useless to them. <laughs> but it can't be no pistol whip type thing. It has to be a straight shot, and it has to be a bad bullet wound. By the readings I've done, being shot in the leg will do the trick. <laughs> well, damn. A bullet wound sounds better than serving. You ever been shot before? Never. But I'll do whatever I can to get home to my baby biscuit. So I'll do whatever I have to. Let's do this. I'm going to do it, Sketchy. I'm going to do it. Oh, damn. I can't do it. I'm too scared, Sketchy. Can you? Ah! Damn, Sketchy. Shit. You could have let me know you was going to shoot me, you asshole. And it's bad if I do it without warning. Catch you by surprise. Trust me. It's going to hurt you a lot more once the adrenaline comes down. What a relief! I can't wait to get back home! How you feeling, Sketchy? I feel fine. I'm gonna miss that hot tub, though. Wait a minute! Hey, Sketchy, you never shot yourself? Nope. Well, why did they let you go? Cuz, I told them I got shot and they believed me. You stupid. Who wants to get shot at? <laughs> you funny sometimes, K-more. Sketchy, I hate your ass. So let me get this straight. You two got so blacked out drunk, you both enlisted in the army? Yep. And you shot yourself in the leg so you could be discharged. Yeah. Actually, I'm the one who shot him. Why are you shot, Sketchy? I just told them I got shot. They didn't even check my leg or nothing. They just took my word for it and sent me home. Suckers. <laughs> Why did you guys just say you weren't vaccinated? Say what now? Yeah. The all because of white soldiers who refused to get the COVID-19 vaccination. You didn't know that? Well, I mean, come on. The only internet assets I had based on was 2004 Dell computer. This thing had more dust on it than Zane's music career. No offense, Zane. I just love you more when you was in One Direction. Hey! Kids in the building. <laughs> Let me take a look at your chart here. Hmm, shot yourself, yada, yada, yada. Oh, damn, your dumb ass got shot on duty, huh? <laughs> it happens. All right, let's cut this leg off. Think of nice thoughts, k -more. This is only going to hurt a lot. Wait, doctor, he doesn't need an amputee. I think he'll heal fine if he keeps his leg in a cast. Oh, uh, you always kill my fun. Fine, get a boy, Cass. I got to go to my next job anyways. I'm Nick Cannon's tax consultant. That nigga just announced he's having his 12th kid. He the real cheap about a dozen. <laughs> Boy, I ain't never heard of a rubble. I'm gonna get his kids written off his dependents. Oh my God, do you know who you sound like? Yes, yes, I've been trying to tell y'all. What did I say? You sound just like Dad Costanella. You mean the guy that voices Homer? Yes, exactly. I can see it. I definitely can. What? No, he sounds like Kmore. Nah, I don't see his sketchy. Yeah, you tripping. Man, I hate y'all. Oh, hey, guys. What a surprise to see you here. Hi, Marlon. How you doing? You still live across the street? <laughs> yeah, I still live across the street. Oh, wow. What happened to you, k -more? You got an ouchie? Yeah, I got shot. It happens. It definitely does. I remember I got shot in my penis one time. Took a lot of surgery and a lot of money to reattach it. <laughs> now when I pee, it comes out of three holes. Yeah, I'm gonna head out. This nigga ain't been here for two minutes, and I'm already freaked out. Oh, uh, yeah, I think I left my pot roast on the oven back home. Uh, bye, baby. I I'll see you later. It's good to see you, Marlon. It's been a while. 
What are you doing in the hospital? I don't know. There was nothing good on TV. Besides, Marlock loves looking at dead bodies down in the morgue. Love seeing them. Hey, what up, Marlock? Fuck you. I. Well, it was a blast seeing you two again, but I have to run to the hardware store for some supplies. I got a busy night ahead of me. <laughs> Bye, Marlin. Bye, Marlin. I love seeing Marlin. He's a great guy. Yeah, when you're not being weird. How long we gotta wait till they let you go back home? Hmm, I don't know, Skit. I never been shot before. Man, being shot sucks. I don't know how Meg the Stallion makes it look easy. Are you slandering Meg the Stallion right now? You sure you want that statistic? I retract my statement. I don't need toxic fans knocking at my door. <laughs> All right, Kmore. You should be set. I brought you the extra TV up here. You got your window to look out of for whatever reason. So yeah, I'm going to head out. Wait, Skitchy. You going to leave me here? Hell yeah. I got shit to do today. But I'm lonely, Skitchy. Where's Biscuits? Tell her to spend some time with you. She went to go cater for her mom. She had a fifth heart attack. The doctor told her to lay off the sweets. But that woman is hard-headed. She weighs twice the size as Biscuits. Damn, that's some scary stuff. Well, hang out with Larry or something. Larry went fishing with his kids. Larry got kids? Yeah, he got thousands of them. <laughs> Wait, fishing? What do I do when I hook a fish, Daddy? You bring him in and stab him, gut him. Yeah, like that. Some will be killing all the fishes in the sea. Well, I don't know what to tell you, Kmore. I gotta go to work. These bowls ain't gonna tow themselves. Later. Man, it sucks. The worst part about it is I'm supposed to teach a soccer class today. But I had to cancel and give everybody their refunds. I hate giving people refunds. Hey, Marlin. I'll see you. Well, slap me silly and call me Billy. Hi, Kmore. How's the weather up there? It feels great. How's the weather down there? It's warm down here, but that's probably because I peed myself when you yelled my name. Gave me a little fright. <laughs> what you got there, Marlin? What's in them bags? Oh, these? Just some tools I needed to buy. I got myself here a hacksaw, a pair of pliers, a meat cleaver, some soundproof blankets, chloroform, plastic tarps, gloves, and a Diet 7-Up. Oh, damn. That's a really weird shopping list. Die 7-Up tastes like ass, Marlin. I don't know anyone who drinks that. Well, it's been a blast talking to you, Kmar, but I really need to get inside my house. I have a busy night ahead of me. <laughs> Very busy, so don't bother us. <laughs> okay, Marlin and Marlock, y'all have a good night. Ha, ah, what an odd couple. <laughs> Silly Tom, you never gonna kiss Jerry. He's too small for you. I do like your enthusiasm, though. Uh-oh! Sketchy! Hey, Sketchy, come here real quick! Man, what? The TV said we haven't paid our bill. What happened? Shit, it sounds exactly like what it says. You in charge of that. That's your bill you supposed to pay. Yeah, you right. That is my bill. I remember. Instead of paying the cable bill, I bought these ventures off parks. <laughs> Definitely worth the money. Yeah. I myself don't like using internet or cable. It's a distraction for people. Maybe instead of burying your face in the screen, Kmore, why don't you just enjoy the beauty of your life? Are you high right now, Sketchy? I'm fucking blasted, Kmore. Yes. But it sounds boring. I want to watch Tom and Jerry. This is so unfair. Whatever. You killing my high. I'm going to walk out of this conversation. <laughs> Get it? Because you can't walk? <laughs> Man, this sucks. What am I supposed to do? Oh, binoculars. I remember when I used to use this to spy on Miss Porter changing. <laughs> Good times. Let's see what I can see around here. Okay. There's SpongeBob and Patrick jellyfishing like the virgins they are. <laughs> Grown man still jellyfish. I stopped doing that after I got my first pube. What's this? Is this star Quish on the corner selling her ass again? Damn. You go, girl. Make your money. <laughs> okay. I see Tuck Weezy. What is he doing? He ain't working on his final season, I'll tell you what. Oh, Marlin. Looks like he got a girl over. Okay, Marlin, I see you. About to lay some of that fin down, ain't you, boy? <laughs> oh, is that an all-you-can-eat buffet? Look at the rose on that girl. Damn! Later that night. <laughs> oh, what the? What was that? Oh my god, Sketchy! Sketchy, get in here! 
Uh, K more what? It's three in the damn morning. Marlon, he killed somebody. I think we need to call the police. The police? I just slapped the black off of you. We don't call the police. That's some snitch shit. Start over. What are you talking about, K more? Okay. So earlier, I saw Marlon from the window, and he was bringing in these bags in. He had bought some weird stuff like a hacksaw and chloroform or Dye 7-Up, which just really blew my mind, because, I mean, who the hell drink Dye 7-Up? You got to have no taste bud to drink that. K-more, continue with what you were saying. Okay. And then earlier, I saw him bringing a girl back to his place, and then I thought he was going to smash like any nigga would think. But then, that confused me, because I'm not 100% sure what his preference is. I thought him and Marlock had a relationship. It's complicated. But anyways, a woman screamed woke me up. So I look outside the window with these binoculars and I saw Marlock's face covered in blood. I think he killed her. k more, you tripping. There's got to be a logical explanation for all this. Besides, you said you seen Marlon's face with blood, right? Yeah. Well, Marlon isn't a killer. Marlock's a killer. Marlon wouldn't hurt a fly. Yeah, I guess you're right, Skitchy. Maybe I'm just making up scenarios. All right, now go to bed. If you wake me up again, I'm going to push your ass down the stairs. Go to bed. Sketchy! Sketchy! Get back in here! Look at this! What now, k More? Damn! Look at what Marlon's doing! Here! Oh, damn. That's weird. There's got to be an explanation for this. Let me go talk to him. Be careful, Sketchy! Hey, what's up, Marlon? What you doing there? Oh, uh, hi, Sketchy. Sketch dog. How's it going? It's a nice day outside, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Um, hey, so, I know that you digging a hole out here with these mysterious bags. What's up with that? What, these? I just planted some seeds for, a uh, a garden. A garden, huh? What kind of flowers are you planting that's in these big garbage bags? Uh, would you believe me if I said I was planting a tree? I might. That's what I'm doing. I'm planting a tree. Hmm. <laughs> Okay, one more question. So k mentioned he saw you bring a girl home last night. Where's she at? I heard she was a baddie. Oh, her. Um, Marlock has this obsession with prostitutes. So, she was a prostitute. Didn't even give me her real name, so you can't look her up or anything. <laughs> well, alright. This has been a very suspicious conversation. I'll talk to you later, Marla. Well, what happened? what he say? Yeah, that nigga definitely killing people. Damn, you think you know someone. What are we going to do? So we call the cops? Hell no. As long as he ain't killing us, I don't care what goes on with that man house in his spare time. It ain't my problem. I'm going to go smoke my bowl. Deuces. I'm watching you, Marlon. You think you got me fooled, but you don't. I'm going to be on your ass like Garfield is with lasagna. Sketchy! Sketchy, get in here! Marlon did it again! He gonna kill this dude! Damn, he on the road! Let me see! He's like reality TV! Hey, yo, what the? That's my dude I sell my bud to! He be paying my bills! Now, you see? That's interfering with the sketch dog business! That's a no-go for me! This means war! Are you gonna save him? Hell yeah! Come on in! I got chocolate frosty milkshakes inside! I bet! I'm a sucker for some chocolate frosty milkshakes! I'd die for them! Oh, I bet you would! <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me. Nah, he already in Marlon's house. He's a dead man walking. The bogey has left the perimeter. You're free to move, Cotton Balls. Over. I told you my nickname ain't Cotton Balls. Call me Red Badass. Hello? k more. You have to end the transmission, Sketchy. You have to say over every time you're done talking so I know you're finished with the conversation. Over. You stupid, K-More. I don't know why we ain't using our phones anyway. Walking talk is out of date. I'm sorry. I didn't get that. Are you done with your statement? Over. I'm hanging up. Bye. Man, this dude crazy. Should have shot his ass in the head. Hello? Over. You there? Over. Over. Over, over. I am. Wow, this place is like a mansion. Couldn't tell how it looked from the outside. What's this? A chocolate frosting machine? Man, that's wild. You see anything, Sketchy? Yeah, he got some cool shit in here. I think I may rob him. Stay focused, Sketchy. Find the evidence we need. I'm not seeing anything here, K-Moy. Man, I shouldn't even be in here. I'm on parole. If I get caught breaking into this man's house, I'm going back to jail. Just five more 
minutes, Kitchen. Please. Alright, fine. Let me keep looking. Oh, damn! Hey, K Moore, there's a dead one in here. Great! I mean, not great, it's terrible. Rest in peace. But great job finding. I can call the police now. Wait! Sketchy! Get out! Marlon's coming back! Oh, damn! He don't got no back door. Man, what kind of house don't got no back door? Some lazy architectural shit if you ask me. Oh, no, Sketchy! I'm coming! Damn! I can't get down these stairs fast enough. I know what to do. Ah! Fuck! Damn! That was a bad idea. Block out the pain, Kaymo. You gotta save Sketchy. My milkshake brings all the boys to the yard and they're like, It's better than yours, damn right. It's better than yours, I can teach you. But I have to charge. That's enough right there. You can drop the eggs, Marlin. I got your ass. Sketchy! Hey, hi, how are you? Are you robbing me? I only ask you don't steal my mom's ashes. I play with them when I'm bored. Nah, 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 nah. I'm here stopping you from killing niggas. You were cool with killing random bitches. But now you're killing my clientele. I ain't rocking with that. Killing? What on gosh green earth are you talking about? Sketchy, don't worry. I'll save you. k -more, what are you doing? I'm here to save you. Duh. Come on, man. I'm the sketch dog. I don't need saving. Niggas need saving from me. Well, damn. I guess I underestimated you. Oh, well. Anyways, start talking, Marlon. Why are you killing innocent people? I never killed a thing. <laughs> I would never hurt anyone. You must have me confused, doodly do. But I saw you bringing in all that stuff. Tools to kill. A hatchet, a meat cleaver, tarp, chloroform, and for some reason, die seven up. That's easy. I'm building a swimming pool in my living room. See? Well, damn. I didn't even see that. What about the chloroform? I have night terrors, k -more. I need it to help me sleep. Duh. And what about the digging you was doing yesterday in them garbage bags? I told you, I was planting a tree. Come on, you expect me to believe that? Damn, that grew fast as hell. What about the dead body that's in the hallway? That's not a dead body, Sketchy. That's a blow-up doll. I get lonely sometimes and need companionship. Well, I right. Checks out for me. Wait a minute. What about the people you was inviting over your house and was never seen again? Oh, them. Yeah, Marlock killed and ate them. Oh, damn. So I guess we were kind of right. Oh, well, let's go, k -more. What? We got a Tim Marlin in. You can try, but it's hard to find me guilty when there's no body to find. That's why I eat them. Oh, well, damn. There ain't no point of trying. Let's go, Sketch. All right, Marlock, I'm going to fuck with you. Just start killing my customers, please. I'll try, nigga, now leave. Damn, that was crazy. You want to go to Glove World? Shouldn't you be resting? Both of your legs are dysfunctional. Don't you tell me what to do, Sketch. Now let's go to Glove World. <laughs> Make way, make way. Jailbird is being left free. <laughs> I'ma miss beating your ass with my nightstick, Tyrone. No hard feelings? Mine, whatever, cuz. I'm glad to be getting out of here. Well, enjoy your day. Be safe. <laughs> I know his day gonna be bad before breakfast time. Get in here, Tyrone. Are you ready for your new job? Born ready, cuz. That little nigga dead. I don't creep. And make sure you join the Discord. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Join the Discord so y'all can keep updated what we doing. Sketchy. I got it. Damn. Let me do it. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Join our Discord. She got her diploma from the... She know how to roll that marijuana. She is such a stoner. She don't give a fuck about Corona. Everybody want her, but she only good for a boner. Cause she from the corner. God damn. She gon' dress you back. Talking about her phone dad. But she was giving that. Getting her back blown wide. I seen it. Anything for cash. She gon' twerk her thong dry. And put her feet on only fans. She belong to all guys. That was the first part, man. I'm telling y'all.